Dad fell in love with a Lamborghini girl because she is a Lamborghini robot. It is because all the women in this world will awaken various robot forms after they grow up. There are Violet Lowly Robot, Cold Goddess Motorcycle Robot, and even Tomboy Armored Robot. As for men, they become commanders who control the robots. The two parties form a contract and transform into battle forms by controlling the robots, together resisting the invasion of the beasts. At this moment, a girl awakened on the stage, a cold and beautiful school flower. She and Fei Fei walked out of the crowd. She crossed her hands in front of her chest and every step she took showed gentleness and charm. After drinking the awakening liquid, she and Fei Fei, the seventh generation whale transport aircraft, S class, please transform in an open area because you are really too big. All the boys whitened their eyes. Transport aircraft, flying robot, damn it. The transport robot of S class can even rival the SS class. It seems that the people at the Dragon Defense Hub are about to take action. Seeing this, Principal Wu happily said to the woman beside him, Shen Ling, you have been teaching for a year. Are there any outstanding pilots? Compared to the robots, the pilots are more important. The energy supply for the robots to transform into battle forms and the amplification of weapon power all rely on men. She thought for a moment and said, No, ordinary writers can't control Qin Fei Fei. The last school beauty, Li Shi, came out. Li Shi was highly valued in school, and everyone was looking forward to her awakening some amazing talent for special training. After taking the awakening potion, Li Shi became the fifth generation chasing light motorcycle rider. D rank, ha ha ha, Li Shi turned out to be a D rank motorcycle rider. Everyone couldn't help but burst into laughter. I thought she would awaken as an extraordinary battle princess. TSK TSK TSK, let me give you a suggestion. Find an ugly D level pilot. Maybe it will work out and then start a small company. I silently watched all of this. This is reality. In this era of popular motorcycles, the mecha girls are so cruel. Principal Wu picked up the microphone and now the pilots are awakening. The most attention is on the school grass Xiao Pengfei, and the tall and sunny Qin Feng. There are two items for pilot awakening. The first one is the most important, which is the wave band. The wave band determines the possibility of fusion with the mecha girl. Usually, only D level or above have a chance. The second item is talent. The mecha girl needs to be level 15 to awaken talent 1, while the pilot only needs to be level 1. At this time, the mecha girls excitedly looked at the awakening platform, and the loudspeakers were pressed down. It turned out that Qin Feng went up. Qin Feng, A level wave band, A level talent 1 is super capacity expansion magazine, double A level pilot. The teachers were delighted that Qin Feng did not disappoint their expectations. This is the combat power that can match an S level mecha girl. Finally it's my turn to go on stage. After drinking the awakening potion, I place my hand on the crystal slate. Celestial star. Band E. Talent 1 is a level super power drive. It's a pity for an A level talent. Super power drive is such a great talent, but unfortunately can only be used on tricycles. Ha ha ha. So funny. Just as I turn around to leave the stage, Ding. Detected that the host is from the original band. Gaining the SSS system talent, Galaxy Heart. SSS talent. This is a legendary talent that can only appear in Legends. So I excitedly opened my own driver panel. Driver, Tianchen. Proficiency level, level 1. Feature, original wave band. Talent 1, a level super power drive. Improving the long-term mobility of the machine girl. Talent 2, SSS level galaxy heart. Ten Tian level hundredfold energy supply. While I was studying the system panel, screen suddenly came from the other side. Oh my god. Zaya Pengfei, a level wave band. S level talent. As soon as talent 1 is the earth dragon energy, people from the Zhao family consortium stood up when they saw this, as if they had already seen a rising star among the drivers. Countless machine girls flashed their lights, and even public transportation expressed their willingness to give it a try. What if the school grass can't bear it? Zhao Pengfei shook his hair confidently, walking in the footsteps of the king of cats, and was surrounded by a group of machine girls. After creating a climax, more than half of the drivers were in the D level band. Those few instantly became the focus of cultivation and will definitely be poached by various forces when they leave campus. The awakening test for this group of drivers has ended. Principal Wu pressed the button, and those who awakened in the morning formed their own teams to experience their talents and wavelengths. Miss Qin Fei Fei, can I team up with you? Zhao Pengfei walked towards Qin Fei Fei elegantly and gentlemanly. Sorry, Zhao Pengfei, who was rejected by the school flower Qin Fei Fei when he wanted to practice by himself, looked unhappy. Fiji, let's team up. I don't mind having a few people together. Zhao Pengfei was immediately surrounded by other machine girls. Don't be so noisy. Have you all formed teams? Teacher Shen Ling's angry roar instantly scared the machine girls into silence. Um, Teacher Shen Ling, 
No one wants to team up with me, I awkwardly said. Seeing this, everyone couldn't help but laugh. Tianchen's waveform is too bungee jumping. Even the rational ones wouldn't consider working with him if they still have a chance, because once their waveform is affected, how can they find a suitable pilot in the future? Teacher Shen Ling didn't hesitate. All right, the practical class is about to begin. Those who haven't awakened should leave the field. As for Tianchen, I will team up with you. Oh my god, I envy you so much. If I had known, I wouldn't have formed a team first. I want to team up with the goddess. The people who were just mocking are now all envious in reverse. Several female teachers on the side breathed a sigh of relief. Fortunately, there is Xin Ling on the damaged roof of the car. Otherwise the school would lose face. Principal Wu looked at teacher Xin Ling and said, Shen Ling, that guy's wavelength will affect you. Just practice. Besides I can't transform. Saying that, teacher Xin Ling transformed into a barrier tank. I stood in front of the barrier tank and saw scars all over the body, especially a fist-sized hole in the rear engine. Isn't the S-Class barrier tank driven by three engines? It's probably difficult to move. Was it facing an imperial-level exotic beast at that time? Get on the car. That's not something you should be concerned about. Upon touching the car door, the system interface displays information, name, Xin Ling, level, level 45, ripple, SS level evaluation, mechanical form, 8th generation S-Class barrier breaker tank, battle goddess form, iron blood battle armor goddess, talent 1, a level profound power, talent 2, a level massive barrier, talent 3, a level siege destroyer, special, core engine fragmentation energy requirement is 6 times that of normal power consumption, forced single person transformation transmission function is severely damaged, I looked at the detailed information of the mecha and it seems that teacher Shen Ling has never cooperated with a pilot before, the cockpit is still very clean, while the outside is full of traces of the battlefield, don't touch anything randomly, sit down by yourself, the lever on the left is the propulsion lever, don't step on the throttle pedal randomly. Barrier tanks are heavy power consuming mechas. They usually choose pilots with engine talents. Otherwise the pilots will be tired and lack power. I don't think I need to explain the basic knowledge. Just let me give you a taste. I understand. The machine is normally operated. If you want to link up, hold the main controller with both hands. The machine will wrap around the pilot's arms and enter the combat state. Teacher, I won't try my talent. What impact can your frequency band have on me? The compatibility is zero so nothing can happen. However, as soon as teacher Shen Ling finished speaking, I directly injected talent. In an instant, the SSS level galaxy heart energy instantly exploded the four energy storage boxes. She clenched her teeth, but her body was almost uncontrollable. She didn't know why, but she felt like she was about to burst with the damaged energy hub. Her whole body seemed to fly into the sky, breathing the freshest air on the clouds. This feeling was like injecting the energy of a nuclear reactor into a car. Installing a hundred thrusters on a rocket, and a single engine level super output port could easily provide SS level heavy duty mecha. I didn't control it well for a while and used five directly. The whole body of teacher Shen Ling was trembling, and the condensate leaked out and spilled all over the floor. Teacher Shen Ling, what's going on? Why is the screen showing an overload warning? Did I do something wrong? I don't know how I accidentally stepped on the accelerator. The barrier tank started and crashed through the meta alloy protective wall of the playground. What happened? It's teacher Shen Ling. So powerful. It can even penetrate the meta alloy protective wall. Truly worthy of the S class. Too fierce. Must have been Tianchen's reckless manipulation that day. Ha ha. I forcibly released control. Sorry teacher. Shen Ling teacher is sweating all over. What happened to her own Jitai? Why does she feel like being electrocuted all over her body? Even losing consciousness for a few seconds just now. It's okay. It might just be an old injury acting up. Let's stop practicing here for now. After saying that, the seat ejected and threw me out. Ha ha ha, Tianchen was thrown out. What can you do with an E-level waveband? Teacher Shen Ling's face didn't look good when she turned back into human form. She returned to the stage and said, Let's stop the morning practice here. Starting tomorrow, Teacher Zhang Chuanhao will lead you in extracurricular practical exercises. No one is allowed to be late. Early the next morning, Teacher Zhang Chunjiao walked up to the stage and said, the training location for today has been sent to you. I don't care how you get there, but you must arrive within two hours. This is a requirement for the practical class. All right, let's go now. Drivers can mix their own cars. I watched as one by one. The machine girls and drivers went far away, leaving only me and Li Shuri. Let's go. I'll give you a ride. Li Shuri turned into a chasing light motorcycle. When I got on the motorcycle, the attribute panel in front of me lit up. Machine girl, Li Shi, level, 15. Ripple, unchanged. Evaluation, S-level. Mechanical form, 5th generation D-level chasing light motorcycle. 
Battleform, 9th generation SS level fighter jet, talent 1, shatterer missile, special, dual transforming machine girl, damage, right wing steering damaged. It's actually a dual transforming machine girl? It's been almost a hundred years since the last one, and as soon as I drove out of the city streets, I noticed two red modified cars following behind. Warning, you have been locked on. I turned around and saw two modified sports cars, both of which were D-level, equipped with the 6th generation of X-Special lock chain guns. The alarm should be the 4th generation of Mei Hong small missiles on the roof of the car. Here they come. I reacted quickly and dodged two purple lock chain guns to the right. Hold on tight, Li Shi said, suddenly decelerating to avoid the sudden appearance of an off-road vehicle, accelerating again and pulling away. But this sudden attack forced the two of them to deviate from the main route. This is the B-level talent hidden light curtain. Your eyesight is good. There is a driver in every car. Pay and get things done. Bounty hunters love cheap fourth generation weapons. Sorry, it's my carelessness. Li Shi suddenly said. I didn't expect these people to dare to act within the country. I whispered. How about throwing two exterminator missiles to destroy it? How do you know? She sounded shocked. I have a special ability to see some data from the other party. I won't say it unless it's a special situation. Looking back, the other party accelerated again. I feel that if we are caught, neither of us will have a good life. We can't switch. And the shredder missile is a weapon in jet form. I can't switch under such high speed running. I will rush to the Cloud River area at full speed and eject you. Whether you can survive depends on yourself. Warning, energy is less than 10%. I have another way. Linkage. The speed in the driving state will increase greatly. And my talent is super power drive. Shake them off beyond the range of the shield. And they won't dare to chase. The current signal communication is blocked and the distress signal cannot be sent out. What can you do? With your Bungie E-Band, even a basic 3% compatibility is already amazing. Not to mention that my energy is not enough. You are only at level 1 and can't provide much. Come on, trust me. The linkage begins, and the armor light of the motorcycle handle starts to wrap around my arm. The wave point contact is successful, and the linkage compatibility is 30%. How is this possible? She exclaimed. At this moment, her common sense was shattered compatibility needs to be gradually honed. After working together for a long time, it may increase from the initial 3% to 20%. Even if an S-Class driver links with 10,000 machine girls, the maximum compatibility for the first linkage is 10% for one person. I activated my talent, powered up with a supercharged particle crystal rocket, and the dashboard instantly reached a speed of 500, leaving the bounty hunters behind in an instant. Damn it, how is it possible to run so fast? Chase after her. Even the fifth generation pursuit light with full energy will run out of fuel soon. She won't get far. Warning, fuel level is critically low. Ready, I'm going to activate talent 2. Control the super output port of the galaxy heart. The energy box is instantly full. The whole body feels like it's about to explode with energy. Li Shi clenches her teeth, almost losing consciousness. Charging complete. I immediately step on the accelerator. The speed soars and I disappear in a flash. The people chasing behind are all dumbfounded. It's impossible. How can there be so much energy? Damn it, the intelligence was wrong. After shaking them off, I slowed down and disengaged, using the school beauty as an experiment. It was really enjoyable. After arriving at the Chongyun Kama's training plane, as soon as I took off my helmet, Li Shi jumped up and turned back into human form. Seeing this scene, a female mecha girl mocked. Wonderful. This combination is not bad. Jumping off the cliff with an E-Wave driver and the 5th generation motorcycle school beauty, it's quite compatible. I walked over and said, fellow student, with your talent, how could you awaken an armored vehicle? So what do I awaken? You're fit to be a forklift, a green forklift. What do you mean? Changrong he said you are T, green T, ha 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 ha, ha 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 ha. Some of the drivers and machinists who heard around them didn't hold back their laughter. What did you say? You E-Band waste driver. Makoto shrugged his shoulders. Shen Aya came over. What's the commotion? Chang Rong saw her teacher coming and held back the gas that nearly exploded. Zhang Chuanjia was counting the number of people. Shen Aya looked at Mukin with one arm crossed, as well as the sweaty Li Shi. Did you encounter anything on the way? No. Li Shi answered quickly. Really? Li Shi nodded. Shen Aya made a tisk sound and took a drag on her cigarette and walked away. It was obvious that she had discovered something. Mukin whispered. I've told you to turn off the distress signal earlier. I guess it was picked up by her once. Chapter 007, Sudden Danger. Fei Beast appears. Li Shi blankly glanced at Mu Chuan, crossed her arms and exhausted. She almost lost consciousness in that situation just now. How could she have the time to turn off the campus band distress signaler? But such a long distance teacher Shen Aya could also detect it? 
Shania is level 45. No wonder, a level that high? Hey wait, how did you know what I was thinking? Li Shiyi was speechless. Zhang Xuanjiao finished counting the number of people. This is our Red Dragon Country's Chongyun Province's Kamas training plane. Everyone will be able to better practice and transform at will here. Students who want to practice firing remember to all face north. Now start free practice time don't go out of Kamas plane got it? Being outside was just exciting. The gunnies started transforming and running wild outside without the limitations of the grounds inside the school. And some of the gunnies can play freely. There is also a lake in the middle of the training plane boat girls can also practice transformations. Overall, the number of flying girls is less than 10% of the boat girls just above the line. Vehicle type machine nymphs accounted for 6 tiers, then various artillery types and mechanical types. You're not going to practice? I'm level 15 the basic skills have long been practiced and used to. You're not going to practice? Didn't you practice just now? Li Shiyi paused for a second immediately responding that it was taking her to practice. With a toss of her black silk hair she walked under a tree to rest and check her ripples. Strange, obviously a 30% fit had occurred why hadn't there been any change in her ripples? Everyone was practicing happily at the moment. Zhao Pengfei and Chang Rong fit 5 now. That's awesome. We don't even have one yet. Setting off a chorus of exclamations it's only been practicing for half an hour. Right? It is indeed very impressive teacher Zhang Chuanjiao immediately went to give instructions. Gao Runli car rear end flung intentionally to this side to say to Li Shi and not far from the pastor dust to listen to. The four of them really get along with each other. Only five? I think they should be higher. After all, the colors are similar. Chang Rong's sister powerful chant. Not like some people. Said smugly and drove off again. Li Shi almost didn't strain herself. Mud dust meaning Chang Rong and Zhao Pengfei's character is indeed somewhat similar. Someone is hat green someone is itself green. This damage words Gao Ruanli did not hear. Li Shi was dozing G body exhausted. Mac Dust walked away to move his body around. And in the meantime, he studied his own system. Everyone is practicing the bombing zone in the north that is constantly exploding. Usually E level and above machine girl and driver will be recruited during the invasion of foreign beasts. Shepherd's Dust read the relevant information every time the sacrifice is quite a lot. Bad luck only out of the academy may have to go to the battlefield. Shania had been smoking a cigarette and stood on the high side of the stone slope to observe. Even though she wasn't the leader but she was more serious. The transportation helicopter flew away. Zhang Chuanjiao. How did you let Zhou Long and the others go? Shania shouted to Zhang Chuanjiao. Let them go pull lunch for the students. It's fine it's only half an hour away. She replied irritably. Shania's serious and responsible attitude irked her. Makoto was not far away to see what was happening. The five teachers who came out this time. Machine Lady Zhang Chuanzhou. Rank 20. 7th generation multifunctional artillery. Class B. Has been working as a teacher at the academy for 8 years. And her wargirl form is a class S heavy artillery wargirl. Previously. The lowest assessment of the wargirl form are B wargirl. Nearly 200 years or more than 5 generations of mechanical form. War G lowest has been to a level. The driver was Mr. Kai Jia. B rank. Level 20. Teacher Zhou Long is a B level driver. Level 29. The helicopter G that left was Teacher Yu Huan. Rank 31. A 6th generation B rank transport helicopter. Engaged in the work of the academy teacher for 3 years in the forward transportation group recruited for half a year. All of these academy resumes were on the board. Shania's resume was a bit richer. 3 years in the frontline attack group. 1 year in the special team and two years as the leader of the Frontline Material Transportation Team. Red Dragon State First Class Savior Badge. She is only 26 unfortunately seriously injured G body damaged retired. Shania sat down here as the territory as she overthinks. Looking at the pulse through the wristwatch. The news in the group are once good partners. Defense Center to disclose such information. Not afraid of deducting salary. What? Even if I know it's your Hyun Hyung, he won't say anything. No way? Isn't the head of the Jankyo Defense Department a little girl? I heard she's really mean. She's so mean. You too. If she reads this, she'll blow your faces off with a Class SS laser missile. Recently, the beasts outside the country are restless. There may be a wave of beasts in two years. When that happens? Sorry. I'll just have to cheer you guys on. Shania sent. Shania. Cheer us on. Don't be sad. You've always been our hero. No. Don't think about that day. I'll cry if I think about it. Shania, you're a teacher in heavy cloud now. The transmission center has news from half an hour ago. A large number of Earth class alien beasts have been found in the territory of heavy cloud South Cloud Lakes. And the warrior girls have all supported them. War G is the core fighting force S class or above is the core of the core. In the six provinces of the Red Dragon Kingdom, Chong Yun province, there are only 20 registered SS level or higher war girls. There are more than a thousand of A levels. 
But the destructive power of A-level wargirls might not work when faced with an imperial-level alien beast. Our tactical hub jokes that the probability of finding a beast in the country is very low, but if a beast appears on the southern border, it would be troublesome if a beast appears on the northern side of Chongyun, and the support won't be able to arrive for half an hour. It gives people a flavor of conspiracy. Shin Aya looked up. The Kamas training plane was in the northernmost part of the heavy clouds. I'm at the northernmost Kamas training plane. Just at this time, clack 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 violent earthquake. What's happening? The earth is collapsing. Run, run. What's going on? Heavy cloud observation hub center. Alert, Fei presence and high energy reaction detected in Kamas training planes. At the same time, the Red Dragon Kingdom Core Command Hub also received the message. What's going on? The silver-haired lowly shouted. What's going on over at Heavy Cloud? The screen cut over. The moment the screen cut over, a large number of machine nymphs were seen fleeing for their lives in the Kamas training planes. The ground shattered and crawled out ten purple crystallized, mutated beasts Berserker 6. Fey beasts that looked like scorpions but had a body of more than ten meters at the ground level. The beasts are distinguished by their threat level, gradually rising from insect level, fierce level, earth level, royal level, dragon level, and extermination level. The Earth-grade Xenomorphs had tough leather armor. Normal gun damage was basically a scrape. And the damage might be enough for a 6th generation or higher when the Mecha Goddess is linked up. It's Berserker 6. Run. Run. Why is it in the territory? The Machine Girls frantically fled, overturning and colliding countless times. Shania was the first to send a distress signal. In fact, both the Heavy Cloud Hub and the Red Dragon Center had already observed it when it was sent. Damn. How long will it take for the fastest support to get there? Our warjacks just went over to the South Cloud Lake. Damn it. The maneuvering squad has already departed. It'll take about 25 minutes. Three guilds have been contacted to already head over for support, including the Heavy Cloud Academy teachers who are all heading over there. How come there happens to be an Academy students training there? Xian Shang narrowed his eyes. It's someone's intention to sabotage our new generation. Chapter 008 Emperor Level Exotic Beast Land King Turtle Appears. Heavy Cloud Territory. Urgent announcement, a foreign beast has been discovered in the Kamas training planes. If any freelancer wargirls are in the vicinity, request for reinforcements. Request for reinforcements. Alarm sounds were everywhere within Heavy Cloud, the core command center of the Red Dragon Kingdom. The Heavy Cloud Central Command were all looking at the screen. The mutant beast Berserker 6 grabbed the fleeing armored car mechanic girl's tail and pierced right through her body. The mouth was able to spew out small destructive rays through the mecha nymphs, and they exploded in screams. Ah. Screams of terror were heard everywhere. Run. Ten Berserker Six roared monstrously. One. Two. Three. So recognizable mechs and pilots torn apart. Blood spraying wildly. The scene was chaotic for a time. Many of the mechs switching between transformed and human forms repeatedly. More unstable under the tension and fear. Doors fell off. Spare tires flew about. And oil leaked wildly. Help. Coming our way. Gao Ruinli was smashed over by the flying rocks the tires shattered. She changed back to her human form crying and shouting. The few of them happened to be closest to the location of the outbreak. Sister Chang Rong save me. Save me. Berserker 6 approached. Chang Rong looked back. Ah. Screaming in terror. Zhao Pengfei in the car shouted. Run. Turn back for what? What's the trash to save? Chang Rong does not care. Immediately accelerated the gas pedal regardless of their girlfriends to escape and go. Berserker 6 is already behind Gao Ruoli's spike tail pierced through the roof of her car. Ah. Save me tearing, exploding, dying in screams. The machine nymphs were now running for their lives. How had these newly awakened machine nymphs ever seen this scene? Sensei, help, teacher, Zhang Chu and Zhao's eye students were killed 20 to 30. The Berserker 6 was still madly killing blood red 6 eyes glowing. This situation are among the rare. Ah Jiao froze for what? Hubby Kai Jia ran over. Transform. After transforming into a multifunctional artillery Kai Jia sat up and linked it. Zhang Chu and Jiao, what are you doing? Steady your mind. Why are your ripples so unstable you can't get to 25 like this? Can't change into a warjack like this. The Sky Whale transporter crashed a Berserker 6. Sister Fei Fei. Jean Fei Fei opened the hatch. Come up here. The machine without mobility changed back to human form and come up here. Small destructive rays pierced through the front hull of her transport. The Berserker 6 flipped up to counterattack. Fifi San. How many machine girls have ever seen this image yelled? Get up here. Get up here. Jean Fei Fei didn't care about the wounds, but the two Berserker 6 looked this way. In the distance, Beldet commanded. All gunnies listened to this lady's order slant 45, 11 o'clock direction, gathering more than 50 howitzer and mortar machine girls, plus more than a dozen pilots together. Load. Fire. Boom. 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 
a bombarded area in front of Qin Fei Fei, two berserkers six howled in the cannon fire. Nice work Beldet. The defender surfaced to where rocket launcher laughed triumphantly. Ahahahaha, ahahahaha, have you seen the strength of this lady? You plebes. The air breaking minus 10 combat heim pass through. Fifi, -fi, watch out there's another one coming from the left take off and go. I'm unarmed. Han Xuanyan flew over to try to attract the alien beast killing on the left. But there was no way the fighter could crash into it and blow itself up. It wouldn't be able to attract it at all. There are still people on this side of the lake who haven't come up. Xin Fei Fei was here to save the boat girls on this side of the lake. They could only turn into human forms to escape. It was too late. Berserker VI's mouth was going to spray small destructive rays at them. Just then the sound of a motorcycle. Makoto rushed over in his fifth generation light chasing motorcycle. Pulling up the front of the bike, he jumped up and trampled on the back wheel. The small destructive rays were deflected. Landing instantly dodged the spike tail strike, as well as the two attacks from the berserk heavy vice. Drifting and dumping the bike letting the rock smash into the Fei's face, pissing off the Fei beast to come and frantically attack them. But Mu Chen controlled the motorcycle to circle around the foreign beast to dodge all of them. The two foreign beasts in the explosion were injured but not killed. The front end of Mu Dust's bike turned around and delayed in one pull and three, leaving the machine girls dumbfounded. It's Li Shi, Li Shi and Mukin. Good. So handsome. They're so handsome. Ah, handsome. Don't come up yet you guys. Xin Fei Fei shouted. Mukin and Li Shi didn't have any weapons, so they could only draw the attention of the three berserkers six like this. The two of them had a high tacit understanding, driven by superpower. Li Shi didn't care about anything just ran wildly at full speed, and Mu Chen came to be responsible for the direction. The celestial whale transporter took off. Dong Menyan's tow hook pulling a few scared and crying machine girls to escape. To the left, Yutana's side of the rocket car machine nymph's cannon fire began to counterattack. Five dozen or so machine nymphs bombarded a berserker six covering the escaping people in front of them. Sheen Foam shouted, just pull it, ten of our cranes are pulling a berserker six, it doesn't have as much power as us combined. Over there are the students of the, heavy cloud academy, there are a lot of good seedlings. The people in the command and control center looked at the screen, what's the teacher doing? Yes, where is the teacher? I saw one that hadn't transformed just now. On the other side came the images of the face screaming and being crushed and shattered. A berserker 6 being crushed before being crushed repeatedly. The S-class wall attacker violently crushed the alien beast. Purple blood splattering all over the place. So many artillery attacks hadn't killed a single one. And the first one was still being. Teacher Shania. Teacher Shania. Shania crushed the alien beasts and continued forward. Facing the two alien beasts that rushed up to her and directly crashed into them. Crash flying more than 10 meters away. Her side deck crushing berserker 6 is also very flexible. Everyone retreat. There is no linkage state single machine lady without S-class firepower can't kill them. Retreat. Hold on for 15 minutes the rescue team will come. Yes. M.S. Shun Aya. Shun Aya was now hitting 3 with 1. The students all retreated and escaped. Especially the gunnies who were going to change back to their human form to get on the bus. At this time, 30 warplanes came from the sky. Nukin and Li Shi also turned around and fled. Support from the defense center is here. Awesome. Keep running. This is an artificial bomber. It's not a machine girl with limited firepower. The voice of Qin Feng shouting. Bombardment support. Precision bombardment against the three alien beasts except Shen Aya who were facing each other. At this moment, Zhang Chuanjiu and Kai Jia transformed successfully, and 7 meter S rank heavy artillery battle maidens appeared. Teacher Zhang Chuanjiu is also there. Awesome. It can be stabilized. Damn it. We sacrificed at least 50 people. Command center here is the heavy cloud defense hub. North Border Air Force Squad we will protect the students to leave safely, please, just when everyone thought that the danger was solved. Wow. Black and red illusion breaking light swept across. Everyone heard the sound as if their heart stopped for a moment. The ten bombers in the air of boom 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 boom. Exploded. The ground trembled emitting a strange roar like the gates of hell. Warning, Imperial level beast land king turtle discovered. The ground exploded open and the hundred meter body of the Imperial great alien beast appeared in front of a ten more land grade berserkers six appeared. Air Force. What is that? Good. What a huge alien beast. It's an imperial level. A terrifying foreign beast that the S-ranked warjacks are having trouble killing. Run. Chapter 009, SS-class battle Heim debuts. This is the Heavy Cloud Command Center. Air Squad retreat quickly you guys are no different than sending them to their deaths. But students. Array from the back of the Land King Turtle. Boom. 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 Boom, 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 boom. Five bombers exploded in the air. Retreat, that's an order. K. 
can't pointlessly give away their lives the remaining 15 bombers split left and right. Run. Run. Just now everyone thought that they had stabilized and were not running fast, but now the appearance of the imperial level alien beasts was too terrifying. The teacher in class had given an example that 30 land level foreign beasts might not be comparable to an ordinary imperial level foreign beast. The land king turtle belongs to the top of the imperial level is almost equivalent to the dragon level foreign beasts, such as counting a hundred berserkers six to compare. Open mouth huge destructive light swept thousands of meters. A piece of miserable screams. This head of huge super king aid is aimed at the direction of the machine lady's escape. Countless machine nymphs were blown away and smashed on the ground amidst the screams. Some were directly killed in seconds. The image was so horrifying that many of the machine girls were too scared to move the coolant was scattered everywhere. The land king turtle shot in the direction of the huge gully spanning a thousand meters that exploded in front of them. There are still 12 minutes before support arrives. Zheng Chuanzhou transformed into a war girl and blew up a berserker six with her heavy artillery. But at the moment, facing the land king turtle, her feet were weak. Zheng Chuanzhou, Ah Jiao, Kai Jia couldn't wake up even if she shouted. Linkage fit is below 25. Disengage war girl form. She was so scared that she couldn't link up. Her legs were so weak. The terrifying road king turtle let out a pale hiss. The intimidating sound could be heard for 10 miles around. Chang Rong and the girls didn't dare to cry out loud. The sound of the heavy engine roaring. The wall attack battle vehicle crashed through the two foreign beasts rushing straight towards the road king turtle. Teacher Shania. Shania don't go. This is the heavy cloud transmission hub. Shania don't go. This is the heavy cloud command center. Shania come back. This is the rangers guild. We still have 15 minutes. Don't send them to their deaths. This is Defense Hub Zhang Dongyuan. Shania. Heavy Cloud Chief Commander Zhang Dongyuan's signal was all choked off. Shania deliberately crashed the Berserker 6 and attracted the attention of the Land King Turtle under the howling of the Fei Beast. The Land King Turtle was the top combatant amongst the Emperor level Fei disadvantages were slower movement. Has air to wear destructive rays on its back? When violent, it could spew out a powerful destructive ray from its mouth every minute with an extremely long range. Shania knew very well that she was not an opponent of this level at all right now. But as a teacher, she had to stall for time to keep her students safe. The destructive ray came. Boom, 500 meters of sweeping light. Under the huge explosion, Shania wasn't even qualified to get close. A single-handed witcher was useless. She was blown out more than 500 meters in the explosion. Flipping sideways and smashing into the ground nearly fainting. Teacher. Teacher Shania. Whatever. Run. Run separately. As much as you can. The machine nymphs fled. The land king turtle hissed and had to fire light. Makoto leaned over on Li Shi. You go. Your crazy teacher may have fainted. And she woke up. We'll also rush out in order to protect everyone. What are you going to do? Don't need you to care. You go. A deceleration. Mood dust jumped the car. Good thing the physique is now really strong rolled a few times to climb up. In the sand and dust there is not much to see. Mood dust twisted open the door of the car. The last time he came in he knew the door code. Teacher. Shania. What are you. Doing here. Come to help. Much dust directly sit on it. I didn't let you sit. What are you doing? Mu dust pulled the lever to start the engine. Not entering the tiger's den. Not getting the tiger's son. Deep breath. Teacher Shania. Let's go. What did you go to school to learn? That band of yours? What can it do? She suddenly stopped what she was about to say seeing Makoto's eyes. There wasn't the slightest bit of joking. His eyes were deep and penetrating. G body damaged 65. Two sub engine power consumption needs six times. Just now the sprint my energy has bottomed out. Forcibly start the linkage driver will be pumped. Wasn't it filled last time? Makoto was actually a bit embarrassed. Then it's really you who did it. Ahem. Probably. Is. A bit of an awkward picture. Let's spell it out together. Let's go. No one can look at the fire from a distance in the age of calamity. Cut. Education up teacher I come. Rolling over. Shinaya body body rolled right. Countless students who turned back saw Shinaya teacher's engine sounded again. She still has to charge. Shinaya teacher. Countless machine girl and driver tears. Everyone in the command center looked at the screen as Xin Xing kept her arms crossed over her chest. Throttling down to the floor. She began to set off again. This is the heavy cloud tactical center. Shinaya. Your energy are not enough to drive over. Do not move there are foreign beasts may not necessarily attack you yet. It's no use. She blocked the message. The call center replied. This is the red dragon center command Chendong. The air force is ready to 4-4 and up. Hit the land emperor turtle eyes. Delay time you are the hero of the red dragon. Border squad received. All troops take off and depart immediately. More than 10 berserkers 6 have a few Shania's right side. All the major commanders looked at the screen. The barrier assault vehicle was launched. 
and she couldn't even rush in front of the Land King Turtle with the amount of fuel she had. Inside the driver's cab, silver alloy linkages wrapped around Mu Dust's hands and feet. Mac Dust, I still have a chance to pop you out now. It's not easy to hug your thigh? Haven't touched it enough yet pop what? Still joking. Get on the road together. Fight. You guy. Shepherd Dust sensed, Shania prepare. I'll recharge you first. Sure enough, it was a hidden talent. The galaxy's heart was unleashed, and the two super output ports linked surging energy instantly injected. Oh, Shania felt her entire body filled with energy four energy tanks instantly pulled full. It was this feeling that the whole body flew up, but it was a lot more moderate than last time. Shania teach her how? Shania almost cursed. This what energy body to hold up cracked. Too horrible. She is now broken everywhere just her mouth is hard. It's not bad. It would be better if it could ease a bit more. This energy fullness was a little too much to handle. I'll use one of the output ports then. Instantly the pressure was halved. You can still control the output? Pretty much. Shania seemed to understand that last time it was probably at full power. The kid didn't confuse it and almost got her killed. Energy sufficient super power drive injected. Shania's body emitted a silvery glow. First crashing through a large scorpion. Rushing towards the area of those five berserkers six this image even has some people feeling that she is going to choose to blow herself up. Some people in the command center didn't dare to look. At this moment, Shania couldn't believe her eyes. She had already generated silver streams of light with Muchen this was a state that could only occur with a high degree of tacit understanding. Macdust's throbbing waves were suddenly massive and perfectly overlapped with her wave points. This was simply impossible. It hadn't appeared in hundreds of years. It had never been heard of wave segments dancing on their own and still jumping up and merging on their own. It was a slow change that had to happen one by one, day by day. 50 wave points perfectly overlapped. Linkage fit 50. Shania, who had fought on the front lines, knew too well the horror of this fit. Her ripple riot belonged to the extremely poor pandering type anyone who linked with her would be affected. But at this moment, interesting, dare to take a trip to hell with me? Not bad with a teacher. Silver streams of light float out from outside the armor of the wall attack battle vehicle. What is Shania doing? She's crazy. Crazy Shania. Shania don't do this. You won't survive the second time of the single transformation. Even if it wasn't destroyed by the alien beasts, her G body would not be able to maintain due to the multiple force transformations that she might exercise. The people in the command department and the people in the center stood up. Makoto had seen many times in the textbooks what to say when transforming. Fusion. Shania. Except dash. 50 fitting waypoints burst into their bodies. Makoto felt his soul fall from the air. Shinaya emerged from the water. The two souls crossed over in the water. Maxion was wrapped in silver light and disappeared. The barrier attack battle vehicle stood up at this moment. Its doors opening to extend its white arms, which clicked and transformed into metal armor. Slimming down, the armor instantly wrapped G body. Standing on two legs, black crystal armor covering the whole body has crimson flowing energy scales flashing. Front siege armor covering the chest armor, may titanium black crystal covering the whole body, 10 meters of the body female mechanic head sticking out, reddish red V light wings, black titanium gold helmet silver gray mask without five senses, explosive devil's figure mechanical life human form, war girl appeared, blood red cloak behind her back, the moment she landed on the ground her left hand held a shield of S grade iron blood, her right hand drew her back up a great beam long knife, a single slash killed five berserker six, the S grade, Iron-Blooded Heavy Armored Battle Goddess appeared to participate. Chapter 010, Iron Blood Goddess Full Battle Form. Everyone in the command center. The escaping Mecha Goddess students were all stunned at this moment. Mecha Goddesses who succeeded in transforming alone in addition to the huge wear and tear on the G-Body were 1 in 10,000 Mecha Goddesses who were able to do so. It requires a strong physique and unwavering perseverance. Transformation. Transformation succeeded? Oh my god. How did she do it? Shania Dash, her friends covered their mouths in tears as they watched the image. How could she do it with such severe damage? Shania. Zheng Dong Yuan looked at the screen. The seventh detachment of the attack group will always be with you. Shania charge. The final glory dash. Luo Tan don't shout so desperately. I can't hold back my tears. Kill five foreign beasts. Right hand long knife on the ground at the moment quiet. Analyst. Analyze the situation of the iron blood heavy armor wargirl Shania. Xian Qing's voice. Yes. Xian Cheng Chief Finger Metropolitan. Shania's situation core engine shattered requires six times the energy. Single warjack transformation requires four times the power energy to drive. Wargirl external scan damaged guess 70. S rank defense main weapon broken 23. Backup weapon is A rank beam longsword. Possibility of attacking Road King Turtle is zero. She's likely out of energy to move. Ten times the energy consumption? The three berserkers six hissed and rushed towards her, jumping up to crash into her. 
Suddenly Shania stepped forward, feeling the surging energy throughout her body. Shania had never enjoyed the feeling of not running out of energy and having to charge her up. Die dash shield strike unleashed the attack destroyer. Charge shield instantly moved forward 20 meters, and the three-headed burser curvy shattered in a bloody mist. The long blade in her right hand dragged on the ground behind her six thrusters allowing her to accelerate her jet glide forward. The analyst man was dumbfounded. Holy shit. Ahem. Jenching's voice. Xian Cheng Chief Finger Tutelary. She, she not only dragged ten times the power consumption but also activated the thrusters to move, which will have to be added two times ah. Shen Aya propelled forward to move the alien beasts attacking from the left and right, turning around sharp spinning chop, fluid, without any pause to cut it down. Crazy crazy crazy. Holy shit. Crap. So handsome. This was the communication channel of the command center, and the commanders were starting to pugilist the native language. Teacher. Teacher Shania is so strong. Isn't she a heavy armored battle maiden? This sword technique teacher is handsome. Shania didn't just feel his energy panic. Makoto wasn't simple either. Fusion mode. Fit 55 inch. It was still rising? It was also her first time experiencing the feeling of her body in the form of a fusion battleheim. There were three other iron blood heavy armor wargirls red dragon kingdom she had asked to teach two of them. But nothing about the body being so smooth. This was the difference between harnesses. What level was this guy's hidden talent is in the end? Shania be careful. The attack is coming. Frontal Land King Turtle sprayed destructive rays from its mouth in her direction, stabilizing her body. She stepped out with her front foot and inserted the alloy auxiliary armor into the ground at the position of her calf. Raise the shield. Deep power. Huge wall. The 10 meter shield of iron blood grew to 30 meters under the light. Rumble. The incomparably blinding light exploded into a small mushroom cloud as it completely hit Shania. And the fleeing machine girl students were also lifted out even from such a distance. MS. Shania. Shania. Dust filled the sky. And the battlefield had six alien beasts still approaching the center. The air force that was stalling in the sky came. The pilots above could see the explosion screen not daring to approach. It was quiet on this side of the command center. But from the air force's proximity communicator came Shania's voice. This is Battleheim Shania fighting against the Land King Turtle. The air force squad is on my command to stay away for now. What? What? Dusty rushed out with his shield on top of him. The shield of iron blood rolled but didn't shatter. Shania perfectly blocked the Land King Turtle's powerful attack. Oh my god. This is the defensive power of the iron blood heavy armor war girl? No. It's probably only her who can block so well. Oh my god how could she do it without a driver? She's damaged beyond 81. Six large scorpions surrounded up. These beasts had the brains to surround her from all angles and pounce on her at the same time. Shania. No need for you to say it. It was as if the minds were connected. Fusion. Fit 60. The blood red cloak behind her as light flash turned golden. At the same time on the silver gray face armor of the war girl. The face appeared face with three waves of lines to the ear position. Open. Eyes. Up. Iron blood goddess? Poo dash. Poo dash. Holy shit. Really opened her eyes. Open eyes was the industry's abbreviation for when a war girl enters a full combat state. The full battle form that could only be opened when the war girl entered oblivion with a fit of more than 60% with the harnesser. What's that? The iron blood goddess. What what? Support still has three minutes left. What? There's an iron blood goddess? Who transformed? Oh my god. Novels don't even dare to write that. MS. Shania? Iron blood goddess. Whisper. A tearing sound was heard. Didn't even see what was going on those six land level foreign beasts became blood mist. The iron blooded goddess rushed towards the land king turtle causing that emperor-level foreign beast to feel threatened. Its huge front limbs stepped forward. The ground burst out countless spikes, but the iron blood goddess jumped hundreds of meters and directly dodged them. The air-breaking blade slashed at the land king turtle's head. The land king turtle tore and howled as blood sprayed wildly from the three-meter wound. Another chop, inserted into the neck of the land king turtle, but the sound of shattering was heard. The A-ranked backup longsword shattered apart due to its lack of strength, leaving only the hilt. What? In the inner world Makoto linked with Shania's consciousness like he was floating in seawater. The strength of the weapon is too low. There's no money to buy a good one. Dang iron blood goddess only has a shield? No other weapons. It's my first time changing too. Coming. The moment it landed the destructive light struck. The iron blood goddess raised her shield with one arm and blocked it directly. Even though her legs broke through the earth she was blasted back a hundred meters. But Shania roared and charged up again. Attack destroyer impact. The terrifying impact knocked the Land King Turtle directly over. They don't say you're a tank behind your back, do they? Ha, huh? how is that possible with my size? Those guys will mostly shout cow. Broken car. Is that the teacher Zhang Chuanjia who peed condensation in fear? The two exchanged mental communication while fighting. 
The fusion state was like having no scruples or thinking. It's like that if you haven't been in battle. The iron blood goddess landed on the ground and flipped 50 meters backward, dodging the third destructive ray. The level of destruction is 89. One last time then. Facing the fallen land king turtle, the iron blood goddess slammed into it again pushing it out nearly a thousand meters. She narrowly missed her footing with the armor ruptured under her feet. Air force bombing support. Chen Dong commanded for them to change to support. Regardless of whether it was scraping or scratching, a distraction would do. Shania was panting very hard her mental power and Ji body had gone over the limit a long time ago. Half kneeling in the battlefield could not stand up. Iron blood goddess? Well done. Leave the rest to us. Support came. The large guild wanderer guild's five battle ages arrived. The Tsong Fong war girls have brought people to provide support. The Qin clan's people rushed to Qin Feng's aunt. If it's tricky just wait for us. The five from the defense department have half a minute left. The support had all come. Chapter 011 100 million credits mission reward. It's here. The support troops are here. Finally. Holding a crimson flag lance in his hand. The president of the wanderer guild. SK 129 streaming wind banner goddess. SS class. Rushed in open eyed form. Following behind the powerful thrusters were three SN armored battle girls. Grade A. Holding the great S weapon. The beam armor piercing lance. Class A armored wargirls were the most common, and many armored vehicles and tanks transformed into these types of wargirls, with different models. Pure white ornate armor with a helicopter's tail Linkong Battleheim, S rank, flying in the air, the pale wind goddess flying in midair falls, SS level. The two SA armored warjacks went to high ground to set up semi-automatic heavy firepower giant cannons. The guardian Battleheim unfurled a 30 meter V-shield and went to the injured machine girl's side for defense. To the north, two more freedom fighters arrived. The freelancers were warjacks that had not yet organized or joined a guild. Iron Blood Goddess did a very good job. The life rescue team is on its way. Your mission is complete leave the rest to us. Flowing Wind Banner Goddess raised her crimson banner to form a thousand meter beam barrier isolation. Even the Land King Turtle's destruction rays could be resisted once or twice. No longer need to command. This Land King Turtle was beaten by Shania without much combat power. Shania's petite body gasped as her chest armor rose and fell violently. Undo the fusion state turned over and changed back to mechanical form. The mechanical body was smoking. Makoto returned to the driver's seat. Only at this moment did he feel tired and sweaty all over. The first, fusion, is several times the normal physical exertion. Nothing to rest on. I need to find a place. She drove off towards a wooded area not far away. Everyone else was watching the Land King Turtle being blasted to death by the various battle girls. Shinaya's weakness surged up as her consciousness began to blur and she bounced Makoto out near the edge of the forest to shoot to a farther location. The mechanization dispersed and her human form fell to the ground gradually losing consciousness. I don't know how long it took. Mu Dust woke up and felt that the light was a bit harsh. Looking to the left the first thing he saw was, so big dash. The next bed is looking at the optical screen Sheen Fei Fei blinks her eyes. I mean this big room is, where is it? Allah Allah Allah, woke up a Mac Dust student. This is the college 9 treatment center you slept for a day and a night. Sheen Fei Fei's left arm was bandaged. The attack of the foreign beast did not cause major damage to her G body, but it needed to recover for five days. Next to the bed were two other witches. Mu Chen is awake? You slept heavily. We didn't even call you for dinner. Han Shuangyan was also infusing nutritional energy. Li Shi left in the morning. That was a cool match you guys had. Classmates helping each other should be. Nukin responded. Zhou Xia now felt that Nukin was great. And such a driver was not bad, even if it is an E-class band. Long and handsome, the person is also low-key. How is the situation? I also don't know how I fainted. She said that you guys were affected by the explosion, and you were blown out. Xin Fei Fei's expression had a few bad smiles in addition to being flirtatious. It was as if she knew something. Li Shi was covering for her. The screen appeared in front of the hospital bed and Xin Fei Fei scratched the news to him. Reporting the news is very detailed access to the optical drive analog screen. Stereoscopic holographic news. This major outbreak. The academy died 167 machine girl students, 46 driver students, 72 seriously injured and scrapped, 24 seriously injured and rescued, 1295 students had varying degrees of injuries, there was also the image of Shania being resuscitated, former first line attack team leader teacher Shania, the iron blood heavy armor battle maiden desperately covered her students, and fought against the top imperial level alien beast, the land king turtle, in a single transformation. There are some clips of video of the combat footage, heavy damage to the alien beast, holding on until the rescue force arrived to destroy the alien beast, a large number of messages on the internet that were touched by Shania, how is Shania's situation, 
Zhou Xia and Han Xuanyan were too embarrassed to ask, and now the three of them looked at Qin Fei Fei. Can't show you guys? Inside information. Took the current medical best organism life essence. After oral intake or self-regenerating recovery. The one in my family said that the teacher's single second transformation. G body is likely to be scrapped. The current inspection situation. So that many senior here people are stupid. Seems to be able to maintain the mechanical form. But she can recover to within 8 layers of damage is amazing. The normal situation teacher will have to take a taxi in the future. And the life expectancy may be greatly reduced. Heim body damage is over 80. Unable to perform a mechanical transformation. I hope sensei can recover. This incident has a big impact. I heard from my mom that both teacher Zhang Chuanjiao and teacher Kai Jia were taken away for investigation. What's this? The vice principal was taken away for investigation by the defense hubs. Much dust off the nutrient solution body nothing wrong. I'll go out for a walk. Take off the bandage on the forehead there is a scar. It is estimated that Shania was bounced out and smashed on the ground. Luckily, Mu Dust's head is iron. Change others, at least concussion. Outside is also chattering countless people are discussing. I heard that this time, the foreign beast was introduced. No way. An underground transportation pipeline? Didn't you guys look when you were escaping? The eyes of that foreign beast looked like it had eaten something berserk. I saw it too. It felt even more berserk than in the lesson plan. I heard my father say that it might have been someone from the great kingdom. Shouldn't it be the beautiful? They're the worst. And it's not the first or second time they've done it now that the world is so dangerous. Walking to the shade of the playground bleachers, Li Shi was also here to blow off some steam. Awake? Intermittent memory loss yet? What happened? Makoto walked down. Teacher was still smart enough to pop you out in the end. Otherwise you might have been in trouble. The only person who knew the reason for Shania's transformation was Li Shi. Nukin was likely to be investigated in the car. And now that he had no ability to resist, he would definitely be subjected to all sorts of experiments. His situation hadn't even come out in history. After saying that, Li Shi walked away. The fact that they kept standing together would be said something by the students who saw them. This was the troublesome part of the academy. Nukun. Nukun. So handsome yesterday. Hey. Nukun. How's the recovery going? How about going fishing this afternoon to relax? Relax. How about we go study the study materials later? The other students were greeting him when they saw him. And the witches practicing transformations in the playground were flashing their headlights at him. Boys had also asked him to go relax and unwind. Classes were delayed for an estimated 5 days. Some students were still slowing down. Some remembered that image and started practicing to be strong. Everyone had different ideas. After politely declining on the grounds that his body was injured, Makoto first returned to his dormitory. Wait. It seems like he missed something. The student who studied the material. Special note next time. The cabin door was immediately closed. The two quests have been completed. Open the system and click to receive the reward. Ding completed mission 1 with a mecha transforming into battle girl form. Level B. Obtain 2 lunar energy life function recast cards. For details, this is a treasure that can regenerate a mecha heim body or a human limb universe, and can be used on the same life form up to once per year. Put it in the system first. Ding completion of mission 5 to face off against an imperial alien beast head on. Level A. Receive a reward of 10. 000. 000. 000, 000, 000 credits. Host's physique is upgraded by 100 points. Gained a special S rank ability. Gained a special S rank ability. Chapter 012 Equipment Shopping and Trading Center. 100 million? Suddenly, he remembered what someone from Blue Star had said about doing a small goal first. 100 million credits appeared on the Pulse Pass watch. Mu Chen swallowed his saliva. A normal Red Dragon Country worker would only be paid 500 credits per month. Tapping on the attribute interface. Driver, Mu Dust. Level, 7. Physique value, 238. Attribute, Primordial Wave. Talent, Grade A Super Power Drive. Grade SSS Galactic Heart. Special Ability, SS Level, Flare X. Ranks can be interpreted as growth. Learning and practical combat, as well as linkage are increased. Ranks enhance the driver's and machine girl's body, lifespan, and recovery power. Right now, Makoto's physique. A punch to the meta alloy headboard will hurt. Ah, it was still dented. More than 10 times that of a normal person. Flare EX, an active move that releases destructive high temperatures. 100% of the power of the war girl form in the human state. Can't experiment in my own dorm. The body was still a bit tired, and bought some food to go back to the medical center. In addition to the three witches just now, Trainman, Bay Creek was also there. She was on good terms with Zhou Xia. Mukin, your family gave you money? Buy so many delicious things. You don't have to be polite. It's not good to just get nutritional fluids when you're injured. So take whatever you want to eat yourself. Then I'm not polite. 
Me too, Zhou Xia and Bai Xiao she were choosing. The machine lady had a large amount of food, and with just the nutritional fluid, she always felt that her body was empty. Han Xuanyan also took an apple. I ate it just now. I'll take it later. Qin Fei Fei never had a big lady frame. Han Xuanyan's family worked for the Qin family, and the two were very close. There was chattering over their eating. Nukin's bed was in the corner, and next to her, Qin Fei Fei lowered her voice. How does it feel to link up with Xi? Mu Chuan looked at her purple pupils, the flirtatious movement of her right hand blocking half of her face, squeezing a huge. Nope, this woman has the attribute of belly darkness. I'm familiar with her. Your cooperation tacit understanding is linked. Sexy school girl so gossip? Girls, just like these. Curious. You're curious that we actually linked up? It's all of them. She wouldn't just let anyone link up. You guys are the latest to arrive. Let me think. Ouch. Ouch. Out of town met some bad. Bad guy right. It couldn't have been you who arranged it. Could it? Is it so direct? Encountering that kind of thing. I was caught. 1 TIB. Caught? There are images. This Qin Fei Fei is too good at it. Mu Feng didn't dare to think. Double change machine lady. Is it able to change into two battle maiden forms? Yes. But there is one that can only self-provide weapons. And the talent awakening can only choose one of them. How does a harnessed self-provided weapon? Infusion form? Work? She raised her hand. Her white right armpit. Usually, when fusion, the mind is in harmony. The driver provides the weapon. It is best not to have more than two. The two people are best to have had this kind of cooperation. Choose this position to stick up. Easy to hold. Transmission of weapons also need to buy SNE and ABP ports. The price is not expensive. The weapon model is different. Don't buy the wrong one. Worthy of being one of the schoolmasters. I have answered you a few. I'm curious about your wave. Really? Can it link up? Barely. Rolled over and went to sleep. This Qin Fei Fei, usually gentle and elegant, now how to feel a fallen demon ah, and then look at her, it will require top control shooting skills. Qin Fei Fei got the answer. Purple pupils blinked. Interesting things increased. Shepherd dust rested and recovered well. And the next day everyone left the treatment center. After taking a shower and changing his clothes, he was now rich. Usually, he was studying in the academy bookstore and had no money to spend. With the system bound, the goal was going to change. It's like he said, no one can watch from the other side of the river in the face of calamity. Buy some clothes. Handsome guy buying a house? We have all types of houses here. Do you want to consider the Windstarter neighborhood? A lot of young witches live there. And the top match is 1. 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0 credits. Ground Maple neighborhood is also good. There is a lot of space there. The machine lady headlights. And the price is cheap. And new 200. 0, 0, 0 credits turnkey. The house area is considered in a couple months. Next to it is the tool store. See Mu Feng walk away. The men in the middle order said coldly. That kid looked at play. A look is a poor goods. You should recommend him the kind that's full of F-ranked machinima and pilots for the neighborhood. That's right. He probably won't earn a million credits in his entire life. Makoto ignored them. Pretty girl. By the SUP full module modification toolbox. The few machinima clerks in the store froze. Hello guest. The SUP full module modification toolkit is the best toolkit for civilian use. 5 million credits. No, can't haggle, but we'll send you a set of titanium alloy semi-automatic mechanical silo. I know, is it in stock? Take it now. Mac Dust was calm. Upgrading to change and repairing the machine lady, tools were a must. Having the money to use the best of course. Ah, sir, Zheng Qingqing at your service. The pulse pass wristwatch swiped the money and immediately packed it. The machinists in the store looked at Makoto, all of them with stars in their eyes. Sir, it's being vaporized and compressed for you. Ten minutes to send it to your Pulse Pass wristwatch. After opening it for the first time, the store offers five free times of vaporizing compression again. Mr. Mukin, this is your JIP card. You are a 3G member of our store. Mukin nodded. Thank you, Mr. Mu Dust. My name is Zhang Qingqing, Class D Lucid Water Coop. Our store's member service specialist. Please feel free to contact me anytime you need anything. 24 hours a day directly swiping 5 million credits. It looked like it was still coming from the direction of the academy. The son of a large consortium, a large power awe. The pulse pass wristwatch showed that the goods had been stowed. Mr. Makchen, we have a listing in the Tianji community. Would you like to consider it? The agent who was sneering just now. Immediately, he was cheeky and fawning again. Not considering it for now. You have an idea. Welcome to come and consult at any time. We special G pick up and drop off. It seemed that in any era, it was always like this. Shepherd's dust doesn't resent anyone. Any era is all about life. 
Today's core destination, Dig Self provided weapon trading hub center. Registration was required to go in, as was the purchase of weapons. Any country's weapons trading center is strictly controlled. Going in, technology is full of sense. Everywhere is a gorgeous booth. Some large weapons also have a woman detailed introduction. Personal equipment. Virtual trial. There are countless witches and pilots. Ordinary working class people would not consider coming in. The fifth generation be great beam long knife 300, 000 credits. The sixth generation wants 800, 000. The seventh generation is even 2 million. The sixth generation B engine upgrade module was 800, 000. And the eighth generation A grade modified beam cannon was 8 million credits. No wonder Shania also shouted that she had no money. With her ceiling income in the first tier, she had to empty her wallet to buy a 7th generation weapon. This was battlefield life-saving equipment, and it was naturally expensive. 1. 5 million credits for a 6th generation A-class beam armor piercing gun. Walking around, there was a wide array of weapons and upgrade modules, module modifications, and finding an excellent G repairer, were not cheap either. 7th generation A-grade Dawnbreaker missile, supports rapid launch, high accuracy, and responds to a variety of environments that are not suitable for blasting. The power is also comparable to the S-grade 7th generation. A-grade price. S-grade effect. Good stuff. Mu Dust stood next to a woman with a golden double diamond hairstyle. Did you know that too? There's still such an insightful plebeian. Ben. Hey. Mu Dust. Chapter 013. Spending money on weapons. Oh, our beautiful Miss Beldet. Actually knows my name. Can this be construed as a supreme honor? Beldet was tall. And that golden drill styled hair was especially obvious. Ah ha 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 ha. You're a nice plebeian. She wasn't wearing the blue and white military uniform cluster today. A blue tracksuit would have been nice. Beldet's witches who had studied abroad were in a separate study abroad class. The performance was good when the Mackin plebeian awakened to the training ground, and this young lady barely remembers it. In fact, you want to say that the awakening was a clown. The whole school remembers it. What are you looking at? Where is your pro guard group? Here within the city. This great lady is not a glass maiden. Everything needs to be protected. Makoto laughed badly, but rumor has it that the corners of the city, there are G-catchers everywhere. Like Beldet U, is a key target. Not only can't transform and move, pretty or study abroad. She visibly swallowed saliva. Don. Hmm. Plebeian you still want to scare this lady. I can them blasted to hell with one shot. Right hand crossed her waist, arrogantly said. Little nervous. Today really didn't bring a pro guard group. Only to see Makoto pull up her left hand. One of the Blue Eagle Kingdom's etiquettes. As an alumnus, I can still barely act as a knight. Beldet's face slightly red. Immediately folded her fan to block half of her face and laughed. Ah, Mu Dust this young lady appreciates you very much. So I'll be gracious that you can call this young lady by her real name. In fact, Mu Dust was trying to look at the data. Machine Lady, Beldet. Rank, 3. Mechanical Form, 7th Generation Defender Surface to Air Rocket Cannon. S Rank. Special Ability, Fire Suppression. S rank, able to replicate the attack weapon that was fired. It's really something, having a special ability. There would be one or two out of a thousand amongst the machine girls, with special abilities that had been understood as essential gifts that would be awakened at level 1. Beldet, as a key international student, might have awakened it before she came. The day before yesterday was able to well summon so many classmates to fight back together. Apart from her missy habits, her character wasn't actually bad. 7th generation dawn missile. It does suit you. 2 million credits apiece. A little. Not enough money? The right hand tossed her hair. Humph. Plebeian. How could this big miss lack money? This kind of cheap goods. Not suitable for this young lady at all. Let's go. Go downstairs to take a look. Downstairs is the 6th generation. Shepherd Dust pretended not to know that the 6th generation was only 800. 000 for one piece. And the power was twice as bad. She paid to buy two. That expression is obviously cutting meat. Simu Dust eyes. Immediately explain, this miss practice play with, real combat are with 8 generation, right right right, practicing 4 generations is too expensive, the two of them walked and looked, Mu Chuan you're also here to buy weapons, use it, in case of an outbreak in the territory, a little self protection, it makes sense, the trailer crane G can also be fitted with armor piercing bullets, this young lady is bored, so I'll give you, the commoner, a popular science, Beldet was a noble lady, studying from childhood to adulthood, the knowledge reserve was not something that could be compared to Moodust's two years of study. The advantages and disadvantages of each weapon. The tiny tips. Assault continuous pulse guns. How many rounds are best to snap at a time? 
These were all practical combat experiences taught to her by her elders. And this arrogant young lady does not have much heart. You ask what weapons are suitable for what machine girl. She will also give you recommendations. What if it's a war girl like Mess, Shania, Hoomph, Siege Vehicles and Armored Vehicles, Non-Gun Girls and Tank Girls. This young lady especially recommends your Red Dragon Country's Rift God Gun. Walking over to the display case, the Rift God Gun has a high output power, suitable for heavy war girls with great strength, top destructive power and penetrating power, especially with your Red Dragon Nation's design. There are two modes of spinning and bursting, and the premium isn't too high. Sentimentally, Beldet liked the drill stuff. She recommended it well. Hiss. That's expensive. No. That's cheap. The blue pupil glanced at the price and backed away. 6th generation A grade 2 million. 7th generation S grade 5 million. When Beldet didn't pay attention, Mu Chuan Pulse Pass wristwatch leaned up and directly placed an order. 8th generation Scythe under splitting god gun. S grade. 20 million credits. The item has been virtually compressed into your chakra tong wristwatch. Teacher Shania such an excellent. UE grade banding don't consider it. This young lady recommend this to you. Give it to that Li Shi. There's a good chance oh. Makoto blinked his eyes. She's just a D-level 5th generation motorcycle. Still on campus. You guys match well. You have to have money to start. Give it to her with a chance. Beldet was still a relationship expert? Romantic teenage reading didn't miss much ah. Pointing to the multifunctional missile launcher not far from the booth. With its own blaster. This a grade missile launcher. Universal. No matter if it is a gun girl. Ship girl. Small motorcycle. As long as it is not a micro power engine. It can be equipped with a 6 generation 10 consecutive rounds. The power is well average. But the practicality is very high. 1 million credits. A lot of generation 6 weapons don't have an S rank. Let's see. She looked at biting her nails. 7th generation S grade 4 million. Saved for 2 months. I can also add one. Then if I buy an 8th generation S class. Can I go hook up with an S class machine girl ground to air rocket launcher as well? Beldet froze for a moment. Then she lightly kicked at Makoto. You plebeian have a lot of guts. And you dare to joke about this young lady. This Mrs. Prince Charming. That is to be able to link fit with this miss by more than 50. And to have an S class energy talent. Cough cough. You ah. Better go find a trailer. While Beldet was self absorbed. Mu Chen swept his wristwatch. His movements were too fast for the average person to see. Spending 20 million credits. He purchased the 7th generation SS grade black mantle multifunctional missile launcher. The 8th generation SS grade cost 50 million. And there was still a reservation to be made. The two had just taken two steps when the woman in the white uniform walked up. Hello, Mr. Mu Dust. The weapon you just purchased needs to be registered again. Please sign. What did you buy? Maxchen? Bought two at random. Hoomph. Red Dragon Country is not bad. Buying some cheap goods and registering them so carefully. Beldet also praised. The customer service agent froze for a moment. Only those over the 10 million level registered a second time to confirm. And would also send the port for free. Thank you beautiful lady for the compliment. You will definitely be a bright new star in the future. After registering. Walked a few steps. Hey, that's not right. Makchen. How come the Dawnbreaker missile I bought doesn't require a second registration? Crossing her arms. She coldly grunted. Targeting foreigners isn't it? Just now this lady shouldn't have complimented that plebeian. And the premiums of many good things here are even higher than our Blue Eagle Country's trading center. Doubling two or three times. The two of them had heard. As they strolled around. Quite a few people talking about the Black Market Trading Day. Makchen. You've heard of the Black Market Trading Day. I have heard teacher Kai Jia unintentionally say that it seems to be once every three months. Hoomph. I've heard of it as well. Those goods aren't registered. 50% to 60% off the price. And I heard that there are all sorts of rare weapons. As well as modified core weapons. Just now also saw the Machine Girl Transformation Core where B level are 2 million. If, can transform Shania S level is 25 million. The premium was indeed serious. If we know where it is, this lady also wants to go shopping. It's to pick up a bargain, right? Ha, huh? Mac Dust this is what you don't understand. Money can't be spent like this. The Transformation Core here has a premium of 3 or 4 times. There are many other things that pull up the price a lot. Isn't buying it just a wrongdoer? The two walked and chatted. Very much like they were on a date. Suddenly a man drilled out from the side. Two of you. Want to go to the black market to trade? Tell the two of you that the trading day is today. Chapter 014. The Maction who easily fought 10. Oh, plebeian. You said it's today? Beldat came to be interested. Yes. The black market has cheap prices for all sorts of high grade coatings. You two should know that many manufacturers can't afford to pay the high entrance fee here for their stuff. And foreign goods are also vetted for trouble. 
you're the salesman over there? Makoto carefully sized up the other party. No, 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 there's no shortage of buyers over there. The level of bustle is no worse than here. Handsome men and women are rich masters. I'll lead the way to go just a few streets around here and I'll be there. How about one? Zero, zero, zero credits? The weapons one wants to buy start at several hundred thousand. Thinking about the bottom floor for just 500 credits a month. It seems reasonable. Yes, plebeian lead the way for this lady. Coming out of the trading center. The man was chatty. Hand waving and introducing all sorts of things. Paint jobs for inside sales. Armor plates. Lights. Bumpers. Landing gear for the flying G. Painted rockets. Tracking guides. I heard there's also a cheap modification core unit this time. Only 5 million for the S class. 5 million. So much cheaper. 50% off the entire price. As a S class machine girl. Veldette was heartened. With her identity loaning 3 million credits. It shouldn't be a problem to pay it back in 2 months. Eating cucumbers for 2 months would be good. Makoto didn't say anything along the way. But her eyes kept looking left and right. Still not there yet? Beautiful young lady. The entrance is definitely not in the center of the city. It's almost there. Walk past the empty lot of the abandoned factory in front of you. Turn the corner and you'll be there. It should be here. Right? Makoto suddenly spoke. Hmm. Mu Dust looked at the man. You want more than just the 1000 credits to lead the way. Right? At this moment, there was the sound of emergency brakes at the entrance and exit of the abandoned open space. Two large modified cars blocked the intersection. From the left and right of the abandoned factory building, as well as the cars, nine strong men walked down. A small range of signal blockers were inserted first. Ho, oh, kid, good observation skills, sweeping out all the credits on you, as well as that beautiful foreign lady, the engine and weapon of the machine girl form. What do you guys want? It's a death sentence for the Red Dragon Kingdom to do this. Beldet scolded. Ouch. Still very much in the know? Ha 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 ha. Little girl knows a lot. Look really good. Foreign witches. No take. Uncles can manually pickpocket on you and play some adult stuff. Come over again. Don't blame me for being rude. One shot can fuck you all to hell. Beldet prepared to transform. Ha ha ha. So it's a weapon girl? There. A strong wave of light interfered with the shako and a crate was dragged out of the car on the left, opening it up to reveal purple exotic colored winged machinery inside. Is that, the wings of Fey Sound Blocker 5? Beldet recognized it. It's not easy to meet a fat sheep. We've put in our blood. We've brought all our treasures. This fate beast didn't have much battle power. Its wings flapped to send out a wave that hindered the mecha nymphs from transforming into their mechanical forms, and it would also have some effect on the wargirl form. Beldet transformed. The body half mechanical and changed back. Really cannot. How? Do? Beldet really panicked a bit at the moment. This was the rumored Kime Grabber. They had all talked about it in school. They were all beastly things, but they didn't expect that they would dare to strike even within Heavy Cloud City. Makoto stretched out his right hand in front of Beldet, holding her back. At times like this, it triggers the main plot inside a romance novel, where the hero saves the beauty and gives his body in return. Beldet looked at Makoto. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. But Laughed me to death. Kid. Watched too many fantasy dramas? All 10 G-grabbers were laughing. A driver who walks out of school. You really take yourself seriously kid. He took off his jacket and muscled up. Without a Kimikomi, a driver is no different than an ordinary person. Cocking his neck, he made a clicking sound. The big man with the sunglasses rushed up and threw a punch at Makoto. Beldet closed her eyes in fear. These people were strong. But, Maxion's left hand caught the other party's fist. And his body didn't move at all. In an instant, the right fist struck the opponent's chest with the sound of bones shattering. The wind of the fist penetrated out from the opponent's back. The sunglasses big man directly rolled his eyes. And with a kick, he kicked out 10 meters. What? Shepherd Dust didn't pause. These 10 people were very close. Jumping up and kicking another one. The sound of facial bones shattering. These people were scum. With his character, Moo Dust would not half pity them. Every hit was with full force. What's the situation this kid? Easily dodging the opponent's fist. The difference in speed. Uppercut to fly. Then grabbed the leg and pulled it down to the crotch for an elbow strike. Ah. More miserable sound than killing a pig. There was a sneak attack from behind. Grab the other's arm. Over the shoulder slam. Slam it on the ground. Kick the place in the face. Dragged it up and threw it out to smash over the two people. The powerful force made them wail in pain on the ground. This kid. What? Weird stuff. Beldet's fingers blocked her mouth and her eyes widened. Shepherd Dust had just knocked over six people from the other side in just a few seconds? What a fast speed. Strength. And. Good. Handsome ah. Beldet's eyes were glowing. Hey, uncle guys, 
Why aren't you laughing? The shepherd's dust crooked his neck and flung the blood on his fist towards the ground. Together, the remaining four took out the folding beam knives on their waists and rushed up. Mu Dust dodged nimbly, becoming more and more familiar with body changes and better coordinated. He who usually had exercise, plus the current inverse human body value of more than 10 times, an iron cushion, knocking over two people, spraying saliva, he flew out 10 meters, infected by Shania, to what not to obey is to bump, really not to show any chicken feet, the academy has always had fighting classes, their class or Shania taught, sliding shovel, up fist blast to the face, seventh, then the eighth, there are still two guys left with beam guns, bang bang, two gunshots exploding legs, the last two guys just stood up and screamed miserably as they fell to their knees screaming, not looking, Shepherd Dust made a jump first and returned to Beldet's side, shielding her behind him, the sound of front and rear entrances crashing, six armored mecha nymphs crashed up and smashed the armored vehicles blocking the road, artificial ones are just brittle law, it's may you have thicker skin, more than 30 people, over the wall, appear, both men and women, and the crane truck mechs transform back into human form, Beldet looks at the roof of the abandoned factory building, the woman who fired earlier jumps down as well, she raises her hand, her right arm turning into a gun pointed this way, cyborg talent, a talent that can exist in both human and mechanical form, the most common talent awakened by a level 15 mechanical lady, and its utility was high, these people aren't from the security hub or defense hub, Beldet whispered as she hid behind Makoto, let's, first, put our hands up, light energy guns were pointed at them, numbering 30 to 40, no matter how capable Makoto was, he couldn't beat so many with weapons, the group was dressed in ordinary clothes, most of them were dirty construction site uniforms, the organic woman was wearing a ramen store apron, there was even a clerk from a passing flower store that Makoto had an impression of, and this woman with the gun pointed at them, in her early twenties, short black hair, eyes makeup wearing blue, bronze healthy skin, and a hot body, wearing short leather pants, exposed navel, leather jacket, sexy wild cheetah, the body is not bad, little brother, these ten people, is it okay for us E-Fire to take over? Chapter 015, Organizing E-Fire, Cadre Dina, E-Fire, is that the name of your plebeian organization? Yes, you, the foreign missy, shouldn't know, Makoto interrupted the two conversations, there's no problem with giving you the people, however, can you grant us a simple request? After all, using us as bait was still successful right? Yi Fire's men had already tied up the gang of G-catchers and were carefully working on recovering the Fey wings. That thing could be worth two million credits. Hoomph, kid, still making demands from us? A kid with two strokes. And his strength isn't small. But guns don't look at these. The seven or eight uncles looked at Makoto. Say it, I'll judge. This young woman was their leader. Today is the black market trading day, right? Although that guy lied to us, at least half of his words are true. We want to go to the trading ground so please he fire which ones just lead the way, several men froze, just this, Dina looked at Makoto's eyes, the arm returned to normal, later, I'll lead you there, the trading ground we, ye fire, are one of the ones in charge of, happy cooperation, Makoto stretched out his hand, che, you guy, you found out about our people when you came out of the trading center, underestimated you, there was no blame for them baiting him, having strength and being good at talking, not bad, of course, Mu Chen also felt that if they were in danger, Yi Fire's people would make a move. At the beginning, Dina was aiming this way, and Mak Chen had sensed it. The purpose of the handshake. Mashinima, Dina, age 21, rank, 15, identity, senior cadre of the Heavy Cloud Civil Organization Yi Fire. Ripple, initial small change. Assessment S rank, initial proof of not having fused with someone to transform into a wargirl. Mechanical form, 8th generation Aurora 16 artillery heavy machine gun. Grade A. Talent 1, Cyborg Machine Girl, 8th Generation Machine Girl, or a Gun Girl, no wonder it's a cadre, focus on cultivation, however, the 7th and 8th generation of the Machine Girl Ripple Disorder, linkage success rate greatly reduced, Ye Fire quickly cleaned up the surrounding area, the damaged debris all cleared away, the men of Ye Fire laughed and talked, caught these dogs a few times, didn't realize it was caught like this, this is not the mantis catching the cicada and the yellow sparrow in the back, what's behind, that student took care of it, that student is an expert, I don't think you three can last more than 10 seconds, Dina, the defense hub people are coming, let's retreat, signal Heim shouted from high above, May, Xiao Mei was a 5th generation C-class small armored car, get in, I'll take you there, the trading ground is on the other side of the city, Beldet glanced at Mu Dust, Missy trusted him now, let's go, get in the car and leave, 
so as not to have to toss and turn with the people from the security hub for the day. Xiaomi chirped words about the buns. Dina, is there a reward for us catching them this time? We can finally buy new clothes. May, there are other people in the car. He he he, I forgot in my happiness. You ye fire are a civic organization? There were quite a few civic organizations, big and small, and it was the first time I had seen one. Humph, we ye fire is one of the top three civic organizations in heavy cloud yet. These few streets are full of our people. Scared little handsome, those punches of yours were really powerful. Dina added, Ye fire is an organization of the bottom level machinists and pilots to survive. Unite, help each other, and help those in need. The bald uncle on the co-pilot chimed in. The people in the security hub are unreliable. And the people in the defense hub are too busy to be bothered with minor inconveniences. So we do all these things and they turn a blind eye. What do you call them young people? Beldet elegantly pointed at herself. Blue Eagle Country. Second daughter of the Alushia family. Beldet. Seventh generation S-class defender surface to air rocket launcher. Wow. Seventh generation S-class. Oh my god. Xiao Mei exclaimed. But Dina and the bald uncle didn't react much. Didn't ask you. Missy has nothing to do with us. Dina was nonchalant. You. You bunch of plebeians. Humph. Mukun. Do you want to come to the driver's seat? Little brother Macduin. You are so powerful. Or professionally trained. Do you want to link up and try? Sorry. I only have classy band. Ha. Huh? What? You only have classy? The bald uncle was a bit surprised. Ah ha 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 ha. He's right. We've only been drinking the awakening liquid for a few days. And Makoto's bands are just like bungee jumping. Beldet added. The wave band doesn't mean everything. That's just a test of the instrument. As long as you can link the mechanical form, it can be just as reliable a battle force. Dina took the initiative to speak for Mu Chen. What you, you said is somewhat reasonable law. Beldet was very bad at dealing with Dina like this. Ye fires cadres, there are many others who have survived the battlefield. When the beast wave comes, countless people have to go to the battlefield. And with the massive sacrifices, the commanders don't have the time to care about the bottom tier of pilots and witches. We, ye fire, are the ones who organize these people, unite on the battlefield, and survive down more. Dina has been on the battlefield? Three years ago, in the defense of Yulong City, I still remember now, only half of the half a million machine nymphs and harnesses came back. This beast tied, they had learned about it at the academy. Yulong district had the most tragic sacrifices. Here we are, you guys haven't wandered around, right? I'll take you around to familiarize yourselves. Yeah, I'll leave the handling to you guys. Go relax. Ha ha ha, you youngsters have more contact. Dina was bounced off the bus by May. Ha ha, with a laugh. May throttled down and ran. The atmosphere of Yifire was good. The east side of the city, close to the exit, had a number of armed patrols at the entrance. Entry required 1000 credits. Dina, you come to hang out too? These two? My friends, Makoto and his girlfriend. That's too bad. Dina, what are you talking about? Ha ha ha, just kidding. There's no charge for your own people. This to wear. It was necessary to wear a mask to go in. It was an underground trade after all. There are three black market trading entrances. This side is Yi Fire's people in charge. Take the elevator and go down. Dina, Nukin is not this young lady's boyfriend. This young lady's boyfriend will be at least an S-class driver in the future. With, it's just saving you 1000 bucks. You, hum, the underground city was huge. Every city had underground cities that lived a lot of underclass people, and many of them were dirty. Dina took a special look at Beldet and realized that she didn't show an expression of disgust. She even offered to help a child pick up a leather ball. It seemed that she had also underestimated this aristocratic young lady, probably with her whole body, just a hard mouth, coming to the trading floor. This isn't smaller than the dig trading center, right? The scale is about the same. Goods variety, cheap, but need a good pair of eyes, hiding a lot of broken things, not allowed to try on the body. No need to register here. Take the money and deliver. Oomph, this lady certainly has a good pair of eyes. Beldet was immediately attracted by the price. 2 million for the S-grade heavy artillery armor coating? 8th generation level quantum dual blade S rank is only 6 million? There's really 5 million for the S-grade transformation core here. She was super heartened to see this. Chapter 016, High Tech Scramble Storm. A mecha usually had 5 core upgrade areas. Reformation cores upgrade engines and power drives. Paint to upgrade defensive armor. Weapons upgrade attack and defense means. Turbojet upgrades mobility and flight requirements. The Pulse Core upgrades mechanical coordination and energy upgrades. Each battle maiden has its own primary and secondary weapons, which are best suited to its core weapon or defense. And the core of the battle maiden's life is the key body. 
which is several generations old and almost impossible to upgrade in the normal way. G body can self-recovery, but the recovery power is limited. Shania did not have a normal fusion change over the war girl, naturally did not equip these things, are the body of the machine girl and comes with the main weapon. Of course, change in upgrading the Megane. To consider the tolerance of the Megane, power consumption, and the ability of the driver. Powerful driver can provide strong energy, enhance the G body tolerance, as well as greatly increase the power of the weapon. Modification cores were good, and they could be used by all the same class of nymphs. Beldat couldn't move her legs as she looked at it. The price is good. Dina crossed her arms over her chest. You're displaying arms, aren't you? Dina was about the same as Beldet. As if she wasn't as good as Li Shi. Makoto leaned his hand up to touch it. S-Class Transformation Core, 7th 10th component is broken. 84 new. The system still has this ability? There are two breakages. Not buying. Mac Dust pulled Beldet. You can tell? Fiery eyes. See through everything. Beldet blinked her eyes and immediately covered her chest. Cough cough cough. Don't have that ability. Beldet trusted Mood Dust, then Mood Dust. Quickly help this young lady take a look. In addition to transforming and upgrading the core, there was also the Jiao Feng destroyer missile. The armor coating. Mood Dust could tell if it was good or bad just by touching it. We'll buy this one. And this one. The price is really good. This great A pulse is only 1 million. She was spending all the credits inside her pocket. Makoto wasn't ambiguous either. Sixth generation A grade vehicle mounted laser machine gun. 1 million for two. Sixth generation B grade broad axe bombs. Directly four boxes of 80. 800. 000 for all of them. Fifth generation flash flare. Sixth generation signal shield. Half a circle down spent two. 5 million. Makchen. You guys are really rich? The black market had a lot of goods. But the main ones were the fifth and sixth generation products. While they weren't paying attention, they said they were going for convenience. Maction immediately went to buy the S grade transformation upgrade core for six, five million, as well as the S grade black abyssalist armor coating for three, five million. Have you heard? That 38 million seventh generation SSD aside cannon was seconded. Crap, who's so rich? Many people in the surroundings hotly debated. Beldet and Dina saw Maction return. Maction, when you went to facilitate, Someone bought that Godslayer cannon we were looking at just now? Is that so? Which guy is so rich? Mu Chen said to himself, the Pulse Pass wristwatch showed that there was still 14 million left, and it was almost spent. Mu Dust, come help me look at this too. Seeing that Mu Chen had a good eye, Dina couldn't help herself. The machine ladies of this world. There was little interest in any bags, any luxury items. What they liked were all kinds of weapons, defensive gear, paint jobs, and new tires, windows, headlights, and what not. The competition is who has bigger headlights, who has better looking armor, handsome transformations, and whose gun is more grippy. Not bad, not bad, this lady is satisfied today. Returning to the school entrance, Beldet shook her hair. Next time on the black market trading day, Mu Dust remembered to choose the transformation core for this young lady. There were two more friends on Maction's Pulse Pass watch, Beldet and Dina. The academy was bustling just inside, and Mu Chen was thinking about visiting Shania tomorrow. Obviously, quite a few of the equipment he had bought used Chenaya's reference. No one wanted the Iron Blood Warrior Girl. He would find a way to ruthlessly take it. Just at this time. Ding, the SSS mission system refreshed three items. 1. Transform into Battle Girl form with the second Machine Girl. Level B. 4. Probe to the Signal Point. Level A. 5. Upgrade and modify equipment above Grade A for one mecha. Grade C. Because the mission for Option 23 was not completed, it was not refreshed for the time being. Going to some place to scout and give a level A rewards? It's not just a hundred million ah. As he walked, Mu Dust overlapped with the light screen map. Outside the country? This marker was heading to the west of the Red Dragon country, which was west of Heavy Cloud out of the country's borders. Although going out wasn't that far, going out required a bit of relevant formalities and was also very dangerous. It was such a long distance to travel, and one would have to find a machine lady to work with. Being able to get the formalities, and being a machine lady, and also possibly talking her. Heard Dust has thought of a person. I heard that new equipment came from the experiment hall side. Principal Wu got it last month to get out high tech. I heard that you can virtual transformation linkage. Super powerful. There are only 20 of them in the country. The principal is awesome. That's for sure. Once known as the goddess of the hegemony. Of course the principal is awesome. He he he. I also heard that when MS. Shinaya had an accident. Principal Wu hung vice principal Zhang up and beat him asking him if he was a spy. Bullying ah. Uh. I heard that the principal treats MS. Shania like a daughter. I wonder how MS. 
Shania is doing. I heard that the injury is so serious that it is possible to not be able to stand up. Ah, don't ah. Quickly go and take a look. I heard that there are also some big powers coming to observe. I heard that Han Xuanyan and the girls have signed with some big forces. This time is also an opportunity. Along the way, the machine nymphs were talking. Mu Chen was also curious. In the huge laboratory, a hundred machine nymphs and pilots came to gather around. Able to look above was the huge screen. In front landed a white double passage chamber. There were two seats at the entrance, and to the left and right were several connectors. Two of the Red Dragon Nation's latest high-tech analog linkage fusion XP combatants. Aya, our Ice Cube schoolmate. What? Still wanna help make a splash? With this voice? One didn't need to look to know that it was Chung Rong. In the middle of the instruments, Chang Rong counted down Li Shi, her hand pressing on one of the instruments. Next to Li Shi stood Dong Man Yen, being unruly as you. Where did I cut in line? Everyone has just arrived. So you say your queuing is queuing? I also said that my hand touching it is queuing. And brother Pengfei said he is a cum. A waste trailer. A motorcycle with what this good machine. Zhao Pengfei's proguard team of more than three dozen machine lady helped to speak. Seven words. Mu Dust asked the huffing and puffing by Xiao Xi next to him. What's going on? Mu Dust. Ah, the instrument arrived everyone wanted to try it. We all lined up. Dong Man Yan was the first. The machine was still in the process of starting up. Chang Rong came and unreasonably jumped the queue. Several people on our side quarreled. Zhao Pengfei's side too. I used to see that he thought he was good. Indulging his own proguard group. Originally, there was no Li Shi matter. But it turned out that Chang Rong saw Li Shi in the crowd and took the initiative to count. So Li Shi came out to help Dong Manyan speak. And that's what you saw. Mu Chen looked up. On the second floor there were some consortium people who came to observe the machine and also to look at the machine maiden. Chang Rong and Zhao Pengfei were trying to show themselves. Especially since they were stolen by Li Shi last time. Chang Rong was very upset. Zhao Pengfei was also upset with Li Shi, whose pursuit was rejected back then, causing him to lose face as the school grass. Zhao Pengfei walked out and also spoke very loudly. It's not a result for us to argue like this. Why don't we do this? It just so happens to be two instruments. Let's combine them to compete. How about it? Chang Rong added, the person who loses, don't do anything. How about just obediently learning five barks, then get lost and don't touch this instrument for ten days. Staring at Li Shi. How about it? You guys? Dare? Come? Chapter 017, Shepherd's Dust's Textbook Cooperation. Ha 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 ha. I almost forgot. Our student Li is as pure as can be. He won't link up with the general public. Chang Rong's laughter made quite a few people a bit upset. Zhao Pengfei stood next to Chang Rong, naturally acquiescing to his new girlfriend's behavior. Many people dared to be angry. How could a wave a gifted S-level driver be compared? Normally, in the shooting class and driving class, Zhao Pengfei's grades were among the top. The son of a big family didn't practice a lot growing up. But where there is a little bit of sanity, it is not a level on the machine girl against the touch. The motorcycle of the 5th generation and the 7th generation SF motorized armored car. Admit defeat now. Won't be humiliated. Everyone knows you are a motorcycle girl. Learn five barks. This matter will be so over. Chang Rong swept no one to help Li Shi. More complacent. She. Let. Me learn the dog. Dong Man Yan knew that things started because of her. How can she get involved with Li Shi? Next to the other students. And many people in the next class were furious. Yutina wanted to walk up. But was pulled back by the foreign students in her class. Ha ha ha. Dong Man Yan. You trailer. Better roll aside. Looking down on the trailer? One hook dumps you over. When you flip over one day and can't get up, you'll still have to shout at the trailer mom. Fine. Just compare. Li Shi looked at Chang Rong with icy eyes. Ha ha ha. On my side is me and brother Pengfei. How about you? Oops. It won't be you a machinima coping. Right? Chang Rong deliberately said. Right. You have cooperation with that e-band called what's his name classmate. To not let him come and help out. Don't worry. I won't let him learn how to bark too. Ah, uh, don't engage in targeting our Chung Rong classmate. Mac Fong was even named. He walked out and everyone looked at Mu Chen. How about this? If I lose I'll bark five times as well. But if student Chang Rong loses, not only will I bark five times, but I'll also add five pig squeals as well. Well said. Mu Kun. Joe Xia coaxed. Mu Kun this is really in awe. This guy. Mu Dust. Something he really dares to go on. Han Xuanyan nodded her head. Ah la ah la. It's getting interesting. Xin Fei Fei and the girls were also watching. Mukin stood next to Li Shi. Owe me a favor. Li Shi gave him a blank look. Nosy. The two of them were still eyeballing each other. Exasperating Chung Rong. Fine. Ha 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 ha. Then it's a deal. Don't deny it if you lose. Shepherd Dust coming out to help made a lot of Machinima happy. 
but there were many sensible people. Chang Rong's side's combination is too strong. This side's win rate is almost zero. Yeah, the bottom is hard. It can't be compared at all, right? At least we can't let Chang Rong be so arrogant. Go Li Shi. The principal is here. Hearing the sound, everyone looked up. Principal Wu had arrived a long time ago, and beside her stood two people from the technology hub center, her nieces and nephews. I thought she would stop it, but I didn't know. Just in time, Chang Rong, Zhao Pengfei, Li Shi, and Mukin, the four of you try it out. The people from the hub still need boot data. This was fun. The principal became the host. Simulate the linkage fusion XP combatant, capable of providing simulations of all weapons below S-Class in the 5th and 6th generations, and with linkage fusion virtual turned on, it is capable of simulating linkage fits up to 25. The principal explained the power of the function. Zhao Pengfei and Chang Rong had gone to sit on the right side. The instrument was a girl sitting on her back in front, like the action of driving a motorcycle. Six connectors wrapped around the arms and legs, and one at the waist. The last one links the driver's waist. Nukin was the rear position that was on the higher side, and the movements were almost the same. There, the instrument hatch entered, and inside was closed space. Chang Rong's side is a white hatch, and Mu Chen's side. Looks like it doesn't have lights on. This instrument this point is not humanized. How can I choose a weapon in the dark? Mu Chuan and Li Shi used the light from their pulse pass wristwatches. Came the voice of Colonel Wu from outside. The item you are practicing is the alien beast smashing. There will be points for smashing. You have three minutes for weapon selection. You can only choose four. All the organic nymphs and drivers looked at the big screen. The simulated scene had hills, lots of lakes, and the main view looked over a large number of bug class alien beasts. A few ferocious ones, and some earth class alien beasts could be seen. Beldet came running in as well. Cabin. I'll use a fifth generation B class pulse missile. Li Shi tapped the switch. Then I'll go with the fifth generation class C pulse rifle. That thing is heavy. And it's dangerous not to maintain the linkage to this alien beast density. Li Shi turned to look at Makoto. The eyes seemed to be saying, we're going to win with speed. Minor problem. I was going to go for a B-grade heavy artillery pulse rifle. Trust my arm strength. Chilin arm? Ha! Mu Chen coughed. It wasn't strange for Qin Fei Fei to say this word. But Li Shi. Those watching could see the weapons chosen by both sides. What did Mu Chen's side pick? The power of the first three pieces is too small. A 5th generation B-grade pulse missile, a 5th generation C-grade pulse rifle, and a 5th generation C-grade Xian magnetic explosive grenade? On the other side, Chang Rong and Zhao Pengfei, clear of the 6th generation weapons, 6th generation grade Zhao Feng destroyer missiles, 6th generation grade offensive defense paint, 6th generation grade pulse scorpion cannon, and the 4th piece chosen was even a 6th generation grade pilot multiple missile launcher. Heavy firepower pulled full. Isn't this a lost cause? The firepower is not at the same level. You plebes, you don't even understand. You only know the values. There's nothing wrong with what they chose. Li Shi is a motorcycle. Heavy firepower and heavy recoil weapons don't work. Beldet grunted coldly. Pulse weapons are the preferred choice. Followed by, most of the bug and ferocious level exotics. The fourth and fifth generations are enough. Qin Feng also spoke. Although the sixth generation is much more powerful. The buffer time is much longer and any weapon has advantages and disadvantages. Look, what's the last piece that Maxion and the others chose? A 6th generation A-class Windwalker Spear? A melee weapon? Simulator fully activated. Protective force field deployed. Please note, the simulation will stop when the damage exceeds 20. Makoto opened his eyes and appeared on a hilly mountainside with a 10 second countdown in the sky. Li Shi transformed. Mukin immediately rode on it. And on the other hill, Chang Rong also transformed into a SF motorized armored vehicle. Start. Chang Rong just started, shooting two auger wind destroyer missiles down the hill. The sound of the explosion was perfectly simulated, exactly like the real thing. The seven or eight alien beasts were blown to smithereens, rushing down, reinforcing the defense paint, giving Chang Rong a thick deck, ignoring the attacks spewed out by the lowly xenomorphs, using powered acceleration to smash them to pieces. The strength and dominance was manifested to the fullest. On the other side, the light chasing motorcycle was very fast. Rushing down, against the alien beasts, S-line high speed moving alignment. All of them brushed by, not daring to collide at all. Ha 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 ha, really lame. Chang Rong had seen Li Shi's movements in the distance laughed out loud, but the next second, all of the foreign beasts that Mu Chuan and the others passed by exploded in a series of explosions. The Xian magnetic explosive grenade was powerful enough. The airborne foreign beasts attacked. Mu Chen controlled the motorcycle in a beautiful dump, and the two of them were extremely well coordinated. 
Wu Dust kept the linkage in one hand so that the power drive was guaranteed, and his right hand raised the very heavy pulse rifle with one arm. It fired at the four alien beasts that were attacking the sky. Li Shi's front end twisted, stretching out four pulse missiles left and right. Boom 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 boom. Precise strikes. Two directions. Eight alien beasts were killed by the two at the same time. The degree of cooperation was textbook level, and all the students looked dumbfounded. Chapter 018 Accident. All kinds of unfavorable. Ah. Mu Chuan and the others are so handsome in their coordination. So smooth? Make sure you didn't practice in private. Is this batch of students from Ant Academy so strong? The two nieces and nephews of the technology hub were all handsomely impressed by this action. Mu Chen raised his gun with one arm. That pulse gun was 30 pounds, and all four shots hit. Li Shi also didn't aim and flung her head to hit all of them. The gun was carried on her back, and both hands were launched to accelerate. On the other side Chang Rong and Zhao Pengfei gritted their teeth, directly smashed the two bug-level alien beasts. The scorpion cannon on the roof of the car was set up. Zhao Pengfei's movements were very skillful, controlling the dual cannons to aim. Rumbling explosions, accurately hitting the two heads, the left side of Chang Rong's vehicle. The Zhao Wind Destroyer missile, cooled down one and immediately fired it again. Even the ferocious level alien beasts would be blown apart. Zhao Pengfei's shooting was at a high level, striking with precision. Chang Rong's horsepower was on full blast but she was able to run up to 70. Look at Mu Chan and the others. So fast. Nukin was driving Motoji in a wild race. Mu Dust's band is poor, but his talent isn't. Class A superpower drive. Really fast. They are? Li Shi was responsible for the full speed in projecting Xian magnet explosive grenades without error under Mu Chen's instructions. Visual field judgment and direction were completely left to Mu Chen. Linkage fit 39. Isn't the simulation 25? Don't get distracted. Li Shi reminded him. Don't worry. Prepare to close the net. The two attracted a large number of alien beasts. All circling an area. It was now. Parking against the center. Pulse rifles and missiles were all fired. Clusters of 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 clusters of. Instantly exploding. The mine array laid down shattered all of the nearly 100 alien beasts attracted to the area. Just now, Chang Rong's side had reached 80 points, and was double the lead of Mu Chen's side. Mu Chen and his team's points immediately rose to 109. Ha ha, well done. Is this geometry? Ha, this is called tactics. Utilizing the power advantage. Li Shi and the others can run over 300. Chang Rong will be 70. Use the speed to haul in the monsters and then blast them together. Fighting like this, we can't catch up. You can Li Shi, go for it. Brother Pengfei, go for it. The schoolmistress personal guard who was complacent just a moment ago panicked. Ha 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 ha. Beldet crossed her arms and laughed. It must be the weapon that Nukin chose. It's all guided by this big miss. The corners of Han Xuanyan's mouth twitched. Beldet was also stealing the limelight? However, seeing that Mu Chen's side was leading, most people were happy. Damn it. Chang Rong roared in displeasure. Don't panic. There's less than half the time. Chang Rong is aiming at them. The pilot will automatically aim. Zhao Pengfei activated the pilot multiple missile launcher. It wasn't the alien beasts that were targeted. But the warning, you have been targeted. Two alarms were issued. Qin Fei Fei blinked her eyes as if she had leaned in close and heard something. So Chang Rong aimed at us? Twenty small missiles the size of a fist shot in, and the pilot would track the target. What is Chang Rong doing? How can we attack Makoto and the others? Can't afford to play can you? What a shame. Can't afford to play with attacking people. Hoomph. This is tactics. What do you people know? The school grass escort guard frantically escorted. Boom boom boom. Chasing after the motorcycle running at full speed. A series of explosions behind them. Pissed me off. Zhou Xia and the girls stomped their feet. It's definitely that Zhao Pengfei who did this. I've known for a long time that he's sinister as hell. Shu, keep it down. Don't let the Zhao family hear it. Many drivers whispered. Li Shi was going to be blown up if she was one step slower. There were three more rounds to go. It was going to be impossible to dodge. The seat ejected. Makoto was launched out. Boom boom boom. Ah. Ah. People were stunned. Makoto didn't scream in panic. In the midst of the explosion, some broken light chasing motorcycles rushed out. Accelerating and rushing up. It raised its front end and turned into human form first the moment Makoto was about to fall down. The moment it touched again, it transformed into mechanical form. Utilize the transformation cushioning effect. Land on the ground and sway left and right to unload the falling force. At the edge of the rollover. With precise judgment, Makoto grabbed the handle and didn't get thrown out. Sit firmly and accelerate again. Nima dash. Crap. What kind of operation is Li Shi doing? Using transformation to instantly buffer? Dumbfounded the teachers. Handsome. 
Countless boys exclaimed in shock. The ProGuard group gritted their teeth. Is this a nifty operation that a student can do? How's the damage? 17. Li Shi's counterintuitive operation shone brightly. While Han Xuanyan and the girls realized that Mukin had been catapulted out of the air and didn't scream in shock from the time he was in the air to the time he landed. The moment his chest smashed against the cushion as he descended, he immediately pulled back with both hands and wasn't thrown out. The entire process was wildly praised by Qin Feng there, who was watching and understanding. I really want to give that Chang Rong a deicide cannon. Maxion was a little angry when he heard Li Shi's damage. No need. That kind of thought. She can't do it with a trashy green tea. It's Xiao Pengfei who did it. Chang Rong's side was still upset that this didn't even blast them. Immediately, her weapon cooled down and she output it at the alien beasts, taking the opportunity to catch up with the points. Aron leaned towards their side, and when the pilot multiple missile launcher is ready, send them away. That was indeed part of the tactic. The score is going to catch up. Chang Rong and the others took advantage of Li Shi's consolidation, and the weapons unleashed another wave. The number of foreign beasts is less now. The key is that the missiles are coming again. Makoto immediately rode his motorcycle and used his pulse rifle to increase his score. There were fewer bug and ferocious level foreign beasts, and the other side was grabbing those foreign beast scores. Zhao Pengfei has a brain. Your magnetic explosive grenade tactic is ineffective against the earth level fey beasts. Pulse rifles can only break the skin. I'll just rob your low level alien beasts. The only way to kill an earth level alien beast is with his weapon. The higher the level, the higher the points. Maxion now had 137 points and Zhao Pengfei's side had 115 points. There's still enough time. Zhao Pengfei can totally catch up. No, right away the pilot is cooling down. That guy Zhao Pengfei is definitely aiming at people. If Li Shi's side gets bombarded with one more, it'll be a forced end. Qin Feng gazed at his eyes. They have to find a way. There's no chance of winning at this rate. The points will also catch up. The only way to crack it, rush over and destroy Chang Rong. Morong Buo leaned against the wall. Humph. Qin Feng. Are you telling jokes? With the weapons that Mukin and the others have, what can they take to destroy a Class A 7th generation SF mobile armored vehicle that has Zhao Pengfei's augmentation? This, Xin Feng couldn't say anything either. Allah Allah Allah, and the machine was a bit of a surprise. Xin Feifei's angle was just enough to see that there was a light at the top of the number one machine that wasn't lit. Oh no, auntie, there's a bit of an accident. What? Machine One's virtual architecture fit simulator didn't turn on. The tech hub's nephew awkwardly pointed to a light at the top that wasn't on. Colonel Wu gave his nephew a blow to the head first. Still so sloppy with your work? What does that mean? It's the state that allows them to fictionalize to reach 25 fit. That is to say, this group of students on the left is completely relying on their own cooperation with a little bit of tacit understanding in the simulation. That Zhao family's kid on the right they are self-contained 25 fit. Colonel Wu crossed his arms. TSK. That means that there's no hope for Mukin and the others to turn the game around? The pilot multiple missile launcher on the motorized armored vehicle once again rose. As expected, Zhao Pengfei was once again locking onto Li Shi. It's over. Chapter 019 No wonder it smells like a teacher. Cluster clusters 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 clusters. The pilot's multiple missiles fired. All 20 locked on. The light chasing motorcycle ran at full speed. And Mu Chen turned around and held his pulse rifle in one hand. Firing five shots into the air. Boom. 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 Hit three explosions. No. The number of missiles is too high. Mu Dust drove the motorcycle in an extreme left turn, and his speed soared to over 400. But the pilot missiles could also turn, and had already locked onto them as their target. Three more shots were fired and two more were dropped. The pulse rifle is overheating. Please be advised you are locked on. Please be advised you are locked on. Less than a hundred meters to go. Makoto and the others can't escape. It's over. This is definitely more than 20% damaged. Damn it. It's infuriating to watch. That Chang Rong can't afford to play. So she's doing this. On the instrument's dial, it shows that the missiles behind them are all encircling. Extremely darting. The speed was already to the extreme. But it was no match for the speed of the missiles. Mukin, Li Shi. The two shouted each other's names almost simultaneously. Dangerous distance 50 meters. Dangerous distance 20 meters. Dangerous distance. Nective. Makoto. Eption. As if Maxion's soul was immersed in the blue sea, the soul of Li Shi in the air fell down looking into each other's eyes, and high-fived on the surface of the sea. Boom 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 boom. Chain after chain of explosions. The entire laboratory trembled in a simulated scene. The sound of the explosions was very real. All of them were looking at the image of instrument one forcibly stopping. But, no, fusion fit 45. The center of the explosion in the image dented and pierced out a figure. Whiteheim body armor with flowing colors. White and gold trimmed head armor. 
a white visor, a golden armor line, and her long black hair could be seen flowing in the wind. Diamond-shaped fitted chest armor, shoulder armor emitting streaming light, arms with armor wrapped around only the joints, soft arm armor, white octagonal waist skirt, and dual pulse engine jets with a two-wheeled shape on the back. Everything to simplify the lightweight, less than three meters of body. A lightweight battle maiden that pursues speed, the light chasing battle maiden. Ah, crap, transformed, so handsome, too, sexy. The light chasing war girl was particularly sexy because she was wearing less. It's the light chasing battleheim, a war girl known for her speed, dodged all the explosions, too cool. Li Shi, Mu Chen is awesome, he actually managed to transform. Che, what's there to be complacent about? It's still just relying on an instrument to simulate the architecture. Don't be complacent you guys. The noise outside was fiery. Sheen Fei Fei's purple eyes widened as he discovered a new continent. Not only him, the two jaws of the technology hub almost smashed on the ground. Transformation? The transformation was successful? That's impossible. Look at the screen. There's no virtual construct formed at all. Oh my god, could they be? Completing the fit transformation by themselves? Colonel Wu's pupils flickered. What's their degree of fit? The light screen in his hand immediately linked. 100 polka dots were seen. 45 of which were flashing. This time the eyes popped out. Ant. 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 You T are evolved into a pigeon? No. So to say you. The old lady also became a pigeon. How is the situation? Ant. You see. Fit 45. Battlefield main core battle maidens fit degree. Wu school was also shocked. Ant. 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 Wu school gave his nephew another blow to the head. You too. Who dares to say this out? I will hang you together with your own mom and dad. Got it? Without my consent. Whoever says a word out. Your heads are ready to be stuffed inside the little swan toilet and turned 10,000 times. Yes. Yes. Aunt. We listen to you and everything. Auntie. I have intermittent memory loss. Yeah. 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 Hey. 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 Who are you? How come you look so much like my aunt ah? It's so pretty. School will blankly glanced at his niece and nephew. The two of them had listened to themselves since they were young. Pass me a copy of the data later. Then delete it on your side. Understood. On the screen, Li Shi was also transforming into a war girl for the first time and felt the changes in her body. How was it? Don't take the tone of a person who has come over. I'm at least a second time. No wonder it smells like a teacher. Ha, huh? I said pure school girl student. Why do I feel like you're not pure? Why didn't I smell it? Attention. The explosion attracted four fey beasts to come closer. The earth level fey beasts were simulated very realistically. The prepared windwalker spear appeared in his hand, spinning the spear, in the blink of an eye. The light chasing wargirl was already in another location. Residual shadows could be seen on the screen, spaced out for another second. The bodies of all four earth level alien beasts disintegrated and fell to the ground as points. So fast. That's the speed of the light chasing wargirl. Che, it's far from the Lingfang battle G. You have to look at what kind of body changes ah. This is AD ah. The fifth generation D can be so handsome ah. Landing. Score lead. The rest of the time, even if it is a score, Chang Rong and the others cannot catch up. Chang Rong and Zhao Pengfei gritted their teeth in the distance. The scorpion cannon took aim. Two cannons blasted over. The light chasing war girls moved at high speeds. The Z words lightning dodged and came towards their side. Damn it. Let's come too. Zhao Pengfei and the others came as well. The virtual constructor activated and came with a 25% fit. Chang Rong transformed into her battle maiden form. Chang Rong and the others transformed as well. It's an SV armored wargirl. A class. Right? Common type. The light chasing wargirls are also A class. What are you so proud of? Brother Peng Fei finished them off. Li Shi and Mu Dust rushed up. A chop. Chang Rong's left arm half shielded against it. It also wanted to counterattack. But the light chasing wargirl was already behind them. Twisting her body. The movements were very uncoordinated. Completely like a machine. The light chasing wargirl tucked a foot into her face. Landing on the ground. She rushed up and attacked continuously, almost a one-sided thrashing. Li Shi and Mu Chen didn't directly finish each other off. The two of them didn't communicate, but the idea was the same. It was to hit the face. A kick to the face. A fist blast to the face. Ha ha ha. That's it. Beat that Chang Rong to tears. Where's that arrogance just now? Comfortable. Li Shi slapped her big mouth. Mu Chuan kick. Kick. Beldat was all up in arms. Give her an ingot. Ola. Utana and their international students were also shouting. How come there's such a big difference in the battle maiden forms? Yeah, it's not even on the same level. Now it's the state of a mom beating her daughter. It wasn't just the speed. Chang Rong's combination body movements weren't even considered coordinated. 
Chang Rong and the others are the normal performance of the first fusion. That's why they have to practice, is the point of this machine? It's just that. Nukin and Li Shi's coordination is too good. Hoof. Beldet crossed her arms. Very happy. The kick flew out. Chang Rong and Zhao Pengfei were lifted out of their battle maiden forms and changed back into their mechanical forms. It's almost time to finish. With a white blast of wind, the Windwalker spear pierced through Chang Rong's body. The simulation has been damaged by more than 50%, and the second machine is forced to stop the simulation. Chapter 020, The Vicious Schoolgirl Qin Fei Fei. The simulation is over. Machine number two's nymphs are damaged and can't start up again. Ha ha ha. Handsome Li Shi and Makoto. A light chasing war girl can be so handsome, sexy and valiant. So cool. I also want to see my own turn into a battle maiden. Regardless of the points or the matchup, Mu Chen's side was victorious. The cabin exited. Zhao Pengfei angrily threw off his helmet. Unplug the connector. Angrily glanced at Li Shi and Mu Dust. Threw off his hand and turned around to quickly leave. The pro guard advocates immediately followed. Hey, shouldn't it still say I'll definitely come back next time? Mu Chen wiped the sweat from his forehead and laughed. Ha ha ha. That's a terrier from a few hundred years ago, isn't it? Li Shi is too handsome. Mac Chen. Wow. Next time practice with us as well. Okay? Several witches winked at him. The two were sucking up countless fans today. Chang Rong stood there gritting her teeth. Well, Chang Rong? Li Shi? Humph. Today count you two as just lucky. And it's also because of this machine. Otherwise, you'll always be at the bottom. Cannon fodder of the battlefield. She turned around and wanted to leave after she finished speaking. Hey, wait. Where are someone's five barks and five pig squeals? Mu Chen called out to Chang Rong. The scene was quiet and all looked at Chang Rong. In full view of everyone. You're not recognizing a loss? I. You. Ha 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 ha. Don't think. Get out of my way. Chang Rong pushed away the onlookers behind her and fled. The courage to face setbacks is not even there. Chang Rong really can't afford to lose. I knew she wouldn't scream. Many observers from the forces scratched Chang Rong's name off the wristwatch recorder. Nukin shrugged his shoulders. Cooperation pleasant. Turning around, Li Shi had already put on her jacket and turned to leave. Nukin you kid handsome? It's also too good to cooperate with the pure schoolgirl. Companion quite a few drivers came up and almost stacked up. Sacrifice. Our machine lady strong. I'm just a jerk. Tired me out. I'm going to rest. Sorry for cutting in line. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. The atmosphere was great. By the way. Remind you all to use that number one machine. The cabin goes in dark. Causing us to choose a weapon and almost didn't find it. Makoto also kindly reminded his classmates. They didn't understand. Mu dust passed by Qin Fei Fei. It's dark because the virtual architecture fit isn't on. You. Are transforming yourselves. A flirtatious woman's voice reached his ears. Maxian knew that it was the voice of Qin Fei Fei. The dark belly woman. But he froze. The virtual architect wasn't on? Qin Fei Fei's expression of a bad joke. The pulse pass watch friend request was her. Oops. Oops. I seem to know something incredible. Are you telling the truth? It was indeed true. As Makoto looked at the task list. The transformation task with the second machine lady was completed. Don't worry. There aren't many people who know about this machine. They don't know. I see that Principal Wu called out to the people from the technology hub at the first time. And went to open up the virtual frame. And the people behind you don't know either. Look at your expression. It's so interesting. Sheen Fei Fei this woman. The most difficult to deal with. Really want to tie her turtle armor and then ruthlessly. I won't tease you. I won't say anything. Doesn't Li Shi know? I don't think so. Do you want me to tell her? No. I don't think so. You're both fit for transformation. So let's go for it. You'll have a good chance of getting it. And buy a 7th generation multipurpose missile launcher as a gift. Already making plans. You know what I'm thinking right now? What? Set up the DSI cannon and take a shot at one of the Sky Whale transports. No. 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 No, 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 no. My family won't agree. In case one shot hits the soul, it's very harmful to the body. Shepherd's dust was speechless. This Jean Fei Fei is against the odds. Someone is looking for you. Don't bother you. Macduin also saw two people walking towards him, one wearing a suit and a woman in her thirties with deep red hair and a leather jacket. Hello fellow Mu Dust, I'm the Earth Wind Group Observer. Hello, your performance is really good, and your results in various subjects are also excellent. 
Is there any interest in coming to us after graduation? To engage in work such as testing with the function of the machine lady, the minimum are 3,000 credits to start. And, we, the Earth Wind Group, will not throw off the Mega Peak Consortium how much face. Someone came to dig. Quite a few people were quite envious when they saw the scene. This observer was very good at talking, coming in soft and hard, besides being treated well. The Mega Peak Consortium was owned by the Zhao family. Thank you, I will consider it. Looking forward to your contact. All very polite. The man in the suit turned to leave. Makaz Sen, it's not free to go to a place like that. The leather-clad redhead spoke. Indeed, there is a free place, except for the low income. I think your character is suitable. Your ability is good. Most of us here are Eban drivers. Sister my name is Liang Ta. Our organization has tens of thousands of people in heavy cloud. Mu Chuan blinked his eyes. How mysterious. Tens of thousands of people is very kawa. Ah. Speak also cover up. That's a very powerful force. Right? She lowered her voice. Although the treatment is poor. But we are free here. Have you heard of the civil organization called Ye Fire? Ye Fire? Yeah. You guys probably haven't heard of it. Do you Ye Fire have any named Liang Ta? Early 30s. Short crimson hair. Liang Ta froze as Makoto sent a message on his wristwatch. Sister Liang Ta. Ha, huh, what's going on? You met her. She's nice. Hey, who are you messaging? Makoto? Dina. Put. Spewed Liang Ta. You know that Dina girl? Hey, you still have her best friend? We're friends who just met. Liang Ta knew, in the morning to catch a gang of catching G. I heard that it is a man and a woman two young people to lure. The woman blonde hair foreigner is. Beldet, the man is you? Shepherd Dust nodded. You know Dina. I won't say more. Have any ideas to contact us at any time? Your kid has potential. Come to us can be a cadre. After shaking hands, Liang Ta was sent away. It seems that the civil forces are also scouting for talent everywhere. Wanting to stand in this era. Should one join a power? Or find a way to get one on their own? Mu Chen had a lot of things to do right now. And the more important thing was to be strong. Returning to the dormitory, he first claimed his rewards. Ding you have completed mission 1, transforming into a war girl form with the second machine girl, level B, receive a reward, one man type suit, possesses strong defense, self cleaning, and is able to change any clothing, receive reward, 100 points of physique, now Makoto's level reaches level 8, and his physique value reaches 330, taking the meta alloy nightstand, he pinched it into a giraffe, accidentally making a bit of a commotion, is this going to let me dismantle the Gundam with my bare hands in the future? Right now, Makoto, surpassing a normal person's 30 times physique, looking at the black jacket in his hand, draped over his body, what he thought in his heart pressed the internal button, change into a black jacket, gorgeous set, cool in the mirror, change again, suit, change again, casual clothes, change again, vintage clothes, fairy, seems that this world has long gone out of this expression, change again, G13 short skirt American girl warrior, knock knock knock, bed check, Chapter 021 Shepherd's Dust Makes the Principal Go Soft The next morning, the principal's office, Assistant Morong Xian reported yesterday's information. Xiao Xian sent a message for the senior group's Mu Dust to come to my office. Okay, principal. As soon as the words fell, the doorbell communicated the message, forming a stereo projection. Wu School Senior Group Student Mu Dust wants to see you. Morong Xian froze. This student is still unpredictable? Interesting. Xiao Xian you go down. Let him come up. Light ion elevator. The height of 20 floors only takes 2 seconds. A soft knock on the door. Please come in. Mac Dust walked in. First saluted the principal. Then closed the door. Student Maction. What is it that you're looking for me for? In the academy, no matter what family or consortium, they won't move anything obvious. It's not that aspect. I'm guessing that you, headmaster, might be looking for me. Oh, she smiled and scratched the file aside. Interesting student. Tapping on yesterday's linked data. Then let's get right to the point. Yesterday's simulation. You can come to me. Hiss. Chin Fei Fei the dead girl told you didn't open the virtual structure right? Worthy of being the principal. Anticipating things like God. No need to kiss my ass. Someone from the Chin family was involved in the design. That dead girl is a human savant. Can I record it and send it to her? Yes. I'll hang both of you up and educate you hard. Worthy of school woo. The data panel of the fit popped up in front of Mu Dust. Say it. I said. Can school head Wu do me a favor? You don't have any bargaining qualifications with me. She narrowed her eyes. Your situation hasn't been seen for hundreds of years. If this data goes out, with your current background and status, do you know how high the danger level is? You are such a beautiful, great, considerate person for your students and community. For world peace, 
Stop stop stop. Makoto smiled. That's why I came to find you this morning. Tell me first, what's going on? I have a hidden talent. A SS ranked efficient linkage, capable of carrying a certain linkage effect of its own, with the effect becoming more pronounced the lower the fit, and it's also the third time I've worked with Li Shi. There is such a talent? Wu School pondered. Indeed he had never heard of it, but it fit perfectly. There were more than 3,000 known talents in humans, and there were often special ones that appeared as well. Not surprisingly, naturally, Mu Chen had done his homework before he came. Primal fluctuations really to say grade. That can be said to be far more than SSS at least also an LGS of the universe level. Glancing at Mu Dust. This talent of yours, the less people know about it now, the better, understand? I'm doing this for your own good. Colonel Wu I understand. Speak. What is it that you're looking for me for? I want to know how Shania is doing now. Why do you care about that? Last night, Jean Fei Fei told me that Shania's G body recovery became worse. Her twin engines shattered. And now she's barely past the danger period. That talkative stinky girl. Jean Fei Fei was still eating breakfast and drinking milk when she suddenly sneezed continuously. The milk also spilled, covering her chest. She wiped it off and looked up. Hey, hey, what's wrong with everyone? The boys were masked on the floor spewing nosebleeds. I want to go see her. What can you do if you go? She's in the ICU. She's just passing through the danger phase. Don't bother her. Colonel Wu's face did not look too good either. She did not have a daughter. And Shania's mother was a comrade in arms. Back then, Shania's mother protected her and fell into serious injuries and retired from the army. She had always treated Shania as her own daughter. Precisely because she is in a very bad situation. That is why I want to go and see. Do you really think that the last time with Shania was a single transformation? Schoolmaster Wu's eyes were suddenly not right. This student in front of him. The second single transformation G body was not completely scrapped. All battle damage injuries. And in the form of a war girl. Open a higher linkage to reach the open eye form. The posture of the goddess of the battlefield. All kinds of unreasonable. In the end, Shania strangely withdrew towards the wooded area instead of withdrawing in a straight line. She was trying to hide something. Wu School, who was a godmother, now united, seemed to have thought of something. Were you up there at that time? I don't know. Makoto said pretty much the same thing. Wu School was indeed a big mountain he could rely on right now. She paused for a few seconds. Young people nowadays, really? You can't get in. You can't even help? No. That side is Zhang Dongyuan in charge. Those guys are even more stubborn than me. Except for the defense hub people can't get in. Zhang Dongyuan Chong Yun defense center second seat. Also wants Shania their immediate leader. Meaning that people who are from the defense hub can get in? What do you kid want? Colonel Wu I don't have anything else. I'll leave first. Mu Chen got up and went out the door to leave. You brat come back to me. I feel like you brat is going to do something crazy. Shouted Mu Dust back. But the moment Mu Dust walked back to the door, black and blue uniform, chest is the badge of the defense center, armband, hat, when walking back, put Wu School in the chair cackled. Her first reaction was how the people from the defense center drilled to come, but when she fixed her eyes, it was Mukin. When did you, your kid change it, crazy, wearing this body? If Colonel Wu doesn't know me, is it unrecognizable? The uniform was exactly the same. Stupid. What's the use of light clothes? A random sweep is fake. The light particle screen displays information. Defense hub tactical instructor Mu Dust. Sweeping it out is real? How did that happen? Mac Dust had studied his own 10. 000 type suit last night. And all of this could be perfectly replicated and simulated. Go away. You kid is crazy. Mu Chen put away his smiling expression and looked at the other party with deep eyes. It's precisely because I value her so much that I won't give up at this critical moment. You should know very well that with the current level of biotechnology. Even with Heavy Cloud's best treatment, when Shinaya was discharged from the hospital, she was only able to preserve her human form, with her dual engines with multiple breakages, and her mechanical form was difficult to maintain. How many years can you live? You should know better than me. Saluting. The movement was standard. Shepard Dust left the office and changed back to his usual attire first. For the first time, Colonel Wu. She was sitting in a chair by a young man. She felt that Mukin was crazy. She should control this kid. What can he do? But why is the body not moving? She knows that Shin IIS current G body is damaged, and the human posture may not be able to live to 35 years old. A few nights of annoyance without sleep. She did not have any solution, and had already arranged for the best treatment. On the other side, Heavy Cloud Machine Girl sent her to remind all passengers. The road 10 million. Safety first. Machine Girl is not regulated. Loved ones two lines of tears. The Thunderwind Jeep stopped at the entrance of the defense hub building. A total of 500 credits. 
I hope you continue to point Journey G for your service next time. Remember to 5 star praise O. In order to be more like it, Makoto naturally had to come in a classy locomotive. There were four uniformed locomotives at the door. Seeing Mu Dust scanning the door open, immediately saluted. Mu Dust nodded and walked in with his head held high. Chapter 022 Field Instruction Shocked Professor Team There is an issue between Cloudflare's cache and your origin web server. Cloudflare monitors for these errors and automatically investigates the cause. To help support the investigation, you can pull the corresponding error log from your web server and submit it our support team. Please include the Ray ID, which is at the bottom of this error page. Chapter 023 Taking away Shania and mixing up a position. Open the hatch and enter. Shania was lying on the medical cabin and was sleeping, her heart and pulse were all green on the various treatment instruments. This is over the danger period. Approach softly here usually no one comes, even if there is a nurse witches can be casually fooled. Her face and lips were white, and now she had more of a vision of an iceberg beauty. It's just that. These nurse witches are really something too. They don't know to look for clothes that are one size bigger. Those two buttons on the chest bear the pressure they shouldn't bear. It was as if they were going to fall apart at any moment. Mu Chen's hand was just about to be placed on it. Don't move. The hatch opened. The seven-word pulse pistol was aimed at Mu Chen, and this person was none other than Yin Pei. A middle-aged man also walked in behind him. This one, Mu Dust, recognized him, and he was often seen on the news. The current heavy cloud defense center chief finger Zhang Dongyuan, General Finger Zhang, immediately saluted. As for Yen Pei's gun, he didn't give it a second thought. The moment it was fired his current reflexes could completely dodge it. It was obvious that his identity was exposed. No malice from himself. See what happens. Oh, you're still calm. Posing as a center instructor and sneaking into the intensive care unit. Do you know what the consequences are? No. Hoof. Zhang Dongyuan held out his hand and Yen Pei lowered his gun. It's hard to imagine that you're just a student who hasn't graduated yet. It seems that mess. Wu Qin has fallen. Wu Qin cried outside and sent a message. Anti. Is finished. I've been exposed and caught by Chief Finger Zhang. Zhang Dongyuan knows about it? Yes. I can just explain a little bit. It's nothing. What's happening now? I've been asked to stay here. Colonel Wu felt it was interesting. What does this Zhang Dongyuan mean? Makoto gave an honest account. I heard that Shania's situation is very bad and wanted to come and take a look. That's all. Just you? Disturbing her rest is just that. This is Red Dragon's most cutting-edge technology center with the most professional team. You, a student who hasn't graduated yet? What can you do? Mr. Zheng pointed out that you are right. And then what? The data is on the screen. How damaged is Shania now? Maintained at 82 damage. No more. Yen Pei pointed at Mukin. Kid, do you know what you're saying right now? You're just here to cause trouble. If I were really messing around, I would have grabbed a big shot and threatened it at this time. How dare you? Yen Pei's blistering speed. Instantly approaching Mu Chen. A tackle to be. Dang. Before Yen Pei could react, his face came into close contact with the ground. He was pressed to the ground by Mu Chen. Yen Pei's force value was very high, and his entire muscular body was easily pressed by Mu Chen with one hand. Unable to move like a chicken. Vice instructor Yen Pei. Sorry, body reflex. Yen Pei was shocked. What kind of strength and speed did this kid have? Zhang Dongyuan knew very well that Yen Pei was born as a practitioner. Now that the mechanical era was emphasized, the physical quality of the drivers was generally poor. Yen Pei was already a leader of the younger generation in terms of physique and fighting. In fact, it was only one move. It was actually Mu Chen's reaction that was too fast. Speed and power suppression. Nothing fancy. Stop. You too. This is the intensive care unit. The two men stepped aside. Yen Pei moved his arms. A bit interesting. You kid has a method? Zhang Dongyuan was watching Mu Chen's behavior in the hall with so much anticipation. The expert doesn't have a way, so I naturally want to try. Mu Chen pressed on Shun Aya's hand. G body, mechanical form damaged 82. Core engine broken, sub engine broken. Imperial body white scales cannot be repaired. Mu Chen read out the detailed data given by the system, including the last sentence about the current estimated lifespan of 33 years old for the machine lady. Do you have a way? It's basically difficult. Then it's still not coming to mess up? Yen Pei looked at him, not as hostile as earlier. Shepherd Dust was concerned about Shania. And this kid was definitely talented. Not just on a technical level. That reaction and speed just now. Mr. Zheng pointed out that there are many choices in life. A man's wife has a terminal disease and will die after a year in the hospital bed. While the wife chooses to go on a trip with her husband for two months and then die of an early seizure. Do you think she made the right choice? Humph. Are you reasoning with me? Isn't this because you are a reasonable person? How about letting her make her own choice? 
with the commotion just now, Shen Aya actually woke up. When Mu Chen checked her G-body, he knew that she woke up. Mu Dust, you guy, where did you go to steal the clothes? Shen Aya woke up and was surprised to see that Mu Dust and Zhang Dongyuan were conversing. School Wu that got it. Open mouth came a backstabber. Shen Aya, feeling better? Yen Pei was her classmate for a term. Yen Pei? What happened to your face? It's bruised. It was smashed on the ground just now. This well. I feel better. My students are coming to pick me up. Shen Aya got up. Shen Aya, are you clear about your situation? Zhang Dongyuan looked at her. Very clear. After sleeping for a few days, it's almost time to go back to class. Shen Aya looked at Zhang Dongyuan. That's just it. Since you are like this, our side will not care. Shen Aya saluted. She clenched her teeth, lifting her hand too fast hurt like hell. Zhang Dongyuan opened the hatch and looked back at Makoto again. What's your name? Mukun. Chief Zhang refers. Yen Pei. Register him. Defense Hub External Deputy Instructor. Understood. After saying that, Zhang Dongyuan left with his hands behind his back. Now even if the people from the Northern Bear Country checked, there was indeed this person, immediately appearing on the Defense Hub's official website. Shen Aya froze. What did you do? No. Go go go. Leading Shen Aya out. Wait. Yen Pei called out to stop the two. Mucho. Next time one air one fight. This is no problem. Shen Aya went to change her costume. Outside, Wu Qin saw Zhang Dongyuan walk out alone, and a moment later saw Yen Pei walk out. Yen Vice Finger. Yen Pei. How is it? Be serious. This is the hub. Wu Qin was one term younger than Shen Aya and the others, but familiar with each other. Shen Aya applied to be discharged from the hospital. The chief finger agreed. Now I'm registering that Mukin. That kid is really a ruthless corner. Although it's a little small no wonder Shen Aya will be a little interesting. Ha, huh? what's the situation? Registering what? Now that kid is the official external technical assistant instructor. Zhang General Finger passed it. Ah, uh, that's three levels higher than me? Luo Tong. I heard that Shen Aya has applied for discharge. Ha, huh? isn't she just out of danger? Inside information. A handsome officer came to pick her up. Shen Aya's character will surely be discharged. What's the situation over there? Prof. Qing used the best technology, but Shen Aya can only maintain 82% of her body damage, so her recovery is basically impossible. Who's that handsome guy? It's the first time I've heard of him. Why don't you guys worry about Shen Aya? You're gossiping so much. It's a miracle that Shen Aya survived. Let her have her way. Zhou Yang, you watch over the transmission hub. If Shen Aya needs anything, tell us. She's too strong to say anything. Indeed. Indeed. She actually found a handsome guy. Zhou Yang, Luo Tong, Wang Chunfang, and Zhang Lingmin. Do you take me for granted that I'm not here? Shen Aya spoke. Hey, 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 hey. We didn't mean that. It's not because we're worried about you. Even with her body, Shen Aya in her tight black and blue uniform was still valiant. With her ponytail tied up, she walked with the wind in her hair, lit a cigarette, and walked through the center hall. Countless people froze. Shen Aya? She suddenly turned back. Who borrowed a car I drive? Can't change my body. Chapter 024, News of Shen Aya's Boyfriend Spreads. There is an issue between Cloudflare's cache and your origin web server. Cloudflare monitors for these errors and automatically investigates the cause. To help support the investigation, you can pull the corresponding error log from your web server and submit it our support team. Please include the Ray ID, which is at the bottom of this error page. Chapter 025, Chang Rong who doesn't change her mind. Shen Aya didn't let school Wu control her, and for the time being, she didn't take what Mukin said to heart, because that was impossible, the most cutting-edge biological drug she had taken. Shen Aya also contacted Professor Ching by phone to express her gratitude. Girl, enjoy your life, don't have any pressure. In this age of calamity, how far mankind can go is unclear to anyone. Makoto was not only studying in the library these days, simply go to practical exercises. Completely not giving Shen Aya the courtesy of driving her car, who told her to not even change her password. At the defense hub, Mu Dust could see more information and could watch videos of his studies. Associate Instructor Mu, can you please come and help take a look? Mu Dust appeared a few more times, and everyone here was familiar with it. With his extremely high insights on the inspection of machine maiden problems, as well as mechanical modifications, in a few days' time, everyone had gotten to know each other. Some of the slightly more familiar people even jokingly asked where their girlfriend Shen Aya had gone. Can't talk nonsense? She needs a good rest at the academy. Do something she's happy with? You're doing the right thing. G body mentality is important. What's the situation on the 10th floor? Why is it off limits? The people from the combat hub sealed it. In fact, everyone can guess. It's related to the beast tide. 
It's estimated that the beast tide is going to be advanced this time. It's likely to be in the last two years. Zhou Yang smoked a cigarette and continued working away. There are nearly two years. Ding SSS quests refreshed. I just completed one. Is it refreshing as well? 1. Destroy 1. 000 ferocious level and above alien beasts in a beast tide. SS level. Attention, the estimated time of the great beast wave is 35 days away at 2359. 36 days left? What's the situation? No one could have imagined that. As Mu Chen stared wide-eyed. According to the normal time of the beast tide's arrival, there should be two to three years left. Zhou Yang had said that it might be earlier, and the people in the strategy center guessed that there were nearly two years left, but it was not expected. The answer that Mu Dust got here was 36 days? Calmly thinking. Mukun, look at your expression. Is something wrong? It's Yen Pei Ah. Nothing, nothing, I ate greasy too in the morning. Then I'll go and get busy. Wait for next week. I'm free. Yen Pei took the documents and walked away very busy. It can't be said now. For one thing, he had no evidence. And secondly, he would be asked how the information was obtained. Leaving the defense hub, Mu Chen was thinking about what he could do. One person's strength was small in front of the sea. If the scale of the beast tide is too large, the E rank and above machine girls and pilots in the region will arrange for support, or even go directly to the battlefield. What could one do in such a short period of time? Being strong yourself was the core key. Makoto was wearing his uniform and thinking at the side of the car. He didn't notice that this scene was seen by Chang Rong. Nowadays, there were machinima everywhere, and there were very few people who drove mechanical cars, and Shin Aya's car had an impression on everyone at the academy. This Mukin, not only did he steal a car, he also stole a uniform. Haha <laughs> caught by me. Chang Rong immediately contacted the people at home. Mom last time I told you about that damn guy. Yes, he set off. I'll follow him immediately. You'll bring someone later. She turned into an armored vehicle to follow Mukin. Macdum sighed. Mac Dust, can I trouble you with something? Dina sent a message. You're welcome. Come to the abandoned warehouse. We need to get rid of some equipment. Makoto drove there. The city was full of biker chicks and didn't notice Chang Rong stalking. When they arrived at the abandoned factory, they could see four large container warehouses and a dozen or so people from E-Fire. Makoto got out of the car. The businessman who handed it over stretched his neck. The expert has arrived? How come the one who got out of the car was a young man? Dina, the expert you're talking about. It can't be this young man, right? Yes? Ha, huh? Dina you've learned to joke too? The two businessmen just didn't believe it. Makchen, this side this side. Xiao Mei waved at Makoto. The non-speaking signal G. The four armored G in charge of transportation. The six strong men. And the bald uncle Jie. And I didn't expect Sorghum Tower. Who was in charge of the academy's observation. To be there as well. Dina, the expert you shouted at was Mac Chen ah. He knows about this aspect as well? Leon Ta didn't even believe it. What aspect? Mechanical equipment? A little bit of knowledge. Mu Dus smiled. And naturally wouldn't take it to heart for others to question him. The two businessmen didn't believe that Mu Dust was an expert in any way. On the contrary, it was Dina, don't worry. If the person we hired says it's qualified, this batch is qualified. In the distance, Chang Rong zoomed in on the observer and stared at this side. And even took a screenshot, mom come quickly. You saw the picture, right? It must be an illegal transaction. Bring someone with you, worthy of being my daughter. This is a great achievement. Bring someone right away. Mukin, you're just waiting to be arrested. She spread the word throughout the college in the afternoon. Just in time for the outdoor class briefing. Chang Rong also sent it to Zhao Pengfei. Pengfei, look, I've caught Mukin. He'll be taken away soon. Don't bother me. Seeing Zhao Pengfei's reply, she was angry. It was hard to hold on to the Zhao family's leg. Her family was happy to hear it. It's only been a few days and they're ignoring her. First, she dealt with Mu Duan. Then humiliatedly she, so that Zhao Pengfei was satisfied. And her relationship with her would slowly come back again. The cargo warehouse opened. Some painted decks from the 5th and 6th generations. The modified core of the CDE class. And equipment such as turbojets. Yi Fire's own gear? Yes. Updated gear from my side. My own people's goods. I'd be relieved if you took a look at it. Don't look at Dina in her early 20s. But managing thousands of people. Everyone liked her and listened to her arrangements. I've only recently earned some credits. Everyone has a job. If you don't worry about food and clothing you can buy more weapons and equipment. The beast tide is said to be two or three years. There's no harm in preparing in advance. Dina said her thoughts. Very good. Your preparation is right. Makoto gave her a thumbs up and jumped onto the cargo bin to inspect it. A quick pass was all that was needed. Who's in charge? The man in sunglasses stepped forward. Rather disbelieving, 
Me, this plum red missile of the fifth generation, also this BS coating, and this magic mirror RCT armor. These two pulse guns, all have problems? Replace them. Ha, huh? problems? Impossible. Our goods are all good. The sunglasses man explained. Makoto threw a pulse gun to him. Try firing a shot yourself. The sunglasses man coldly snorted as he prepared his gun at the abandoned warehouse. However, it couldn't be fired. The number 3 embolizer screw is broken. And this coating, the model has an error of 0.3 points. The sunglasses man immediately took it and tested it with his toolbox. 0.3 points of error. The sunglasses man and the other merchant administrator's eyes widened. Do you want me to say the rest? No sir. I'm very sorry. All the problematic equipment you mentioned. We will replace them all unconditionally. Awesome. Xiao Mei and the others opened their mouths wide. It was important to know that Makoto passed very quickly. There were quite a few weapons in a cargo bin. And he finished checking them in a few minutes. Dina crossed her arms with one hand. Unexpectedly. So powerful? Liang Tao was shocked. It was at this time. The sound of brakes. Three armored cars at the entrance stopped. And the weapons on them immediately aimed this way. Chang Rong's mother rushed down with a group of people. Chapter 026 Shepherd's Dust to Overpower the King Three heavy armored vehicles with 7th generation light rockets were aimed this way. A large number of people in black uniforms appeared. From the fence jumped over 8 machine nymphs, semi-mechanized arms, hands into cannons aimed at this side. There was a clicking sound. At the entrance, 6 5th generation BPL Grenadier Himes took aim. A helicopter Heim flew in mid-air. There were a dozen other people on the front with crystal shield wielders and various pulse guns presided. This looks like a professional team. This is, the people from the security hub. Why are they here? Yi Fire's people felt strange. Surely not resisting. Team Yen that's them, dealing in illegal transactions. Chang Rong mother Jiang Jiechi pointed this way, fawning and smiling at the woman at the head. As an office worker, discovering these situations next time the promotion will have landed. None of them are allowed. A few armed machinima semi-mechanized walked up and actually sensed something was wrong, because Dina they knew. It was like Dina said, Yi Fire was a civic organization that helped the underclass, and all the major hubs knew about it. Those who had dealt with them still knew their cadres. Chang Rong was still smart enough not to be at the scene, but just secretly watched from afar, waiting to take pictures of Mukden and the others being taken away. Dina, no formalities for your transaction? You can jump down from the cargo bin first. We are in compliance with the regulations. It's just that we trade well. We're used to seeing the goods before going through the process. All walked up. We received a report that a large number of people are trading illegal items here. And are now conducting an inspection. We've always been compliant. May pouted. Are these the four cargo bins? We're going to bring them first. I hope you. Team Yen. And their principles are to be investigated as well. Zhang Jiuqi spoke from the sidelines. She didn't see a few of the armed machine girls. The cyborgs cancelled out restoring their hands. The helicopter Heim also changed back to its human form and landed. We cooperate with the investigation. Dina just spoke. Makoto walked out. Team Yen, there's some misunderstanding. Mu Chen tapped on his pulse pass watch and crossed over his identity information. I'm Defense Hub External Editor Technical Deputy Instructor Mu Dust, and I'm here to conduct an inspection of the safety hazards of these equipment and weapons. The entire Yi Fire staff stared at Mu Dust with wide eyes and crooked necks. What are you talking about? There's no need to look. Yen Pei has shown me 10 times, and in the past 2 days, he's been saying at home that he's finally met an expert, and that he's so excited that he's practicing at home right after work. That was him being careless. Mu Chen said modestly, Is Shin Aya's situation okay? Why are you all asking me? Ha, huh? who do you ask if not you? Aren't you guys in that relationship? Everyone at the security hub is talking about it. Not. Yet. Makoto smiled awkwardly. The two chatted on there. Yen. Yen. Yen team. Him. Chang Rong's mom had actually felt that something was wrong, but still, Yen Xin backhanded a slap on Zhang Jiechi's face. Lock Zhang Jing, Lai Qianchan take her down. Go back to the third group to ask why it would inexplicably say that there are illegal transactions here. I, Yen team, doing things in a thunderous manner is very much in the style of the Yen family. Yen Pei had said that his old sister was a formidable piece of work, and now Mu Chuan had seen to it, ten years older, but had never beaten Shania. Close ranks, Mu Chen saluted. The Chang Rong people in the distance were dumbfounded. Her mom was jerked away by Tin Yen and was also taken away. In the end, what the hell happened? She panicked and ran back to the academy first. And on Mu Chen's side, Mukun, you're still a technician of some kind outside the defense department? Xiao Mei exclaimed. Just a hired hand who hangs around to earn some credits. Mu Chen smiled. Let's continue. Sir, please. The sunglasses man and the merchant administrator. 
We're now more respectful. Thanks for today. Dina jumped in onto the cargo bin. Where? The other guy obviously knows you guys. No big deal. It's still going to be a bit of a hassle. The two inspected the cargo bay, out of earshot of the others. Dina, will you be on the battlefield for the next beast wave? According to the Red Dragon's rules, witches and pilots who had supported the last beast tide were exempted from one recruitment for the next sudden beast tide within a manageable range. We'll go. After all, there are so many of us partners. As a friend, I can only tell you one person. What secret? Shepard Dust lowered his voice, whether you believe it or not. But don't say that it was me who said that the Beast Tide might still have 36 days left. What did you, you say? That's impossible. After checking, the rest is fine. Just take it as my nonsense. But the next time I go to the battlefield, you have to help me. For the first time, I guess I'll have to be weak in both legs. That's a normal behavior. Don't worry. I will stand in front of my friend. Dina watched as Makoto drove away. She stood on a high place. The teams were organizing the goods. Although they hadn't known each other for long, they were quite chatty, and Dina thought that she knew about Makoto's character, and that remark of his didn't seem like a joke at all. Dina, what's with the days? Go back. Notify our people that the captain is having a meeting tomorrow. A little quasi. Shepard Dust returned to the academy, and just as he got off the bus, he heard many of his classmates discussing. Chang Rong was just arrested by the people from the security hub, saying that she maliciously spread rumors or something. I heard it too. Deserved it. That's right. She totally deserved it. Mu Chan walked over to the shade of the tree. You did this? Li Shi Yi was here reading an ebook. I'm not that boring. It seems like she was the one who messed up the report, saying something about being taken away for illegal trading. So it's her ah. This woman doesn't die ah. Li Shi Yi heard. How do I feel that it has something to do with you guy ah? Whispered. G body repair okay? How? Do a favor in a couple of days. What Mu Chen had to do now was to complete more tasks to strengthen himself and contact reliable and trustworthy people to form a team. A single chopstick was easy to break. A handful of chopsticks was different. No help. I haven't finished talking. Don't be so heartless. Hoomph. It's no good for you to be so cautious. No. Shania's health is not good. I can only look for you. Li Shi stared at him with wide eyes. What are you trying to do? Bullying the king? What do you mean? Must help. I don't trust anyone else. No help. Li Shi Yi replied directly. Then I'm not polite. What can you do? Maxion suddenly put his hand on her shoulder and directly a galactic starport output. The surging energy was like a giant wave directly filling Li Shi Yi's body. Ooh dash she immediately tensed up, almost screaming out. The surging power swelled from her shoulders, to her brain, to every part of her entire body, nearly filling up. She was in human form. Well, it's my new discovery. My hidden talent that recharges even against a jointed machinima human form. Li Shi was holding back the water from her eyes. Just a split second of energy made her hold it in for half a minute, and her body tensed up and scolded. You're going to die. Chapter 027, forcibly pulling Li Shi to the front line. Originally, not many people paid attention to this place. Li Shi's petulant scolding, comfortable and at ease. All the high and low age machine nymphs and pilots around her looked. This image, this line. Shepherd Dust pursuing the pure schoolgirl and being rejected? No, rejection is not this line ah. The slightly more corrupt machine nymphs had already thought of evil images. What kind of contact happens? What kind of haughty shyness? And, ouch, ouch, ouch. Whatever the calamity era, whatever the machine girl era, gossip is never changing. With countless gazes, Li Shi's face exploded red. You asshole. She immediately wanted to slip away. But as a result, the energy within her body was overcharged too much, and she couldn't take a big step. Li Shi didn't need to say much who didn't recognize anyone in the academy? Right now, Mu Chen was also very famous. In front of the E-band, there is a sudden danger of handsome rescue. And after a few days ago, simulated linkage fusion XP combat device violently beat Zhao family big young Zhao Pengfei and Chang Rong combination. Not far away. The driver of the same class. Hey. Hey. Mukin. Not honest oh. Mukin go after them. With my years of experience, the chances are great. That's right. It's possible. Quickly refuel. Can you have a chance? already giving him advice. Mu Dust covered his face. Jane Shochi, you have been single for what many years of experience ah. Ha ha ha. The other male and female students around him laughed. We were just discussing academic issues. Mukin also explained. We all understand. It's all cooperated twice. The schoolgirl doesn't refuse to have a chance. Go on. Don't cover up here. It would only get darker and darker. The academy was youthful in this way. I don't know if everyone will still have this cheerful atmosphere after 30 days. Shepard Dust quickly chased after them. How do you feel? Free energy storage. 
Li Shi gave him a blow that was completely empty, and her speed was not in the same league. Do you know what I'm thinking right now? What? Have the sky-based cannon lock onto you and take a shot. Then we're all in range. Together no. This is a very confidential matter. I only trust you and Shania. So I can't be asked to go to that belter Chin Fei Fei. Can I? Looks like you're familiar with her too. If you don't agree I'll be a bully oh. I'll give you one if I run into her. Mac Chen laughed evilly. In order to complete the task as soon as possible. Li Shi gritted her teeth. What did you run into? He signaled to a place with fewer people. Mac Chen tapped on the map. And there was a red dot on it. North Morin? You're so strong at reading maps? I recognized it at a glance. This is the outside area. You have to cross over the front line area. What do you mean by this red dot? Li Shi got serious. I'm going to this place for a while. It's so far away. So I looked for you. You're crazy. Even though it's a cold tide it's now. It's easy to encounter foreign beasts. That's why I called on you. The other witches at the academy will be too scared to move when they encounter the fae. Why are we going here? Secret reason. Count me as owing you a favor. Do me a favor. Just these two days go 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 and return. You'll know when you go. Li Shi looked at his deep eyes. Couldn't see through this guy. This was not a normal risky behavior. And the area from the border to the front line might also encounter some danger. Not to mention the edge of the forest where North Morin was not on the transportation route. Frowning, he wondered what secret this was of Makoto's. But the more mysterious it was, the more attractive it was to Li Shi. The front line will be stopped and won't be able to get out. I have a way for this. When are you free? Tomorrow afternoon. When I eject you as bait don't blame me. The next day, Chang Rong made headlines within the academy. The whole academy was informed of being taken away for investigation. Zhao Pengfei was also speechless that dumbass. Not using his brain at all. Shin Aya only took one class and returned to the office feeling very tired. The two engines of Ji body broke making her to rest more to recover. Zhang Chuanjiu and Kai Jia returned from their investigation. Now when she sees Shin Aya, Zhang Chuanjiu is very polite. And she was too humiliated at that time. Not only was she educated by the school. Her husband was angry and spit out blood. After lunch. The sound of a motorcycle left the academy. We won't meet a bounty hunter this time. Right? Can't say for sure. I'll only help you once and come back if it doesn't work out. No problem. Let me know if you run out of energy. Get ready to pull up. I'm going to switch. Li Shi left the interior of Heavy Cloud City in her Moto Heim form and traveled to the left. Scanning the road when there were no cars nearby. Click click click. Switching forms. Makoto felt wrapped in a silver colored glow. When he looked again. He held the joystick in his hand and the sound of the propellers, flying into the sky, Li Shi in battle Heim form, the ninth generation extermination 20 combat G, saying that out loud would be grabbed and exploded by various forces, or just be forcibly recruited, white body with yellow lines, very beautiful and majestic, if you don't know how to operate it, don't press it, especially not charging it, hands on learning is important, next time you meet me you'll be able to pilot it directly, next time, you're overthinking it, Arriving at the heavy cloud border location. Fighter number 0145741 Exterminator 20 please cooperate in landing. Landing to the tarmac position. Li Shi maintained her mechanical form and watched how Mu Chen responded. Suddenly he changed his uniform and walked down. Li Shi froze for a moment. Hello? I'm going to check the equipment in frontline area number 7. Crossing his identity card to the other party. Hello deputy instructor Mac. Is the inspection this early this year? It seems like it's going to be earlier. We've also heard the wind. So everyone is on their toes. Li Shi froze. This Mu Chuan even gave the other party a chat. Not being driven away at all? This. What are your orders? Investigate Heavy Cloud Academy Senior Department Student Makoto. Immediately the information was transmitted to her. Just became an assistant instructor a few days ago? Rumored to be Shin Aya's boyfriend? Seeing this information, Li Shi was now even more interested in Mac Chen's behavior. It was like a kitten scratching an itch. Wanting to know what Mu Chen's purpose was. Mu Chen returned. It's time to depart. Taking off once again. The crush destroyer missiles had been hung out. Even though it was the observation area with the cold tide time. Flying foreign beasts could still be encountered. Toward the northwest was Yunlin City. Toward the southwest was Chuan Feng City and Copper Scale City. These cities were also inhabited by many people and were likewise fortresses. There were six provinces in the Red Dragon Kingdom. With three semi-fortress cities outside each province as well as 10 frontline regions opened by divisions. Flying over, the 7th frontline region was seen in the clouds. Li Shi landed down. This place was the size of a county town in Blue Star a few hundred years ago. Two was equipped with giant cannons and other weapons. Armed machinima came and went. The frontline area was not allowed to be inhabited by ordinary people. Li Shi changed back to her human form. 
it was her first time here as well. Makoto, on the other hand, was in uniform. Hello, may I ask who you are? I'm here to find your Luo team. Please follow me. Li Shi followed behind and just watched how Mu Chen left this place and what exactly he was going to do. Team Luo, someone from the defense hub wants to see you. Come in. Chapter 028, speaking out. Known by Shania. It's you kid. Why did you run to the frontline area? Luo Tong and Yen Jin were classmates. A few of the leaders of that batch of people. Now serving as important cores in various fields. Slabbed hair. Robust body. It was hard to imagine that he was also a proficient video game guy. S-Class driver. 7th Frontier Regional Chief. It's good that you recognize me. Makoto went up to shake hands. You kid. I've seen the pictures a few times. How about it? How's the relationship with Shania? Without outsiders Luo Tong didn't have much of a rack. There were two witches on the left ebook shelf, the chief lieutenant and the junior captain. Both have a very good relationship with Luo Tong, and one of them is a Shania comrade in arms. Still, okay. This beautiful girl, I saw is an extermination 29th generation, Mac Chen's sister? Looking toward Li Shi. Girlfriend, overbearing kind, Li Shi replied without any expression. Put, Pu Dash, Put, Mu Dust, Luo Tong, and the two machine maidens all sprayed. Luo Tong looked at Mukin. What do you kid mean, does Shania know? In this era, there was no more bride price, no more three gold in hardware. As long as they all agreed, there was no conflict. Many families were family interests, a union between forces. The capable Mashinima had a driver, and so did the driver. Li Shi, I'm kidding. I thought Chief Rotunda could kick your ass. The four blinked at the woman. Ha ha ha, funny, you guys are really funny. Luo Tong felt that Li Shi was also a talent. Ninth generation extermination 20 fighter. Whose ministry is she? Tell me, what are you guys running to me for? Brother Luo, there are no outsiders here, right? No, don't worry and speak boldly. It's fine if you want to turn over the sky in my place. Many people here know you kid. Mu Chen's original plan was to use Shania's connections to get him to North Morwood, but that would really be overbearing. Unexpectedly, he had now mixed up an external position and expanded his identity as Shania's male friend. At this time it was possible to utilize these two identities. There was no need to let Shania laboriously run around. Pulling on the second position. Li Shi, to make a run would be fine. Brother Luo I have two things. Luo Tong nodded his head signaling to continue. First, the identity of this friend of mine who is an extermination 20 fighter. Don't go out in public. Freedom G, I see. Small problem. Everyone will think it's the defense hub. Second, I'm going to make a trip here. Please help. Crazy? This is North Morin, lurking this quite a few alien beasts. At Luo Tong's sudden change of voice, both of those two machine nymphs looked over. Eyes puzzled. Can I say it's for Shania? For Shania? I have a secret formula. The other ingredients are already together. Just the last one needs to go to North Molin to get a little bit. This secret formula may help Shania's G body. You research the biomedical liquid yourself? There's something heavenly about it. Luo Tong's deputy spoke, and it's too dangerous. For Shania's sake, let alone North Morin, I dare to go to the pitch black forbidden zone. Mu Chen's words made the two machinists a little heartbroken. Ah, Shania, this little handsome boyfriend was a little younger, but his speech was very mature. Ah, and it made the machine nymphs move their hearts. Ah, what is the success rate of this? You kid, what secret recipe? This thing has to pay a big price. I hope Luo brother do not publicize, and the success rate is also very low, but for Shania are worth it. Maxion do you know how to drive a probe armored car? He's driven all the wall attack vehicles. Li Shi added. Poo dash. Poof. The force field gate opened and the probe armored car went out. Shepherd Dust was driving it. Luo Tong was originally a man of nature. And those two sentences for Shania made him almost shed little pearls. Although it was strange to have a probe armored car go out at this time, the order given by Team Luo didn't leave much doubt. Shania has vision. I don't know what to say. I think I'm reading something into it. Ha, huh? I didn't say anything. What are you misunderstanding? With an IQ like yours, Shu, let's keep it quiet. Shania is not here. Tell us what's going on. We won't tell a soul. It's nothing. Laden, Shania is on the line. Shania? What's going on? No, it's a joke. We're all joking around these days. Why are you so mean to me? I don't know you. You're a generation old howitzer with a brain like an eggshell. My friends in the group were laughing. It's nothing. If you don't tell me. I'll come to District 7 and find you there. Tell me. Mr. Makin came to my place to bet on Shania's development of a special drug, saying it's a big price to pay. Wow. That's great. It's like making pills with blood. You should read less of those old-fashioned e-readers. What do you mean? Luo Tong. 
tell me the truth, or I'll be rude. On Mu Chen's side, he drove to North Molan to detect the strength of the armored car, and the earth-level beasts couldn't simply destroy it. Unbeknownst to him, Luo Tong had already explained his actions to Shania. He's crazy. Mu dust this brat I'm going to run him over. What's on his mind? Wow. My heartbeat is accelerating as I listen. It's over. True love. Did you really let Luo Tong out? It's too dangerous. I trust you. Mr. Mac. It's for Shania's sake. Wait. I'm coming over to get my private message from Rotunda. Oh no. Shania is angry. She's worried about her boyfriend. Under the private message situation, Shania realized that Makoto had brought a machine lady. The ninth generation of the Exterminator 20 Battleheim? With the presence of a machine girl, the level of danger was indeed greatly reduced. Very young? Pretty? Why can't you say that? Alright, you use the macro light far probe to give keep an eye on his car. Shepard Dust's side was already close to North Molin. The sky over here was pitch black. There were giant corpses and white bones everywhere. And there were fights between foreign beasts. Some of the trees in North Morin were two to three hundred meters. And many of the plants mutated. The detection armored car was as small as an ant. Li Shi turned off the heat sensor and turned on the bio virtual force field, covering the engine and energizer. The speed was greatly reduced but not easy to be found by the alien beasts. You're so professional? Her movements were very skillful. It was like a toy. We're almost at our destination. Entering the North Molin. The giant mushrooms around them glowed fluorescently. And even though the trees covered the sky, there was still good light. Stop the car. The probe armored vehicle stopped and Li Shi was on the co-pilot looking at the radar signal. Fifty meters away to the left, three massive alien beasts walked by. Nervous, they had been discovered and would likely draw a siege from the nearby fey beasts. Never mind that they were only 500 or so meters from the target area. They had to stop every 50 meters and observe before advancing slowly. Good thing it's a cold tide. Shepard Dust took a deep breath, and the edge of that lake in front of him arrived. You guy, you actually did this for teacher Shania. Li Shi gave him a blank look. If it was you, I would have done the same. Li Shi instantly didn't look at him. Hoomph. There's no need. Just don't annoy me. You fellow. Being filled with fear by Mu Chin. But Ji body was strange. Obviously that charging was so terrifying. The surging power was going to make the body explode. But why? Ji body would feel very. Wanted. Chapter 029 S-Class Quest Mission. There is an issue between Cloudflare's cache and your origin web server. Cloudflare monitors for these errors and automatically investigates the cause. To help support the investigation, you can pull the corresponding error log from your web server and submit it our support team. Please include the Ray ID, which is at the bottom of this error page. Chapter 030, A Shocking Discovery. Escape begins. Entering the ghost stream, it was always a downward slope, advancing 200 meters, as if through a mist. The picture in front of them shocked the two. The two sides of the Great Rift Valley's mountain wall were densely packed with insect eggs. The cocoons covered with frost protection, as if they were set in the mountain wall. The exterior was frozen, but one could feel that the insect body inside was alive. Li Shi was bold and dared to touch her hand on it. These alien beast eggs, split cell replicas, she immediately captured the image, and the instrument on her wrist was highly analyzing it. It's not eggs laid by some imperial level, or dragon level foreign beast. Makoto was alert to the surroundings. The two of them leaned back to back. These are not normal, but cell division clones. Meaning, with so many bug eggs, there are humans involved? There have long been speculations that the foreign beast higher beings might have connections with some humans. Li Shi didn't dare to transmit the video now. The signal fluctuation was too dangerous in this area. There are alien beasts coming. Li Shi immediately turned to him, her clothes pulling up the optical camouflage tent. Flying alien beasts flew overhead. The two of them cooperated well. When Shepard Dust was serious, her perception was 30 to 40 times that of a human's and she was able to discover in advance that the fey beasts were patrolling by. At the corner of the Great Rift Valley, the two were still exploring. There are footprints here too. Very new. Li Shi was also nervous. Ahead there was was a huge cave. The location of Mu Chen's mission objective was also at the entrance of the cave. He directly pulled Li Shi's hand. The ground here was muddy, and the machinery was not moving well. Right eyes. Go and take a look. Arriving at the entrance of the cave. The two of them slowly crouched down against the frozen worm egg. Ding completed upgrade quest 4, traveled to the depths of the phantom stream to explore. S rank, reward obtained. Wargirl set, shining Gaia armor. SS rank, instantly equipped. Wargirl strengthened, shining form, armor self-repair. There was no time to study the reward more, because in the middle of the huge cave, there stood two humans, on the side with their backs facing each other. The bald man was wearing a black cloak with a standing collar. 
and next to him stood a short-haired adult female. It was impossible to see the faces clearly, and they were conversing with a monster, a 30-meter flounder-shaped crystal creature, emitting silver-blue light, with a large number of umbilical tubes linked to its entire body. In addition to the strange red light particles surrounding it, the entire cave was wrapped in dense blood-red vines. It was like intestinal peristalsis. It makes people wretch and ooze greasiness. Have you ever seen such a life form? Maxion looked at Li Shi. Li Shi shook her head gravely. Without opening their mouths, the two knew what the other was saying. According to your plan, the great ruler will launch a beast tide in advance. The creature could still speak human language slowly. Currently the life instruments we provided are fine. The core you want should be in the red dragon. The bald man spoke. Our dealings have always been smooth. And this time we work together. We have a win-win situation. The Maharaja will consider your hajj words. Don't be smart. You guys, ha, huh? you still have brought people? Does this monster's nose belong to a dog? Maxion and Li Shi secretly screamed that it was bad. What? There are people, not my people. Instantly the monster looked in the direction of the two of them, and countless writhing vines were about to come towards them. Run dash. It was discovered and hurriedly ran. Damn it. Why are there humans? Must kill them. The densely packed vines rushed in. As soon as she picked up Li Shi, she ran wildly. It didn't matter what headlights or thighs the hands were pressed on. Life was important now. Li Shi was startled. Mu Chen's stride was as fast as flying, and his running speed was terrifyingly fast. The fastest flying man in front of him was probably as fast as an elementary school student. She didn't care, and still flipped over in Ma Chen's hands, reaching out to slap down the vines that were chasing them. Subsonic wave. The flying great moths. All of them received the news of an intruder. They rushed toward Mu Chen's side. The sky was covered with foreign beasts. Throw me out. This side of the road is fine. The moment she threw it out, Li Shi turned into a light chasing motorcycle, and Mu Chen jumped on and pulled the handlebars, immediately accelerating to escape. The foreign beasts behind them roared furiously, wanting to tear them apart. Mu Chen turned around and activated the black main multifunctional missile launcher. Don't look at them small. They were very powerful. Instantly, there was a big explosion and the entire Great Rift Valley was affected. A thousand meter sea of fire. In the seventh region. Report, Team Luo. A large-scale explosion has been detected in the North Molan Phantom Stream region. Several people from Luo Tong's office were also aware of it, and it was also observed by their macro light far probe. It had been maintaining a connection with Shania. It's likely that it was done by Mu Chan and the others. This point was recognized by everyone. Notify down. The first, second, and third teams are ready to fire at any time. Scanning at full power. Wait for my order. And notify the 7th Wargirl squad to prepare. Understood. Alarms sounded throughout the entire 7th region. And they began to fully arm themselves and preheat various weapons. What the hell are Makoto and the others doing? Shania sorry. We are not allowed to take the initiative. I know. That bastard. Shania's people were still on their way. The Great Rift Valley collapsed quite a bit under the make dust explosion. So hot. Only you're a crazy person. Holding a multifunctional missile launcher that's close to 200 degrees even if it's fired with precision. Only a physique like Mu Chan's would dare to launch it on his back. Throw it into the system space first. The foreign beasts are coming. Rush out and change cars. I'm not fit to run such a road. Fei Ji was even less able to do so. The heights were full of densely packed huge tree trunks. Behind them, the foreign beasts were in hot pursuit. The vines were restricted by the collapsing great rift. But the foreign beasts wouldn't be. The level wasn't high but there were too many of them. Get on the probe vehicle. Undoing their transformations, both of them moved in a forward roll. Shepard Dust flew to pick her up and threw her straight in. Li Shi'i reacted to everything. This speed of Mu Chen was too fast. Then he came up and kicked the gas to the bottom. Luo Tong. The probe car is starting to move outward. It should be them. I know without saying. Go to the command station. Notify down there. Just say the probe car is a squad of agents we've excluded. Understood. Sector 7's had been put into a state of combat readiness. The force field half opened on the towering iron wall. A large number of gunheims were running up. Dozens of automatic fire gunheims had transformed. Their drivers were standing by, ready to link up. The order had been given. The probe vehicles that went out two hours ago everyone had an impression. The sound of violent explosions should have come from them. North Molan was more than 20 kilometers away from the 7th region. We can only watch it by remote imaging first. The seventh region was a defense zone and could not take the initiative to attack. And Luo Tong did not have the right to do so. Releasing people to go out and explore was already the limit. A few people went to the command tower. And the macro light remote probe image was always on. Seeing it, 
The probe vehicle crashed through a 10-meter giant moth alien beast and rushed out. Now it didn't care if it would play with the car. Shepard dust was the gas pedal to the floor. They rushed out. Not good. There's a big guy coming from behind and pouncing on the car. Insect and fierce level alien beasts couldn't block the probe car. But earth level alien beasts were different. Covering the front of the block. Mu Chan and Li Shi's pulse gun blasted the car door. And the two of them tumbled down. Li Shi pulled on Mu Chen and instantly transformed. The battle Heim form took off. The destroyer 20 fighter jet flew into the sky. And Li Shi hovered in a circle. Aiming at the alien beasts chasing in the sky. Crush destroyer missile. Launch. Boom boom boom. Six alien beasts were blown to smithereens. The ultra long range telescope in the 7th district could see the images blurrily. Beautifully blown up. Worthy of being an agent squad awesome ah. In the morning come that destroy 20 fighter ah. It's them. Seems very young. Each squad is equipped with remote lookout equipment was. Breaking through the air and sound. The whole body black crystal and armor of a war girl suddenly appeared. Towards Li Shi in the sky. The back diffusion burst missiles were fired. Boom 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 boom. The sky was a sea of fire. What's going on? Who is that war girl? Why is it attacking them? Chapter 031 Shepherd's Dust Pushing Li Shi to the Limit The sudden change caused those who saw the image to widen their eyes. Luo Tong. What happened? Originally, they had already transformed and returned. And suddenly, an unknown battle maiden appeared and attacked them. That war girl still rushed out from the North Morin. Not one of ours? No. Unknown model. Li Shi rushed out from the explosion. Her G body somewhat damaged dodging the fatal position. It should be them. The two knew very well that the black face armor. 10 meter body black battle G was the bald man and female machine lady they had just seen. Black six winged wings on the back. Capable of launching tracking diffusion missiles with the power of a 7th generation S class. Paint black coating. Scales flow like cargo color upper layer. Waste plasma beam cutter. 7th generation S. Blood red 4 thrusters. Shoulders. Head. And also legs should have all kinds of weapons. The whole body emits black streams of light. And the sense of oppression is full. Using the words of Mu Dust in their class. This Battleheim was already strong and smoky. It was rubbing like a gas stove. Guaranteed level 40 or above. Mu Dust boldly guessed. Conservative. Li Shi'i predicted that the other party was level 50. A powerhouse amongst war girls. Mu Chuan and the others wanted to fly towards the 7th district place. But the other party was also very clear. It directly hung in the air. Holding a plasma beam cutting blade to block their way. The speed the other party was now even better doesn't want us to go back, the war girl is faster than me, and running in the direction of the northern bear country will catch up with us, coming, the black war girl turned into a shadow, not an air type but the other party's equipment was all first class, the level was high and there were many talents, three consecutive slashes were directed at Li Shi, the blade could cut out a hundred meters of light edges, and as long as it took a slash, the G body would be sliced off, spiral steering, the opponent accelerated to follow up, and Li Shi shot a crushing destroyer missile, it was easily dodged by the Black Battleheim. Who the hell is that Battleheim? Someone who deliberately tried to attack us. There are no markings on her entire body. And the Guardian air scanner also shows unknown. It's a war girl from another kingdom. Could it be that our detectors have found something and are then going to be put to death? The distance is too far. Any past this range would be easily dodged. Missiles with long range output were ineffective in front of the powerful Battleheim. That Battleheim is so terrifyingly battle hardened. Every position is stuck well. Those two plasma beam sabers are Mourner SXE, right? Eyeballing the level 50 or higher machinima and pilots. The experts in the 7th area were watching. Judging that the opponent's battle power was strong even from the blurry images alone. Team Luo. Us? The men and women of the Wargirl squad took their positions. No. Exceeding the permissible range is something none of us can afford. Luo Tong glanced at the small team leader. The machine lady. Who was considering rushing out on his own. It was too late to go over there now. Li Shi dodged three attacks. The combat G's stance was already excellent. And two of the slashes were cut by a fraction of a second. Die. Two plasma cutting light blades. Cross X type 50 meter chop. Li Shi lifted his transformation. He and Makoto were in human form. With smaller bodies. That X cut almost grazed far away from them. And the battle Heim form wings would definitely be chopped off. No way. Not at the same level. Li Shi's entire body was sweating. Pulling Makoto to transform back into the airplane again. The two of them had a similar operation on the simulator. Li Shi was also betting just now that transforming back into human form might also be decapitated. The people in the 7th district set off a gasp of shock as they watched in cold sweat. This switching transformation of the machine lady really dares to gamble. No. The opponent is coming up again. Li Shi. Transform and fuck him. 
flying in the direction of the northern bear country, the other party's thruster jets slammed after them. Us? Last time it was only by the simulator. The virtual architecture that. Linkage fit 35. Why is it so high? The virtual architecture wasn't on last time. We've already changed once. Don't worry. I don't mind you. Dislike me? You E-class wave driver. I don't dislike you, but you still dislike me? It's only the big ones like mess. Shania's that are tempting. Ha, huh? my D may not be worse? You pervert. In addition to being able to energize also. Coming. The plasma twin blades in the black war girl's hands flashed with light. The two of them had an extremely high degree of tacit understanding. As Mu Chuan pulled the joystick and Li Shi did the same. There was no communication. The two of them moved in unison. And if it was the other way around then they were dead. Ian my man flipped. The body flipped upwards. A high degree 180 degree turn. Ha, huh? the black war girl's icy voice. It actually dodged it? Immediately turning around. Catching up again. Come on. I'm responsible for you. No need. I'll clean you up later. Fuck this guy first. Only Mu Chen could make the calm and collectively she become fiery and shy. Later on, it will be in a state of broken defense for a long time. Tracking diffusion missile launch. Locking the extermination 20 fighter. Double knives in hand. Ready to make up for its avoidance of the direction of the position of the budget. Should be over. Nective. Mac can. Eption. At this moment Makoto transformed into light. The two souls intertwined in the blue sky and opened their eyes at the same time. Linkage fit 45. A wave point fused and exploded away to merge with each other in the two souls. The fighter jet hovered vertically in the air. Golden light stretched out alabaster arms and long legs. White intersected with golden armor wrapped around her petite body. Golden scales of crystal and armor shimmered and covered the fighter's body. The nose morphs and crystals merge into a full breastplate. And on the war girl's head is a golden battle helmet. Sun laurel shape and formed four waves of hair around her ears. Flowing like a fairy. With her black three meter long hair. Sexy and beautiful. Both arms had white winged armor with golden lines and missile launchers on her small arms. The moment the shoulder armor unfolded, the back extinguishing air turbine propulsion was launched, and the wing's golden light became eight wings to unfold. It was as if an angel descended. A SS class radiant battle girl. Transformed? Transformed! Luo Tong all exclaimed. Crap! Radiance battle heim! So beautiful! A rare radiant battle girl? What did you say? Luo Tong? Transformed? Shania also heard it. Yes. They transformed. The Radiant Battle Girls. Golden Flashes. The Radiance War Girls dodged the cuts of the Black War Girls. The Goddess of the Sky. The Flag in the Air. The Light Amongst the Battleheim. The Radiance Battleheim's popularity and rumors were an existence of explosive heat. It really transformed successfully and the fit is so high. What's the deal with you pervert? Hey hey. I say dear schoolmate. Don't keep bringing in the word pervert. Fusion Degree 46. The two of them communicated internally and flew out a golden Z-word light at the same time. Dodge that black war girl's attack. Turn around. Radiance kick. Stigmata. So fast. Right. The plasma cutting blade chopped in. And the radiance warrior girl's left arm armor blocked it. What a fast reaction. Li Shi was stunned this was brought about by her fusion with Makoto. Her perception reached the realm of terror. Backflip. Plus upside down golden hook. The black battle jade pulls back. Eight wings of golden rays radiance rays. The opponent stretched out his right hand to unfold a quantum force field. Boom 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 radiant golden light exploded in the sky. Chapter 032 10 expert battle goddesses beaten and running away. The goddess of radiance came with her main weapon being her SS ranked wings. Followed by an S ranked lance of dawn banner. The opponent blocked it. I know. The level makes up for her speed in the air. Li Shi was now level 16. The opponent had level 55. If there wasn't a big difference in level and equipment. The air battle lightning warrior girl was completely suppressing the opponent. In the back. Piercing through the sky while holding the lance of the dawn banner in both hands. Boom. Boom. Two golden laser rays. The black war girl predicted the shots and dodged them at the same time. Plasma dual blades rushed up to chop. Vertical projectile breaks through the air. Sonic boom's sudden acceleration. Glory war girl pulls away. The radiance war girl. Is even less able to stay. The black battle Heim's icy voice carried the accent of a large home country. Blood red light spread. What killing move the other party initiated. Li Shi stretched out her hands. And her arms shot out in successive flying bullets. And racked her gun to shoot. Using multiple angles to restrict the opponent's movement. But the black war girl actually ignored the flying bullets and only needed to dodge Li Shi's laser. The other missiles were detonated by the red force field as they approached her body. And had no effect at all. Red flash. Let me do it. Makoto took main control. Continuous melee collisions. And the other party was like a roaring. Maddened beast. Suddenly attacking furiously. 
Mu Dust resisted with all his might, defending against the 16 angles of the flashing attacks, trying to pull away. What kind of talent is this on the other side? Our fastest speed can't pull away. The two sides fought, colliding continuously in the air. A lightning storm had formed. The light wargirl is strong too. That black wargirl is a complete monster. Our entire squad might not be able to block it. What kind of state is this? Luotan's neck looked thick. Nima, this is the kind of operation two students can have? It was like what the people from the Battleheim squad outside said. All five of their seven squads battle ages, together, might not be able to block it. Luo Tong, how is the situation? Shania asked on the other end of the phone as well. The enemy has unleashed a powerful talent very terrifying. Destructive power and speed, like there is a level 60 or above existence, comparable to the level of a dragon class alien beast. Ah, then they? Are you sure that Mu Dust isn't Red Dragon's elite wargirl genius? The two of them youngsters were unable to counterattack, but all of them blocked. Fusion Fit 55. Still rising? Mac Dust you pervert. What a weird wave. Last time with Shania it went as high as 65. No wonder the eyes opened. My wave band is finished. It's already distorted beyond recognition. If it's distorted, it's fine. I don't mind. You'll sleep in the second bedroom from now on. Ha, ha, ha. Uh, what second bedroom? Mukin. I'll tear your mouth off later. Li Shi broke her defense. Even if you took advantage of her, you also gave her a second bedroom. It's not even a big room. It's a second room, isn't it? What if I want it? What are you doing with your spiritual power? You guy. Because the fusion fit was so high, the mental consciousness was almost constantly intertwining between a mecha and a pilot. Ordinary linkages were usually fine, but a lot of mecha goddesses and harnessers who have been fighting and cooperating for years won't transform even if they have a fit of 25. It was because soul intertwining was an act that went beyond friends and comrades. Makoto unleashed galactic heart charge and intentionally two ports. Your asshole. Radiant wargirl red warmth scolded. God came with a kick that flew to the black wargirl, sending it flying out a hundred meters. This sudden outburst stunned the other party. Nanny. What talent did the other party unleash? Yes, the spiritual encroachment talent that Mu Chen unleashed. Like holding Li Shi in a hug she couldn't resist yet. The G body was already blushing red and it also carried a wave of powerful energizing, instantly filled with energy. The power of the galaxy's heart also caused her attribute value to rise. Do you know what I'm thinking right now? Don't be impulsive. I know what you're thinking. I also know what you're thinking. Maxin you pervert. Wait, after this is over, I'm going to dismantle you. Then let's give him some color first. Pull the fusion to 60 if you have the ability. There was no shortage of energy, which was very crucial. This was also the reason why Li Shi didn't run in the first place. The current speed was going to be enough to run. Tempers came up and the chest armor was cracking. Knocking down a piece of the other party's armor and bringing it back was also important information. What she wanted Makoto could also know. The ripples don't care? Li Shi'i gritted her teeth. Just say it if you can't. Fusion fits 60. This is my current full strength state. Come on. Open eyes, awaken state. The golden light of the radiance warrior girl shone. And her eight winged metal wings, with a single vibration. Unfurled with platinum-colored feathers of light and shadow, her beautiful face appeared on the mask. Eye-opening? Crap! Eyes opened. Goddess of Radiance. Fuck them. Let them know the power of our red dragon wargirls. Shinaya. Shinaya. They opened their eyes. Sixty fusion. Awesome. Luotong was excited. His highest fit with his vice squad was only fifty-one. No. I hear you guys. Those who saw the image. Exclaimed and shouted. On the contrary, Shinaya wasn't as surprised as they were. When the transformation succeeded, it was because she had experienced that strange waveform of Makoto's. The degree of fusion with her last time alone reached 65. Moreover, according to the examination, her ripples hadn't changed in the slightest. How is the battle situation? Both sides are clashing. The speed is too far away from our side of the screen to see. Continuous collision. The goddess of radiance appeared, and the battle power rose once again. The opposite side similarly opened their eyes. It was years of grinding. It was the first time that Makchen and Li Shi transformed into a Radiance Battle Goddess. Makchen, I know what you mean. Go! The Radiance Goddess flew in reverse, heading in the direction of North Molan. This caused the Black Battle Goddess to be taken by surprise. The eight wings unfolded with golden feathers. She spun and danced in the air. In an instant, thousands of golden feathers cascaded down, each one a terrifying bomb. The entire Phantom Stream Great Rift Valley became a sea of fire. You damned thing! The Black War Girls cursed. They were in a hurry. Li Shi's sonic boom speed bombed the air. But instead, she traveled with ease. And the other party's speed air battle didn't hold the advantage anymore. Come on this move. Trusting the tacit understanding. 
The goddess of light turned and stretched out her right hand, flare X, instant blinding light, exploding for thousands of meters. The sky incinerated in flames. What kind of move is this? A talent that can fire out? Secret. The power is okay, I guess. What else do you guys have hidden? Seems like all that's left is in my pants pocket. Shut up. Breaking backward into the air and flying away. Such a great power actually just made the black warrior girl's shield armor shatter. That mysterious force field defense of the opponent was strong. Fight a protracted battle. We're not afraid of him. You pervert is just full of energy. Now it's one output port. My intimate schoolmate. If you say I'm a pervert again, believe it or not. I'll use 10 ports to energize you. You. Finding it very amusing to tease her. Come on. Give you a weapon. We're not afraid of him in melee. Oh dash. Li Shi almost screamed out. You idiot. Where can you directly channel a weapon like this? It was like something directly entered her body. And her delicate body trembled a few times. First time. The black war girl was still hesitating. Only to see the goddess of light pull on her right hand. The 8th generation Psy Thunder Rift God Gun appeared in her hand. Where did you get the 8th generation split god gun? Li Shi was spitting. And the other party. The black war girl. Was also spitting. Nima. Goddess of radiance had this weapon. Moreover. The goddess of radiance was emitting silver colored streams of light. A sign of very abundant energy. Can't figure it out. Can't figure it out. Big bald head and female machine lady had lived for decades. But they had never seen such a situation. It was as if the more they fought each other. The stronger they became. The other party must be one of red dragon's top 10 experts. It could also be a hidden expert. They had less than 10% energy. And the other party was full to overflowing status. This energy can be so much that it's overflowing. What's going on? What's going on with the Red Dragon Kingdom's war girls? Can't figure it out. Can't figure it out at all. Subverting their perceptions. One of the top 10 masters of a certain country had a brain overload at the moment. Looking below, the Great Rift Valley had been destroyed. The tracking diffusion missile launched instantly, turning into black streams of light and flying toward the far reaches of the sky. Running away. Taking the speed of Li Shi's Goddess of Radiance was no help. And taking this recharge from Mood Dust was even more useless. Chapter 033, Shania sleeps in the master bedroom, Li Shi's second bedroom, we can't do anything about him either, the goddess of radiance hovered in the air, there's actually a way, but still, forget about the people in the 7th district who are watching, you guy, you still have a bottom card, honestly explain, with the intertwining of spirits, she knew that there was another word in Makoto's head, shining Gaia armor, what was that, there was a hidden talent, armor, it sounded like a defense weapon only, it's not like we're in that relationship. Why should we explain? Want to. Consider it. Sleep in the second bedroom. Makchen. I'm going to tear you a pervert. Go back. I won't tease you anymore. Fusion transformation disengaged. Changing back into the form of a fighter jet. He flew back to the 7th district. Well done. Directly knocked the opponent away. Awesome. Shows the prowess of our red dragon fighters. You guys are great. A large number of people cheered. Luo Tong walked out. All right. All of you return to your posts. The captains of the Battle Heim squad, as well as the captains of 1, 5, and 8 come to my office, and everyone else continue to be on sea level alert. Understood. Mu Dust came down with a head full of sweat. Luo Tong threw him a coat and hat to wear. Li Shi wore Mu Dust swan tight clothing, wearing sunglasses and hat, and the uniform, her figure and temperament could not be seen at all as an 18 or 19 year old girl, not to be recognized. Go to my office. On the way. Li Shi had already transmitted the data. Inside the office, besides the vice squad, there were five captains. All of you are your own people. Don't worry to say, what situation has arisen for you? Luo Tong's words, made the war girl squad and several other captains who just came in puzzled. So secretive. Look carefully at the man of this special offense team. ISNT it's Shania that boyfriend? We accidentally discovered the Pandora factor. As well as the phantom stream rift valley with thousands of fey eggs. And the battle hag that chased us was negotiating a beast tide with a talking fae. Li Shi scratched out a few pictures. Stereoscopic images appeared. And everyone at the scene stared wide-eyed. According to the analysis, these insect eggs were not born normally by the fae beasts. But rather, there was human intervention. Li Shi squeezed Mu Chen out of the way as she came to say. I have three detailed analysis reports here. Captain Luo Tong. I can give you two. But there is one request. The four junior captains looked at Luo Tong. This beauty's tone. She wasn't one of their own at all. Ha. Huh? They all judged but didn't say anything. Captain Luoton should be clear. Clear my ass. Luoton looked at Mu Dust. What's the situation ah old brother? Listen to her. You say. You normally can't hide my situation with Mac doing well. 
Just say that you're cooperating with the people from the lighthouse, and then cover it up externally. I don't think it's hard for you. These two reports of the Pandora factor and the cloned bug eggs, as well as these pictures, I can share them with you. You're from the lighthouse? Several squad leaders had a head full of questions. Only Luo Tong and the vice squad had shocked expressions. You can totally report it as such. I won't talk nonsense on this point. I am indeed someone from the lighthouse. This point is also unknown to Makdu and you don't need to ask him. Mu Dust shrugged cooperatively. This information is very important. And it's been a pleasure working with the lighthouse. Luo Tong extended his hand. Li Shi shook it up. Pleasant cooperation. Team Luo. There's one more thing. Mu Chen stood next to Li Shi. It was convenient to have a backstabber. When you reported, you said that according to the lighthouse's investigation, this beast tide is substantially advanced, and it might still be more than a month away. What did you say? This is impossible, right? Makoto, what are you talking about? We don't have this survey. There is now. You want me to carry your nonsense? Maxion blocked it with his hand and whispered in her ear. Trust me it won't be wrong. I can only tell you that it's not a general intuition. Li Shi bristled. When she met this guy, Mu Chen, she admitted it. Is this true? The people from the tactical hub predicted it to be a year and a half. With these pictures and information, what if the beast tide has higher exotic beasts or even some human intervention? So saying anything was possible. Posting up from this matter, Mu Chen not only managed to convey that the beast tide had advanced. Moreover, he could barely keep his identity hidden. At least for the time being, he didn't have to go completely on stage. And he could also make that unheard of lighthouse organization carry the information. Just say it. Li Shi ghostly believed in Mu Chen's evil. As of after today, Li Shi never doubted Mu Chen's intuition again. Mu Chen, did you collect the stuff? Got it. That's great. Luo Tan nodded. Right. You rest for a while. Shania, came over. Ah, uh, Mu Chen looked at Luo Tong, who smiled awkwardly. Bugger off. Then the exterminator 20 fighter jet ran away, and Mu Dust was still standing in Luo Tong's office. This is finished. Mu Dust covered his face. Older brother Mu Dust. This friend of yours isn't simple. Brother Luo, what kind of organization is the lighthouse? I haven't heard of it at all. Not many people know about it. They do things very secretly. The rumors are all very powerful. You can understand it as the topmost guild. I'm not really clear about it, but I've dealt with the other one, and the top recognizes them, and Shania probably knows a little bit more than I do. Speak of the devil. Shania's car killed straight in, getting out of the car, cigarette in hand, domineering arms crossed over his chest, top arms suppressed. Move over, I'll park. The two machine women were scared and immediately ducked away. Immediately, immediately, Sister Aya, being several years older than her, they also had to shout Sister Aya. Shin Aya saw them both at a glance. Where's that extinguished 20 machine lady? Come up and look for the machine lady first. The vice squad heard stealing joy. Feelings like coming to the big room to check the small room ah? Hearing that you are coming, directly ran away. Mu Dust, you guy. Shin Aya twisted his face. Lawless? I don't care if you're still going to the Black Forbidden Land? The behavior of the two, in turn, made people think that they were flirting. Shin Aya suddenly felt that something was not right. Looking around, many machine ladies were snickering. There were a lot of familiar looking guys. She was still here at the beginning of last year and recognized too many of them. I'm going to die of exhaustion. I'm going to go to the car first to take a nap. Makoto was exhausted. When Mu Dust woke up, it was dusk sun outside. The city walls of heavy cloud could already be seen in the distance. Awake? How does your body feel? Mu Chen was in good spirits now, except for being a bit hungry, and full of physical strength. Compared to the last time, the change in physical enhancement was obvious. Shin Aya turned her head and looked at him without any good humor. The story of the incident and their significant discovery was known from Luo Tong's mouth. It can change ten times Iron Blood Goddess. You stinky guy. Beast Tide thing is true? Our relationship. You don't even believe me. Finished. Hopeless. Shepherd Dust looked at the system. Their actions delayed the Beast Tide's predicted time by two days? The general trend wouldn't change. The Great Rift Valley of the Phantom Stream might just be a laboratory for the other side. Luo Tong will report it up. But the number is so unbelievable that it's hard to be effective. Humans always judge by their own experience. It's not a good habit. I hope the cost is smaller. Makoto flipped to the co-pilot. Who's that machinima? The one who will live in the second bedroom later. Second bedroom? Don't worry. The master bedroom is reserved for you. Ha! Huh? Shin Aya clenched her fists. This Mu Chen was getting more and more licentious. How could she not understand what it meant? Stretch your hand over. Pulling Mukin's hand. Linkage fit 30. Your wavelength still hasn't changed. 
and I'm still on the initial wavelength after I've transformed with Fusion and Professor Ching's check on them. It was because of this reason that everyone was convinced that Shania had transformed herself. Why was this? My bands don't have a rank and will cater to change depending on the bands of different people. Do you recognize Dina of Ye Fire? I have met. I had her do an experiment with me yesterday, and the linkage we started with was having a 25, and it was still me not catering at full strength. You can't go out in public with your situation. Definitely. Only told you the details. Shepard's dust leaned on the chair, didn't take Shania as an outsider, or even as an insider. The character of doing things, the decisiveness, of Shania's various aspects, all belong to the type that Mu Dust is very favorable. High fusion linkage over. It will build emotional trust, quiet all the way. Shania threw out the finished cigarette, the night after tomorrow. Let's try. Chapter 034, eyebrowing the two in class. Are you saying that our plan? Has been discovered? A war girl in the top 10 of battle power? Impossible. The Red Dragon's top 10 warjacks are all within our monitorable range only. Linkage can reach 60? Radiant war girl? No wonder you missed. Damn Red Dragon. Still hiding some experts? It doesn't matter. It can't disrupt our plans. They can't predict it. At the same time, Luo Tong's report set off an uproar. And after saying that he was working with the lighthouse again, he wasn't questioned too much. Just. Impossible. More than a month? None of our guard control systems are reacting in any particular way. No movement from the North Bear either. And it would take a year of extremely cold air. Sort of an early year of receding cold. Plus nearly half a year to do it. This is the natural world. Not the fantasy world. Mac Dust old brother. Major commendation sent to me. This has nothing to do with me ah. Brother Luo received it. Thank you for letting me out. Where's the beast tide I mentioned? No news. Trust me. Mr. Law. There's still 30 days to go. Prepare for it in District 7. I trust you and Shania. I'll be on S-level alert in those days. On the other side, Li Shi entered a mysterious room. The old man in a tuxedo butler handed over the clothes, put them on and pressed the button. Light and shadow flickered and went down a very deep elevator. Entering underground, quietly, she walks out and heads to a silver lighthouse. Inside is like a starry sky. She sits in a chair. This, please make me a cup of black tea. Miso 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 miso. A remote screen appears. Geez, our little Shersher is doing really well. Come on, who's the handsome guy who fused and transformed? The voice of the female mechanic. Amanda, don't call me little Shersher. My daughter is a year older than you. If only she was half as cute as little Shersher. Honestly, I'm curious too. Lighthouse members are private and cannot be viewed casually. Got it. Old Xian you're the most rigid. Tata, how is the information analyzed? That Heimbody I probably guessed who it is. From Omoto's side, the mechanical lady is codenamed Redicide. The driver is not clear. A very significant discovery. Confirming our guesses at the time. A three-dimensional screen appeared. Plus Li Shi 10 people. But this 37-day beast tide. Is it really possible? They all shook their heads. I. Believe in my partner. Li Shi sipped her black tea. Ah. Can't stand it. She. I want to know who that guy is so badly. Amanda. Don't be like a springtime blue eagle she-cat in heat. Why is my little Shersher's mouth getting cuter and cuter? There were people from every kingdom here. We will consider this carefully. But the lighthouse is limited. I didn't expect you guys. Li Shi'i was the youngest member. And it's like a child. You need to be dropped hard once to know the pain. So you'll listen next time. Making a few old guys cover their faces. Old companion. I used to wonder how Li Shi'i could marry. As a result, today it fused and transformed. And opened its eyes. Yeah. I feel like she can't look at anyone. The ten exchanges didn't represent individuals. Some women had several harnesses around them. Some of the harnesses had several machine women as well. Without anything else, I'm going back to rest. On the other hand, at night, Makoto was in his dormitory. This time, the act had allowed him to level up to 12. And he had also completed two quests. Ding, completed quest 2. Leveled up to 10. C rank. Acquired special ability. Level B insight. Able to gain insight into an area with a distance of 10 times the field of view. Ding complete mission 3. Destroy 20 earth class alien beasts. Level B. Reward. 1 galaxy upgrade kit. Can upgrade one of the abilities of the battle girl. G body. Reward. Galaxy upgrade kit. Can upgrade one of the abilities of the battle girl. G body. Tap the system again. Driver. Mood dust. Level. 12. Body value. 335. Super characteristics. Primordial wave. Talent, Grade A Super Power Drive, Grade SSS Galactic Heart, Special Abilities, B Class Insight, SSS Class Flare X, Fusion Core, SSS Class Shining Gaia Armor, sent a message to Shania and Li Shi, 
Shen Aya replied aha, uh -huh. Li Shiyi replied Dai, the latter hadn't lost her temper yet. The next day, it was raining heavily outside, and the indoor lesson was ancient history. Every time Mu Dust took this class, his stomach hurt, because of the laughing, more than 300 machinima and pilots in one classroom. After the incident passed, everyone was very active, and in the past few days on the simulated linkage fusion XP combatant, Many of the machine nymphs and harnesses simulated transforming into battle girls with the help of the virtual architecture. The excitement was so great that they couldn't wait for anyone to say how awesome it was to be turned into a battle maiden. But the real 25 fit is hard, and it's just a trigger condition, and some of them can't transform into a war girl even if they reach it. It's like a nervous MS. Zhang Chuanzhou. Secondly, most people still couldn't walk after simulating the transformation and were basically targets. I heard that Zhao Pengfei has been killing it in the instrument these days. I guess he wasn't convinced after losing last time. Where's Chang Rong? Hasn't been released yet. There are still two days left. Chang's family fines have all been paid. When Mu Chen came in, he saw Li Shi in the last row. To her left sat Qin Fei Fei, and to her further left were Han Xuanyan and Zhou Xia. The positions were generally random. Mu Chen then walked over. Didn't let you sit. Li Shi stared at him. I just wanted to sit here. Ah uh, but sat down. I haven't gone to clean you up yet. Look to the side. Nukan reminded her. Li Shi looked to her left. Qin Fei Fei's big purple eyes Han Xuanyan and Zhou Xia and the girls, as well as the students in the front row. At this moment, they were all looking at her with curious babies. The two of them were? Rumor has it that the day before yesterday on the playground there was a petulant scolding incident. Wait for it. My sky base cannon. Try it next time you transform. The two whispered there. Qin Fei Fei blinked. They didn't believe you when you said the date. Expected. I'm not talking about my side. It's heavy clouds side. I'm sure you believe me. Die far away. You pervert who believes you. The teacher came in. How is it Mr. Shania ah? Doesn't the ancient history teacher son old? M.S. Shania is better. I candy. Shania teacher the silver uniform. Good looking. Indeed. Shania teacher. Mr. Son sick? Shania held a cigarette in her mouth and slapped her hand on the electronic podium. Sick? It's being pissed off by you guys. Poo. Put. Makoto had to cover his mouth to keep from laughing. Shin Aya cursed. You guys, don't write nonsense if you don't know. Look at what you've written. It made Mr. Sun fainted in anger. Shin Aya teacher. Mr. Sun said, can't be empty, when the test is the same. Ancient and early history ground can't be forgotten. Want us to learn from experience. That is, his old man said. Shut up. Today properly educate you. Read to the class. What the hell you write? Chapter 035. The teacher is going to pass out from anger. Shania took the electronic test paper. The first ancient morning culture question. It's clearly the monkey king wreaking havoc in the palace of heaven. What did you fill in? By Shaoxi, the monkey king founded Jindong? Instantly the drivers and machine nymphs inside the classroom burst out laughing. Jian Xiaoqi was still scratching his head next to him. It's Shun Feng, right? Put. Shania covered her face. Zhang Ji Tong wrote it. The monkey king goes crazy drinking. Zhou Xia, what did you write? Say it yourself. Zhou Xia, Sun. Sun Wukong Monotone Red Center. Put. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Qin Fei Fei didn't even hold back. Shen Aya was speechless. The most outrageous is Qin Feng. The monkey king wielding a sword? Ha ha ha. The whole class doubled over in laughter. Shen Aya flipped one side, the third blank. Chao Chao holding the son of heaven hostage. Han Xuanyan, what do you write? Han Xuanyan immediately replied. Chao Chao holds the son of heaven hostage to pick up airdrops. Put. Mu Chen didn't hold back. Li Shi even had to cover her mouth. You're a real airplane lady. You can even think of an airdrop? Dong Man Yan don't laugh. What did you write? Dong Man Yan stood up. Old. Teacher. I wrote. Chow Chow holds the son of heaven. Hostage to boil lard. No. Laugh not live. Shen Aya then flip. This is not the most outrageous. The ancient morning ground title. The big book and named Fusan. Morong Buo. What you write? Morong Buo crossed his arms in front of his chest. I. Wrote, De Ben's using his head to split the steak. Qin Feng laughed madly beside him. What did you say you wrote? Mi Jiaza? Mi Jiaza said awkwardly. The great person cooks fish soup with his butt. Put. This Li Shi didn't even hold back. You guys. And next. The main city of the Cold Kingdom is Cold City. What did you guys write? Zhou Xia wrote that the old head of the Cold Kingdom is Zhou Jiluan. Ha ha ha. Zhang Jitong you wrote. The people of the Cold Kingdom shit a pot. Put. Mac Dust's stomach has laughed and hurt. Ancient morning history class, the distance of a few thousand years, and people do not pay attention to answer a thousand strange questions. Lu Shishan punched Qin Guanxi, 
Dong Man Yan, what did you write? Lu, Lu Zhishan will repair the washing machine. Xin Feng, what did you write? Lu Zhishan beat Jian Ji on the top. Ha ha ha. The next one put Shin Aya are looking at the laugh. Will Yuji take the birth order? Jiang Yuan Li, Jiang Li, what did you write? Teacher, me, I wrote. Wu Yu's born hemorrhoids. Teacher, I wrote. Wu Yu swore to marry Guo Dajiang. These brats, hopeless. Shin Aya saw the back and laughed himself. Two days of nothing. On the course Li Shi didn't give Mu Chen a good face, but she had to answer whatever Mu Dust asked again. In the afternoon, in the principal's office, I see that you've been tired for the past two days. Rest for two days? School head Wu was heartbroken for Shin Aya. She was still very energetic every morning, but she often shook her head at noon, and her body was starting to weaken. This was the reason why both the main engine and the secondary engine of the G-body were ruined. It was like a normal person whose heart and liver had failed. Living was already a miracle. How could they have any energy? Shin Aya was well aware of her physical condition. For her, who had grown up strong, doing things in a thunderous manner and even a bit pugnacious, such a situation was very uncomfortable. The defense hub side all have side reminders. Let her not worry about her parents' hub everyone will help. The day before yesterday, she saw her mother crying early in the morning, and externally, she was all smiles. Shin Aya ah, has always been the pride of our family, but at home. Then you come to me what is the matter? Wu school organizing the documents, tomorrow is nothing. I go to your house to visit. It has been a long time since I saw your mother. Shin Aya didn't say anything for half a minute. Wu school felt that it was not right ah. Shin Aya was never this hesitant to look at her. Shin Aya stood up and bowed to her. Thank you for always taking care of me. What's wrong? What happened? Shin Aya, you tell me ah. Your mother back then in order to help me block the explosion. Only to fall to the present G body life expectancy is not more than 70. As a result, you this girl, I have promised your mother, she left me to take care of you, you don't want to think about it ah. Shin Aya looked at the other party worried, gently bumped, nothing, I'm just ready to try another way, you know me, it's not my character to be depressed like this, Colonel Wu remembered, you mean Makoto? Yes, if I don't come back in a couple days, you can take that brat as your godson, he's an indispensable mastermind in this era, trust me, as the four eyes met each other. Shin Aya's eyes carried a crimson light, just like when she was at her most energetic, I feel crazy, Colonel Wu sat down and covered his face, it's basically impossible, there's a one in a thousand chance of him, I'll eat the door to this principal's office, you reconsider, there are still nearly 10 years, let's go, in a few days, hopefully I can bump you out, on Shin Aya's side, she thanked the people around her almost as if she was leaving her last words, messages of concern were sent to Zhou Yang, Luo Tong, Wan Chunfang, and Zhang Min, more than a dozen good companions, they immediately guessed what, but Shin Aya blocked the message, she blocked it, let's not talk about it, it's Shin Aya's choice, Luo Tong, how much hope is there, how do I know, Prof, Qing is one of the world's best, Zhou Yang, you've mentioned it in the past few days, Prof, Singh said it's impossible, current biotechnology is about 500 years more advanced, so it's possible, 1 in 10,000, what's the probability to try, if Shin Aya transforms again, will she become a machine and disappear? Are there many like that around? We've all seen it before. Leave me alone for two days. Absolutely pessimistic, because it's impossible. On the contrary, it was Makoto who spent the last two days thinking about how to remodel which position would be convenient for holding a weapon in the future. The difference in size between the Light Warrior and the Iron Blood Warrior is double, and the feeling of fighting is completely different. What are you doing? I'm leaving Shin Aya sent a message. Let's go to my house for dinner. What? Crap, Makoto's eyes widened, to Shin Aya's house, to meet her parents, wait, I haven't prepared a gift yet, wait, what, hurry up, I'll wait for you in the garage, clothes can be changed at will, and took a shower, that's, this meeting parents should be formal ah, there is no need, go, on the way, when she saw that Mu Chen was a bit nervous, Shin Aya smiled instead, I see that you don't even have this look when facing a land emperor turtle, not to mention the emperor level, Facing a dragon level foreign beast might not even be this nervous. Shania's home was not far from the academy. The courtyard neighborhood elevated garage. Optical force field iris scanning to enter. Wait. Register one for you. The next time Makoto came he could go straight in. Parking Shania stopped moving. Mac Chuan. How about promising me a condition? Chapter 036. You can do whatever you want to teach her tonight. Promised. Mukin replied directly. You guy. I haven't said it yet. It's not your character to be so hesitant. What you're so serious about saying. I promise. Shin Aya pinched his face, revealing a gentle smile. 
It was hard to see the strong and icy Shania could have this expression. Getting out of the car and going upstairs, Shania's car comes back when the home's quantum screen will display. Shania came back quite early today. Froze. Shania brought a handsome man back? Crap. Crap. The parents were petrified with white eyes. What are you two's expressions? Bringing someone back. You don't need to be petrified by the dragon level foreign beast King Medusa, do you? Mukin immediately spoke. Hello aunts and uncles. My name is Mukin. I'm disturbing you too. Young man. Quick quick quick. Feel free to sit down. Shania's father. Shen Tsong Yun. Was a retired driver S rank driver. And the scars from back then could still be seen on his neck. Mother Ling Mei. The S class guardian got us back then. Both of them were also famous existences before. 20 years ago a big battle was seriously injured and retired. Ling Mei is now sitting in a wheelchair. And her movements are not convenient. Normal life expectancy of 2 or 300 years. The driver also has the ability to live to nearly 200. But this era, many people without grandparents, sacrifice too much. Shania really. There are guests come not say earlier. We also prepare. Both parents were very hospitable. The first time Shania brought a strange male friend back. And there was little explanation. Auntie and uncle. Came too quickly Shania also did not give me a word. Just casually brought some. Shepherd's dust pulse through the wristwatch a pull. Hands instantaneous full of things. A wide range of things. Is not a cheap goods. Who let you buy? Shania almost gave Mu dust a throat lock. And it's not for you to buy. It's for aunt and uncle to buy. I'll clean you up later. Seeing that the two were on good terms. Shania's parents were happy. Eating dinner. Pulling together the family. Shania also realized that Mu Chen did not have parents without any family background. The two old men instead looked at Shania. You dead girl how also this expression ah, you also do not know? So young, it's the defense hub's external technical deputy instructor. Not bad. After eating, Mu Chen took the initiative to wash things. Although it was a bit smaller than Shania, this era of the machine lady had a longer lifespan. They were satisfied with Mu Chuan because of this. Sitting in the living room Shin Tsong Yun whispered, Daughter, is your situation clear to Mu Dust? Hearing these words, the wife was not feeling it. But Mu Dust at first glance is a good boy. Very capable. Deputy instructor. Zhang Dongyuan personally appointed extremely rare. That stubborn. Their generation of people ah. It was impossible not to be clear. He is clear. Shen Aya knew what her father meant. You don't have to worry about it. That guy Mac Dust. More powerful than you think. Machine mother several relationships are good. Recently. We may have to do an experiment. Experiment? Just us. I don't want to hide anything from you guys also don't persuade me. The success rate of this experiment may not be high. Right. Failure? I mean if. I will ask Mu Chuan to take care of you guys. Shania bit her red lips and held back. But the parents kind of couldn't help it. There's still time ah. There's still time to reconsider. Said. Don't persuade me. How are you a character with your mom? Say it again and I'll leave first. Shania stood up. In case. It succeeds. Success? What experiment? How could they not have asked Professor Ching? There would be no method. Mukin washed the bowl and came out. I'll wash. Come out and look. Auntie is crying ah. The atmosphere is not right ah. The atmosphere of a life and death parting is vestigial. Mood dust ah. Nothing. See the joke. Much dust. Are you going to do experiments? Ling Mei couldn't help it. Yes. Mukin nodded his head and didn't hide it. Is there a probability? It turned out to be this matter. Of course, Shania is my most important person right now. You too. Shania. Who else did you tell? Wu school. That's okay. Auntie and uncle. Don't worry so much. There are probabilities. But this experiment thing, no one should say that it is related to me. I've told school Wu as well as Luo Tong. Whoever says a word, I'll tear their mouths apart in their dreams at night. Come on. You've transformed into a state of grievance. Can you not worry your parents? Watching her daughter and Mu Chen leave. Ling Mei couldn't stop her tears because she felt that Mu Chen was comforting them. Getting into the car. You come, just go wherever you want. I'll listen to you for everything from now on. Anything? It's all fine. And there's plenty of time. You can do whatever you want. Shen Aya's words were extremely seductive. Mu Chen looked at her and swallowed his saliva. The gas pedal was stepped on and set off. Shen Aya sat on the co-pilot. Relaxed. The traveling car came to a civilian technology warehouse. Which was something that Mu Chen had asked Dina to borrow and she could use the best security factor to remodel the warehouse. Upon entering, the defense force field unfolded. Dina also prepared some tools for him. The time was still early. The car was parked. Makoto looked at Shania. Shania spoke. You want to play with this? Blinking his eyes. This is Takar. Can't stand it. Your words a few people can't stand it. 
Shepard Dust does not care. First stamped on the red lips. Then, there is no follow-up. Deep breath. Tonight need to transform a long time. And Shinaya's body is in a poor state at the moment. In case this body of his, the force was too much, something was going to happen. Shinaya, you can't be thinking that there's no possibility, and then use you. In exchange for me promising to take care of aunt and uncle right? Yeah, I didn't even think that I would do that, but I didn't resist. It could be that we fused. Shinaya also got off the bus, and was very open-minded about this kid. Mu Dust. Mu Dust smiled and didn't say anything else. Don't worry, I'll take care of all of you. I'll get ready first. Shinaya stood in front of the optical stereoscopic motorized transformation table, looking at what Mu Dust was getting, only to see that Mu Chen first took out the SUP full module modification toolbox. This remodeling box, 5 million that model. Right, sup, where did you get it? Modification box body open. First form protection force field. Safety is the first step of the transformation. Various precision instruments appeared. Analog mechanical helper arm. Wanjing instrument and other equipment in place. The main control screen unfolded. Borrowed. Mu Chen smiled. So it was borrowed. Shin Aya nodded. Thud. The sound of landing. S rank black abyssar armor coating? What did you take this out for? Where did you get it? Borrowed it. Borrowed this for what? You can borrow this too? To the right appeared again. The 8th generation S rank scythe under split god gun. And right in front of it. The shining S grade upgrade core. Thunder splitting god gun? S class upgrade core? Wait. It's always impossible to borrow these things. Shinaya's beautiful eyes widened. What the hell? It's even if you borrow a toolbox. Defensive high grade defensive coating armor. 8th generation S rank weapons. And upgrade cores? This was for remodeling and upgrading the warjacks. It had nothing to do with her. You are my person. Of course you have to use the best you can use now. Just kidding. This is the equipment I dumped my family's money to buy for you. For me? Bot? Equipment? Shinaya had a head full of question marks. Chapter 037, Upgrading Shinaya's SS Ranked Machine Lady. No. Not. Mu Dust. You this remodeling ah. My situation. And where did you get so much money? Shinaya also went to shop several times self-provided weapon trading hub center. Understand the price. You don't have to care. Don't worry. I'm sure I'm not going to steal to rob. Shinaya nodded her head and took off her jacket and pants. Wearing a close-fitting black workout suit. Let's start. Mac can. Mac can. Mac can? Shouted three times. She simply crossed her arms in front of her chest on purpose. The devil's body shape is displayed to the fullest. The waistline. And the completely unreasonable heavy weapon armament. Shinaya was beautifully berserk. Beautifully overbearing. And every part of her tall body was combat great perfection. Ready to start. Not going to watch a little longer? Wouldn't be able to stand affecting the main thing tonight. Makoto looked serious. I've realized that you're my favorite type now. Shinaya crossed her arms and revealed a smile. Is that so? Many of my classmates guessed that it's that kind of ironic man. No. I didn't have a favorite type before. I didn't even feel it. That kind of relationship is quite resistant to ordinary linkage and I don't like it either. Shinaya muttered to herself there. The toolbox instrument activated and the levitation device made her body float. She took a deep breath. Starting? Makoto nodded her head. Transformation. Barrier attack battle vehicle. Suspended in the air the particle platform held it up. The main control platform scanned it. The external machinery had recovered, but the interior was marked red. Shania let out a soft chanting sound, maintaining the mechanical state. The shattering of the twin engines, coupled with the destruction of multiple core key bodies was a real pain. Human form was only a vague pain. How does it feel? No. It's fine. Shepard Dust did not use the lift, directly jumped up 5 meters into the car. Shania didn't know what Mukin would do. There was a smell of life fluid in the car, as well as the smell of motor oil and four of the six energy tanks were broken. Shinaya? Shinaya was in pain and somewhat lost consciousness. In the place of a normal machinima, she would have long ago been unable to stand the loud screams. Hands pressed on the car. The system made a detection and analysis. Human consciousness can still be maintained for three hours. The degree of damage 82. The main console has been flashing an alarm. Don't let the Megane maintain this state. Shinaya did not answer. Having passed out. Under normal circumstances if it didn't change back to human form when it woke up, it would consume human life, and if it fainted a few more times, it might never change back. Shinaya's just now cancelled all defense codes and acted at Wumakoto. Open the life plate armor inside is the cold source light cluster, which is simply the heart. If broken, it will die. It was the most dangerous location for the mechanical form of the machine lady. Muchen took out the lunar energy life function recast card. Floating in his hand, the surging life force spread. 
as if it was a green crescent moon, crystal clear, and about to shatter at the touch. It was injected into Shin Aya's G body. Instantly, light covered this body. Immediately, Mu Chen closed the life deck and jumped out from inside, as if the flames of life were burning. The sound of clicking machinery could be heard. Shin Aya's situation is serious. The treasure may still be a little short of a complete repair at once, but it should be able to help Shin Aya recover to normal will be able to transform at will. On the main console, the G body detection light alarm stopped. 79, 75, 66, 50. 42. Time passed by minute by minute. Shepherd Dust was also nervous. The more he could recover the better. Finally, after the green blow of life disappeared, G body's damage level recovered to 15. Fantastic. Mu Chen was also happy. This was already an extremely heaven defying effect. G body damage of 20 or less were in the mild range normally there was no sense of abnormality. And the loss of life was extremely small. Waiting for better rewards in the future. And then fully recovered without a problem. Core engine restored to normal. Output power 100. Secondary engine slightly damaged. Output power 95. Secondary engine slightly damaged. Output power 96. The most crucial core engine was refreshed. While Shin Aya was sleeping, Mu Chen loaded the coding installation, as well as the weapon interface. Then he took out the treasure galaxy upgrade component and installed it in the turbojet, instantly incorporating it. Turbojet upgrades bit 9th generation S class. Turning on explosive air mode. Now my precious teacher is going to be in the sky. Black Abyssinian armor transformation completed. G body fusion in progress. Scythunder splitting lance port installation completed. G body fusion in progress. S class transformation core fusion complete. Fit 100%. Core engine upgraded to SS class Earth Guardian. Installation of broad axe bombs completed. Body fusion in progress. Auxiliary multifunction upgrade complete. Flash flare docking. Shield loading complete. Makoto wiped the sweat from his head. It had been busy for more than 5 hours. The masterpiece was almost complete. The hand was pressing on Shania's G body and rescanning. Mechanical Maiden, Shania. Level, 45. Ripple, initially unchanged. Evaluation SS class. Mechanical form, 8th generation Earth attack vehicle. SS level. SS grade now, the galaxy upgrade component. Coupled with the extremely high quality equipment. And Shania already had this SS grade talent in the first place. The mechanical form was upgraded. Wargirl form, Earth Guardian Wargirl, Talents, Grade 8 Deep Power, Grade 8 Giant Barrier, Grade S Roar of the Earth, One of the Talents Changed, Core Weapon, Primary Weapon, SS Rank, Earth Guardian Shield, Secondary Weapon, S Rank, Psy Thunder Splitting Lance, Multi-Purpose Weapons, B Rank, Broad Axe Bomb, B Rank, Flash Flare, Multi Shield, Not Necessarily All High Grade is Good, Equip Some Functional Weapons, Low Consumption and Easy to Use, Special, S Class Turbine Propulsion, Capable of low to medium altitude flight when energy is sufficient. G body, G body injury level 15. Once she's adapted, after the next link up, let's see what else she's packing. After 6 hours of busy work, the brand new earth attack battle vehicle. Its appearance had changed very little from before but everything was brand new. Its battle power was even raised a notch. Auxiliary resumed her human form. She was lying on the instrument platform. Sexy and beautiful, as if she was a queen commanding the battle from the front line. Shepherd Dust went to wash his face and heard movement. Shinaya had woken up. It had been a long time since her body had been this relaxed, and the pain that had lasted for over a year was gone. This light. Am I in heaven? Yes. This is Paradise Station 1. Report the name of your spouse. And 3. Mate. 3. Whom? She immediately did up, hovering over the mid-air instrument. Arms blocked the light. Mac Dust immediately turned down the toolbox lights. Mac Dust. You guys are driving me around again. Stopping what he was about to say, he felt that his body was very relaxed and full of strength. The heart vigorously beat, and the five viscera and six bowels were as comfortable as if they were newborn. And, SS Earth Guardian Shield, Psy Thunder Rift Lance, Black Abyssal Man Armor, and a brand new turbojet. The sensation of these physical changes appeared in her brain. Her own body knew best, and it was really comfortable at the moment. How does it feel? Mine was busy for six hours. Feel down to adapt? Chang. Succeeded? Chapter 038, Dating Under the Moon, Encountering an Attack, Shinaya couldn't believe this was real, Professor Ching World's top team is also less than that, Mu Chuan is just one person, also so young how can it be possible, putting her down, her body could move freely, suddenly a sound of breaking wind, Maxion swung his fist to strike, Shinaya reflexively blocked with her right arm, her reaction speed faster than before, successive combinations of punches, Shinaya's body dodged continuously and a dominating sweeping kick, 
Makoto jumped to avoid it. Again, doubled the speed this time. Makchen disappeared. So fast. Shinaya realized that she could only see the residual shadow. However, in terms of fighting experience and skill, Shinaya was an existence that had pressed Yenjin, a 100 victories female powerhouse, onto the fighting stage. Makchen was much faster than Shinaya, but he couldn't hold her. Staggering 50 or so moves, Mu Dust pulled away. Looks like the body adapted well. Why is your speed so fast? Walking over to Shinaya, don't care about me. Look at your situation. Shinaya's body was great and energetic. It was like she had only gone to the front line herself with some more increase in her reflexes and strength. Transformation. The earth attack vehicle appeared. A new black coated armor. Much thicker. And a closer look would reveal that the core armor was dark brown. Earth attack battle wagon? SS class? My core engine and secondary engine are repaired? This can't be possible. Shinaya felt like she was dreaming. Makoto sipped his drink and spoke. I used a treasure that no second person in this world knows about. The moon energy life function recasting card. To repair your G-body. That thing is a cosmic level treasure. Look how good I've been to you. Secondly with the galaxy upgrade component. I thought about it and upgraded the turbojet to S-class so that you can fly at low to medium altitude. After Makoto had fused the radiant war girl, he felt that the flying piece of the machine girl was very important. If she couldn't fly, many environments would be limited. Galaxy upgrade component? Top secret treasures. Coated armor. Weapons I've loaded for you. Complete with SS level upgrade fundamentals. Shepherd dust drilled in. And the car body was different. Well, all my goodies are for you. Shania's headlights flashed and she didn't speak. But it showed her happiness. Mac dust. I. You stinky guy. Mu dust sat on the chair. Nothing. What relationship do we have? You are my person of course I have to give the best. Ha. Huh? You this guy stomped on his nose right. What your people? Writing on the teacher to come? The linkage appeared. Hoomph. Give you some color and you're lawless. Don't link up and go out for a spin yet. Mac Chen laughed. Shania now had a hard mouth. But her heart was soft. Putting away the toolbox. Leaving the warehouse. Thanks. The warehouse I ran out. Looks like you're in a good mood right now. I won't bother you. Take an early rest Dina returned the message. Ding completed mission 5. Upgrading and modifying a class A or higher equipment to a mechanic girl. Class C. Gained knowledge skill, fighting skill patriarch. Gained physical fitness improvement of 30 points. Silver colored light entered the bloodstream of Makoto's brain. With a large amount of extra fighting skills to digest, Shinaya wouldn't be his match in the future. The earth attack battlecruiser was on its way. A behemoth of a locomotive. Many locomotives had to raise their heads to look. Wow. Attacking chariot. So majestic. Brand new armor coating. I wonder which power is the big one. So powerful. Maybe it's S-class? It's the barrier attack battle vehicle, right? No, it seems a bit different. Out of the city, Shinaya ran comfortably in the planes. The three engines pulling full power. The propulsion was terrifying to the extreme. It was as if it could smash through the alloy city walls. You can toss and turn all you want. Energy is nothing to worry about. You don't want five ports at once. What? My Shinaya has to be lighter? Be careful I'll eject you. I see you can't spare it. Ah, Makoto was ejected and pretended to be shocked. Shinaya immediately caught him at the place of his descent. Deliberately again. I'll use the 10 output end for my next sneak attack. My precious teacher won't have an overabundance of energy and leak or something. Right? You stinker. Come on. Fusion. It had been showing that the maintenance fit was at 30. Makoto nodded his head. Fusion. Shinaya. Accepted. The degree of fitting was once again pulled up to 40. Transforming into an Earth Guardian Wargirl. Unlike the Iron Blood Wargirl. The Earth Battle Heim's Heim body protection crystals were brown in color. The shoulder armor and cape were also changed. The overall shape was more exquisite. And the weapons were equipped with under. Handsome. The left hand is the Earth Guardian shield, which unfolds at full strength and can cover a hundred meters of light curtain. Together with Shinaya's talent, one person was the front row of a team, carrying the Scythe Thunder splitting lance on her back and taking it out to dance. Shinaya knew all kinds of weapons. Finally, like a tiger with a jet. Makoto accessed the single output galaxy star. Shinaya flew in the sky. The sky is nice, but I still like the feeling of the earth. Earth Guardian Wargirl. Has the red dragon come out in the millennium yet? Not much of an impression. There might have been one. Might not have been. In full combat form. That would be the earth goddess. The guardian of life. The leader of the land wargirls. Stretching for a moment. She undid her transformation and drove to the edge of the cloudy lake. Changing back to human form. She leaned back under a tree to rest comfortably. The moonlight was beautiful. It was late at night. And the neighborhood was filled with insect chants. Feeling this now true to herself. The moonlight shines on Shinaya's newborn. 
Walking over, she sat next to Mu Chen. It's been hard on you, leaning against such quiet serene comfort. Mu Chuan's system heard the SSS mission system refreshing, but the sweet moments of the moment, he did not care for the time being. The opposite side of the highway occasionally had organic women traveling by, not too far from this side. A dark red giant armored car drove by, not too fast, and there were two normal armored cars following on the left and right. The person sitting on the passenger side looked like Qin Fei Fei. What kind of machinima is that? The Qin families? The one just now? It's Qin Qin of the Qin family. A seventh generation A-class giant fortress transporter. Shin Aya was cognizant of it. She's hauling cargo this late. It should be a more valuable item. Thousands of meters apart. 20 to 30 black locomotives also traveled by. With so many suddenly appearing, Makoto stayed mindful. It's so late. Your family is hauling goods. How did you know? I was passing by and saw you sitting on the passenger side. Yes, some valuable medical equipment and a few upgraded cores. My family only got them. It's not easy. You don't know. I'm very good at mechanical appraisal. There are two dozen black cars behind us. Are they owned by the Qin family? Ha, huh? no. Qin Feifei immediately sensed something was wrong. Fourth uncle, there seems to be a problem. Fifi what did you say? The main canyon road in front of them suddenly burst into flames and mountain boulders smashed down. There were two other machinima nearby that were almost smashed. The entire main route was blocked by the huge mountain boulders. The giant fortress transport stopped. The vehicle's radar showed. Warning of a large number of highly thermally modified vehicles approaching. Damn it. Someone is trying to rob something. Qin Qin take the left side and send a distress signal. Ji Lei and Rong Hang. Be careful of something nearby. Understood. Understood. Coming from behind. The giant fortress transportation vehicle turned to start. Before it could drive out 500. Cluster 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 cluster. High energy reaction. Over a dozen missiles incoming. Metaforce field unfolding. A purple curtain of light covered the transport vehicle. The earth shook with a massive explosion. All armor piercing bullets. Uncle Qin Si took control of the vehicle. And Qin Fei Fei was almost bumped against the windshield. To the left and right. The Qin family's drivers. Ji Lei and Rong Hang. Immediately linked up to turn on their counterattack weapons. Fourth uncle. We're surrounded. Chapter 039, The Unstoppable Brand New Shania. Qin Fei Fei covered her head, which was raw from the impact. On the screen in front of her, the durability value of the meta defense force field was consumed by half. The vehicle defense cannon was turned on, and Uncle Qin Si came to control it. But looking ahead, their three armored cars were already surrounded by 30 or so pitch black modified sports cars. Bounty Hunter Team. Various missile weapons aimed this way, not getting any closer than 200 meters away. The alarms kept going off, being locked on all of them, were being sneak attacked come to the rescue. On road Z5714, Xin Fei Fei sent a distress signal, but the other side had a warjack standing in the back row, and on top of the vehicle next to it was the signal shield. The wavelength signal couldn't get out and the short frequency signal could only spread nearby kilometers. Damn, who are these guys? And a war girl? They dare to cause trouble even in this location? This wasn't even out of the range of the heavy cloud region. The Qin family's escort went back after reaching the border from Copper Scale City, thinking it was safe. Our route is completely known to them, and the other party would strike in a dangerous area even at their own risk. Over 60 missile launchers were aimed and over 20 pulse guns. A SC armored battle maiden. Even if it was an A-ranked end-of-the-line warjack, these people were bounty hunters who licked shells and ate lasers and wanted money for their lives, and they couldn't cope with the war power that erupted. The firepower is not at the same level. Fourth Uncle Qin narrowed his eyes. Ji Lei you will come and pick up Fei Fei and run later. Rong Hang you follow. They want goods Chiner and I will stay behind to maneuver. Can't hitch the younger generation here. These people are crazy. Fourth uncle. I don't think they want to let people go or even the goods. Qin Fei Fei whispered. The bounty hunters just didn't come any closer. This stance. They want to destroy the goods and the machinima altogether. This round of flush fire force field can't stop it. Qin Qin's scared voice. Uncle Qin Si shouted to the other party. Leave the goods to you and let us leave. Oomph. The other party gave money. Not for you to leave. The voice of the bounty hunter commander. Aim and fire. Twice as many as the first round. Spreading over the sky. Qin Qin screamed out in fear to be blown to pieces. This moment. Death comes. The heart almost stops. Brownish golden flashes fall before the earth shaking explosion. 500 area blast explosion. A power that could level mountains to the ground. Qin Fei Fei with Ji Lei and a few people from Rong Hang shielded their eyes with their hands. The two machine ladies were screaming. So rockets and missiles, dead. Qin Fei Fei snapped to see and understand. Uncle Qin Si is had glared like a gong. Force field, still there? In the diffuse flying sand, in front of their car, 
the golden brown light shield that spread out as if it were that flying wing. There was also a lifelike more than 10 meters long earth pattern cloak fluttering, drawing the scythe under splitting god gun behind them with a sweep. Thunder, an airy sound that tore through the air. Not only did it rip through the sand and smoke in the sky, it also formed a 50 meter air chopping wave. More than 10 modified locomotives on the right side were split in two and exploded. What's going on? What's going on? There's a war girl? What? A war girl? These bounty hunters withdrew their sight from their companions who were cut and exploded. Seeing that 10 meter body of the stunningly beautiful Battleheim, standing in front of the giant fortress transport vehicle. At this moment, she had put away her unfolded earth shield. In her right hand, she was squeezing the SXI Thunder Rift God gun. War girl? How can we need a free Battleheim here? Hey, hey, what model is this Battleheim? Never seen it before? Kind of looks like an iron blood Battleheim. Iron blooded? Look at her. She's so strong that she's bubbling over. She's not one of Red Dragon's top 10 Battleheim. Is she? The ones who came were of course Shania and Mu Dust. The Battleheim emitted a light golden color. The explosion just now didn't even bring any breakage to Shania's shield. Uncle Four Boats you guys go. I'll take care of this trash. War G's voice was very familiar. The 10 meter body was all Earth War Girls. But even Qin Zhou. Qin Si Zhou didn't recognize what kind of war girl it was. Could it be SS level? Okay. Okay. You have to. Be careful. The other party knew him. And shouted uncle. It should be his own people. Hurry up. Dawdle. I am afraid to shock you guys. Shania urged the voice. Jean Fei Fei froze for a moment. How would Shania teach her a character of this war girl? Damn it. Don't think of running. All. Breaking through the earth's maneuvering speed. Shania rushed towards these bounty hunters. These guys have no evil only recognize the money thing she will not show mercy. So fast. A land heavy armored warjack can be this fast? Reverse to escape? Firing a gun in the face of a battleheim? The Battleheim had already appeared in front of these modified locomotives. The Earth Guardian Wargirl's protective scale crystals unfolded, dodging most of the cannonballs. All the weapons from other angles were blocked outside the armor. Just like scratching an itch, she was the most defensive Battleheim type. The head of the gun in her hand spun and bubbled with lightning. Sweeping across the field, the half moon exploded. Shepard Dust mounted powerful weapons with sufficiently formidable attacks. The armored Wargirl flanked and drew her beam saber. Shania turned around and shield smashed. The opponent's beam saber shattered like glass, and was also sent flying out 200 meters by the shield smash, smashing into the ground in a continuous backward roll. What kind of battle maiden is this? At least S rank. S, S class at least. Run. The pulse cannons fired various missiles indiscriminately through the air. It was useless. Continuously sweeping across the sky, the wind arrows cut through the earth. The earth guardian wargirl spun the split god gun, an explosion behind her. The sound of running, that armored warjack still trying to escape. The warjack gasps and looks back. There was no one in sight. When she looked back again, the earth guardian wargirl was already in front of her, crushing the ground with one hand. Say, who instructed you to come? The right hand rift lance spun as if to drill through their heads. Don't kill us, don't kill us. I say, I say, it's a sound that tore through the air. Shania immediately raised her shield to block it. Three rays of light hit the shield and the piercing impact was blocked by Shania. However, the projectile was still able to attach itself to the shield and flash exploded. The power was even greater than the mass of cannonballs set on fire just now. In the sky of dust, Shania jumped out. Her shield slightly cracked. Is it alright, Shania? It's fine. But that war girl hostage. The armored war girl had deactivated her transformation and collapsed in a pool of blood. There were flashes of metallic luster on the mountains in the very distance. 7th generation SS ranked cloud piercing polymerization sniper cannon? The broken air became a black shadow escaping them trying to chase without possibility. The only survivor was also killed. Being set up. The rest of the stray bounty hunters. None of them had the value to make up for it. Even if there were any alive they couldn't ask for anything. 20 minutes later Yen Jin's convoy arrived at the scene. And only the finishing touches remained. No living victims? Investigate and take away the ones with signs of life. Yes. Team Yen. Yen Jin looked at the traces of the cuts, as well as the text that contacted the Qin family's people, and she couldn't think of who it was in the first place either. Who is this freedom warrior girl? Chapter 040, the entire staff is looking for Mu Chen. Qin Fei Fei's mother arrived with her people, and if it wasn't for the fact that Mu Dust and the beautiful teacher were on a date, they were lost. You guys were saved by an unfamiliar war girl, with a body over 10 meters, brownish golden color, and a hot body? I don't have an impression. The giant fortress transporter followed eight armored vehicles to the left and right, driving on the highway of Heavy Cloud City. Looking at Chao Qin's video record, it looks like the rumored Earth Guardian Wargirl. Yes, yes, 
Yes, Big Auntie, she can deploy a golden brown hundred meter light shield, Ji Lei added frantically, shocked and fascinated by its valor. But the other party is very direct in calling forth uncle by his name, like he's very young. Jean Fei Fei rested her face. The most outrageous thing is that when I heard her voice, guess who came to mind first? Who? M.S. Shania. Shania? That can't be right. But that girl would call it that. But her situation. And the fact that she's an iron blood warrior girl is a notch off. The Qin family's people wanted to thank and couldn't find anyone. But the headlights are huge. And the delicate minded Qin Fei Fei seems to think of something. Early morning sunshine. Ling Mei did not sleep well last night. It feels like her daughter is not coming back in one go. Downstairs to the living room. She people froze. Shania had just come out of the shower and changed into comfortable clothes. Mom woke up? These dark circles under your eyes. Didn't sleep well last night? Shania is back? Father also immediately came over. Shania is back? Great. I'd say she's grown up now and will think about it. That's too dangerous. Click. 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 Mechanical sound. The body's right arm mechanically stretched out. Handing breakfast up. We bought breakfast. Mukin is sleeping in my room for a while. We haven't slept for a night yet. Question mark. Didn't sleep for a night? Exercising all night ah. Parents thought of that kind of thing to go. Receiving breakfast. She hadn't noticed Shania's semi-mechanization. This talent was automatically obtained after she upgraded. The parents have not reacted Shania did not have this talent before. G body is seriously damaged cannot be half mechanical body. Ling may walk down, girl. The first time you do not so tossed. Do not rush once into ah. There is plenty of time. Poo. Shania drinking water sprayed a ground, but also choked. Mom is not what you think. Shania's face burned red at the moment. She also had a blush. We went to the Cloud Lake Berth Z5714 Road last night. Pugilistic one night car. Ah, that's too bad. Shania covered her face. Father laughed. Both their mother and daughter spoke bashfully. Shania you didn't sleep for a night. Is your body alright? Right now I'm in good spirits. A stroll around the Black Forbidden Land is fine. Wait Shania. What did you just semi-mechanically hand us? Shania performed with both hands on the spot. Semi-mechanized. Dead girl crazy ah. Your body can't transform like that. Can't stand it. Shania I remember you don't have a talent for cyborgization ah. It was Pops who found the clue. Level 1 talent awakened last night. You guys don't think that last night we raced all night and drove a car. Right? Crossing out his key body panel. Core engine intact. Three engines at normal power. Equipped with a thunder rift lance. SS rank Earth Guardian shield, added S rank Black Abyssalist armor coating, and S rank turbine injectors, especially the bottom. G body damage level 15. Parents vigorously wiped their eyes. Do not believe that this is true. And even Ling may ruthlessly pinched her husband's leg. Pain in that Tom call. Really, really, it hurts me. Go easy on it. Shania is also like a child who got a perfect score on the exam at the moment, showing off like her parents. This? Where did you copy the panel? Cough, cough. Still disbelieving. Mom and dad don't say anything about Makoto transforming me successfully. It's a secret. Really? It really worked. Oh my god. Lower your voice mom. He worked hard all night. He used a special what treasure. Ling Mei and her husband and wife were excited and felt incredulous. Optical image morning news reported. Last night in the early hours of the morning in the Cloud Lakes Park Z5714 wrote a large scale explosion. Suspected of a large number of bounty hunter convoys in the implementation of sabotage operations. According to the news of the security hub, a passing freedom warrior G disintegrated the other side of the behavior of the currently Z5714 road is back open to traffic. Road Z5714? Shania, I think you just said that you guys raced there last night? Yes. By the way, I resolved the 30 or so bounty hunter convoys that were causing trouble. I heard Chin Chin say she was crying in fear when a goddess suddenly descended and blocked everything. According to the description, it's probably an SS class warrior goddess, the guardian of the earth, one that appeared more than 400 years ago. We've got a lot of talented people here in Chongyun. Chin Chin also told me that her first thought was Shania, and that the war girl's voice was very similar. Shania was able to block the attack, but she was hallucinating, wasn't she? There's a lot of people with similar voices. Oh, no one's reprimanding anyone now. It's so comfortable. Luo Tong, I'm not here for half a day. You itchy skin is not it. Tu Lian, get me to his ass kick 10 feet Shania's message. Tu Lian is the deputy team of the 7th district. And Luo Tong is also a fusion transformation relationship. Shania, you're back? Didn't go and risk anything, did you? Shania, I'll kick his ass right away. Whatever you say. Ha, Shania's back. Ha 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 ha. I miss my old teammate. Cho Yang, when you're free, 
Check if there are any registered wargirls who specialize in using the 7th generation's SS rank sky piercing polymer sniper cannons. It's a rare commodity. You're the one who made it happen. Shinya, I miss you. Let's get together. It's been a long time coming. Shinya, there's still time. Don't get discouraged. You're all playing the emotion card. Shinya, our old comrades can't live without you. It's good to have you back. Luo Tong, you're so fake. Ha ha ha. I'm back. I'm back. Good. Let's get together sometime. Looking at the message sent by Shinya, the crowd was happy, but it felt a little bit wrong. Not like Shinya's style of speaking. Shepherd dust to sleep until noon. Shinya in the warehouse self-cultivation cleanup. At the Heavy Cloud Academy. The morning was Shinya's indoor class. Shin Fei Fei looked around. Fifi, who are you looking for? Have you seen Maxion? Mu Dust. Ha, huh? no. He usually sits in the same row as us when he comes. Zhou Xia and Bai Xiao she also looked around. It seems like he rarely misses class, right? Class is about to start. Li Shi noticed the burning gaze. Shin Fei Fei, what are you looking at me for? Ah la 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 la, I was wondering if MS. Li Shi knows where Mukin is? Why are you asking me? I'm not familiar with him. Shin Fei Fei bumped into someone with a ball. Really? You don't know to ask if you have a close friend of his. Li Shi blanked her. Still saying you don't know him well. You know he has my best friend. Li Shi turned away to read her book. Ignoring this difficult woman. Plebeian, tell this young lady if Mukin is in your class. A discordant voice at the classroom door. It's Beldet? Beldet is looking for Macduin? No way. It seems like Macdust hasn't come yet. And just now I saw Qin Fei Fei looking for him as well. Macdust Plebeian, come out here for this lady. He didn't come today? Strange. The message didn't return either. Beldet stood at the door with her arms crossed. What are you guys crowding at the door for? A majestic voice. Beldet and Anata they turned around to see that it was Principal Wu standing behind them, frightening them to immediately duck away. Class will start soon. Go to your classrooms. School Principal Wu walked in. Where's Makoto? He hasn't come today? The class collectively asked. Strange. Why are they all looking for Mu Dust today? Chapter 041 No wonder the seatbelt hasn't been upgraded in a thousand years. Concubine. School Wu you're looking for Mu Dust too? Beldet almost blurted out. What are you looking for him for? Rhetorical question. This, this, there's a three-day practical training team test in a few days, and we're going to bring him along. It turned out to be this matter. Beldet also wanted to ask School Wu what he was looking for Mu Dust for. It was not usual for the principal to come looking. School Head Wu didn't answer with a bad look on his face. Li Shi, when Mukin comes back tell him to send me a message. Dropping a sentence, he left. Shinya didn't come back, and Mukin didn't come back. Wu School was in a lost mood, even if he didn't hold much hope. The whole class was quiet, including Beldet and the girls. Li Shi was embarrassed. By what right did she call out to inform Ah? Now you say there wasn't an affair. Someone believes it? Li Shi was speechless and sent a message to Mu Dust for a burst of output. Mu Chen and Shania hadn't prepared to go to the academy today. They had to wake up at noon to leave for Xinjin City. The harbor city of the six main cities of the Red Dragon. What's with all the messages? Many messages popped up from Mu Chen's Pulse Pass watch. Let me see who they all are. Shinya pulled over to take a look. Qin Fei Fei with a flirtatious voice asked if she was there. Beldet sent seven or eight plebes on what they were doing. Dina had a message asking if his warehouse was still being used. Then there was Li Shi. Where's the asshole pervert? It's okay. Mac Duan. There are five machine girl mistresses sending you messages to Ah. Mac Chuan looked at Shinya. The whole room vinegar jar overturned flavor Ah. He sat on the bed with a look of being caught in adultery. No. Shinya. You said that Li Shi and Qin Fei Fei. These classmates are even if it's not enough. How did you include School Wu in it? The five witches who sent the message. School Wu was also among them. Hoomph. Don't get up yet. Aya. My beautiful teacher's bed is so fragrant to sleep in. I can't get up. My body is being pressed with a five finger mountain. Instantly. Shin Aya blushed. She directly grabbed Makoto and wanted to throw him out. Shin Aya's arm strength was great. However. Mu Chen reacted quickly and directly flip clamped Shin Aya and flipped him back. Under the rotation. Instead, he brought her to the bed and entangled her. Mac Chuan's fighting skills were now first class. Four eyes were facing each other. Faces close at hand. It suddenly fell into silence for a few seconds. Where's Shania? Mukin. Get up for lunch. Ling Mei came in just in time to see the two entwined. About to kiss up. I didn't see anything. You guys feel free? Mom. Shania immediately rolled up. Mukin also got up. The picture was a little awkward just now. Simply returned the message. Shania. Is school Wu's side back? Not back first. We are going out for two days. The less people know about the operation, the better. 
Makeup Departure Shinjin. Two people with sunglasses in a casual dress. Mukin Upright Sunshine. Shinaya Figure Devil. Tied a ponytail sexy and beautiful. Attract a lot of passing people side eye. Thought it was some kind of big family people or the ranks of the stars. All passengers, please fasten your seat belts. I'm Zhao Lu, the aircraft's maiden, and I'm ready to set sail immediately. Inside the cockpit, the pilot linked up. The flying G traveled to Xinjiang. Makoto tapped on the SSS mission panel. He had refreshed four of them when he returned last night. Quest 1 to destroy one. 000 foreign beasts in a beast tide hadn't started yet, and the other four refreshed. 2. Level up to level 20. B rank. 3. Eliminate an imperial great alien beast. Level B. 4. Before the beast tide begins, recruit a temporary formation of 10 or more witches centered on yourself. Level A. 5. Defeat an unlinked SS ranked machine girl. S rank. 6. Recruit 20 war girls to station at Chuanfeng City or Copper Scale City for more than 10 days. Before the beast tide. Grade A. The purpose of this trip was to travel to the Dragon Alliance. The news that Mu Chen asked Luo Tong to report was not taken seriously at the hub center. Last night, the system showed a prediction of the time of the beast tide, five days ahead of schedule. It was unknown what had happened. There was less than a month left. Shinaya did believe in Mu Dust, although he didn't say why. The hub center doesn't believe it, and the two of them discussed and went to the headquarters of the Xinjiang Dragon Alliance, whose influence is top-notch in the entire world. In passing, MacDust told Shania that he wanted to find an SS-ranked machinima to spar with. S-class rewards ah, he naturally wanted to obtain them quickly. An SS-ranked machinima? Just right. Let's go to the Dragon Alliance and meet my opponent. She's an SS-ranked machine lady. Task 456 all had a chance to be completed on this trip, so the two were setting off immediately. Heavy Cloud Academy side. Sheen Fei Fei from her class, as well as Beldette from the international student class, and Li Shi were all on good terms with Mu Chen. Zhao Pengfei let out a cold snort as his fist pounded on the electronic desktop creating ripples. How could he, a hallowed AS driver, the future pride of heaven, an existence that the Zhao family was now focusing on cultivating, lose to an ordinary driver in the E-band? Unconvinced, displeased, his and Chang Rong's loss to Mu Chen and Li Shi had spread throughout the family's peers, becoming a joke. Wait, for the team practical test, I'll get my face back. Zhao Pengfei was ready to lay down the gauntlet. Brother Pengfei. That kid is afraid that you won't dare to come to class. Chang Rong just came out and sat next to him and fawned. Hoomph. Prepare yourself well. Don't drag me down when the time comes. Next week's practical class test is crucial. Zhao Pengfei was very serious. And in the back row sitting in the back row, Gao Yinchan topped his glasses and sneered. Zhao Pengfei. Just trash. Chang Rong was disliked back and secretly turned her head, showing an expression of displeasure with Zhao Pengfei. But at this moment she couldn't be seen. What are you doing in Xinjiang? Li Shi was corresponding with Mood One. Xin Fei Fei peeked in. Apart from the exit, Xin Jin is the Dragon Alliance. There's no benefit to peeking. Li Shi turned away. Aya, it's not like people are stealing. Why are you so petty? Go to the Dragon Alliance. Get some help. You know, Li Shi probably understood what Makoto meant. The Dragon Alliance is more complicated than expected. If you run into trouble, reporting the name of the Rock Elephant should be able to help you. My good classmate. That's great. Rock Elephant was one of the core members of the Lighthouse, in charge of the Dragon Alliance, and Li Shi wasn't completely clear about his specific duties. However, she knew from her usual words that everyone in the Dragon Alliance had to give him a few points of face. Shepherd Dust did not know. Li Shi's help instead became one of the main reasons for the failure of their operation. Xinjin had a heavier urban flavor compared to Heavy Cloud. Heavy Cloud was facing the inland direction of the Beast Tide. Xinjin's focus was biased towards commercial trade and was transportation to multiple national cities such as Daban, Gao Yu, and Mozu. Port construction ahead. Please detour. Detour. The construction site's machinima shouted with fluorescent boards. 50 meters of giant armed crane girls. Serious forklift girls chatting gossip as they worked. The sea breeze blew. Makoto and Shinaya drove by. Shinaya's mechanical form was too big. And this road was so narrow that they could only rent a mechanical car. Artificial cars are really bad to drive. Sometimes, I really think it's good to be smaller. Shinaya said as she smoked a cigarette. I think big is good. I like big. Mudu emphasized. Shinaya pulled the taut seatbelt. Really? Like big ones? Heavy industrial arms display. No wonder the seatbelt has not been upgraded in a thousand years of styling. Wonderful. Seeing Mu Duan's eyes. It can still be seen for a while. We're about to arrive at our destination. Ahem. We are appreciating advanced technological weapons, and with our own weapons, what can't we look at? Driving for an hour, they arrived at this giant hemispherical center. 
which externally looked more like a shopping plaza, but this is the place where all guilds above the ninth floor will join. The Global Non-National Power Number 1 Behemoth, Dragon Alliance. Chapter 042, Kicking the Door Open to Smash the Scene. The Dragon Alliance was like a chamber of commerce in general charge. The guilds that joined were a store. Large guilds like rangers and judges with large numbers and wide power could stand alone, but most guilds might only have about 10 people, and the drivers and machine maidens set up their own teams. Joining the Dragon Alliance allows for safe trading here, cheap weapons and armor, and the ability to find each other if you have questions, being able to discuss each other's pointers, share to the latest information to learn and so on. For guilds without power, it is indeed a good place. The Dragon Alliance would call for a joint guild force so that large and small guilds wouldn't look like scattered sand in the face of a large beast tide. With each passing day, the Dragon Alliance now had over 500 registered guilds, numbering over 30,000 people. Those who formed guilds more or less possessed some battle power. Entering the huge building, it was very lively inside, high and low, one crystal disc after another. The registered guild territory area, hordes of machinima and pilots, riding on various lifts, horizontal and vertical high-level passages. Light vein passages crisscrossing, three pontoons suspended in the air, upside down image screens announced the broadcast, you have entered the area of the Dragon Alliance, the rules and regulations of this place are all set by the Dragon Alliance, and are not affected by the regulations of any other place, and all acts of sabotage and violation of the rules and regulations will be dealt with by all the guilds of the Dragon Alliance, most of the guilds that descend to the leveled floors have business, trading weapons, special items, intelligence, or recruiting the best and brightest. Dragon Alliance areas can be visited by non-affiliates as long as they are not inside the core. The external area is considered half a market. The central area was to enter the underground. Shinaya came to the lift and lost the command code. Obtaining permission. Lift down. Underground metropolis. Here is the real Dragon Alliance's area. All kinds of flying G and G car. In this has nearly a thousand meters deep underground city intertwined. So many battleheim. Long green ribbons. Green crystal armor. Modified biplane turbojets, S-Class Longwind Battleheim. The crimson armor was particularly handsome, with a stature of more than 10 meters. The mighty S-Class Flame Battleheim, cutting each other, the common type of armored wargirl. The sea surface tumbled up. S-Class Blue Sea War G is with three SC armored war G cut, toward the far living area, drinking and chatting, people coming and going, and the mecha girls letting out a song. Like this place? Shinaya led the way. Generally, it feels free. But the price of freedom can be complicated and confusing. There were quite a few men whistling at Shania as they passed by. Such a proper chick. Which guild? The body is also too hot. Shania was wearing was not showing at all. Her body curves were too good. Same idea as me. There weren't so many people when I came two years ago. Now it's even more mixed. There were wild machinima that were very revealing and flashed their lights at Makoto. Look at the machinima over there flashing their lights at you. Go over there. Maybe there's an orgy tonight. Shania took the initiative and said, Is that so? But I have a tigress at home that will definitely grab my legs and play 3600 degree windmill. Shania took a drag on her cigarette. Ooh, dare to call me a tigress. Itchy skin? I just want to say that you are my family. Mukin laughed badly. You guy. Shania gave him a pestle. Anyone else would have been directly knocked out. Riding the light body pipeline. One was able to move quickly through 20 areas of the underground city in human form. Shania told Mu Chen that the Dragon Alliance had two leaders, both were SS-class pilots, and the name of the young alliance leader, Fang Tianshua, was one that Mu Chuan had also seen on the news, Red Dragon Top 10 Outstanding Youth, to be able to convince so many people, it's not just as simple as having three-legged kung fu, the passage came out to the destination, White Maple, the main entrance was clearly scannable for entry, Shania knew the communication password of the other guild, the relationship should be quite good, going up was a kick, Shania kicked open the other guild's gate. White. Someone's here to kick the door. It was her who said that. Makoto retracted his earlier thoughts and remembered that Shania had said it was the opponent. With a cigarette in her mouth, she walked in with big strides. This was here to smash the venue. Each guild had grounds the size of a soccer field. Just as Makoto entered, she heard clicking sounds, semi-mechanized gun barrels, and the red dot of a pulse gun aiming at the two. What kind of person? Crazy? Dare to make trouble in our place. Halfway through his words, he saw Shania take off her sunglasses. Shania? It's Shania. I heard it from the voice. This pugnacious one. It's only her. The four people at the doorway lowered their weapons. One armed, red ponytail, early thirties, wild brown leather jacket revealing bronzed skin. Seventh generation A-rank territorial heavy artillery machine girl. Ma Yelly. Cigar smoking. 
bearded man who lowered his burst shotgun, middle-aged man from the northern bear country, B-ranked driver, Jerov, next to the machine girl who had just changed back from the crane, middle-aged woman with brown wavy hair, sixth generation B-rank multifaceted crane, Gong Hongying, wearing a suit and picking up a red wine glass glasses man, a class A driver, Chai Shan, I just heard someone breaking in, who's here, Shania is here, the sky on the helicopter G fell down, blowing bubbles, hair color dazzling fashionable 7th generation S class white eagle helicopter G, degree Ting Mei, from the room came out, wearing back pants and glasses, the quiet teenage girl helicopter girl, the 7th generation B class wind speed runner, Xiao Chui, someone dared to kick in the door, my first thought was Shania, your pugnacious character, I say Shania, you can't marry even if you're pretty, the driver can be pinched to death, the light prism tank changed back to its human form, short haired, wearing an eye patch, fitness muscle 30 year old machine woman, the 6th generation of the S class light prism tank, you silk, you kin, what are you talking about, people Shania brought a little handsome boy, Last time I heard from Sister Shurjan, Sister Shania has a young handsome man by her side. Yu Jian looked over. There was really a young handsome handsome man standing behind Shania. Yo, Shania, has adopted a young handsome man. As soon as Yu Jian's words fell, Shania's fist had already arrived in front of her. What? All knew about Shania's body. How could it be so fast? Yu Silk is not idle. Both fists to meet. The body of the tank machine lady was first class strong. Shania 10 consecutive attacks. So what if the other party blocked? An iron mountain leaned against the clash. Yu Kin was knocked out and smashed the wooden table next to her. Yu Kin, you've taken a step back. What ah, didn't I say that I wouldn't let you have one hand because of your G body damage? Yu Kin rolled up in defiance. Then again? Shania's stance was drawn out. And that ruthlessness came up as if it carried a domineering aura. Why do I feel that Shania is faster than before? Do Ting Mei blew her gum? Chai Xian walked over to Mu Chen. What's the name of the little brother? Mu Chen. He was dressed like a social elite, suit and tie, red wine glass in his left hand, and just at the moment when it looked like he was about to touch Mu Dust's body in a very friendly manner, the speed of the blistering wind, like a hungry wolf, the sound of Chai Xiang's entire body flying up and then smashing on the ground was indeed in front of Mu Dust, a hungry wolf, the starving kind, the movement was slow, he was pressed to the ground by Mu Dust with one hand, Mai Yeli and Du Ting Mei they blinked their eyes, Chai Xiang looked like a suit and elegant, in fact, he was a fighting expert. How is it that in an instant? He was. Sorry. Reflex. Luckily I didn't exert much force. The ground is cracked. And you still didn't exert any force? Mu Chuan knew that the opposite side was slightly testing. It was true that he didn't use much force. Chai Xiang rolled over and jumped up. Why did it feel like he was being pressed by a crane in that instant just now? Chai Xiang. Mac Dust using more force can pull your arm down. All of you. Where is Xiao Bai? The sound of the wind breaking on the third floor. The three rotating knives rotated and came towards Shania. Shania, if you call me Sal Bai again, I will will cut your G body into pieces. Chapter 043 Shania vs Bai Yin The three revolving knives cut towards Shania at extreme speed. Shania leaned back in place, and the fastest knife wheel was almost sticking far away from her plumpness, turning sideways to dodge the second hilt, then leaping in the air to dodge the third wheel hilt. Swish swish swish, spinning back, then dodged by Shania all over again. A shadowy figure leaps out from the third floor and catches the spinning hilt that goes back. It landed in a dashing manner. Short silver gray hair. Alabaster ice cold pretty face. Delicate and beautiful features. Wearing a silver trimmed white close fitting shirt on top. A silver white fluffy cloak on the outside. And soft metal arm guards on the small arms. Under the white belt was a close fitting soft leather skirt. The left leg had a soft armor leg protector. The right leg just tied a leg ring. Revealing alabaster slender legs. And the feet wore black low laced boots. The whole person exuded a faint silver colored aura. She was the rival SS ranked machine woman that Shania had spoken of? Xiao Bai turned out to be in awe. Shania, how many times have I said that I'm a year older than you? Shania held a cigarette in her mouth and crossed her arms in front of her chest. Older? How do I feel like you're a circle smaller? You. Arms suppression. Bai Yan's arms are actually quite excellent. Nay Shania belongs to the weight class. Instantly striking. Bai Yan's speed was extremely fast. Rushing up to row cloud palm against Shania's iron fist. The two men's fists and palms interlaced. White maple guild other seven people cannot be inserted. The speed of the fight faster and faster. A variety of moves. Collision sound is continuous. Xiao Chui watched with blurred eyes. Only Shania can fight with the chairman like this. Little brother Mu Dust. Is Shania's body alright? Everyone present except Xiao Chui was older than Mu Dust. It's fine. 
Chairman Bai even let go of the water at the beginning, and none of their clashes hit a fatal position. It was indeed wonderful, and Mu Chen couldn't take his eyes off it. In the first 30 moves, Bai Yan only brought out six layers of strength, and it was only after the test that she brought out her true strength. Mu Chen you can see clearly? What Ma Yeli and the others saw were all residual shadows. The two fought soundly. Shen Aya with a petulant scolding movement domineering, Bai Yan was different. She was good at all sorts of kung fu techniques. Shen Aya's stone cold iron fist was skillfully diffused and directly unloaded by her. Backhand shot palm and inch power is very powerful. Bai Yan's expression did not change, but fighting with Shen Aya was very enjoyable. Not many people could make her use her full strength. Shen Aya. Mac Chuan's voice of reminder was a step too late as Bai Yan's inch power struck Shen Aya's abdomen. Suddenly Swimming Dragon turned around to support the foot shift, impact, and for 2,000 pounds. Shen Aya was lowered to the ground. Awesome. Shen Aya hasn't won over the chairman once. Duo Ting Mei whispered. However, the only person of the same age who can force the chairman to use his full strength and still fight for so long is Shania. Hmph. Convinced or not? Bye. I let you just. Not only is your whole body hard, your mouth is even harder. Letting go of his hand. He was just about to get the tea next to him. Shania suddenly attacked. Pulling by Yan's legs and directly letting her hit the ground with her chest on the ground. You still come to the Yin. Shania pressed her hands together. Now it's my turn to ask you. Serve or not? You guy tricked. Shen Aya's grappling was very strong. Bai Yan normal could not break free. The two of them were pulling at the ground like unconvinced little girls, saying that they were rivals. Instead, they were the heart-to-heart -heart kind. White, you cheated. Hoomph, you started it. The two stopped cutting, and Baek Yan patted the dust on her cloak. Why did you think of coming to us? Our news but you have a big health problem. Baek Yan didn't figure it out either. Let's not talk about my health problems. Baek, I came to ask for your help. Hoomph. I knew it wasn't good. Who is this person? Looking toward Makchen. Makchen, my driver. There were guesses, but I didn't expect Shen Aya to admit it so directly. All of them once again focused on Mu Dust. So it's true. What class driver? S class? Yu Silk was curious. I think it's grade A. Looks that up. Do Ting Mei blue on her gum? As far as Shen Aya's vision was concerned, it was at least a rank or above. Everyone guessed S rank. Nukin is an E rank band. So it's grade E. Ah. Grade E? Du Tingmei stared wide-eyed. I heard it wrong, right? E-class. What? E-class driver. Shen Aya, you don't have your head in the water. Do you? No way? The crowd was surprised. And although it was a bit impolite, this was how it was in this era. Shepherd Dust wasn't embarrassed at all. The testing instrument was indeed giving an E-grade assessment. Bai Yan looked at Shen Aya. You shouldn't find an obedient one and let it help take care of Aunt Ling when you're gone, right? What she saw was really accurate. Ha ha ha. Shin Aya lit a cigarette, thought about it, but this guy Mukin isn't as obedient as he imagined. Let's get down to business first. Bai Yan wasn't asking more questions. It really wasn't very polite. Then follow me. Heading to the conference room. On the way, Shin Aya introduced Mukin. Jalav and Gong Hongying were husband and wife. Extremely skilled in maintenance and weapon modification. Chai Xiang was good at business and had many suitors. After all, he was an A-class driver. Originally thought that he would like the kind of model-looking machine girl. But it turned out that after fusing and transforming with the tank machine girl you can, the relationship went further. However, A-class driver and S-class machine girl, this is a very common combination. There are fewer pilots, and more nymphs. Of course the S-ranked pilots were much more arrogant. Some even waited their whole lives without having a long-term linked pilot. Jade, not to mention her young age, is a top tech hacker. Duo Tingmei was fashion conscious. Able to take her mechanical form of an S-rank white eagle helicopter and dye it all sorts of strange colors. As for Bai Yen, she was actually a cannon girl. Bai she likes to be flexible. And as a result, she awakened herself as a cannon girl. Even if she is SS rank she doesn't like to transform. And at most she will be semi-mechanized for a bit. Bai Yen glanced at Shania. The white maple guild had few people. But everyone real was good. President Bai Yen was known as a humanoid mecha. And her human combat strength was strong. The guild had the S-rank White Eagle helicopter, the S-rank Heavy Armored Prismatic Warrior Girl of Yu Silk and Chai Xiang, and the SA Armored Warrior Girl of Gong Hong Ying's couple. Their strength and reputation had always been very good in the circle. They were often entrusted with escorting valuables. No one here can eavesdrop on anything. Then I'll get right to the point. Shen Aya took out the pictures of the Great Rift Valley of the Spectral Stream, and told what Mu Chuan had seen, as well as the guest time of the Beast Tide, I am 100% convinced of his judgment. Trusting him, an E-class driver? Daring to go to North Morin is courageous. But, the front of no problem. In fact, 
There has long been speculation that the birth of high spiritual intelligence in the foreign beasts, the Maharaja, a new term, but the speculation of the time of the beast tide, it is too bold. Bai Yan has a delicate mind. This love has a high value. Xiao Chui immediately pressed on the light body screen. The current observation of receding cold is still 341 days away. The temperature of the desert region is around minus 20. This guess is basically impossible. The foreign beasts won't come against this temperature. The others nodded. This was the popular opinion. Bai, teacher said that we should trust our own judgment. We can't completely believe in cold data. I believe in Muchin. Bai Yin wrapped her hands around her. Shin Aya, we believe you, but we don't believe him yet. That said, Maxin pressed Shin Aya's shoulder. There are some things that can't be done just by saying them. How about this? President Bai, how about we compete against each other? Shin Aya laughed. Ha ha ha. Yes, Maxin, give me little white to educate him fiercely to the sky. Bai Yin thought that this was just Shin Aya's arrogant words at the moment, and in a little while she would experience the literal meaning for herself. Chapter 044, Shepherd's Dust vs. Bai Yin. Her secret. Does Little White dare to try linking up with Mu Dust? Linkage? Bai Yen didn't know what kind of medicine Shania was selling in her gourd. E-level wave linkage doesn't affect me either. My SS level wave pattern is complex. There's no one who can fit in with anything. Shania said in Mu Dust's ear. Go up there later and give her 10 ports directly. I'm going to take pictures of Xiao by leaking motor oil and mock her for the rest of her life. The corner of Mu Chen's mouth twitched as he felt a wave of air. Bai Yen was so close to them that the others didn't hear it but Bai Yan's eyes were on fire when she heard it. The linkage was scheduled later beforehand. One of the purposes of coming here this time, Shin Aya has been saying that her opponent, intelligent and powerful, I heard that I've long wanted to curry some lessons. Shepherd Dust arched his hand in an inviting gesture. Ooh, challenging the president? Very courageous. The person that Shin Aya looks up to, at least when it comes to things, he really dares to go on. He won't be able to survive more than three rounds in the chairman's hands, right? Didn't you see just now? Ah Xiang was pressed to the ground by him in one move. Little brother has something. Shin Aya hadn't reacted at first. Mac Chen, I haven't complimented Xiao Bai like that. Pooh. Put. Xiao Chui and Du Ting Mei laughed. Bai Yan was already standing at the door. Shin Aya, your driver is at least better at chatting than you are, but I'm not going to let up. The lift came out and once again came to the open space. Bye. Don't bully people. I won't be finished with you if I get hurt. Mac Chen hasn't graduated from boxing yet for two years. Shin Aya was not confident. She was not even by Yan's opponent. Fighting class was taught by her. Before what level of Mukin is very clear. Even if recently I do not know why the speed has become a few times faster. But the technical level. Humph. I will put. Wait. Chairman by Yan don't listen to Shin Aya. What do you mean? The few people who were watching blinked their eyes. Including Shin Aya. Only to see Mu Chen take off the wrist guards of his hands. Pull off his clothes. And a ring of waist guards wrapped around his waist. It was thrown to the side. Dang dash. The ground was cracked by this gravity alloy three-piece set. Aside from Bai Yin, the expressions of the eight people froze. Makoto moved his wrist. Shinaya's health is not good. Usually, I let it go. Jalif picked up Mukin's wrist guard. Something palm-sized. This thing is 50 pounds? Gravity alloy equipment. Can adjust the weight parameter. Mu dust these three pieces add up to 200 pounds. The fist in foot stance was drawn out. The starting stance. A pull back and forth. Each movement carrying wind strength, please use your full strength. Bai Yen judged from Shin Aya's surprised expression. She also didn't know that Mu Chen was like this. Interesting, I'll try to see what level your 8 extreme fist is at. Bai Yen pulled back her stance. The original atmosphere of the crowd's pleasurable flirting now became grave. Bai Yan's expression was serious. Pfft, the sound of dutiful Ting Mei blowing a bubble. Both of them rushed towards each other at the same time. Mu Chen's speed of wind. A speed and power that surpassed 30 times that of a normal human solving many troubles with just one punch. But it was the first time for Mu Chen to compete with a true expert. Shin Aya's current body. He didn't want to use his full strength to cut yet. The eight extreme fist pursued a style that was fierce, simple, unadorned and swift in power. Powerful. Wind-breaking punch. By Yen Miao palm like flowing water. Angle skillfully unloading force. But the moment of contact, her pupils widened. This power is much stronger than she expected. What monster? Monster force. Her feet took another five steps backward. Mu Chuan's movements were swift and overbearing. An avalanche, regret, and surge were continuous. Bai Yen didn't dare to directly touch it hard, and her footsteps were subtle, while dodging. At the same time, at the last stroke of an overhead kick, Maxion blocked it with his elbow. At the moment Bai Yen landed on the ground, rubbing and sweeping consecutive moves. Anyone else, being close by this speed, 
the three board axes would definitely not be able to receive it. Bai Yan's movements were skillful and agile. The first photo fell into the wind, but the second photo began, thought of a way to deal with it. And, the consistency of Mu Chuan's moves was slightly unskilled. There was a little less experience in actual combat, or it gave the impression that the body was clearly strong, but it hadn't fully adapted to the speed of the brain's command. There were still breakages, Bagua swimming dragon palm. Bai Yan launched a fierce attack. Her movements and palms were like flowing water, fitting you, no matter what the strength was it just couldn't be beaten away. Every time she collided with Mu Chen, the ground under her feet cracked directly, all of it was unloaded onto the ground. If Shen Aya was like a bursting flame, Bai Yan was a calm lake. In terms of attributes, they were just being restrained. The old generation expert who had once taught them was probably also able to read the character, allowing Bai Yan, who was good at thinking calmly, to slightly control Shen Aya. The bucket shift counterattacked Mu Chen's power back. A palm inch strike struck Mu Chen's abdomen. He retreated five steps in a row. And in the last one, his right foot crushed the ground. Unloaded? This was Bai Yan's movement. The Bagua Dragon swimming palm, which Mu Chen also knew. Again, the same moves clashed against each other. And while the speed was extremely fast, the two of them could be seen having a pushing motion. The Bagua palm was originally a boxing art that focused on palm transformations in traveling steps and walks. It was shaped like a swimming dragon, viewed like an ape guarding, sat like a tiger crouching, and turned like an eagle coiling. Little brother Maxion also knows Bagua Palm, totally didn't expect him to be this powerful. I see Shania's expression she doesn't know either. Ha, huh? Shania was almost burned by the cigarette in her own hand, looking so seriously that she forgot that the cigarette was going to burn her hand, how could I not know? The soundness of the fight between Mu Chen and Bai Yan was even more prevalent than with Shania. It could be discovered that the more he fought, the more skillful he became, battling instead of practicing, familiarizing himself with the moves. This guy, how is it the same as only learning to come down from the mountain, practicing stakes every day? Boom! The two of them exchanged palms and each retreated. If Mu Chuan wanted to take down the other party, he probably wouldn't be able to do it in a short period of time. Bai Yan is not an enemy. Both sides cut and duel this how to complete the task? According to the mission hints, Defeating a SS class battle maiden either crushes the other party to not be able to get up again, or makes the other party personally say the words of admitting defeat. Originally, Mu Dust's plan was to overcome the martial arts, and the other party said that they had lost, and that would be the end of it. Unexpectedly, Bai Yan's 8 trigram swimming dragon palm had already reached the realm of pure fire. Stop stop stop, you guys are pushing the mill like this, it makes me anxious to watch, Shin Aya interrupted. That's what you think, Shin Aya. You're not his opponent. Xiao Bai, what do you mean? I'm an internal palm technique, transforming form and power. I have my own way of dealing with it. But you're different. You're too rigid and fierce to win and lose fast fighting style. His power is nearly 10 times that of yours. He didn't lie. Usually if you guys spar he should have put in a lot of water. Shen Aya looked at Mu Chen. Her eyes were saying, when did you become so powerful? Mu Chen's eyes replied, recently, recently got stronger. The two of them looked at each other. The people of White Maple Guild understood that it wasn't a rumor at all, and that Shania's relationship with this Mu Dust was real. This kind of tacit understanding, a single movement of the limbs knew what the other party was going to express. Shepherd Dust gave Shania a look. Shania crossed her arms, not to share a victory or defeat can't. Light you guys push grinding too waste of time. Shall buy. Linkage try? Linkage? I don't link up with men. Bai Yan was considered to have a much higher impression of Mu Chen. The level of fist and palm techniques were all very high and he had that strange power and speed. It's just that an E-level driver is also too bad. In fact, Mu Chen didn't dare to use his full strength completely. He himself didn't know how destructive full strength would be. Shania wrapped her arm around Bai Yan's shoulders. Let's do it this way. If you guys try if the linkage isn't 5%, I'll promise you any one thing. But if it's more than that, you have to do us a favor. You also know that in the linked state, you can see some images in the other person's brain so that you'll completely believe that the images of the foreign beasts that Makoto saw, a fit of 5%? Shin Aya, are you kidding? Even if he's an S-class harnesser, the first time he linked up with me, it wouldn't be more than 1%. Bye, I'm just asking if you dare to bet? Joke, so confident in the man you're looking at? I just want to see you about to cry later. Ha, huh? Bai Yen didn't get it. Makoto added, Bai Yen, you don't like turning into a mechanical form too much, right? Yes, I don't like cannon forms too much. And every time I change, the light energy aggregation will absorb a lot of my physical strength, making it uncomfortable. When we link up later, I'll tell you one, a secret you didn't realize. Shin Aya and Bai Yan both looked towards Makoto. Bai Yan's secret? 
Chapter 045, Bai Yen being charged up to the sky collapsed on the spot. If it was anyone else Bai Yen would definitely not believe it. A secret on her? She herself didn't even know. But Mu Chen was someone Shen Aya trusted. And besides being an E-class driver, his current talk and image as well as his boxing attainments gave Bai Yen a very good impression. His appearance also didn't seem like he was joking. Even Bai Yen was curious. Shen Aya wrapped her arms around Bai Yen. Let's go. Go indoors. You few can't participate. Xiao Chui and Du Tingmei they blinked their eyes. They couldn't participate. Why? Shen Aya wants you to make some bad moves? I'm saving face for Xiao Bai. You guys wait. She'll obediently do us a favor in a while. Humph. It's just linkage. Talking so confidently. Bai Yan had never experimented with linkage with anyone before. And was dragged away by Shen Aya to the guild basement. The others were curious. Thinking that it was Shen Aya wouldn't have anything to do with it. Whatever they tossed around. First busy themselves with the matter in hand. Warehouse basement. Baek Yun is being dragged under the raw and then try to link up. Can make her just give up thinking to help? What a joke. However, she was also curious as to what the secret was that Makoto was talking about. Bai Yen lightly leapt up and rotated and transformed to land. The silver white glowing machinery fell. A 150 T word beam main cannon. With two secondary cannons on the left and right. The 8th generation SS grade polygonal energy sublight god cannons. The power was super large. Xiao Bai. Your mechanical form is so beautiful. When the time comes to set up on the roof of my car, this is not and can move, but also can fire the cannon. One cannon a royal level alien beast. Indeed with Shin Aya's body can be completely driven. Don't even think about it. I don't like to lie on my back like this. Also, not to mention your G body, even if it's normal who can top the power consumption of the two of us, you three engine heavy power consumption. I double the amount of energy gathering energy sub. Power consumption is four times. S-class driver without a grade A or above energy consumption talent. Completely ineffective. You can quickly go and educate little white fiercely. Shin Aya couldn't wait to see Bai Yan make a fool of herself. The two had just diced. And Mu Chen had seen Bai Yan's data. Machine Maiden, Bai Yan. Level, 15, it seems like it really rarely transforms. Ripple, initially unchanged. SSS level. Mechanical form 1, 8th generation SSS grade polygonal energy sublight god cannon. Mechanical Form 2, 9th Generation A-Class Phantom Sports Car. Talent 1, Semi-Mechanical Form. Special, Dual Changing Machine Girl, Heavenly Zhao Ji Body. The driver's seat of the Polygonal Energy Sublight God Cannon was on the side. And Mu Chen sat on it. There's no one else here. Some very secret things are only convenient to say. My secret. Shen Aya absolutely trusts you before I tell. You say. The more this happened, the more Baek Yun became a little curious. First of all. I can know Jean Yang's G body condition, talent potential, and characteristics when I come into contact with her. This point is not something that can be given by modern instruments. This was something that Mu Chen had also told Shen Aya. Shen Aya's potential talent is SS grade. Bai Yen you are SSS grade. Little Bai is higher than me? Shen Aya was not happy. I'm already a SS ranked machine girl. Isn't that normal? Che, I will surpass you. Ignorant. Potential can still be raised? It can with me. Makoto replied with a smile. Little white. You don't know. Do you? Mac Dust fixed my G-body. Now my G-body's damage is only 15%. The news you must have watched. The one who cleaned up the bounty hunter team on the Heavy Cloud Z5714 road yesterday was actually our transformed battle maiden. What? Fixed? This was undoubtedly miraculous news. Don't spread it out right now. And with Makoto's help. I'm now an Earth Guardian Wargirl. Entering the SS level. She scratched out her G-body panel. This man called Mu Chen could actually have such heaven-defying abilities? I'll continue. Just now during the sparring session I discovered a secret of yours, Bai Yen, that you don't like to transform, so you don't know it yet. What secret of mine? You are a double transformation machine lady. A double transformation machine lady? What? What? Xiao Bai is a double change machine lady? Shen Aya was unable to beat in fighting. Her talent was not comparable. The beautiful teacher was already very unconvinced. And now she also found out that Bai Yan was a double change machine nymph. She almost jumped over to dismantle the cannon barrel. All she suddenly had left was her figure to suppress. Double transformation mechanical nymphs were extremely rare. But it wasn't like they hadn't been seen before. I have another mechanical form. What is it? The ninth generation of the class of phantom spirit sports car. One could feel Bai Yan's fluctuations. She preferred this mechanical form. Ninth generation? A class? Shania was about to pout. Just in time. I have experience in driving a double variant machine girl, with a high linkage value. I should be able to help you if you don't awaken the form yourself. Hoomph. High linkage value? How can? Linkage fit of 25. 
How is that possible? Bai Yan's surprised voice. Bai, got it, ha. Huh? Shania was now more pleased with herself than if she had one. Linkage fit 28. It was still rising. This, isn't possible at all. Why did your strange jumping waves suddenly start to overlap with my ripples? This was a completely counterintuitive harnesser ability. E level? Bai Yan understood that it was a special wave band that existing technology simply couldn't test. I see. Shania's battle with the Land Emperor Turtle wasn't a separate transformation. It was you linking up with her. Yes, our highest fit can reach 65. 65, this value was too high. What about your current ripples? Has it changed much? Initial form? No change. Right. The news they got from Shania was a separate transformation, as the ripples were still in their initial form. So that meant that Mu Chan's was a SSS class harnesser, or even higher beyond that rating. Universal linkage. A harnesser that doesn't affect the other party's ripples and adapts to any ripples. Never heard of it before in a thousand years. Well, little white, my harness is not bad, right? Hoomph, it doesn't appeal to me. Your, Shania grabbed the words, Makchen, charge my little white. Her cannon happens to be short of energy. It needs ten ports. You are charging to death. Mu Chuan looked at Shania. She was now very unconvinced and unhappy. The wild imperial sister was still a defiant little girl in front of her best friend. Charge, the talent one you awakened is charge energy? Bai Yen, get ready. Ready? I'm a SS class machine girl. Not a. Ah. Uh, woo. Wait. Baek Yun clenched her teeth, feeling like the G body was going to explode. What kind of energy is this? Quantum light god cannon main cannon left and right is the energy value. Originally only one tenth of the energy. Two seconds. Directly all full. The power consumption is huge SS grade poly energy quantum light god cannon. Under the five ports of the galaxy star charging energy. Energy burst full. That feeling. It was as if she had pierced through heaven. As if she had gone to hell again. Bye. How is it? Our family's special energy supply. Shinaya patted down by Yan's gun barrel. What is this? How many output ports are you connected to? Makoto? Five. Only five? No. It's not leaking oil yet. Connect eight. Can still add? Bai Yen was going to faint. This Shania just wanted to see her make a fool of herself. But the energy was so abundant that it exploded. And with five endgames Bai Yen was already going to be unable to speak. Stop dash. Hoomph. Bye. If you say you admit defeat. I'll let Mukin stop charging the energy. Otherwise, it'll even double. Chapter 046, Bai Yan's new form dual linked talents. Little White knows how powerful it is. Right? Shania was a personal experience and she couldn't stand the five output ports either. Bai Yan's G body likewise couldn't stand it either, and couldn't hold on for long before admitting defeat. Mu Chuan had originally planned for it to be a fist and feet victory, but he didn't know that Bai Yan was a genius expert at the grandmaster level. Shania had probably intended for Mu Chen to use this move from the start. Shania couldn't resist, and Li Shi's two ports shouted that she couldn't take it. Bai is going to admit defeat and surrender, or else there's ten more ports to output. Ten ports? Shania was selfish. Galaxy Star's energy in addition to charging explosion like sufficient amount. Even more so is the quality. The machine lady eating, drinking and resting to replenish the energy compared to it there is a big gap. Let it use it will want to. Shania had to admit that Bai Yen ability and strength are stronger than her. SS level machine lady knows the roots and absolutely cannot let go. The G body flowed and emitted a silver white light. The fit was still elevated. They could fuse and transform at any time. I. Admit defeat. Admit defeat. Bai Yen had never admitted defeat before. Maxion's mission was completed and broke the recharge. Mukin, how did it break? Ask Bai to admit defeat a few more times. You don't know that in the past. I've fought her a hundred times and never won once. Alright Shania, my purpose has also been achieved. This continuous charging is not bad but not good either. Continuous charging would replace the poorer energy power. I'm sorry Bai Yen. If you listen to, Shania, sooner or later, you're going to roll over. Bai Yen recovered slightly. At this moment, her entire body was permeable and comfortable. Pure cosmic energy. Several times more refreshing than G-Body's natural energy. As if the body did not have any burden. Standing on the top of the mountain to enjoy the gentle wind blowing. Shinaya was leaning next to her G-Body. She knew that at the moment. Bai Yan's body was feeling the comfort of that cosmic energy. How does SSS rank talent feel? SSS grade? I remember that Makoto was a student of the Heavy Cloud Academy. Why hasn't it been publicized? There hadn't been an SSS class talent harnesser in how many years? Even if it was an E-ranked driver, this talent was enough to make even an S-ranked machinist move, because this is Makoto's hidden talent. My normal talent one is an A-rank super power drive. Again, it was a very good talent. Her SS level dual variant machine girl was probably the white moon compared to a planet in front of Muchen. 
Bai Yen, I'll assist you in converting your mechanical form, so you can transform yourself next time. Bai Yen paused for 5 seconds before faintly returning. Turn, because the degree of fit had reached 38. Her physical condition was mostly understood by Mu Chen, knowing Shen Ai is bad intentions. Switch, illusory spirit sports car. The core of the G body was the center, instantly transforming into a particle switch. Clicking sound, it appeared, a cool sports car that looked like a Lamborghini review from a thousand years ago. However, the Phantom Spirit sports car was white in color, leaving silver lines and extra flying wings on the tail. It was rumored that the ninth generation's A-Class Phantom Spirit sports car could run the speed of some fighter jets, and could also instantly disappear on scanning radar, with two turbojets at the lower end of the tail. Not only could it explode with terrifying speed, it could also change modes to travel through the sea. Not bad, little white is beautiful. The engine was started, and Baekhyun circled around the underground lab and ran briefly. Flexibility, high speed, and smoothness were the mechanical forms she preferred. The inner room Makoto was also surprised. Is this the ninth generation's G-Body? Buttons are faster than the airplane. A variety of functional options. Mu Dust single-handedly to maintain the linkage at the same time also experimented with the effect. Bai Yen G is now very soft. Biker girl form wrapping feeling is also very comfortable. Initially harnessed, the locomotive lady aversion or discomfort will let the two have a dry touch. The body will be uncomfortable. Linkage maintained at less than 1% will be like flames in a slow roast, leading to further repulsion. Mutual linkage higher acclimatized will go away and instead gradually become comfortable. The special energy provided by the driver is as comfortable as a March breeze, and the feedback from the machine lady is as soft as gentle water. When it reached this, it was basically 25% fit. Right now, Mu Chen and Bai Yan's fit degree. 40, Xiao Bai turns into a battle maiden to try. Will you be SSS level? Shen Aya opened the car door into the passenger side. What are you drilling up for? I see someone changed into a new form excited. I also come up to see, walk out to open here is too small. Poof, straight out of the basement. The unfamiliar sound of an engine came out of the basement, causing all of the people in the white maple guild to look over. Where did the Phantom Spirit sports car come from? The rear wing? It's a ninth generation. Ninth generation class A? When did it drill into our union? Above them sat Mukin and Shania. So everyone didn't defend anything. The gate opened and went out for a drag race. A jet accelerated. Instantly accelerating over 450 and running straight up to 600. The sound that broke the sound made many people from the Dragon Alliance look over. Ninth generation Mirage Spirit sports car? So fast. Just like the rumors. Disappeared? Disappeared? Over there? It's the illusory spirit acceleration. By Yan speed rushed to 650 direct. Rushing towards the underground sea. Makoto opened four buttons. Boost open. Closed system open. Slow turbine propulsion activated. Unfolding sea shark mode. The underwater speed was much worse, but it was comparable to a submarine. Bai Yen, I'll add the talent and see if I can accelerate underwater. Boom. Superpower drive joined. A red stream of light appeared on the vehicle's body, doubling its agility and speed. It has an effect underwater too? Shin Aya also felt it. Underwater is three times the power consumption of land. Xiaobai don't worry about rushing. Makoto has plenty of energy here. SSS level talent. Capricious and terrifying. Thinking about it Bai Yen had trouble speaking. It wasn't that Mukin interrupted quickly. The image of her collapsing was seen by Shania. As far as Shania's personality was concerned, she would be laughed at for the rest of her life. Mu Chen could feel that Bai Yen loved the sea. Probably what she wanted to awaken the most was the boat G. But now she was also able to move freely under the sea. As for energy, a driver that is an energy class is the best. Little White, you should have sensed by now that Makoto has incredible power. My intuition is still changing 30 days away from the beast tide. Yesterday, you told me that there were still 34 days? It's advanced. I felt it today. Baek Yan didn't say anything, but she did believe it. Miraculous wave. SSS level talent. Shin Aya believed it even more when she had fused with him, because she was able to judge whether the other party's words came from the heart or not. She was even able to see the picture of Mukin and Li Shi in the Great Rift Valley of the Phantom Stream. This could be several times more shocking than the photos. As she watched her take a dip in the underground seawater, Mu Chen first claimed her reward. Ding, completing mission 5, defeating an unlinked SS ranked machine girl, rewarded SS ranked talent, double linkage. Can linkage fuse transform two machine nymphs at the same time? Alright, I believe Makoto's words, I'll help you guys think of a way. He was preparing to return. Wait by Yen, I want to do an experiment. Chapter 047, you form the body, I'll form the head. Do an experiment? Bai Yen and Shin Aya both sounded puzzled. Just now, I gained a talent. 
Acquired, Shen Ai cocked her head. A talent? Bai Yan's voice. Talents take 15 levels apiece. How can you suddenly acquire them like a meal? Shen Aya was about to spit. It would be heaven defying for Mukin to have an A rank and an SS rank. How many levels are you? After linking up with you just now. I'm level 13 now. Didn't reach 15 ah. How did you awaken the third talent? Actually, in addition to the galactic star and super power drive, not counting the one I obtained just now, I also have the B rank talent insight, as well as the S rank talent flare X, and there's also a special. Shepherd Dust didn't say anymore, and Shania's beautiful eyes went wide. Bai Yen were quiet. Off the big spectrum, you're only level 13. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Go up the mountain and fight. No. 5 talents? Never heard of such a brazen. Not. Such a marvelous harness. The B level insight actually has no small role. What is the S level flare X? Bai Yen asked. Shall Bai you also analyze up? This is outrageous okay? Which level 13 awakens so many talents? Ha ha ha. Shania laughed brightly at the end of her sentence. It was too unbelievable. But Mu Chen was trusting them enough to say it. Not joking. Flare X is a special talent. The G body form can release a thousand meters of explosive flames. And my insight is also a special talent. It's several times more effective than my driver's insight. Shania recalled something. When you fused with the Radiant Battleheim, waving your hand and appearing that piece of flame was this talent right? Radiant War Girl? You're saying that the last time two battle ages clashed in the seventh region was Makoto and another machine lady? Yes. She's also a double change machine lady. I see. It was Li Shi, right? Shania guessed, coldly humming how she was a bit jealous. What talent did you acquire this time? Want me to cooperate with the experiment? Bai Yan asked. SS rank double linkage. Able to provide fusion transformations for two machine girls at the same time. SS rank? Dual linkage? A rare talent I haven't heard of in how many years? I basically have no impression. Shania carefully was thinking back. It's rumored to have appeared. Many of the high-level pilots had a few machine maiden confidants, and Luo Tong that Bean had two machine maidens that could transform, but it was extremely rare to hear of a double linkage. The corner of Shania's mouth smiled. Try it. Xiao Bai popped me out. Nonchalant, directly ejected Shania from the co-pilot. Shania held her breath and transformed, and the earth attack battle wagon was not able to move through the seawater. It landed on the bottom of the sea. Makoto maintained the linkage with Bai Yen. What's it going to be? I haven't tried either. I can't sense Shania in the current situation. Bai Yan's turbine advanced and approached Shania's mechanical form, and the two almost touched. Sensing it, Shania sensed it as well. The light body entering her heim body. Dual linkage on. Shania. Fit 42 inch. Fusion. Shania. Accepted. Under the sea, Shania transformed into an Earth Guardian Battleheim. In the fusion state, she felt Makoto enter her consciousness. The fit remained stable. It's actually really possible? Shepard's dust disappeared within by Yan's vehicle body, but her linkage device was still maintained, emitting a golden light. It's still possible? Directly skipping the mechanical form? Shania in her battle maiden form would be able to move underwater, but not being a sea maiden was very bad at such an environment. It's Kahaku's turn. I have to try too. Of course, it's all linked to this fit. It's all the same to see what form the Warheim is in. Shania, why do I feel like you're punking me again? Maxion quick, experiment to see if you can double transform. Maxion was also curious. Fusion, Bai Yen. There was a pause of two seconds. Accept, as if piercing through the blistering wind, Bai Yen saw Mukin's soul flying in to take her hand. Illusory spirit roadster transformation. The five meter body of the mecha nymph appeared. Flashing translucent armor. Three off center wings flashing behind her back. The overall silver white got mecha body and the protective scale crystals flashing, transformation success, and felt the body of the pastor dust came to her side, S-class illusory spirit war girl, this is the war G form, strength, speed, G energy perfectly unfolded, the battleheim form was the perfect embodiment of a machine lady, turning her head, Shania also maintained her war girl form, it seems to be whoever transforms afterward, the core soul is in whoever is inside, Shania crossed her arms in front of her chest, the golden light could be felt within her body, not Makoto's complete soul, but I can move freely, try the distance, the two of you pull back some distance, I'll try, Bai Yen was completely aware at this moment that she had been pitted by Shania, transforming into a war girl and linking up were two completely different concepts, glaring at Shania, if linkage was men and women dancing together, driving and piloting machinery together, one responsible for mounting the cannon and one responsible for firing, then Fusion was going to a room and having a private chat, Shania just snickered in amusement. Undersea shuttle. Baekhyun was still cooperating with the test, 
while also using her own wargirl form. At a distance of more than a thousand meters, I can't freely transform, but the consciousness is still there, and at two thousand meters I can't hear the sound can maintain the transformation. Maintaining two wargirls at the same time requires. Bai Yan just wanted to say the huge energy consumption, but ended up stopping. You can that charging not to mention two wargirls, five carrier wargirls can be maintained at the same time, cancelling the fusion. Bai Yan once again turned back into the illusory spirit sports car. Bai let's experiment again. The two of us merge to see if we can transform? Don't be imaginative. You've watched too many mecha fantasy movies and TVs, right? Still you form the body and I'll form the head? White Maple Guild. The illusory spirit sports car returned. My Yelly and the others watched as Mu Chen and Shania got out of the car. Then, transformed and came back. And Bai Yen deftly landed in a backflip. Her white snowy fluffy cloak pulled back. President? The illusory spirit sports car is the president? How is this possible? What are you guys talking about? That sports car is the president? Beck Yun nodded. It's me. That's my second mechanical form. Second form? A double transforming machine girl? Chairman is just awesome. Bai Yen had to admit. It was Maxion who helped me know. You silk. Chai Xiang. Do Ting Mei get ready? Let's go to the Dragon Alliance hub. Xiao Chui confirm if Elder Jian is there. President? You believe it? Not knowing what had happened. Even if it was to help Bai Yan understand that the double transformation machine lady helped, Bai Yan's character should not be easily believed. Bai Yan nodded her head. She chose to believe in Mu Chen. President, Elder Jian is at the Dragon Alliance hub. Then let's go talk to his old man. If we can persuade his old man, arranging more than a hundred guilds is not a problem. Even if the beast tide occurred in advance, there were more than a hundred guilds that would be at least a hundred wargirls. There were also a large number of driver and machine girl elites. Du Tingmei jumped up and transformed into a white eagle helicopter girl? Let's go. Bai Yan believed that the guild would trust unconditionally. This was the trust between them. Mu Chen, Shen Aya, Bai Yan, plus Yu Silk and Chai Shang. The five of them rode up and took off for the core building of this underground city. The Dragon Alliance Core Hub. Chapter 048, Kain Eyebrow Jane Elder. Jiang Hu Breath Allies. Degree Tingmei was able to directly enter the internal tarmac location. The White Maple Guild had few people and the machine maidens in charge of security patrols all knew each other. President Bai Yen, why are you here? A bit of business. The core area was bustling with people. Most of them were some of the presidents. All of them were greeting Baek Yun as they passed by. Recognizable. Bai Yen only half of the people nodded. A lot of drivers she did not pay attention to. The Dragon Alliance is now mixed too much acceptance is not strict. Especially since Fang Tianshua took over to two years. The guild joined increased, resulting in a third of them being trash now. Ooh, isn't this Xiao Bai? Shen Aya is also there. This shouting. Flanking the few people brought by transportation light drive. Spoke in a red dress machinima. Blonde hair. Body charming and sexy woman. Xiao Yunxia. Don't call me Bai. Sister I'm quite a bit older than you. Not like this crazy girl Shen Aya. Haven't seen you for a year. Have you found a driver? Humph. No need for you to care. The three young and handsome men around Xiao Yunxia are all her drivers. Do you want my sister to help you find a SS class driver? I can still barely find, around me, really, SSS level I will consider. Xiao Yunxia laughed, a lot of SS class pilots who can't find their other half in their whole life are thinking like you. In front of the headquarters gate, both Bai Yen and Xiao Yunxia Iris scanned and said similar things. I'm Bai Yen from the White Maple Guild. I want to see Elder Jane. I'm Xiao Yunxia from the Pink Guild. I'd like to see Elder Jane. Xiao Yunxia laughed lightly. Du Tingmei, Chai Xiang, do you want to come to our Pink Nine Songs Guild? We already have more than 60 people. We have a full 8 battle maidens. We have 3 joint consortiums. Supplies, quests, and equipment upgrades are readily available. And with your talents, you'll be buried in a small guild like that. Du Tingmei blew her gum and didn't say anything? Chai Xiang's gentlemanly courtesy. Thank you MS. Show for your love. Chai Xiang will seriously consider it. Digging in the face. This woman. Bai Yen. Who is this broken car? Mu Chen asked Bai Yen. The president of the Pink Nine Songs Guild. Xiao Yunxia, a consortium successor in Xinjiang, the seventh generation of the S-ranked Thunder Arrow Train. Bai Yan was in a much better mood when she heard what Mu Dust said. No wonder. What? Shen Aya asked from the side. Bitchy in train again. It really fits. Put. Shen Aya covered her mouth and almost laughed out. Both sides were waiting for news. Xiao Yunxia saw Mukin. On her left stood Bai Yan. On her right was Shen Aya both whispering with him. And were eyewitnesses. Who is this little handsome boy? My driver. Sister Chiu you won't be hitting on attention too, right? Shen Aya answered very directly. Oops. So it's crazy girl Shen Aya's driver ah. Rare guest. Rare guest. 
Won't rob with you. Just curious what way Ban Shania is looking at the little handsome boy ah, class E. Ah, Cho Yunxia thought she had heard wrong. How was this possible? The male next to Cho Yunxia whispered in her ear. It's sister I paid less attention. Sorry, sorry, sister Cho just came back from the Blue Eagle Kingdom. Despite saying so, he disdainfully looked at Mu Chen. The looks were likable. Just too trashy. News came back from the gate. President Bai Yen. President Cho Yunxia. Elder Jane agrees. Please come in. The passageway gate opened. Anyone from above can enter. There's a different world inside. It's a natural ecological garden restored by technology. From afar, one could see that in the location of the gazebo high above. Sitting on a plate was an old man wearing a long white robe, with crane hair and a childlike face, rather like he had only come down from Mount Shu. Bai Yen, look at the sword. Suddenly from the left side, a man in black was killed. In his hand, the long sword pushed Bai Yen. Bai Yen hand behind a pull. Will knife appeared in the hand, lightly jumped up to block the other side of the attack, and three rotating knives were thrown out at the same time. Wind spin cutting. The man in black continuously jumped backward. The long sword in his hand was like a rainbow, and he continuously resisted, and his body was like an eagle jumping before he completely dodged it. Bai Yen took the weapon that flew back. Alliance Master Fong. I didn't come here to spar today. There are important matters. Fong Tianchua collected his sword. Suave and elegant. Jade like and made another move. Is that so? That's really a pity. Few experts can spar like this. Why don't you President Bai Yen? How about I be your driver? I'm also SS rank. I'm sorry Alliance Master Fong. I'm not even interested in drivers, regardless of SS rank or F rank. That's really too bad. Wouldn't it be a match made in heaven if we're talented and recognize each other's martial arts? Don't bother. I think Alliance Master Fong, Pink Nine Song's trainman is very suitable. Fong Tianchua, Ha, huh? Shania? Xiao Yunxia looked over in displeasure. What did you say? Crazy girl? What's train man? Train mechanic lady. The last Xia character. Train man is wonderful. Mu Chen added. The two of them came together rather like a wicked couple. Ha ha ha. This title is wonderful. Wonderful. Fang Tianshua wasn't angry at being rejected. It wasn't the first time after all. He was one of the two current allies of the Dragon Alliance. That SS ranked driver Fang Tianshua. Red Dragon top 10 young talents. Different from what Mu Chen thought in his heart. He originally thought that Fang Tianshua would be like Chai Xiang who was an organ calculating and clever character, a smiling tiger, or a deeply hidden cold and arrogant fellow. As a result, I didn't expect. There is a kind of Jiang Hu's atmosphere. Of course, cannot rely on this point to judge a person. Fang Tianshua's sword technique was something. Mak Chen, what are you thinking about? Shen Aya saw that Mukin was thinking. Nothing, I was wondering if he would have a righteous father named Dong. Xiao Yunxiao was alone on the platform, and on Mukin's side, there was him, Bai Yen, and Shania. Everyone else was waiting below. There was quite a sense of a Huashan sword debate. It was really a bit rare in this age of electronic mechanization. Elder Jian, Elder Jian, Fang Tianchua was the alliance master, but had only been in office for two years many things everyone trusted Elder Jian more. Maxian pondered at the back. This could be right with what Bai Yen said. Most of the old guilds obeyed Elder Jian. And only then did Fang Tianshua introduce a large number of new guilds to cultivate into his direct lineage. But the idea was fine. What he did was not. Opinions are listened to. People just too positive some? This was not yet known. It's Yunxia and Bai Yen. Yunxia speaks first. Elder Jane looked kind and kindly. A very talkative demeanor. Xiao Yunxia was talking about her mission in Blue Eagle. This woman was able to manage and recruit so many people. Her ability was there. And she was currently one of the core guilds in the foreign trade between the Dragon Alliance and the Blue Eagle countryside. It was also estimated that the help from the family consortium was not small. There were some things that needed Elder Jane's pat on the back. Your idea is not bad. Just ask Tianshua about this point. Asking Fong Tianshua was basically agreeing. Bai Yen took out the electronic information. Elder Jane. According to my friend's probing, you look at this intelligence information. We deeply suspect that the beast tide on the side of the heavy clouds will be substantially advanced, and even only a month out. Ha, huh? how is that possible? I've read the report on the Blue Eagle side as well. Bai Yen you're talking nonsense right? Xiao Yunxia sneered when she heard it. Elder Jane, fighting against foreign beasts, regardless of the benefits or the founding oath of the Dragon Alliance, is the main task of the Dragon Alliance? I and our union believe in my friend's judgment. If Elder Jane and the Fong Alliance leader believe, can focus on the main distribution of the region's tasks, the hundred counts of guilds to prepare in advance, and there are tasks that will not be a waste of time. Bayan's consolidated idea was that the Dragon Alliance could take a month's worth of masters to go to Heavy Cloud to collect and transport and other tasks. 
which wasn't a difficult task for the Dragon Alliance. Elder Jane was not like Chiu Yunxia, he looked at the information. Fang Tianshua also stood to the side, by Yen. This information can only prove the speculation, but arranging guilds to be stationed in tasks is not difficult. Elder Jian's eyebrows moved slightly. This information was obtained by this young man, right? Elder Jian looked towards Makchun. Elder Jane actually looked at it very quickly because it wasn't the first time he had seen this information. Yes, Elder Jane. Young man, your information is very meaningful, but the matter of dispatching a large number of people will bring about a lot of suspicion, and it's not enough for just President Bai Yen to believe in you. Mu Chen had originally thought of many arguments, but now there was a more direct one. Elder Jane, I know Lord Rock Elephant, if we say that he also believes in my judgment, wouldn't that be feasible? You know Rock Elephant? Chapter 049, Sudden Variables Appear. Shepherd's Dust Leaves. You know Rock Elephant? Elder Jin's eyebrows twitched. Fang Tianshua revealed an astonished expression. Xiu Yunxia and Bai Yan didn't know who the Rock Elephant was, but the expressions of Elder Jin and Fang Tianshua's words should be a great person. Li Shi definitely trusted it. Elder Jane. President Bai Yan and Lord Rock Elephant both trust my judgment. How about you give it more thought? Elder Jian stroked his beard in a serious thinking manner. Xiu Yunxia was very curious. Who was that lord called Rock Elephant? Fang Tianshua's expression was astonishing, and Elder Jian had to rethink. Young man since he knows Rock Elephant, old man naturally has to in more consideration. Your claims need not be said. Old man understands the intention. First go back and wait for a day. The crowd excused themselves and went out. Xiu Yunxia couldn't help but look at Mu Dust twice more. Could it be that he had underestimated this little handsome boy? First, they returned to the White Maple Guild's base. Bai Yan wasn't in a good position to ask, but Chen Aya immediately asked, Mu Chen, who is that rock elephant? Actually, I don't know. Instantly, the people of One Flying G were all question marks. How dare you say that even though you don't know? My friend told me, when I encountered difficulties in the Dragon Alliance said that the rock elephant would be of no small help. So it turns out, it was indeed difficult to persuade Elder Jane at that time. It's best if we can persuade. There's nothing we can do if we can't. There's only so much we can do. Shepherd Dust leaned on the chair. We're not doing charity either. Just do what you want to do. Mu Dust at least the basic task was completed. Obtaining a SS level double linkage. This point Shania thought the same. The people of White Maple Guild actually didn't believe that the Beast Tide would come so quickly. And the fact that the president suddenly believed in Mu Dust made them a bit puzzled. They just unconditionally trusted the president. Bai Yen. Again. Back to the guild. Nothing to do in your spare time to spar again. No time. After saying that, he went back to the third floor. Little brother Mu Chen. The president is not only high in martial arts attainments. He's also a genius in weapon research. He's very busy. Nukin turned to look at Shania. Ooh, it's only because your new favorite isn't here that you thought of me? Shania took a drag on her cigarette and smiled badly. No. Your body hasn't fully recovered yet. My heart aches. Even Shania. Her face was slightly red. Che, what are you smelly guy saying? Watch the move. Shania and Muchen sparred that was the most rigid and fierce collision. After a hundred moves, it was incomparable. The more Shania fought, the more excited she became. Bai Yen poked her head out and saw Shania's expression. You really found the right one. Change others. Can't handle you with this fiery lioness. Less than half a day. Shepherd Dust had gotten acquainted with the people of the White Maple Guild. In terms of machine repair Mac Dust was able to discuss in depth with Jalab and Gong Hongying, solving some of their current troubles and fixing the machinery that was being repaired. Heavy Cloud Defense Hub Deputy Technical Instructor? No wonder. Mac Chen you have this position at such a young age. Awesome. This is a fourth level position. Many people can't mix at this level in their entire lives. Being able to discuss all kinds of rare giant cannons with my Yeli. Even if they were ancient weapons from a thousand years ago, Mu Dust was able to speak out a lot of points. Mu Dust used to be soaked in the academy's library, and there was a lot of replenishment of knowledge reserves. Xiao Chui was only 16. This age would have been the most chatty with Mu Dust. Learned. Xiao Chui is even better than our teacher. Which is not. Which is not. Du Tingmei was playing with a skateboard, and Mu Chen's current ability was naturally handy. Let's go. Peek at Chai Xiang and Yu Silk going on a date. Shania and Bai Yan's friends met on the third floor and chatted, while Mu Chen and Du Tingmei went out shopping. He also planned to buy some gifts and such. There was still over 13 million dollars in his hands now, so it wasn't bad. As a result, after going out and turning around he understood why Du Tingmei was in a hurry to pull in to see Chai Xiang on a date. It turned out to be taken as a shield. Tingmei's sister actually took a little handsome guy shopping? Damn it, where did that kid come from? Go, go up and clean him up. Then, all of them were knocked to the ground sprawling by Mac Chen. 
they didn't even see a silhouette. See clearly? You idiots. Don't bother me anymore if you're not as powerful as my friend. Do Tingmei didn't forget to stomp two feet? And they bug you a lot? Yeah, like flies. Tell me earlier. Nukin smiled. Say what? Only to see that Mu Chen's right arm was cupped in a fist, and he pointed it at a man-made alloy jeep next to him, with a full force punch. Ka! Many people at the scene almost had their jaws smashed on the ground. That jeep almost turned into an accordion. Boss I'll buy your car. I'll give you twice the price. Please help me dispose of the scrap iron. The owner of the drink cellar and the owner's wife man froze. There was a three second pause before they reacted. Mu Dust swiped his wristwatch. Good. Handsome. Who is that little handsome guy? What kind of destructive power is this? That's a big humongous jeep. Shepherd Dust has bought something. Do Ting Mei? Go. In the freeze what? She also froze. What explosive power and destructive force did Makoto's punch have? People could be smashed into broken glass. Here it comes. Mac Dust. This punch of yours is Tai Pants hot. When Bai Yen and the girls came down in the afternoon, they found that Mu Chen was on good terms with everyone, even Du Ting Mei, who was hard to deal with inside the team. That expression, how was it the same as Mukin's sister? Did something happen in the afternoon? Let's also prepare a little bit. Elder Jian passed the dispatch, and our White Maple Guild is joining in, and if we choose, we'll go to Feng Chuan City. The others nodded their heads. Ding SSS system mission refreshed? Inwardly, Mu Chen was still thinking that there were now six optional quests and they had only been refreshed once a few days ago. It was only today that one was completed and immediately refreshed again? Clicking to take a look, Mu Dust's face immediately looked wrong. Mission 5, please return safely to Heavy Cloud with your fellow travelers. Level A, what is this situation? Calmly thinking, he was the host, and the mission system would give missions based on his situation and the world environment, with everything changing as a reference. Returning safely to the Heavy Cloud could be detected from the literal meaning, there was danger. Shun Aya, Bai Yen. Everyone was still happily eating when Mu Chen suddenly had a serious expression. What's wrong? Shun Aya saw that Nukin's expression was not right. Shun Aya let's go. Go back to Heavy Cloud. Immediately, Chai Xiang and Xiao Chui blinked their eyes. Why are you suddenly leaving? Do Ting Mei ate her popsicle? Isn't it true that Elder Jian won't give an answer until tomorrow? Shun Aya collected her things and left immediately. And Bai Yen. If anyone asks just say we went to Xinjin to go shopping. You're not familiar with me at all. You're just familiar with Shinaya. What's going on? Bai Yen felt that Mukin was not joking. Shinaya, go. I'll see you guys off. Bai Yen was just about to transform when she was stopped by Mukin. Don't care first. Don't get involved. I hope my judgment is wrong. Shinaya, let's drive away. Coming. Shinaya had already driven a car up from inside the garage, not knowing why he suddenly shouted to leave. But she was absolutely trusting Makoto. Everyone in the White Maple Guild didn't think to understand why Mu Dust was in a hurry to go back during this dinner time. It was like something had happened, but it wasn't good to ask. Less than an hour after leaving, there was a knock on the door outside the guild. Is Little White here? Don't come and open the door for your sister Chiu. Bai Yen opened the door. Chiu Yunxiao was behind her with four drivers, and could see more than a dozen core members of the Pink Nine Songs Guild behind her. What's the point of coming to my place? Aya, uh, nothing. Where's that little brother called Mu Chen? The good sister invited him to be her guest. What's the point of bringing so many people? Little White, tell me where is the person? Gone, said he went to stroll around Xinjin. Someone from the back rushed over. Sister Chiu, someone saw that little handsome guy in Shen Aya leave the Dragon Alliance. Ooh, so it's really not there. What happened? Xiao Yunxiao waved her hand. Aya, Xiao Bai, there are some things that are better not known. After saying that, she waved her hand and immediately got into the car. Contact everyone in our union and find them. Yes, Sister Chiu. Chapter 050 Dragon Level Powerhouse Alien Emperor Debuts. Shin Aya. Just now, Xiao Yunxia brought people to look for Mu Chen, and there were quite a few of them, and they left immediately after learning that you weren't here. The two were already at the airport when Bai Yin came with the news. Sure enough, something's not right. Mukin, are you sensing something? There's a crisis. From my judgment I suspect it's that Elder Jane who's not right. That's impossible. I don't trust Elder Jane's character and style. Bai Yen and many of the old guilds were very trusting of Elder Jane. He had done a lot not just for the Red Dragon, but for this continent as well. Back then, he was a SS class writer. A writer that no one had surpassed in a hundred years. I'm not sure, but it's definitely not a good thing for Chiu Yunxia to come to me. It's not like her usual style. It's true that she might have been instructed by someone. I'll investigate on this side. Bai Yen, even if you suspect Elder Jane you should not act without authorization, just do things according to the time, tomorrow you will ask for instructions again according to the time, 
The investigation should not be started immediately. I'm afraid you guys are also in danger. Mu Chen and Shania are going to prepare to board the plane. Let's not talk about it for now. We'll contact you when we get to Heavy Cloud. At the White Maple Guild Chai Xiang they all felt something was wrong. Xiao Yunxia was also an old acquaintance. Taking a man for fun was fine. She wasn't the kind of person who wanted to take away handsome men when she saw them. And several of the core of the guild were there. President, how do we act now? We don't move on Maxion's meaning. I probably know. Xiao Chui went to see our dark eyes. Understood. The others don't go out first. All be careful. Even if there's danger Shania and Mac Dan both are there. Not any wargirls can deal with them. Shania is an SS Earth Guardian wargirl. Xiao Yunxia is also a smart person. She shouldn't leave Xinjin. Shepherd Dust and the others would be much safer as long as they left Xinjin. Chairman, there's an exceptionally heavy rainstorm at Xinjin Airport. All the flying aircraft maidens can't leave for the time being. Xiao Chui ran over. And our dark eyes have seen that there are a lot more wandering air women near the guild. And they look at us from time to time. My Yeri and you can sure came over. Chairman, should we force a breakthrough or split up? No need. Our numbers can't lift anything. Bai Yan looked at the ceiling. Could it be that Makoto was guessing right? It's impossible for Elder Jian to do this. But everything is in front of us again. Trust Shinaya and Mukan. Thinking calmly, they would also be stopped by some guild's goodwill even if they went out now. Xiao Chui. Data communication network hack into Heavy Cloud Academy for me. I want the phone number of a student named Li Shi. Okay, Chairman. At Xinjin Airport, Xiao Yunxia arrived immediately with his people and three other teams and started searching. Sister Chiu. No luck. Sister Chiu. We didn't find it either. Xiao Yunxia dragged her face. What about your side? Asked the other two guilds. Both were shaking their heads. Sister Chiu. What should we do then? What to do? Keep searching. It's within Xinjin. The intelligence is just wrong. Right. Let's go to the commercial street to take a look. Maybe it's really shopping. We'll leave it alone when we get out of Xinjin. Half an hour ago Mu Chen and Shen Aya left Xinjin by water instead. On the surface of the sea, a 6th generation B-class mighty bull amphibious ship was sailing. Don't worry, Sister Shen Aya. This route of mine isn't one that ordinary commercial ships are allowed to take. And I'll be able to send you guys to Heavy Cloud Harbor in the morning. Then it's hard work for you. Where are the words? Everywhere Shen Aya had connections and had Wang Chuanfang's sister come to send them back. At this moment at the Dragon Alliance headquarters. Elder Jane was playing chess. News came on the light screen, the other party had left Xinjin and should have taken the waterway. It's just a little doll. There's no need, right? Opposite him at the moment was a brown-robed man playing a game. What Li Shi overheard shouldn't be much, but she was able to determine that the Dai Jun will be acting recently. It's better to be able to chop it up. And that kid behind the curtain, he's bound to be a problem in the future. They easily looked up Makoto's information. A student who graduated soon. An E-class wave driver. This kind of person was nothing more than cannon fodder in Rock Elephant's opinion. Therefore, in his judgment, Nukin was nothing more than a pawn. And the driver of Li Shi who was really hidden behind the curtain was the real executor. This is a risky move. That new little girl from your lighthouse won't suspect it. So what if she will? It would be best to find out who the man was who fused and transformed with her. And even if the move doesn't work out, your man is in Shinsu. And he's invited as a guest. Flying elephants. That's a good hand. You have a point. After all, out of Shinsu it's not a human doing it. But, out of the Fei won't be discovered by the people at the center? Elder Jane was doubtful. Don't worry. Out of the ten adults, the current technology can't scan their bodies. Even if they have just awakened rumor has it that there is also a dragon level. In the future it is even able to get to the extermination level of monsters. They can't live. This person who was playing against Elder Jane was the rock elephant. That girl Li Shi was using trash like Mu Dust to cover herself up. And rock elephant knew that too well. The little girl just loved to build her castle, and when it was destroyed, it would completely crumble. Although it hadn't been figured out why Mu Chen and Shania had suddenly left, but Rock Elephant guessed that it was the order of that person hiding behind the curtain. A machine maiden with a broken G body and a waste driver were obviously cannon fodder. Today's action was considered a warning to the other party. Under the moon, the mighty bull amphibious ship was still sailing. The moonlight was bright, and danger couldn't be ruled out until it reached the heavy clouds. Don't signal now. There is a risk of being intercepted. The channel was quiet. Just like ship Ji Xiaofang said. This side was not a merchant channel. Just at this time, the sea surface broke open. A two-winged monster rushed out of the sea. Extremely fast scared Xiaofang screamed. Ah, what is the situation? There's a foreign beast. Nukin and Shen Aya looked into the air. This monster's body was blue. With a pair of huge pterodactyl wings that exceeded 5 meters. No legs. A huge long tail. A body that was 5 points similar to a human's especially the arms. 
but also holding a trident weapon that emitted a sea blue luster, and eight bulging crystals with antler-like things on the forehead. What kind of foreign beast is this? I haven't seen it at all. Shania had never seen it either. Could it be a seahorse mutant fusion? There were a few similarities. Able to move at high speeds in the sea and fly in the air. From the current knowledge of the three of them, they hadn't seen it before. Elder Jane had never seen it. The monster's nose sniffed, seemingly smelling a familiar flavor. Its right hand's blue light trident rotated with a low keening-like sound. And its mouth spat out blue air aimed this way. Sister Shania, there is no alarm signal from the center. How can that be? This is the signaling area. How could it not be scanned? This is the inner CIA. Sister Shania, I'll send out a signal immediately. And slow down. Shania pinched her fist. A leaky fish is just a fish. When the fight starts, Xiao Fang, you will return to Xinjin by yourself. You don't have to care about the two of us. Good. Good. Wait. Shania's sister, how do you two fight? Ah, Xiao Fang is also aware of it. Shania's G body. Remember to go back not to say anything. Throwing the cigarette in his hand. Makoto, let this monster see how powerful we are. Chapter 051 Big Room in Danger. Little Room to the Rescue. Sister Shania, much dust? Little Fong was still in doubt. Shania leapt up. The moment the mechanical particles rotated to transform into mechanical form. Fusion, Shania, accept. With a silver blue blow, Makoto disappeared. The huge earth attacking chariot had not yet landed on the ship. G body unfolded. Arms, legs, and gorgeous protective crystal armor all over the body. Chest armor, shoulder armor, arm armor, earth guardian shield, thunder splitting god gun behind his back, golden brown cloak shining, gorgeous transformation. Landing on the deck of the ship was the Earth Guardian Wargirl. Ah Xiao Fang grew her mouth. Almost seawater pouring into her mechanical body. Transformed? Wargirl form. And their transformation was accomplished across the air. Which was only possible for a harnesser and a mechanic girl with a fit of over 50 or more. Xiao Fang go back by yourself. Don't say anything to anyone got it? Shen. Shen Aya's sister. I know. Leaping and turbojet spraying. The Earth Guardian Wargirl flew up into the sky drawing the Psy Thunder Rift God Gun behind her. The gun spun in her hand with a thunderous roar. The sky was covered in dark clouds. Before the two sides exchanged blows, heavy rain fell from the sky. Shania don't be careless, my premonition danger value is high. You're even reminding up your teacher? Then my dear beautiful teacher, is here. The other party's dragon wings flapped and suddenly rushed in. For residual shadows were left behind in the heavy rain. Every moment was changing angles. The thunder splitting god gun met it. The Poseidon trident clashed with the thunder splitting god lance setting off thunder and blue waves in the air. The frightened little Fong who was running away screamed in fear and didn't dare to look back. That violent collision. Every time it seemed to be able to chop up her mechanical body. Both hands swept across. Shin Aya's powerful chop. The combination of her and Mu Chen could be said to be fierce. And the overbearing and incomparable power was like a thousand tons chopping down. Even an emperor-level foreign beast would be split in half. But, blue light flowed throughout that strange foreign beast's body. And it blocked the strike with one hand across its halberd. What? Dragon level? Shinaya's low voice? The dragon level alien beast was the commander of the army of alien beasts. A general-like existence. This is a dragon level bio-enhancement that instantly strengthens it itself. The thunder splitting god gun was picked apart. But Shinaya and Mu Chen were not vegetarians. Turning around and piercing the clouds in a chain. The spearhead spun with thunder. The crackling thunder caused the strange foreign beasts in the way to be electrocuted. Baird 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 Roar dash a hushed roar. It immediately pulled away. Thunder still flickered all over its body. Eating the rain and thunder. Use the weather and utilize the power of lightning. Makoto. You attack. I'll defend. Okay. Dear. The dragon winged fey beasts rushed up. Shinaya and the others were at a disadvantage in the air battle. And they were at a complete disadvantage on the speed level. But there was no problem with defensive counterattacks. Instantly. The trident illuminated a rain of guns to attack. Shinaya's huge shield resisted being poked wildly in the air, they continuously retreated. Enduring the constant attacks, Muchin seized the opportunity to strike with a shot. Stigmata. The other party was so fast. So far, only that black wargirl could match its speed. The stabbing strike of the thunder cracking godlance that was dodged sideways. However, thunderbolt release. A hundred meters in front of them formed a thunder net amidst the heavy rain. This voltage of over 100. 000 could still injure the opponent. Charge. The earth roared and the earth guardian shield bloomed. The entire sky roared. The dragon-winged alien beasts were shaken out. The clouds all parted quite a bit left and right. How was it? Overbearing. What did you stinky guy call me just now? Itchy skin. Ha, huh? 
Dear beautiful teacher Ah, before falling into the water, the dragon wings shook, and the other party directly maintained flight. A little. Meaning, Mu Chen and Shania were startled. Did you hear it speak just now? I heard it too. A dragon level foreign beast speaks human language? It might have. There aren't many dragon level foreign beasts we've faced, and it seems to be bursting with powerful strength within its body. The dragon winged fey beast roared low in the rain, suddenly erupting in azure light. The ocean's air currents vaporized and formed a protective area around its body. The rain was completely blocked out. Spiritual intelligence is so high that it actually knows that it's rainwater that conducts electricity. And a strange energy armor also appeared on its body as the demonic aura unfolded, forming an air wave that covered 10,000 meters. Little Fong, who had escaped so far, felt this chi and shivered to the freezing point. Mu Chen and Shania didn't laugh about it. Their expressions were grave. The enemy instantly disappeared. Just as Shadow was seen in a close range position, the Earth Guardian Wargirl turned to shield block, disappearing again. The omnidirectional countless angles of the Neptune Trident attacked. Only a full defense could be mounted. The shield force field unfolding. The speed was too fast. At least three times as fast as Shania's side. How did it increase its speed so much? The aura has completely changed. Shania hadn't fought against a dragon class but had studied it. And this strange dragon class alien beast in front of her was different from anything she had studied. Instead, it was very much like a battle maiden. Constantly thinking about attack methods. Realizing that the air battle Shania had a large disadvantage in their speed. It raised its speed to the extreme. And, Shania's outburst just now actually only left a very small wound. It shouldn't. The body of a normal dragon level alien beast was not as strong as this. It became a one-sided suppression in a flash. The air battle environment was too unfavorable. The sea below was even more unfavorable. Shoulder armor flashbangs occurred. On the glittering sky, flare X. Boom 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 boom. Sudden strike to see if it had a strange effect. The dragon wing that Mu Dust was aiming at. The body of the alien beast was wrapped in flames. It immediately rushed into the sea. How is this guy smarter than Chang Rong? It broke the sea. With a hundred meter elemental giant whale at its feet. Deep power. Huge barriers. Defense opened up. The opposing Neptune Trident shine blasted against the shield wall. The Earth Guardian Wargirl flew backwards. It landed on the surface of the sea breaking through the seawater. Shinaya rolled over and flew up again as her feet broke open. The opponent wasn't able to capitalize on the attack because it also felt its arms tingling. What was the origin of this human wargirl? It was actually tougher than the shell of the dragon level beast, the tumbler heavy armored Xuanwu. Humph dash it rotated the trident in its hand, cocking its neck. Without the lightning plague, the opponent simply couldn't cope with its speed. If it wasn't for the fact that Mu Chen had upgraded the jets first, today that would be being pressed into the sea and beaten. That really didn't have the ability to fight back at all. My beautiful teacher. What to do now? This foreign beast is constantly discovering our disadvantage. A dragon level intelligent foreign beast. Its battle power isn't this strong to be right. This guy is like a high level battle maiden. Shania's rank as well as her experience with Mu Chuan was already so strong that the other battle maidens couldn't block it at all. In the place of teacher Zhang Chuanjiao, she would have been decimated in three moves. Makoto's side of the fusion fit was 55. Increasing the fusion degree opening the eyes, and perfecting the form for a battle was the best way at the moment, but it was hard to win against the other side, the air carried a roar, scanning radar showed that a fighter jet flew by high in the sky, it's not a fighter jet that can help, it would be good if it was an acquaintance, new display, linkage fit 35, this, sensing it, Makoto turned to the sky, fusion, Li Shi, chapter 052, the strength of a double SS battle spirit, fusion, Li Shi, a light suddenly flashed through Li Shi's brain, followed by the sound of Mu Chen calling out for fusion. Originally thought to be hallucinating, Li Shi had just been in the stratosphere, and she hadn't noticed the constant thunderstorms below, but the screen showed, degree of fit 35, without much thinking, except, transformation, radiant battle girl, how is it possible, what's going on here? Li Shi transformed into a war girl and just felt a golden body of light in her soul. The driver wasn't even there but was also able to complete the transformation through space, breaking through the thunderstorm clouds to the sky above the sea below. On the surface of the sea flew a 10 meter golden brown cloaked mighty battle maiden. While not far away, the monster holding the trident of Poseidon was staring at her, the one who appeared out of nowhere. Li Shi, what brings you here? With enough distance, Mu Chen's main soul entered her side. Hoomph, a woman named Bai Yin called me and said that you guys were in a crisis, and I know about the White Maple Guild so I believed her and came over. Came just in time. Next time I'll upgrade your bedroom. Mac Chen, you pervert, asshole, I shouldn't have come over to mind you. Li Shi scolded. There was a two-second pause. 
What's going on with you? You're able to maintain the transformations of two battle maidens? Awesome, isn't it? New SS talent double link. You bastard. Where's so many talents? Who is that machine lady? Poof. Why do you feel jealous? No outsiders. It's Shania. MS. Shania? How can that be? Li Shi couldn't believe it. The Battleheim in front of her was completely different from the Iron Blood Battleheim. Flying in the air as a SS class Earth Guardian Battleheim, she was the rumored king of the species of land Battleheim. Let's not talk about it so much first. This foreign beast came from somewhere. Dragon level. And has extremely high spiritual intelligence also knows simple human language. Li Shi flew down. Shen Aya crossed her arms with one hand. You guys are chatting. But I can hear it too. Because of Mu Chen's double linkage. The communication between the two battle maidens and Mu Chen's second battle maiden could also hear. Old. Master. Be careful of this foreign beast. It's not only fast and powerful it's also very big. I'll break through when you flank it. Li Shi nodded. Shen Aya rushed up. Even if her speed was not comparable. But now it was a two-person battle. She was originally the front row as a heavy armored battle girl. The thunder splitting god gun rotated and chopped. The dragon wing alien beast moved in lightning and rushed to flank Shania. Dawn banner gun laser cannon. The alien beast immediately dodged backwards. Shania turned to shield strike. Trident blocked. The sound of breaking air. Air combat is the territory of the light warrior girl. The speed is not inferior to it. The seven generation S shining sword appeared on her waist. A weapon equipped by Li Shi herself. Dodged by Zhan Yi. Shania's broad axe bomb projected from her small arm. Covering the direction of the alien beast's retreat. Li Shi continuously stabbed her sword. The Fei Beast turned the trident in its right hand to its left hand and spun to block the sword stabs. The dragon wings vibrated to lift off the bombs. However, Li Shi flew up instantly. Shania heavily stumbled on the opponent's abdomen with a foot. The golden light eight winged wings flashed. And the radiant battleship radiant rays. This time, the opponent had no place to hide. Boom. 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 Boom, 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 boom. The golden explosions in the sky streaked across a thousand meters, and the howls of pain from the alien beasts could be heard. The Fey Emperor was also out of luck. He had just woken up from his sleep and wanted to move around, recovering less than three levels, but he didn't know that he would encounter the two SS ranked battlegirls, Shania and Li Shi. The first time they cooperated, they were so in sync. Li Shi had learned many of her moves from her teacher so she could naturally anticipate the movements, plus the double linkage of Makkan, and the three of them were thinking connected to each other. Be careful, it doesn't feel like it will die so easily. Li Shi nodded her head, and her brain saw the memories of the very beginning of their fight with the other party in Mu Chen's brain. It's simply subverting the perception of a fey beast. It's more like a war girl. that's what we thought as well. The explosion dispersed, and the fey beast's torso bled in many places, actually golden blood. However, its body glowed and the wounds began to heal. The trident in its right hand swung, forming multiple boundary force fields. Humans are a bit mean to come back later to recover. The female's voice was smoother than when she spoke just now. Li Shi took the gun of the dawn banner, and the laser cannon hit the force field, actually just generating waves. Alien emperor's boundary? What is that? It's a fey emperor? I'm not sure. I've only heard them talk about very terrifying monsters, and it will get stronger the more they fight. You can't fight a long-lasting battle with it. Mu Chen trusted Li Shi. Their attacks weren't enough to break through the boundary. There was only one card left in Mu Chen's hand. Retreat. Go back to the heavy cloud it doesn't dare approach. Li Shi and Shania looked at each other and nodded in agreement. There was no need to wear it out. Directly lifting her transformation, Li Shi turned into an extermination 20 fighter to catch Shania and Mu Dust. Mu Dust waved his hand. That side of the alien emperor. Beauty. We're rushing back to do the big things in life. The green mountains remain. The green water flows forever. See you later. Wait dash. The spray paint power was launched. The extermination 20 broke into the air and flew in the direction of heavy cloud. Waiting for 3 minutes for the alien emperor to fully recover. It was long gone from its perception range. Landing on the surface of the sea. It collected its weapons. 3 humans. This emperor remembers your breath. Just dive to the bottom of the sea. What is it? What's the situation of the sea's different emperor? Lord Hai Kuei? What do you mean? Humans. With its hand pressed to its temple, it was able to contact a certain person sitting in a formation in Shinsu. Trouble the human you're dealing with. No encounters. Do not disturb my rest. The rock elephants looked at the macro celestial instruments. The chi produced by Jane's old alien cavern had clearly reached the vicinity of this lord before dissipating. How come it was not encountered? Yes. Disturbing you. Rock elephant pondered impossible. Ah, 
But how could the might of the sea's different emperor encounter letting the other party escape? It could only be attributed to how lucky Mu Chen and Shania were. He far underestimated Li Shi's trust in Mu Chen. Hearing Bai Yan's call, he immediately went to the roof of an academy and transformed to fly away. There's no pursuit. Descending from the stratosphere into the heavy cloud region, there were quite a few flying G and passenger G sailing under the night sky. Li Shi could slow down her speed. Thanks to you rushing to help. It's better to be a member of your own family. Teacher, is it okay if I eject Makoto? It's perfectly fine. The two of us will go back without him. Wait, wait, wait. Hoof. Li Shi's petulant humming voice. What's the situation with you guys? Suddenly going to the Xinjin Dragon Alliance and then encountering danger. Regarding Shin Ayaji body recovering to the point of being able to transform at will, Li Shi was actually very curious. No outsiders? Li Shi, I'll ask you a question. Say, Shin Aya knows that you are from the lighthouse. If you say me and Rock Elephant, who do you trust? You bastard. I won't trust you. If I didn't see that my teacher was in danger, I wouldn't have come along to save you. Well said. Shin Aya nodded. You guys don't understand the lighthouse? The Rock Elephant is one of the ten core members of the lighthouse. The Shinjin leader. His status is extremely high in prestige. However, the people of the lighthouse, I won't completely trust them either. Say it. Shepherd Dust told Li Shi what had happened. According to my crisis intuition immediately choose to leave. I suspect that the rock elephants have problems. You must be careful. Li Shi listened to the analysis. And she certainly knew about Elder Jian of the Dragon Alliance as well as Fang Tianshua. Rationally analyzing, it was likely that she had brought up the rock elephants and attracted a crisis instead. She kept flying and didn't speak for two minutes. Shepherd Dust didn't blame her. She was the one who provided the rock image. Maxion knew that Li Shi had good intentions. So of course she wouldn't blame one of her own. Here it is. Finally landed safely. Stopping at the free tarmac. Li Shi transformed back. Makoto patted Li Shi's shoulder. No injuries, right? Lowering his voice. Why don't you dare to speak up in front of the master bedroom? You're going to die. Li Shi gave him a kick. You can go drive. I'm a bit tired. Wait for me here. Nukin went to drive the mechanical car that was parked not far away. Li Shi, teacher? Shin Aya walked up to her with a sense of oppression. Wait, what am I thinking? What big room and small room sense of oppression? Although I'm only six or seven years older than you, I've seen a lot of. You know about me transforming alone to cover everyone on the battlefield back then, right? And then I found out that more than 30,000 of us were betrayed and abandoned, and our distress signals were wiped out. What? Don't say anything about this. Luo Tong and I are hiding it in our hearts. In this age of calamity, one needs to judge for oneself what people are trustworthy. Li Shi didn't say anything. Thank you this time. Otherwise it's really hard for us to cope. If there's anything feel free to call out to me in Mukin. Shin Aya waved her hand, got into the car, and suddenly turned around. Do you want to join us ah? There's no one in the second bedroom. Teacher, you've learned from Makoto. Chapter 053. I like big ones this comfortable. Shall buy. We arrived safely didn't run into any trouble, did you? If you didn't inform Li Shi to rush over, we were really in trouble, and we encountered the Fei Emperor in the inner sea. Fei Emperor? What's that? A new cry for an Emperor-level Fei Beast? No, it speaks human language. Its combat power is probably above medium dragon level. Very difficult to deal with, and the inner sea radar alert didn't scan it. This is the first time I've heard of it. Baek Yun was very shocked to hear. By Yen you go to see Elder Jane tomorrow. You must be careful. Understood. Thank you. Mu Chuan's voice. On the other end of the call, Shen Aya was immediately heard saying, What are you saying thank you to Xiao Bai? Shen Aya this guy. You guys be careful in heavy cloud. Mac Chen. Shen Aya please. Hey hey hey. Bye. I am a teacher. What are you talking about? Be careful I will knock over you next time to educate you properly. Bai Yan looked out the window. You ah. Uh, hmm. Wild impulsive faction. This point Mukin then you. Back to Shen Aya's house. This operation was considered a failure except at the mission level. But we also learned that the Dragon Alliance can't be trusted to not count it as no gain right now. The appearance of the Fey Emperor is definitely related to either Rock Elephant or Elder Jane. Followed by Alliance Master Feng Tianshua. Even, those two old guys were united, compassionate and kind. Back then, the outstandingly meritorious and respected Elder Jane, actually might. Shen Aya's character was rigid, and Mu Chen could see what she was thinking. People change and are greedy either because of power, or longevity. Elder Jane is already close to 150, right? The normal lifespan of a driver was close to 200 years old. You guy, you say it like it makes sense. Shania smoked a cigarette. What about you? Will you change? Muchuan looked at Shania, meeting such a big, and beautiful teacher. Can't change. 
Shania gave him a punch. In fact, the heart is still happy to go to the basement to take a shower to self-overhaul the body whether it is injured. Ding, you complete task 5. Please return safely to the heavy clouds with your fellow travelers. A level. Reward, Galactic Shining Radiance X2. Able to enhance the driver's talent up to level S by one notch. This kind of good stuff was of course for one's own use. Makoto realized that he had leveled up to level 15. He had awakened his normal talent too great at firepower suppression. Within a time frame, long-range output weapons would split twice as many after being fired out. Mu Chen's own talents were definitely not bad, and both talents were A rank. Use Galaxy Shining Radiance. It was just the right amount of time to boost his two A rank talents. Your talents 1 and 3 are upgraded to S rank. Crossing out his attribute panel again. Driver, Mu Dust. Level, 15. Physique value, 373. Super characteristics, primordial wave. Talents, S rank, convergent power drive. SSS rank, galactic heart. S rank, beacon, beacon. Raising the number of doubles to three. Cannon girl couldn't move her legs when she saw this talent from Makoto. Frenzied output core. It's like going on a blind date in the ancient two. Zero 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 year old era. And you tell the other person that you have a lifetime unbreakable Lamborghini. The attraction to the female is too great. Special abilities, B rank, insight. S rank, flare X. SS, double link. Fusion core, SS rank, shining Gaia armor. When Shinaya returned to the living room, she found Makoto leaning on the sofa and falling asleep, bringing a blanket to cover him. Gently brushing up her long wet hair a little bit, she approached Makoto, her red lips slowly approaching. Miso. Door opening sound. Parents came back. Cough cough cough. Shinaya immediately sat down on the sofa. The next day, finally returned to the soothing academy. Shepherd Dust went to the academy cafeteria to eat breakfast. Pointing at the screen to select the shuttle dinner plate will automatically be brought to you. Saw a few familiar looking Lee shadows. Mu Chen walked over and sat down. Directly opposite was Qin Fei Fei. Next to her was Han Xuanyan and Zhou Xia. And next to Mu Chen was Li Shi. Hey, Mu Kun, where have you been? You haven't come to class for two days. By Xiao she was the first to see. Went back to do some errands. Nothing much. Qin Fei Fei didn't say anything and got the celery that she didn't like to eat onto Mu Kun's dinner plate. Chin Fei Fei I'm not a garbage plate. A la a la. Many boys want it and I still won't give it. One of her eyes signaled for Mu Chen to look at the side. Beside. Mac Dust look Li Shi. Today wear school uniform trench coat. Inside the pure white sweater. Figure is very good. The thin place thin. The big place is also big. Concave and convex with. How black eyes ah. Aya aya. It's hard to see someone so heavy black circles under the eyes it. What's wrong with Mu Chen? Chin Fei Fei asked. It was only then that Li Shi saw that this guy, Mu Kun, was sitting next to her. Maybe, it has something to do with me. Zhou Xia, Bai Shaoxi, Han Xuanyan, the three girls stared with white eyes. Li Shi's dark circles had something to do with Mu Dust. Cry Ki, instantly they thought of it. Thought of it. A la a la, even though you're young, you two can't get it on so late. Put, Mu Kun, Li Shi, Han Xuanyan, and the few other witches all sprayed. Xin Fei Fei. What are you talking about? Li Shi glared at her. Aya, you guys are so close, you definitely want people to guess. Being on good terms with him? Humph, I'm crazy almost. Li Shi took a big bite. Mac Chen directly moved closer. I noticed that you're on good terms with Qin Fei Fei, and you won't get angry with her? Humph, I have a private partnership with the Qin family. This could be considered a secret. Han Xuanyan blinked her eyes. This was all told to Mu Chen? What happened last night? Did you go back and fight? Going back? Crap, were the two on a date or something last night? No, do you think I'm as straightforward as a teacher? But I didn't think about why I would do that as a leader. And I didn't sleep all night thinking about it. It's nothing more than power and longevity. Money and wealth. Machinima they don't lack. The original purpose of the lighthouse's establishment was to illuminate the path ahead for humanity. Li Shi chose to believe in Makoto. So when analyzed in reverse, there was a high probability that there was something wrong with the rock elephants. She was smart enough not to tell anyone else because it was impossible to say who was secretly doing the same. She actually trusted the people of the lighthouse. They were all leaders, but she also pondered. After all, they were all human. She also had a strong desire to explore, to learn. But now, because she initially trusted all the people of the lighthouse too much, she shared what she saw moving. Instead, trouble arose, and the other nine of the lighthouse knew about her being a light warrior. He reckons he's using you and sensei as cannon fodder underestimated our battle power and didn't expect you to come. You guys didn't have a meeting last night? It opened. I pretended not to know. I don't understand what he thinks. The two got closer and closer. After all, 
There were some things that couldn't be overheard by someone passing by. Eyebrow to eyebrow. Zhou Xia and Bai Xiao Xi they grew their mouths. This is spreading dog food. Cursing on their mouths. They ended up chatting feverishly in whispers. Jean Fei Fei's beautiful eyes blinked. Still saying that the relationship was average. This was already good to a certain extent. She knew Li Shi's identity as a lighthouse person and heard the two conversing. Obviously Maxian was also very clear that something else dangerous had happened last night. Including the teacher being in the middle of it? Qin Fei Fei heard that it's okay? It wasn't just Qin Fei Fei. Han Xuanyan could also hear it. Li Shi's identity the two of them knew. So they didn't take precautions. Zhou Xia and Bai Xiao Xi were across the empty seats. They could only see them browbeating. They couldn't hear what was being said. Something's wrong. Later you'll pull her to the corner and chop her up. Han Xuanyan shivered. She heard it too. Ah. Qin Fei Fei rested her face in a bad smile. Knowing that Mukin wouldn't do that. And that Li Shi was trying to get back at her. Don't underestimate me. I'm very powerful. Raising his head. Giant arms terror. Rated coconut. Hoomph. Just your little bit of ability. You don't know how much strength this beast. Mukin. Has. Last night to take the car he didn't bring the key. Hard to use his hand to crush the alloy safety column. Originally thought it would scare Qin Fei Fei. Then knew, that, is fantastic. I just like strong strength. So it's comfortable. Mukin? Li Shi and Han Xuanyan sprayed the ground at the same time. Chapter 054, Zhao Pengfei's war letter against Mu Chen. On the other hand, Morong Xian in the principal's office was helping school head Wu organize last night's information. Seeing that school Wu was listless, she herself said that menopause had arrived and people were annoyed. Morong Xian was clear that it was because of Shania. Shania absent two days. No news do not know what happened. She did not dare to mention. Was about to go out. I'm coming in. Shania voice. Also did not wait for the person inside to agree. Shania smoking a cigarette came in. Ah. Shania you're back. Morong Xian morning ah. She looked back. Wu school excitedly immediately stood up. Shania. You dead girl. Morong Xian immediately went out without disturbing. It seems that school was menopause only lasted for three days. Shania are you alright? It's good that you crazy girl didn't act. Wu school came over to be as anxious as her own mother. Tears in the corner of her eyes. Ling Mei has not said anything because Shania said to give her a surprise. Hugging Wu school. I came back. No action is good. Hum. You stinky girl. Professor Ching sighed at most three years. It is possible to research BT super serum? By then I must help you apply. Shania sat down. The big stone in the heart of Wu school landed. Although the technology is irreversible now, and even a little bit more poor, but Shania still has a few years there is a little hope. Do you know about the Fei Emperor? Alien Emperor? I've heard of this name. At the time it was said to be a cool human-like special alien beast. My captain at the time fought with one of them and was seriously injured. Why are you asking this? Last night in the inner sea back to the heavy clouds in Xinjin, I encountered one with Mu Chuan. Speaks human language can control the power of water. Faster in the air than an S-class air fighter nymph. The ability to recover from injuries. Roughly middle to upper dragon class strength. Colonel Wu paused for three seconds. Wait, you met with Makoto? To be precise, we judged that it was someone from the Dragon Alliance who deliberately communicated with it to intercept us. Wait wait wait, a foreign emperor intercepted you guys? How did it come back? Shinaya smiled. Left hand holding a cigarette. Right hand direct semi-machine, of course. It is transformed into a war girl and it fought hard. Of course. Then our friend's support came. We two to one to be able to return in one piece. Don't turn. I thought you didn't have a cyborg talent? Shinaya scratched her data to school Wu. Machine lady rank 46. Full body equipped with all kinds of weapons. SS rank 45 talent earth's roar. SS level 8th generation earth attacking battle vehicle. SS level earth guardian battle maiden. How is it possible? Maxion helped me do it. We succeeded. This office door. I won't let you eat it. It's not good for your body. Wu school's shocked expression was maintained for 10 seconds. She also kept looking at Shin Aya's situation. G body damage level 15. This data is not fake? Go out and let's try crashing? My turbojet speed isn't that slow. I made mom not tell you because I wanted to surprise you. Colonel Wu rushed up and gave her a double wind in her ears. You dead girl. And that dead kid. You must be cleaned up hard. Wu. Shin Aya saw her tears flowing out excitedly. She did not speak anymore. Hugging her again. At 9 o'clock all the senior division machinima and pilots assembled in the giant playground. The senior division teachers were all there and Shania stood up in her silver and white uniform as Colonel Wu walked out. Students, starting today we will begin a nearly three-day practical course. This is the most important course for graduates of the Heavy Cloud Academy. You should know very well that no matter if you go to all walks of life in the future, 
This practical course will be an important assessment indicator for you. There were indeed many observers from the forces that had come to the scene, as well as people from the major hubs were present. This practical combat class is to cooperate with the Heavy Cloud Defense Hub to complete transportation, exfiltration, raid each emission. The location has outside the security zone. I hope you guys don't be half careless. You may encounter quite a few alien beasts. Each team is assigned with three flares. Send out when asking for help. The defense hub's war girl or teacher will immediately arrive. The raid mission causes more than mild injuries. Well, directly the whole team is considered a failure. Understand? Transportation of supplies mission is to transport items to the frontline positions. The danger is to go out of the safety boundaries. Exhaustion mission is to exhaust some forest areas near the boundaries. For the raid mission, there were two options. One was to grab the other group's supplies, so it was emphasized that no injuries could be caused. And the second was to eliminate three bug level or higher alien beasts. It is to be found near the boundaries. If the machine girl and the driver are afraid to fire an attack, later on in the battlefield is a pile of scrap metal useless. Now you have one hour to form teams and register. 1270 machine nymphs and 381 harnesses, each team numbering between 6 and 8 people. Free teaming time. Instantly many people became the meat and potatoes. Boo woo. Let's form a team. Don't call out to me like that. Morong Boo woo was very upset. Brother Morong how about we join forces? No need. The teacher on the stage laughed. Morong Boo was very bad at dealing with enthusiastic machinima and disliked teaming up. This mission was mandatory and one had to adapt to cooperation. Qin Fang's side quickly grouped up. After all, many of the machine nymphs knew about it a week ago. Brother Peng Fei how about we team up? Brother Peng Fei, I'm equipped with a 6th generation B-rank weapon. Brand new. Peng Fei brother this mission is going to spend the night outside again. My cushion can be comfortable. Brand new and super wear resistant. The school grass's personal guards immediately swarmed up. Chang Rong was also there. But strangely enough she didn't bring along her two followers. Ru Xiao Chui and Yu Chi Yu. They weren't that bad. Zhao Peng Fei couldn't see them? Only to see the crowd give way. Zhao Peng Fei walked out towards Mukin. Mukin. Quite a few people saw that Zhao Peng Fei actually went to group Mu Dust. E-class drivers couldn't provide much energy. Right? This actual combat mission. Starting from noon today. Cannot go to any town to get supplies. Unless one puts up a flare for help. The energy provided by the driver to the machine girl would have a key role. What is it? Makoto didn't think the other party's fierce look was to solicit him. This actual battle. Wait for me. I will crush your team. Instantly, all the people around him heard it. A letter of war? Crap. Zhao Pengfei is giving a letter of war to Mu Chen? Too much of a drop, right? An E-class driver. What do you know? Zhao Pengfei lost to Mu Dust and Li Shi last time. And this is to get back at him. Taking every enemy seriously. Zhao Pengfei is so handsome. The ProGuard regiment was a piece of nymphomaniacal witches. And oil was about to leak on the field. Mu Chen looked at him. Then you will fail again. Humph. Where's Li Shi? There's her alone. Chang Rong was right next to Zhao Pengfei the two of them were still a team. After all, A-class chariot. Not many students so resistant to roughness. G body quality is there. She ah. That side went to register. You can also go to the war book. Don't worry. When you raid her side, I won't play in. Mu Chen pointed at the registration. Li Shi's side was already organized. What? Li Shi isn't teaming up with you? Zhao Pengfei froze for a moment. Many people in the academy rumored that they were a couple. Li Shi also heard it. Why should I be on a team with this bastard? Mu Chen? By then, his supplies will be ours as well. Chapter 055 The formation of the 2S class machine maidens is complete. Li Shi's side of the team had already registered. Together with her, there were six machine nymphs a driver. 5th generation Durank trailer nymph Dong Manyan, 7th generation A rank broken 10 combat nymph Han Xuanyan, and 8th generation A rank helicopter nymph Su Lin, 6th generation C rank small transport ship Ji Gue Kai Meng, 6th generation C rank coupe Ji Xiang Mei, and her boyfriend's C rank driver Takizu. The overall team was complete. Crap! Han Xuanyan and Su Lin together? They're not leading the team? This is too strong. How can the other teams play? Didn't Han Xuanyan follow Qin Fei Fei all the time? Luckily with a trailer. Li Shi isn't just a motorcycle yet. The main thing is that the double A mechanic is strong. Going for another A class driver invincible. What's so invincible? Their team is a double A class machine girl. But just as C class driver Zhu Zhou. Ji Xiang Mei is his girlfriend. A class machine girl won't be able to link with C class randomly. So what they can link is just a trailer. A small transport ship. As well as a coupe. Analyzing it like that. It does almost make sense. I'll wait for me. Zhao Pengfei dropped his harsh words and led the people he chose to register. Zhao Pengfei's team was evenly matched, totaling 8 people. 
Aside from him and Chang Rong, there were three machine nymphs and three drivers. This formed a four-team linkup, which could maximize the effect. Look at Qin Feng's team is also very strong. The pilots are all going to be gone. Qin Feng's team also consisted of eight people, four machine nymphs and four drivers. The machine nymphs would have been close to four times the number of drivers. Morong Buwa's team was seven people, with one driver and five machine nymphs in addition to him. But in addition to the S-ranked Morong Buwu, the four machine nymphs were D-ranked, and there was just one C-ranked transporter G. She was excited to be able to team up with Morong Buwu, and could experience the S-ranked driver linkage. The people who had formed their teams were watching the rest of the people forming their teams. Morong Buwu. Where is Morong Buwu man? This arrogant voice could only possibly be Beldet. Mac Dust beckoned. What? Beldet and the girls are actually teaming up with this. Trash. Moo Dust? Many people stared in disbelief. Beldet had always been arrogant. Although she was long and pretty, and people who weren't used to her talking were rather disgusted. But she was an S-class machine girl ah, and without changing her body she was also a very strong combatant. Beldet crossed her arms. Mac Dust Plebeian. This young lady has decided to bring you a hand with great mercy. The message was actually sent yesterday. Then thank you for Missy's kindness. Beldet S rank. Next to her were three machine ladies and a driver. They were Amira, a 7th generation C-rank boom repair kime, La Belle, a 7th generation C-rank heavy transport kime, with her boyfriend, Larson, a C-rank driver, and Utana, a 6th generation A-rank Katie Usha rocket car kime, people from the Blue Eagle Kingdom, Northern Bear Kingdom, and also the Iron Cavalry Kingdom, the foreign powerhouse team, Makchen, relax, we're not that powerful, you're the one Beldet named to be pulled into the team, Utana extended her hand, then I won't be polite to mix the team, reaching up, she shook her hand, pleasure working together, Beldet patted her chest, don't worry, although you are just an E-rank plebeian, but this young lady here is a clear distinction between grudges, the last time you performed well this young lady this time to take you to get a good result, Beldet had told her full-fledged group that the last time she went shopping and encountered a G-grabber it was Moo Dust who escorted her. So every time they were inside the academy, Beldet's family's personal guards would greet Moo Dust when they saw him. It made him still embarrassed. We northern bears appreciate brave men. Beldet's golden hair tossed. This way this young lady's team has six people. Plebeian Mac Dust, do you have someone to bring? Yes. Bring a machine woman. She held her chin high. Bring anyone. E's and D's are nothing. Suddenly the sound of Duong was heard. Beldet instantly opened her eyes, purple hair and eyes, that despairing armament. Qin Fei Fei was standing next to Mu Chen. I'll bring a Qin Fei Fei. Yutana's few people froze. Many of the surrounding people who had invited Qin Fei Fei also froze for a moment. Mukin brought Qin Fei Fei? You, an E-ranked driver, bringing our great big S-ranked Qin Fei Fei? Hey hey hey, their team is so strong. It's the same as Li Shi's side, lacking a driver. It's okay. Double S class ah, the current driver link will be able to charge up and boost down the output. How else can and can't transform? Beldet glared at Qin Fei Fei arms. Damn it. Was crushed. If ranked in order, Qin Fei Fei first, that Shen I a second, followed by Li Shi Ed the third. She, Beldet. Damn. Damn only barely be ah. Qin Fei Fei is willing to group with us? Qin Fei Fei, I'm a klutz. I ah, uh, said to follow Mu Dust, repel the red flame archon, SSSS level. Mu Dust, Nima, what does Mission 6 mean? Chapter 082 Communication between Mu Dust and the Qin family. Mu Dust suddenly had a grave expression, and was talking to himself, almost uttering the sea language. What's wrong? The plebeian's expression changed. Did he eat a bad stomach? No, let's not disturb him. Li Shi immediately stopped the other Mushinima. Everyone ate slowly, watching what Mu Chen was seriously thinking about. The sounds of laughter and clinking of wine glasses continued at the other tables. In stark contrast to this table, task 4 was basically a giveaway. And task 5 Mu Chen didn't understand anything about transcendent transformation for the time being, but it should be upgrading the machine nymphs. But task 6 was a big departure. Above the orthodox SSS is SSSR, then SSSS, which has far exceeded the normal valuation. It's like talent. A SSS talent is also a genius that comes along once in a hundred years. Then there's the wording. The bottom line requirement of the mission is 4s for just repelling. Wouldn't that be fives for killing? Mu Chen leaned back in his chair, his face returning to normal. What's wrong? Li Shi knew when to ask. Trouble. Plebeian. Encounter any trouble. Talk to this young lady. There's nothing this young lady can't handle. Beldet patted her chest. What's above the extermination level for our rating of foreign beasts? There's above the extermination level? Han Xuanyan and Susan were puzzled. Hadn't learned about it. Dragon level would be terrifying. 
Extinction level was able to easily destroy a main city, right? There is, but some organizations define it. Epic level. Li Shi gave the answer. It's nothing. Everyone keep eating. Aya, plebeian, just this ah, uh, can't figure out this point. Ask this young lady. Forgot that Missy is still around. Li Shi and Qin Fei Fei knew that Mu Chen didn't say. What is it? Li Shi made eye contact. Quickly say it. Quickly say it. Crap. How come Qin Fei Fei could read eyes too? Blinking and communicating. The name of the great monarch, Red Flame Great Monarch. Mu Chen whispered. The others didn't understand what a great monarch was. You had a premonition? Mac Chen nodded. Li Shi immediately sent a message to Vis, telling him to look into it. Secondly, the Archon might be higher than the extermination level. That can't be determined. It should be your cosmic eye that found that monster. Wouldn't that be a SS level disaster? What are you guys talking about? Qin Fei Fei blinked. There's still 10 days probably less than that. Prepare properly. As far as my guess is concerned, Heavy Cloud City might even be in danger. Level 4S. This is too terrifying. No news. Li Shi saw this as reply. No wonder Mu Chen's expression was gloomy. Even though it was just a guess. The Heavy Cloud boundary was almost breached more than 60 years ago. And it was led by a medium extermination class alien beast. Time was accelerating. Beast Tide estimated time 10 days and 1 hour. A day ran a day and a half. The banquet ended and everyone was leaving one after another. Mac Chen. And two. Call Auntie. Come come come. Let's go over there and talk alone. It was expected that Mukin was called by Tu Wei Lan. Xin Fei Fei was indeed like her old mom. Shen Aya had been having a look at Mu Dust. And Tu Wei Lan had seen it a long time ago. Sure enough. It was similar to the rumors that Mu Chen and Shen Aya had a good relationship. Walking to the second floor balcony. Auntie will get right to the point. What does Mu Chen think of my family Fifi? Fifi is very good, and we have a good relationship. Aya, my Fifi often praises you. Auntie also feels that although your wave is a bit worse, but your talent is good. The Qin family isn't that stereotypical. In Auntie's case, although she hasn't observed much of you, she's still very satisfied. Thank you Antu for your love. Is there any interest in graduating to work in our Qin family? Wouldn't that be a flunky? But, ha ha ha, it's not that descriptive. Tu Wei Lan laughed. This era is very realistic. This is a good choice for you. Our family Fei Fei is absolutely excellent. And you, Mukin, aren't that bad. You've already successfully fused. Change a few more times. Needless to say you understand that relationship. Maybe you can't appreciate it yet. Her words turn slightly. Auntie knows that you have a good relationship with Shania. Shania's relationship with our family is also good. You guys are together Auntie has no problem with it. And to put it in a not so good way Shania's body doesn't have many years. This era is like this. The best have status. If it wasn't for the family's image, an SS ranked machinima like Tu Wei Lan could pick a lot of pilots. Similarly, an SS driver like Fang Tianshua could have a soccer team of machine girls around him. Stronger people carry on better genes. Qin Fei Fei was an S class. Mu Chen was an E class. And Tu Wei Lan had a mind to be the same status as her as the machine nymphs had the last word. Mu Chen leaned on the windowsill. The information you know. And too, may be a bit low. What do you mean? Your Qin Fei Fei's mother. The relationship between multiple parties is good. I can quietly tell you three things. Ooh, go ahead. She lowered her voice. 4-1. I'm already level 19 and have had fusion transformations with four machine mothers. Three at SS rank and one at S rank. Two way lands brain circuits turned around. Wouldn't the only S ranked machine nymph be Fei Fei? Mu Chen scratched a simple interface out. There was only his level and regular talents 1 and 3. It was about to be level 20. With an S rank polymerization power drive and an S rank beacon talent. Two Wei Lan blinked her eyes. Wouldn't that be an SS rank hidden in 2S talents? Wasn't his talent 1 and A? Secondly, Shin Aya's body. There is a special way to recover a lot. Currently living to 2 or 300 years old is not a problem. What? Thirdly, Anti Qin's family should start preparing. Fifi is trusting me, but the Qin family may not. What do you mean? What the person in charge of the 7th district is doing? You'll know if you check later. Shen Aya and I are definitely on the same front now. At that time, if Fifi splits with me on one side, I'll protect her safely. After finishing his speech, Mukin saw that Shen Aya had been waiting for him at the main entrance. Most of the other guests had left, and Li Shi immediately went back to prepare. Mu Chen directly stood on the windowsill and slightly exerted his strength to jump out more than 20 meters from the third floor. Landing on the manor's fence before going down, Shen Aya listened to what Mu Chen said. Transformation. She jumped up and turned into an earth attack battle car in two way lands gaze. Mu Chen jumped on it and the engine started up leaving the Qin family's manor. This Mu Dust, he wasn't a regular person at all. Jumping out 20 or so meters? Now that I think about it, 
The falling ceiling Chin family's six subordinate servants were struggling to lift it. Allah Allah, look at the mom's shock. There are many things that people haven't told mom about. Chin Fei Fei walked out from the back. Walking over to her mom's side, she looked at the distant chariot. The ones who came to save me and fourth uncle that night were teacher Shin Aya and Mukin. They just happened to be passing by. Tu Wei Lan now understood. Shepherd's dust was far more outstanding than she had imagined. And Chin Fei Fei's meaning. What everyone knew now was as if it was just the tip of the iceberg. Knowing the whole that don't go to heaven. Shepherd's dust is too interesting. Mom, I'm the thing you don't care much. Listen to Shepherd's dust. Prepare properly. You this dead girl. To turn the sky. Chin Fei Fei laughed. That flirtatiousness and belaboredness was even more than her mom. Tu Wei Lan. Someone come. Call San to my room. Yes. First lady. Chapter 083. Shen Aya's mutation explodes in place. The 7th district general team's 6th grade metropolis. The person in charge was Luo Tong. Tu Wei Lan knew that Luo Tong and the others were extremely close to Shen Aya and they had faced two beast tights together. Zhou Yang. Wang Chunfeng. Jun Lingmin. Including his own niece Tu Lian. Were all comrades who had lived and died with Shen Aya back then. Sister Tu you called me? Qin San came in. All 40 or 50 people. Like a girl. Of course the normal machine lady 60 or 70 with 20 or 30 years old look about the same. What is the recent movement on the front line 7th district side? You say Luo Tong they are. Recently the command hub of people laughing. And pulling. And emergency drills. Today also made a big one. What? Commander Luo Tong took out all the heavy weapons of the 7th region to bask in the sun. More than 50. 000 people assembled the weapons there. And the people in the center flirted with the idea that he was going to fight Ping and City. Xin San spoke in colorful voice, this is just tossing the men, loaded for 3 days to sunbathe for 10 days, and then dismantled for 5 days. Modern weapons intactness only need to be scanned by the instrument on the line. However, Zhang General Finger actually complimented him. Earned performance led him to earn. Many people thought Luo Tong earned performance. 3 You can go out. Be mature and act like a little girl. Tu Wei Lan quieted down to think alone. Luo Tong and niece Tu Lian what character? She is clear. This is by no means empty. Come on people, give me notice to go down. The family meeting is advanced to tomorrow. No one can be late. Tu family, Zhou family, Han family must participate. On the other hand, Mu Chen and Shania went to Yi Fire's warehouse. Nukin was still looking for Dina to borrow it. My dear teacher, action tonight? Almost. I'm physically better. Come on. The clothes for the dinner party were not even changed. And came to the warehouse. Makoto took a deep breath and took out the lunar god lubricant and the core of Tarahel. Shin Aya changed back to her human form, walked up to the console herself, leaned on it, and took off her jacket. Is this thing meant to wipe the whole body? Actually, there was no need. Shin Aya didn't hesitate to show her gorgeous posture. It was too beautiful. Shin Aya was like an absolutely beautiful queen, domineeringly displaying herself. Mac Dust. Mac Dust? Mukin, go wipe your nose. Really? Shin Aya you're doing this on purpose? No. The transformation is delayed for two days. Wait. The next day. Dina. Sorry. Can I borrow the warehouse for two more days? Can ah. Uh, why last night to get what failed? Dina only knew that Makoto was going to remodel something. Shepherd dust embarrassed buckle face. Last night is too crazy. He directly transformed into a hungry wolf. There was a little accident. Maybe I'll use it again in two days. No problem. Feel free to use it. Then he contacted schoolmaster Wu. Schoolmaster Wu. Shin Aya is not feeling well. I have to check on her in the next two days to prevent her from moving around. So I'll give her a few days off. Give me a good checkup. If Shin Aya is sick, I won't let you go. You brat. Mukin. You stinking bastard. Shin Aya got up and wanted to punch him. Send me home first. Haven't slept all night. You brat crazy never seen a woman. It's all Shin Aya's fault. Ha. Huh? Still my fault? My Shin Aya is the most beautiful in the world. No way. Shin Aya's face slightly red. Smoked a cigarette. Go home. My mom will remember to say I fell down when she sees it. But Shin Aya underestimated the eyes of people who had come over and immediately realized that something was wrong. Ling may happy ah. Auntie. I went to buy living supplies a few times. All stuffed in the underground warehouse. Ah. Xiao Mu bought so much. How can we eat it all? So much that it will take us 10 years to eat ah. Be prepared. Listen to us. The Qin family also made some moves. Every huge event was one that had an overwhelming impact on the family. On the group. If it was really a beast tide coming, if she, Tu Wei Lan, died in battle, what would the Qin family arrange behind it? As the eldest sister of the four families, she had to think farther ahead. On Mu Chen's side, the madness of the night two days ago, Mu Dust is also known. Shen Aya has gratitude and also now love? 
Before the Great War will give their everything to their man. Being in the main bedroom big room, how could she lose the limelight? This is her style. Come back to the warehouse in two days. This time, it was a real action. Last time, the moon god lubricant had already been applied. Otherwise who could stand Shania's body like this? Shania, this is a planetary first. Come all of them. I'm more fearless when you're here. Shania jumped onto the console, letting the eight auxiliary brackets frame the three-dimensional platform. And Muchuan had told her two days ago that he had gotten her something heaven-defying, the dual change core, and it could be upgraded to a dual variable machine girl? This was something that many kingdoms were researching, but none of them had succeeded. Makoto took out the dual change core and then took out the core of Tarahir, a golden diamond-shaped energy core that was about the size of a mango. How do I absorb this? The double change core was a golden particle of light, and because it was a system reward, it was very safe, but the core of Tarahir was somewhat dangerous. However, the scanning machine lady could absorb it. Shania's body should be able to do it. Bite and swallow the liquid inside. Shania nodded. Swallow the double change core first. High energy reaction. Machine Mahim body subjected to unfamiliar high energy increase. Fission checked. G body in double duplication. G body temperature high. The body lay on the console. Letting out a slight moan. Parched with the feeling that the body was going to split. Shania. How does it feel? It's. Strange. But. Completely fine. The workbench showed that the temperature of the G body had risen, but the G body itself was not damaged, and the reference Machinima parameters were mutating. Originally Shania's parameters were over 7000, but now they had risen to nearly 20,000. This was not the battle power, but the G body energy valuation. The scanning instrument had continued. Shania picked up the core of Terra here and bit and swallowed it. Wait, the first one hasn't stabilized yet. No need. I'm conscious now. One up. It's like you're thinking. Will there be a chemical reaction ah? Shania suddenly screamed in severe pain. High energy reaction, super high value. Danger, danger, danger. A special situation has occurred in the Mechaheim body. The light of the cold source was splitting and fusing again. Shania, danger, danger. Please slow mid remodeling. It's okay. I feel the surge of power. No need to interrupt. Special warning, Mecha energy is in short supply. Please recharge or rest in time. How is that possible? Shania's energy is full. They had checked Shania's six energy tanks when they arrived. And although only five were full, it was okay to have leftover space that way. Only now. 30 energy boxes signaled the appearance of Shania's energy with only one box left. What's going on here? Mu Chen immediately went up. Now the console had a powerful field. Going up was dangerous for ordinary people with electromagnetic wave impacts. But there was no problem with Mu Chen's physique. Immediately pressing Shania's hand. Shania. Shania gritted her teeth and felt Mu Chen's galactic heart energizing her. It's fine. I can hold on. Maxion just jumped down after charging her with half of the energy. Ah dash Shania let out a scream. Her entire body radiating silver and green light. Shania. Super energy reaction. Warning please escape. Please escape. All the instrument's various indexes exploded up to 100%. Makoto just wanted to jump on it. With Shania as the center. A rushing silver strong light broke through the sky and the entire warehouse exploded. Tomorrow, I have to go to the field during the day to do business, so I changed two chapters in the early morning, and there should be another chapter at 8 or 9 in the evening. Chapter 084 SSSR Ching Wan Space Mothership Originally, Mu Chen was hiding inside the SUA console force field and would be fine, but as a result, he rushed out to see what happened resulting in him being blown out. If he were an ordinary person, this explosion would have been half mutilated. Mu dust smashed on the ground, just brain melon buzzing some tinnitus. Suffered a bit of hard wounds, and these two seconds will be unhindered. Collapsed on the ground to see this rushing light. How is it like a digital baby has over-evolved? Shun-Aya, Shun-Aya, he worriedly climbed to his feet. The light was basically unrecognizable, those nearby felt it as an explosion. Those far away thought it was some sort of technological signal. In the Great Rift Valley of Galarbai, the Red Fire Archon looked at the sky. Higher beings? As mad as the Archon was, the Fey Emperor was a stinker in its mouth. In fact, a Fey Emperor in full victory stance was still able to threaten its existence. Mu Dust. What happened? Why did I hear an explosion on your side? Dina sent a message. Mac Dust fanned out the dust. Fluorescent green light shone on Shania. The toolbox force field was still there. Only the rest of the remodeling warehouse blew up and disappeared. Five million dollars for something really reliable. She was suspended in the air. Not relying on auxiliary planes. And the light she emitted was very gentle. Not knowing what was going on. Makoto unfolded his ability first. Ab's force field unfolds. This way it was not visible from the outside. Sorry Dina. 
I accidentally blew up the warehouse on my side. Put, are you okay? I'll take care of Yinjin first. I can say I'm experimenting. Don't let anyone come here yet. I need more time. It's a good thing we're in Yi Fire's territory. Otherwise the helicopter helicopters from the security hub would have flown in by now. The control platform unfolded again. And just now it detected a high energy shock and actually turned on the self-protection device. Heim Body Life 100. Shen Aya's Heim Body has recovered from its injuries? Energy 100. Detected as a double changing machine. Unknown key body. Report or not, no. Heim Body Scanning. Power consumption of the carrier's second mechanical form 26. 26, carrier, Makoto's eyes widened. The heavy power consumption of the earth attack vehicle was only 6 power consumption ah. Although Mu Dust did not recognize a carrier or a large drive like this machine nymph for the time being, but from the academy's information. Although she doesn't know any large drives, but from the academy's information. The largest large drive aircraft lady only has 12 power consumption, and the aircraft carrier also depends on the level. 20 power consumption is already considered high. Shin Aya this test 26 power consumption. At this moment, the light on her body slowly disappeared, and two strands of golden hair appeared on both sides of her cheeks, and the huge right armory, had silver marks, and her thighs had both sides, her clothes had blown up, at least there was nothing wrong with the exterior inspection, there was a greenish glow around her body, and her body looked like it was absorbing it, it was like many creatures had to eat the eggshells when they were born, so he waited without approaching, slowly, Shania absorbed almost as much and opened her eyes, Ding, task 5 completed. Transcendent transformation of a machine girl. S rank. Reward obtained, 9th generation SS god of destruction cannon type increaser. Shania, Shania, Makoto, it feels so comfortable. Fully awake. She landed on the particle platform and realized that her clothes were gone. You stinky guy. Sneak attacking while I'm unconscious. My dear teacher. That was you blowing up the remodeling warehouse all by yourself. She covered it sheepishly. No looking. It's all mine. You're still not allowed to look. No way. Maxion threw out the 10,000 forms clothes and turned into Shania's normal clothes. How does the body feel? Body? Shania moved around, kicked, and kicked out a sonic boom. Makoto? It's good that I didn't use you as an experiment. The body feels like there's not a small change. Makoto immediately went up to take a hand and use the system to scan Shania's body. Machine Maiden, Shania. Rank 57. Ripple, SSSR level. Moon God Blessing. Mechanical 1 form, 8th generation earth attack battle vehicle. SSR grade, mechanical 2 form, 10th generation Ching 1 space mothership, SSSR class, core 1 weapon, main weapon, SS level earth guardian shield, secondary weapon, SS level, Psy thunder splitting lance, core 2 weapons, main weapon, SSS class, shipboard hyperbolic laser cannon, secondary weapon, SSSR class, taral reflex field, multifunctional equipment, B class, broad axe bomb, B class, flash flare, multi shield, S class turbojet, talents, S class aero drive, S class, tar all barrier. SSSS class, carrier strike group. Special, proud daughter of heaven. Higher life. Pride of heaven, useful for longer life. As well as greater resilience. Higher life, the G body will ignore weapons below the 8th generation or SS level weapons. Transcend the realm of humanity. And be able to breathe freely in the universe. Ignoring the special environments of some planets. Mu Dust looked dumbfounded. Jaw dropping. What's wrong Mu Dust? Mac Chen? What's going on with my body? Ha 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 ha. Makoto suddenly laughed. Silly ah. Dear? Shania saw that he was laughing so happily. So at least it was a good thing. Shania you're strong like a monster. My wife what kind of monster is this? Makoto told Shania's data to her. Shania herself opened her own panel. SSSSR ranked ripple? How come it's level 57? You're saying that my second mechanical form is the 10th generation? SSSR level? To know that the Red Dragon Center Xinqing chief commander. That is that milky fierce white hair lowly, is only the 9th generation SSSSR machine girl, the 10th generation basically never heard of, to the 9th generation of the next generation of the machine lady and talented driver, only possible to come out of the 10th generation, the focus was on higher beings, Shinaya, you've absorbed the core of the alien life, plus my transformation, now it's beyond the normal human category, Shinaya crossed her arms, physique 425, awesome, right, Mu Chen crooked his mouth, I also have 377. What? You have 377? Shania knew that Mu Dust's physique value should be very high, but this was too high. Make Dust was also a monster. Both of them were monsters. Let's go and try outside the city. I can't wait. I'll give Dina a word first. The warehouses are blown up for her. The mechanical car drove out and Yenjin was asking Dina what they were talking about. Yenjin, we made it. 
Sorry, sorry, sorry. Shania stuck out from the passenger side. You stinky girl, making such a big commotion. Makoto apologized and transferred half a million credits to Dina. The money to rebuild the warehouse. No need. No need. I have a few more repair warehouses. What are we polite about among friends? Another thing, the experiment was particularly successful. We'll talk about wine after the crisis. Definitely. Dina was also happy for Makoto when she heard that the experiment was successful. Dina probably knew that Makoto was trying to find a way to fix Shania. Of course she knew about Shania and admired it very much. Shania was a machine mother she respected. Yen Jin will help me give a good direction to Mr. Zhang sometime. Humph. He might be a little happier if you go yourself. Shania hooked her hand at her. The Yen family and the Zhang family were close relations. I'm a prick under him well. And I'm out of the picture ready to go with someone. Yen Jin hadn't gotten married or anything. And to follow someone was a change to marriage. Which was undoubtedly saying that it was with Makoto. You quietly tell general manager Zhang Finger. My G body situation is much better. Let's go. Miu Kun. Yen Jin watched the vehicle go away. Shania's G body condition had gotten better? Is this? This true? Driving away from Heavy Cloud City, he parked the mechanical vehicle at the city gate parking space. Shania jumped up and transformed. The Earth Attack Battle Vehicle. The pleasant sound of the engine. 30 shared reserve energy tanks. How are there so many? And Shinaya drove at a fast speed. It's the first time I've seen an Earth Attack chariot that can drive 300 speed. Shinaya driving at high speed. Or in the sand almost set off a sandstorm. The sports car machine ladies on the highway were stunned. Nima, how can such a giant power consumption chariot drive so fast? Did I blink my eyes? It was as if it was about to take off. Shinaya, no one's coming. Come on. Ready. Transformation, Ching Wan Space Mothership. Chapter 085, Terrifying SSSR Class Battle Girl. There is an issue between Cloudflare's cache and your origin web server. Cloudflare monitors for these errors and automatically investigates the cause. To help support the investigation, you can pull the corresponding error log from your web server and submit it our support team. Please include the Ray ID, which is at the bottom of this error page. Chapter 086, The Beast Tide is Coming. Face the fear. The Beast Tide is expected in 8 days and 2 hours. Shania took out her savings, and even took the accompanying gift of 12 million credits that she said she would give her for her wedding at her mom Ling Mei's place. Together with her savings, the two went to 20 million to buy 30 BC-2 bombers with 30 refining 67 fighters. Although they were mechanical airplanes, ammunition and armament were money. The two really spent nothing, resulting in eating out the next day. Teacher, what is it that you are looking for me for? Xin Fei Fei didn't know what Shania was looking for her for all of a sudden. Or at the restaurant. Pay up. Xin Fei Fei? Shania's meal capacity had been boosted by two times. Next time, she should prepare some energy bars to eat. Ahem. A proper energy bar. Normal Mashinima had to eat two big bowls per meal. Shania could do six bowls. The expected beast tide is still six days and two hours away, accelerated by seven hours. Makoto was overhauling the equipment in Shania's home to make sure that the force field was stable if there was an accident. The expected beast tide is still five days and two hours away. Li Shi'i what are you doing these days? Li Shi'i had already missed school. There are five days left? Consolidating forces. I'm at least the leader of heavy cloud. But there are still mechanical forces I can mobilize. That's great. Move in together? No. The mission of the lighthouse is to pioneer and guard. I can mobilize the elite detachment. We'll be in the late stage or the crisis is larger only to act. These days let them in the organization of equipment. You and the teacher to prepare for how. She should have obtained the blessing of the moon god. Say put a few days ago the teacher to call in sick is not what you did? Eh? Cough. The teacher is now fully armed and strong as a monster. Humph. You stinky guy. Li Shi'i pouted. The teacher's charm indeed not many men could resist. How can one be armed? It can still go to the sky. Right. Go to the sky. You upgraded her thrusters? More than that. Beyond your knowledge. You gave her that core? Yes. And I got a copy of the dual transformation core for her. And now Shania is also a dual transformation machine girl. And her second form is super strong. Also SS rank? No. The technology of dual change cores has only started in various countries. That doesn't get my perverted name. SSS. What generation? 8th generation? 9th generation? Li Shi was already surprised. Not a single guess was right. None of the SSSS were right. Not the 8th or 9th generation? 10th generation Ching Wan space mothership. SSSR class. Put. Miss. What's wrong with you? Visa's voice came from over the communicator. Really? The process is still painful and risky. Can you guys transform? Tried. Luan Phoenix Heavenly Realm Warrior Girl SSSR Level. Teacher is a huge undercard. This opened a bottle of red wine for me. 
Li Shi was also happy that her teacher was one of her own. Where's mine? Li Shi sipped her wine. Vis smiled beside her. The lady never used to talk so much to anyone. It was still a bit of a jealous expression. The one that left you a card to use in case of a crisis. Oomph. That's more like it. The beast tide is expected in two days and twelve hours. The time was advanced by close to a day. Shin Aya had gotten a close-fitting combat suit for Makoto. And although he had a strong physique, it had anti-radiation and poison gas effects. The expected beast tide is still four hours away, twelve hours ahead of schedule. Today's weather Ming looked pretty good. Shin Aya went to knock on the door of the principal's office in the morning. Morong Xian was also there. Morong Xian is also here. Shin Aya, come here early? Why are you dead girl here? Colonel Wu was still eating breakfast. Came to put you on guard. Morong Xian put off all of school Wu's activities for today. Just until noon. The afternoon ones aren't possible anyway. Morong Xian cocked her head. Stinky girl, I have to go to Hang Fung for a meeting in half an hour. Shin Aya threw a punch at the alloy door. Dang dash. The entire building shook. Morong Xian was stunned dumbfounded there. The door had been beaten twisted deformed. And Shin Aya's left arm, in its mechanical form, appeared as a quantum mechanical laser cannon, with ten polygonal rings aiming at the window. Where to? This morning you do not want to go anywhere. Wu school. Now I officially announce the kidnapping of you for a morning. Just obediently sit in the office to watch the news. Colonel Wu was dumbfounded. What was the power of her punch? And what kind of cannon is this? You're wondering what kind of cannon this is, right? 10th generation SSS class shipboard hyperbolic laser cannon. The aircraft carrier came to me and I shot through her. So you don't want to leave. 10 polygonal rings. It really could be a 10th generation. Semi-mechanized? Shinaya didn't have the talent for that. Ha! Huh? Shinaya overbearingly sat on the sofa. Morong Xian went to retire the meeting. You know me. Can do it absolutely not talk much. I. I. Xiao Xian retired. Wu school looked at Shinaya also said. Shin Aya, what is the situation of your G-body? Can't say for now, but there's up to two hours left before you have to start. Advance to an hour. Look at the defense center side. Already feel the movement. A message from Makoto. One hour. Quickly pick up Wu Qin's side. It's already started. This has to be advanced. Pick up Nice Wu Qin's side? The people in the squad gathered on Macdust's side had no classes this morning. Plebeian, what's the point of calling us up so early in the morning? Missy walked in with a yawn. She found that Su Shan, Qin Fei Fei, Han Xuanyan, Qin Feng, Dong Manyan, Yu Tina, Li Shi, and even Qin Feng's little fan sister, Zhou Pan, were all called back two days ago to come to school first. Everyone didn't know what Mukin was doing by calling everyone so early. And with a stroke of Li Shi's hand, a large amount of breakfast appeared in this group meeting room. Watch the news. It's coming soon. To prevent panic we got separated. What do you mean? Watch it while you eat. School Wu's side was picking up Wu Qin. Auntie seems to be in trouble. Just half an hour ago, a high temperature reaction was detected. On Mukin's side, Zhou Yang was picking up a small window in the command hub. Mukin's side could see it. Your voices can't be transmitted. You can see for yourself. They are still suspecting it's a climatic variation. They don't believe in Shania's and Luo Tong's. Zhou Yang whispered. Qin Feng was not considered to be completely confused. The Qin family had been preparing for the past few days. And some people even suspected that the eldest sister was crazy. The image came out of the heavy cloud command hub. Several hundred people were looking at the big screen. Southwest of North Molin, a large area of high temperature was detected. And some of the experts who did so are still saying that this may be crustal activity. Volcanic plates. There was a risk of accelerated recooling. On the screen's map, the entire area was still slightly reddish. And now it did look like crustal volcanic plates floating. Shepherd Dust looked at the time. It's advanced again. There's less than 40 minutes left. Plebeian, what are you talking about? Beast Tide time. This time the Beast Tide has been advanced by more than two years. It's going to start soon. The people at the hub are probably going to start praying right now. There's nothing to prepare for. Li Shi said with a cold smile. It can't be. Didn't the news say last week that the Beast Tide might be a year and a half away? Utina and the girls watched the news every day too. The Great Rift Valley of Galarbai. The Red Fire Archon stood up awaken. My slaves. There is no reaction time given to your centers. In an instant, a worldwide alert. Alert, gathering temperature rise detected in the Galarbi Rift. Alert, sharp temperature rise in the first two. Seventh regions. Alert, early recooling of the planet's fourth plate. Alert, Class C Beast Tide prediction alert in Heavy Cloud region. Please prepare the front line of Heavy Cloud City to respond to the war. Red Dragon National Alert. Large numbers of beasts have been found in North Molin, South Yunlin, Thousand Gully Wetlands, and Mago Plains. Class B Beast Tide Alert for Heavy Cloud Region. 
Red Dragon National Alert, High Energy Reactions in the Direction of Chongyun, Red Dragon Nationwide Alert, Heavy Cloud Direction, Excessive Amount of Beast Tide Warning Level S Beast Tide Warning, Chapter 087, The First District Frontier Fallen, Zhou Yang was still holding his cup, and the people in the center still had their mouths wide open, countless people were dumbstruck, throughout the streets of Heavy Cloud City, hundreds and tens of millions of people were still ready to go to work, as if they had been petrified by a loud and escalating alarm. So how is this possible? An S-Class Beast Tide Warning? There must be an error in the Cosmic Eye Detector, right? Alert, Heavy Cloud Direction. Excessive Beast Tide Warning S-Class Beast Tide Warning. If it was really an error, the hub's people would have immediately snuffed out the alert. But, looking at the large screen, dense red dots instantly covered the entire region. North Bear, Blue Eagle, Majo, all of the nearby kingdoms sounded the alarm. In addition to the S-Level Beast Tide Warning in the direction of the Red Dragon Heavy Cloud, other kingdoms also rang with C and B level beast tides of varying degrees. Zhang Dongyuan pushed his way in. Chief Finger Zhang, S class beast tide, two years ahead of schedule. General Finger Zhang, the beast tide is on the move, moving at high speed towards our forward positions. Chief Finger Zhang Red Dragon Center is calling. Zhang Dongyuan stood beside Yen Pei, and all the other high level cadres came running. Someone even uttered a word that made the entire room cackle. The beast tide conjecture, reported by Luo Tong within a month, has really appeared. Many people took this debriefing as a joke at the time. Not many people in the entire heavy cloud, even Red Dragon, and even the world believed it. Zhang Dongyuan saw the dense red dots. S level ah, 68 years. The last time S level his own father was sacrificed in the front line. Notify all ministries. The highest crisis alert for the heavy cloud region. Yes. Chief Finger Zhang. Defense Center Earth Wind Legion deployed to support the front line. Yes. General Finger Zhang. Notify Copper Scale City and Xuan Feng City of the highest defense boundaries, and begin transporting the evacuation of the populace who have no combat power. Yes, General Finger Zhang, contact all academies, ministries, and the Heavy Cloud Crisis Headquarters, and notify them that all adult witches and pilots of rank F or above who did not take action during the last beast tide should enter a state of readiness, and the number of people should be counted within a day. Yes, Chief Finger Zhang, reply to the Red Dragon Center, request for support. Request for International Rescue Treaty Operation Support. Yes. Chief Finger Zhang. On the large screen appeared. Eight images. A large number of guards were running. This is the first sector's forward position. This is Chief Si Kong Hong. Report. We are preparing for battle at full speed. Please ask the hub how much time we have left. The beast tide is expected to arrive in an hour. Damn. So short. We can activate at most one-fifth of our equipment. Requesting support. This is the second district's forward position. This is Chief Ma Yang, reporting to the General Finger the 2nd District will defend the front line to the death. Unite as one. 3rd Sector, Jiang Kong Shang, defend the front line to the death. 4th District, Bing Yu, defend the front line. 5th District, Gong Shi Chang Mao, defend the front line. The beast tide came too suddenly. The front line positions were basically on sea level warning, with less than one fifth of the weapons in use. Zhang Dong Yuan's face was blue. At this time, the frontline positions had to delay the beast tide for time even if they fell. Fighting for time to equip Copper Scale City and Chuan Fong City. When the S-level alert comes out, the main frontier positions are basically difficult to survive. However, the voices of every general team are resounding. 6th District Kai Buatao, defend the front line to the death. 8th District Qin Zhao, the position opens to level a defense deployment. The seven layers of weapons have been warmed up. Swear to defend the front line to the death. Sector 7. Luo Tong, deploy S-Class Defense, all weapons are at full power, defend the front line to the death, all weapons on full power, 7 or 8 days ago, everyone was laughing at the 7th district, all of them laughing at Luo Tong for earning performance, now, how come the 8th district was also quietly preparing, it wasn't because the Qin family shouted, Qin Zhao was a member of the Qin family, all forward positions, never retreat, direct your own fire to respond to the battle, understood, in Xinjin, Bai Yen heard the alarm. Let's set off immediately and rush to Chongyun. All of the people from White Maple Guild were now shocked because they all knew that Makoto had said it a long time ago. Dragon Alliance Fang Tianshua was shocked and was organizing the guild's forces. Rock Elephant was in his room, watching the emergency news broadcast, pushing all the pawns used on the board, and all the cannons across the river. Early warning hot air balloons appeared over Heavy Cloud City, covering all areas. Heavy Cloud notification, the defense hub notifies everyone in Heavy Cloud to stop working. Return to their homes for shelter, and wait for a notice to prepare for war. 
Heavy cloud notice, security hub reminds all citizens not to stay on the streets. Those who cause chaos will be arrested and dealt with severely. Heavy cloud was originally a city of defense and usually had training, but the notification release still brought about no small amount of panic. Quickly go and buy supplies and stuff. Whether you're at home or you've been assigned support, you'll have to figure out what to do on your own when the time comes that you don't have enough war preparations. Heavy cloud notice, class S beast tide warning. Heavy Cloud Crisis Headquarters Notice, all adult E-Class pilots and machine girls are in a state of readiness, waiting to be recruited at any time, with no reason for refusal. The entire Heavy Cloud's 30 million pilots and pilots have all entered a state of readiness. Countless students inside the academy didn't know what to do. The higher department was all adults. Shania tore the office door open at this time. Colonel Wu, start moving. No one can run away this time. Damn girl how did you know? Don't ask so much. The big picture we are not at the same level. You are the academy commander-in-chief. Our guesses are beyond S rank this time. It's likely that the entire heavy cloud is going to disappear. Colonel Wu acted immediately and broadcast notification to the entire academy. This is Principal Wu, MS, Zhang Chuanjiao and MS, Kai Jia. Control the freshmen of the entrance department to prepare to head to the emergency evacuation area. All higher department, students, and teachers gather at the large playground. All of them. Chaos. There were many people on the streets now grabbing for necessities. Many roads were beginning to be closed. And the one million mechs and pilots of the Defense Hub Earth Wind Legion had already departed. Countless locomotives and sky transport operations. Another million resting Earth Wind Legionnaires were rushing back at a rapid pace. Two million from the Skyfire Legion are beginning to gear up. All the major powers are recalling. All locomotives and pilots above level F must wait for recruitment. Yenjin brought all the people from the security hub out. The main city couldn't be in chaos. Many people were experiencing an S-Class Beast Tide for the first time, and their current response was still the same as A-Class. Mu Chen and the others also all went to the large playground to gather. The people from the academy might individually be drawn from different departments, but basically the same army went to support a place. Most of them were in charge of transportation tasks. After all, some of the Beast Tides would fight for many days, and transporting ammunition and supplies was key. The picture of the big screen in the big playground, and the looking up at the sky. The sound of alarms was constant as thousands of transport nymphs took off in the sky and began to support the front lines. And at the Red Dragon Center, Xianqing commanded the deployment. Hangfeng Red Leaf Legion assemble immediately. 600,000 to support Chongyun. Xinjiang 200,000 air troops move out immediately. Red Leaf understands. Xing Air Force prepare to mobilize immediately. Report. 300,000 light macro legions from Shuangguang main city are mobilizing ahead of schedule to support heavy cloud. Half a million heavy armor legions are gathering. Report. 300. 000 amphibious legions from Nansha main city have already departed. And 200. 000 southern armor legions are assembling. Aside from Red Dragon's core main city. Dragon City. The other four main cities had all begun their support. Xian Chang nodded. How long before there's a firefight over at heavy cloud? The beast tide was densely packed with points of light that were pounding towards heavy clouds forward positions. Judging from the map, the beast tide's seven tier numbers were the one, two, and three frontline positions that were impacting, and the target was most likely copper scale city. Report, it is estimated that there are 17 minutes to go before the heavy clouds first sector's frontier positions engage in fire at the earliest. S class beast tide, there was basically no support for the frontier positions. All the legion support was basically going to Chuan Fong city and copper scale city. They were islands of warriors. Why would they suddenly come to attack? This broke the routine of two to three hundred years and taught countless experts a lesson. Warning, high energy alert at the forward position of the first sector of heavy cloud SSSSSS. 40,000 people in the forward position of the first district were still preparing for battle at fire speed. Suddenly, their sky turned red as a gigantic light beam of a thousand meters blasted down. The SSSSS level high energy was expected to warn only the major hub centers. But, all the hubs stood up. Frozen. Terrified, Sikong Hiroshi, Sikong Hong, Zhang Dongyuan yelled into the communication. There was only noise over there. Nationwide alert, Heavy Cloud First Sector Frontier Position, has fallen. Chapter 088 Position Firefight, Crazy Beast Tide. Chapter 088 Position Crossfire, Crazy Beast Tide. Some people had just ducked home, and some were still in the supermarket grabbing household items. There are even some people who are still laughing and talking about how they are not worried at all and that technology has been advancing over the years. Some said that they went to the Beast Tide last time, so they shouldn't be drafted this time, but it was only a few minutes apart. An alarm resounded throughout the Red Dragon country, and even the defense hubs of each country sounded the same alarm. Nationwide alert, 
heavy clouds first sector's forward position has fallen before the firefight even started. The first frontier position has fallen? What's going on? Hundreds of millions of people were dumbfounded, unable to believe this alert. Red Dragon National Alert, Beast Tide Calamity Level has been raised to SS. Dragonheart AI System Alerts, Please prepare for war throughout Red Dragon. Red Dragon Alert, Dragonheart AI System Alerts, Please prepare for war. Class SS? Hundreds of nearly a thousand years ago there was, but there was no rating for the Beast Wave at the time. At that time, the planet had 8 billion people. Backward weapons, low unity, and the Great War lasted for 10 years the total population was beaten down to less than 2 billion. How can this be? It's only been a few minutes and the first frontier position fell? What's the situation on the Red Dragon side? There are at least 30, 000 to 40, 000 fighters in the frontline position? Ah, run for your life. Panic spread. A large amount of panic spread in Copper Scale City and Chuan Fong City. Run anywhere. Running out is all alien beasts. Defending this place to the death is the best option. There were still many sensible people yelling and controlling the chaos. The Red Dragon Center, the command hub of several hundred people, and the major hubs froze. Over at the heavy cloud defense hub that could be heard on the side link. Zhang Dongyuan was still shouting loudly. Sikong Hong, Sikong Hong, please answer when you hear me. Manzi Ming, Xiang Shun, please answer when you hear me. What a front for 40, 000 men. There's no picture. The explosion created a huge magnetic field, and the picture is completely jammed. I'm. Frontier position of District 1. Battle Heim. Kabwan. Poof. She spat out blood. The frontier. Position in District 1 was struck by. Destruction. The position. All disappeared. And the copper scale. Are going to open. The highest. Alert in the sky. Jiwen. Kabwan. There is no more sound. The entire army is gone. And there has been no firefight. A forward position the size of a county town. Gone in an instant? Kapwan's war girl's last breath sent back the only intel, which was an air attack. It should have been extremely fast, they didn't react at all. Chen Dong and Xian Shang were also listening to this. Zhang Dong Yuan, Chief Secretary Chen Dong, Heavy Cloud Full Combat Readiness, Special SS Ranked Crisis Plan opened. Understood, panic spread and the sound of alarms continued. The first frontline position hadn't been stopped by a single Fei Beast, then the Fei Beast army would directly impact from here and the second frontline position would have to be flanked by the enemy as well. Heavy Cloud SS Level Alert, I am Zhang Dongyuan, the highest general director of the defense hub. The whole Heavy Cloud is ready for war. All legions are mobilized. Please all free war girls and trade unions to join in the battle to defend the Heavy Cloud. This time it is the highest SS level beast tied in the history. The whole Red Dragon will face the crisis. The highest readiness for war is now. All people are ready to listen to the recruitment at any time. SS Class Beast Tide. Teachers don't even dare to teach. S-Class would be rumored to be terrifying. The various forces have gathered. The first frontier position has fallen. The SS-Class is too terrifying. It might be an extermination level high level beast killing. This is going to be the end. Let's listen to the recruitment. Take all the weapons in the bottom of the box. The commander of the first frontline position is Seacomb Hong. Right? It's the driver of the SS Warjack. A talented young man who was reported in the news only two years ago. It's just gone? That handsome general team, it was super popular at the time. It's gone. I heard that 40, 000 people from the first district position were all wiped out. Mom, I'm afraid. Countless noisy voices. Not many people thought that the disaster came so quickly. Ordinary people could only listen to a loud manual warning system briefing, as well as defense and security center announcements. A large number of people have already begun to register, and began to gather at the fit as required. The cannon girl camp, the flying girl camp, the locomotive camp, were ready to depart at any time, the other side, the screen that the command hub could see, the second frontline position screen, densely packed alien beasts rushed in, their eyes blood red, Chief Mayang stood on the city wall, there were 43,000 machine nymphs and pilots in the second sector, they all knew about the news of the fall of the first district, but as the front line, they absolutely could not retreat, the beasts at the front of the line could be seen clearly, the cattle class twice mutated beasts, the ferocious class iron horned green bull, as well as the wolf class once and twice mutated, the worm class red blood wolf and the ferocious class bloodthirsty giant wolf. These beasts were more than three times larger than the beasts of a thousand years ago, and their defenses and impacts were several times more terrifying. You can also see a large number of ferocious silver eagles, strange beasts, ferocious vine monsters, ferocious flint monsters. There were different types all with red eyes, violent and wild as they rushed towards the position. The eyes of these alien beasts are not right. It's faster than the previous beast tide onslaughts. 
It's like they're on stimulants. The people from the hub immediately analyzed. Their blood agitation rate has increased by 200%, making them harder to deal with. All the weapons that could be used began to aim, and Ma Yang took a deep breath and waited until they were within range. Fire. The five scorpion giant cannons shot out twin two blue lasers. All the alien beasts in a straight line were killed in seconds, and only exploded when they blasted at the ground level alien beasts. Fire into the air. The sound of swish 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 pulses as 100 ground to air electromagnetic cannon shot this beams. The city wall metaforce field and AAS force field unfolded. Metaforce field energy durability 48. AAS force field energy endurance 31. 100 gamma rockets fired. The first three, 000 mechas transformed on the city walls. Full complement of gun girls, from 5th to 7th generation weapons, all fire. Boom 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 boom. The screen was a sea of explosions. Air units respond to the battle. Special air units 1, 2, and 3 take off. Yes, 2000 majority of the flying hind transformed, and various fighters and helicopters took off to battle the silver round eagles alien beasts in the air. Defense team 2, prepare your weapons, the trucks and other vehicle body mechas armed howitzer types attacked. For the first time, the second front line position fought well, third front line position engaging Fei, fourth front line position engaging the Fei. The gap between the major front line levies before and after was less than 10 minutes and they began to exchange fire. At first, the heavy firepower barely suppressed it, but less than 10 minutes into the firefight, it was met with the fey beasts rushing in to enter, as only one-fifth of these forward position weapons were able to be used immediately, most weren't assembled and lifted out, the first and second waves were relying on the aircraft ladies to carry weapons to suppress them, the second frontier position my young general team also and vice team transformed into a war girl, while firing guns and commanding, but there were too many alien beasts, he had to face more than 100, 000 alien beasts in one frontline position. Just now it was still an appetizer. And immediately the black pressurized fey beasts came. It's here again. Chief my young. It's all. So many earth level foreign beasts. If the bug level and ferocious level are just mutated huge beasts and bugs, then the earth level foreign beasts that have mutated four or five times are the real monsters. It might take three rounds of gamma rockets to kill one. The manufactured weapons in the human frontline positions other than the scorpion laser cannon and the talon giant cannon, were not quite enough to kill them anymore. There are too many, densely packed earth level alien beasts are coming. The number was even more than the fierce level. Deadly battle. All of the war girl squad. Yes, together with my young, there were just nine battle maidens in the battle maiden second district frontier position. All of the organic nymphs and harnessers were on fire. Berserker six roared. Sound blocker five interfered with the signal. And the images and sounds seen in the center began to blur. Dryad 2 was a minotaur with six steel horns. And Destroyer 1 was a frost-breathing alien tiger with wings that could fly low. What's that? There's a fire kunai. The images were gone and the position began to go haywire when sounds were heard. Human screams began to appear. Some of the women in the command hub even turned their heads. Dead guard, dead guard. The fae from the first sector on the left are rushing over as well. Come on people. Go defend the left side. Hold on. Every ten more minutes of delay. We can help the 5 million people of Copper Scale City to delay for 10 more minutes. The Space Brigade is coming to support us. Frontier Position Number 2. Our Heavy Cloud 9 Team Air Force. Coming to reinforce us. 300 ships of human-driven Air Force. Plus 2,000 remote-controlled mechanical fighters came to support. Even so, the mechanical man-made weapons, with limited power, could only stall for time. The Dryad 2 crashed into the defense wall. And the Fire Cohen directly crushed down. There were tons of explosions and screams. The 2nd and 4th districts were battling each other extremely miserably. The 3rd and 5th zones were also very unpromising. The 6th, 7th, and 8th districts were about to respond to the battle as well. This is heavy cloud boundary young Saiken. It's not good. A large number of airborne alien beasts have rushed through the boundary defense at an extremely fast speed. The number of them is 2 to 3,000. Rushing through the boundary and are wanting to rush towards heavy cloud city. Alert! Alert! 3! 000 alien beasts are attacking from the sky above heavy cloud city. Please prepare for battle. Chapter 089, Sky Attack. Warrior G responds to the battle. Alert, 3. 000 foreign beasts are attacking from the sky above heavy cloud city. Please prepare for battle. Alert, 3. 000 earth great face swiftwinders 3 are approaching the main city of heavy cloud at great speed. The 30 million or so people in the main city were confused. There was actually a stream of these foreign beasts rushing directly towards the main city. Is this a way to give us a head start? Li Shi and the others were assembled in the playground. And many of the students were a bit panicked upon hearing this news. 
The Swiftwinders 3 was an extremely fast-flying Earth-class fay with a 3-meter body of black-brown bats that had gone through five mutations capable of spewing out destructive sound waves to kill humans in seconds. Air defense system activated. Zhang Dongyuan immediately gave the order. The ground-to-air pulse cannons on the city walls were activated. This is Yenjin. Security hub listen to my order. All fight on the ground. All flying G and adaptive pilots are all ready to lift off and fight. On the city walls and all the high buildings, anti-aircraft pulse cannons appeared. And the underground of the core building split apart and the building began to move downward to protect the core building. Shania's parents watched the news and briefings at home. Now, they understood that a few days ago, Makoto and Shania were so serious about overhauling and upgrading the house's force field, as well as also buying a lot of supplies. It was like they knew in advance. Coming dash. Knock knock knock. Knock knock. Knock knock. The anti-aircraft pulse cannons opened fire. Colonel Wu crossed his arms. Don't panic. Our heavy cloud is a city of defense. A city of guardianship. It's not a few hundred years ago. This point of alien beasts can't help us yet. Heavy cloud notice. The entire city's air defense system is activated. A total of four. 357 pulse anti-aircraft guns are activated. A large number of alien beasts corpses will be dropped. Please pay attention to concealment and open the house force field. Heavy cloud notification. Citywide defense system activated. Mechanical mobile warrior Z activated. Please maintain the original support routes for the front line. The pulse cannons fired wildly into the air. 10 rounds weren't enough. So 20 rounds would be enough to stuff these attacking xenomorphs. The dazzling colorful light was like a curtain of rain. Countless people watched with a solid heart. Some of the swiftwinders that had just rushed up were shot up. And those that had rushed down were all surrounded by the people from the security hub. As well as the mechanical mobile warriors. The number doesn't seem to be 3000. Only a thousand or so. Mu Chen also looked at the sky. This is the Heavy Cloud ZB-3 Transportation Squadron. Our 1-000 transport nymphs just took off and left the Heavy Cloud main city. We were besieged by thousands of alien beast Swiftwinders 3. We can't land. The transportation is all gunships. Requesting for support. Requesting for support. Heavy Cloud notification. ZB-3 Transport Squadron is 5 kilometers away from the main city of Heavy Cloud. Besieged by the Beast Raptor 3. The Air Force has gone to the front line to support. Heavy Cloud City. There are guilds and freedom war girls, or more than the sixth generation of the combat flying girl. Please support immediately. The transporters were pulling the eight. Zero 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 cannon girls and two. Zero 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 pilots of the Earth Wind Army. The transporters in high altitude could not fight at all. Unless they could transform into individual battle fly heim. On the rock bishop's board, his pawns besieged the opponent's cannons. As long as one knew the ZB squadron, one knew that the transports were all heavy firepower. There were 3,000 heavy cloud human piloted mechanical air forces, all of which were already on the front lines, including 50,000 remote controlled fighter groups. The ZB3 transportation squadron absolutely couldn't be okay. Fifi, go. Mu Chen shouted. Qin Fei Fei came out and instantly transformed into a heavenly whale transport. And under the gaze of all the higher ministry students, Mu Chen jumped on. Fusion, transformation. Light flashed as the heavenly scenic war girl appeared. The thrusters set off a huge wave of wind rushing into the sky, toppling many of the students in the playground. But it was all cheering. Charge. It's so cool. Go and dry smash those foreign beasts. Mac Chen and Qin Fei Fei. Of course school Wu wouldn't stop it. The heavenly scene war girls rushed up into the sky. And countless people from heavy cloud city looked at the sky. Seven or eight light armored battle ages AE. More than ten SN armored battle ages. Ling Kong battle ages. Qin Fei Fei's mother. Song Feng battle ages. Red Maple War Girl, Blue Sky War Girl, and one of the three deputy commanders of the Defense Center SS Class Moon God War Girl. 50, 60, 70, able to fly war girls, almost all of them from the major guilds, as well as a few free war girls all flew towards the target. Mutually is considered to know each other. A lot of Battle G did not expect. Tian Jing Battle G, isn't it that student? Actually came as well. Gentlemen, although we are more or less sparring and cooperating, but the scene is chaotic. It's best for all of you to pull off the fight. Moon God Battleheim commanded. At the same time, there were also 500 remote control fighters coming from the sky in support. You can use the fighters as cover. That's all that can be mobilized and split up right now. Leave it to us. Skitters 3 is not enough to worry about. More than 70 battle girls flew at high speed and immediately saw the area under siege. A thousand transport nymphs had already lost one fifth of them to forced landings and injuries. Most of the others were hanging on to their colors. We're here. ZB3 transport squadron leave at full speed. Those who can move run to the battlefield. Lunar God Wargirl was in command. All sorts of weapons were flashed. Jean Fei Fei's mom flew past. You guys be careful. 
Careful, there was no need for it at all. Jean Fei Fei raised her hand, and against the swift winders that were going to swoop down low, she came up with a vicious job, flare X, boom 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 boom, explosion across a thousand meters. Nima, the other seventy odd battle girls, they weren't frightened by the more than two thousand earth level alien beasts that rushed in, they were frightened by Mu Chin. The air was covered in a mist of blood. One move down kills a hundred in seconds. What kind of weapon is this? The destructive power can be ah. When many battle maidens were surprised, the heavenly whale giant scythe in her hand rotated, power propelled, and s gifted polymerization power driven. The first to rush into the group of foreign beasts, the giant sickle in her hand swept across, first to cut off two heads. Wow, Tu Wei Lan, are you sure that's your daughter and not your sister? I feel fierce. The Ling Kong war girl was surprised next to the Tsung Fung war girl. Are you looking for a fight? My Fifi certainly inherited my strength. Tu Wei Lan said but was equally surprised. Facing the siege, the heavenly scenery war girl rotated her giant sickle to cut a bloody path, sweeping left and right, and dodging all that could be dodged in the face of the spraying waves of destruction. If they couldn't dodge, they immediately used their thickly armored positions to resist. Battle experience and action reaction. Definitely a battlefield expert. How was this like a student? Just outrageous. Better than me. Spitting after spitting, all of the other war girls rushed up to battle. At this moment, Heavy Cloud 7's Cosmic I gave this side of the battle screen and relayed it to the main city. More than 70 battle maidens were furiously fighting an aerial battle of more than 2000 earth level alien beasts. It's the footage of Qin Fei Fei and Mu Chen and the others. So fast. So fast. The battle of girls shuttled and cut through the foreign beasts. Deliberately cutting to this side of the screen was also to let the people of Heavy Cloud City settle down, which was now in chaos and panic. Only seeing the battlefield with their own eyes and seeing the power of the battle maidens made people feel at ease. The heavenly scene war girl killed out, turned around and threw out the heavenly whale giant scythe, spinning and cutting through the three foreign beasts, her hands clasped at her waist, and the booming sky twin cannons opened fire. Boom 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 boom. Knocking the six alien beasts that rushed up into mincemeat, he extended his right hand again. The heavenly whale giant scythe flew back just in time to catch it. Ah, so handsome. That's Chin Fei Fei. Isn't this war girl the student from the last news report? Yeah, so powerful? Crap, she's even going straight into battle, facing so many alien beasts. Seeing this image, there was also a special display with text. Machine Lady, Chin Fei Fei, a student of the higher department of Heavy Cloud Academy. Pilot, Heavy Cloud Academy Higher Department Student. Defense Hub Deputy Instructor Mu Chen. Damn, kids who are only 18 or 19 years old aren't afraid. What are we people afraid of? That's right, come on. Wife wait for the levy will go and blast those foreign beasts as well. Husband, I, I'm a fuel pipe car ah, fire and blow up. Chapter 090, Fighting in Blood. Shania supports the front line. The heavenly scene war girl killed in a big way. She flew in the air. The two swift winders behind her hissed and attacked, only to see her move like a swift wind in dodging. Turning around was a sickle to chop off these two beasts. Quite an expert style. The grace of the strong. No matter which angle you sneak attack, it was dodged. That heavenly scenery Battleheim is so powerful. The sense of existence is drawn out. Are they really students? They're really dazzling. The other battle girls were also fully armed, firing all sorts of weapons, and Mu Chen and Qin Fei Fei didn't kill the most, but they were definitely the most conspicuous. Small in age, large in stature. Qin Fei Fei's body was already hot. The figures of the battle girls were all closely related to the machine maidens. ZB3 Transportation Squadron thanks you all for the rescue. ZB3 Transportation Squadron 724 Transportation Heim continue to head in the direction of Chuanfeng City. Injured machine nymphs please treat and wait in place for ZB4 Squadron to support the transportation. The warjacks were on fire and the skitters were far from being a match for these experienced warjacks. The number was drastically decreasing. On the side of the heavenly scene wargirls, Qin Fei Fei tried to decentralize as much as she could to give more control to Mu Chuan. Her brain consciousness and battle awareness slowly following Mu Chuan's lead. In human form. Her weighted and delicate body wasn't too flexible, but the battle G form was different. Shepherd Dust took her, and the battle maiden form took the average value to make them look strong. The foreign beasts in the sky above Heavy Cloud City were all wiped out, and this side is also nearing the end. Many people in the Heavy Cloud Command Hub breathed a long sigh of relief. In the direction of the main city, the first wave was considered relatively easy to deal with. Yen Jin, bring someone to count the injuries. Dong Fong Chung, Bring people to dispose of the alien beast corpses. Yes, Chief Finger Zhang. The most dangerous thing right now was not the main city, but the frontline positions. Based on past experience with beast tides, they all lasted for a period of time and were divided into waves. 
There were highly intelligent commanders among the foreign beasts that would command to regroup before impacting again. Even if it was a C-class beast tide, it would probably hit two or three times. History had recently seen an S-class beast wave hit for a month. Seven images on the main screen. All in a frenzy of fighting, slowly the images began to blur. Only barely able to hear the sound. Fey sound blockers were jamming the signal. Screams and explosions. Fifth Air Force unit arriving at forward position. Sector 5. Watch out for firebombs. Mechanical fighter attacks are ineffective. Use extreme freezing rounds, then penetrating sea-breaking rounds. These damn beasts. I'll fight you all. The main gate of Team Tsai has been breached. We can't retreat. If the machine girl is surrounded, activate the cold source core and self-destruct. Forward positions in Sector 4. Retreat to the central gate area. It's only been an hour. Alert, a large number of beasts are approaching within 10 kilometers of Copper Scale City. The number is expected to be over 100. 000. The defenders of Copper Scale City are requested to respond to the battle. Hold on to Bronze Scale City. The 1 million advance group of the Earth Wind Army will arrive in 2 hours. Report, here, the 011 ST Earth Wind Regiment has been intercepted by thousands of beasts led by Emperor Class Beasts. The 011 SC Army will fight on the spot. Report, the 012 Corps of the Earth Wind Corps has been intercepted by thousands of Fey led by Emperor Class Fey. The 011 Corps will fight on the spot. The 013 TH Army is being attacked by a huge number of beasts. They're fighting back. Earth Wind's fastest 1 million mechanical nymphs and harnesses were divided into three regiments. And as a result, all of them were delayed. Zhang Dong Yuan's expression was gloomy as the command hub punched the screen. How is it that all of our support has been blocked? What kind of prejudgment does this Fey Beast's commander have, delaying all of our people? Wouldn't ZB3 squadron be delayed even if they had a large number of battlegirls to assist them? Xian Qing looked at the distribution of the battlefield as she narrowed her eyes. It's as if the other side knows our deployment. Chill bird. In. Lord Zhenqing. Notify the heavy cloud division judges to start moving. Division judges were people who specialized in catching viruses. And Xian Qing's first thought was that there was a mole. Could it be that there really were humans who had cooperated with the Fey? This was originally conjecture, but many things had slowly made this conjecture more and more real in recent years. Mu Chen and Qin Fei Fei flew back as they lifted their transformed forms and landed on the academy's playground. Too handsome. Qin Fei Fei give me an autograph. Too handsome. Too handsome. Envious to death. Yutina gave a thumbs up over here. Beldet crossed her arms and pouted. Humph. If this young lady transforms, she's definitely more powerful than them. Li Shi gave Mukin with a look, Shen I ran away. Mu Dust? What's the situation? Li Shi signaled him to look at the communication. Teacher said he went to support a wave first. Makoto immediately went to the side, Shinaya. You went in the direction of the 7th district? My dear. I'll return as soon as I go. This first wave of impact from the Fei Beasts is too fierce. Zhou Yang said that with the Fei Beasts' current layout, the first wave wants to break through our copper scale city. In order not to be told off by Mu Chen, Shinaya's darling was used. According to my analysis, the frontier position 1234 is basically impossible to hold. Then the idea of the great monarch is to penetrate the 1234 frontier position. And then the first wave will break through the copper scale city. And the main force will push straight to the heavy cloud city. So the 5678 position is facing the fey beasts a lot less. And the amount of fey beasts lined up on this side may just destroy the Chuanfeng city as much as possible. And if there's a frontier position to block the Shinaya's analysis is reasonable. In other machine mother to go. What is the use of one? But she is different. And her nature. Let her wait at the academy for tomorrow's departure. Cannot endure. I. I will. Definitely be with you next time. Shinaya knew that she was impulsive. Be careful. Do not blame me. Blame you useful. You come back and see if I don't open up your ass to the teacher. Shinaya kissed the sound of the screen. Makoto was too aware of her. Li Shi came over just in time to hear the kissing sound. She brought a cold grunt. I knew the teacher couldn't help it. She just drove away and I didn't go and say anything. Look at the principal looking around now. I guess it's been screened. Wu school looking around for goddaughter. Can not find. The message was blocked. Poor look at the pastor dust this godson. Shepherd dust sent her a message that Shania had rushed to the front line. She's crazy. School Wu directly cursed out. The entire school was quiet and looked at her. Embarrassed. Ahem. All students wait here. Immediately the people from the crisis preparation hub are going to come to count. Beldet and Utina and the girls leaned over. Still according to the original plan. If we're not grouped together. We'll pick up the squad channel when the time comes. And I'll call everyone to the battle together if there's any news. Shin Aya went unnoticed. She was now a severely high body damaged machine girl. And no one would count her out. Recruitment wasn't in the cards either. She flared the defense hub. 
flew a plane, and headed directly in the direction of the seventh sector. All of Red Dragon was concerned about the war situation over here, with half of the world's countries now experiencing sudden beast waves. However, the highest other places were at level B, just the Red Dragon SS level. Rescue teams from several countries were already assembling. Hold on for two hours. At least there's no notification of a second forward position being breached yet. In the direction of Copper Scale City, there has been a firefight with the alien beasts charging over from the first sector. The city's giant cannons and quantum cannons are all being activated. Copper Scale City is not a frontline position. The city has over 5 million people. All the organisms and pilots have been conscripted. Even if only one-fifth of the equipment was functioning, the 100. 000 alien beasts that had come from the first district for the time being were not a problem. In the direction of the west gate of Copper Scale City, a large number of Imperial level foreign beasts have been spotted. Watch out for the fire cones in the sky. But if the others arrive one after another. Frontier Position Ministries. What's the situation now? Please answer if you receive. Please reply if you receive. Ha! With a decapitating roar? This is the second frontline position. This is Chief Team Myung. Our number of casualties is predicted to be super over 30,000. We are dying to defend the last gate. Air Force Ministries have all sacrificed. Sector 2 forward positions. Defend to the death and by time. Alert. Beast tide detected in Hangfong City's forward positions. Expected to be a Class B calamity. Alert. Collection found in Nansha City's C front position. Expected to be a Class B calamity. Chapter 091. Frontline Commander Shania. How is it possible? There's a beast tide in Hangfong in Nansha as well. The hub centers of Nansha and Hangfong immediately sounded the alarm. Zhang Dongyuan's low voice, the commander of this foreign beast is doing this on purpose so that the Red Leaf Legion and Amphibious Legion cannot support our heavy cloud side. This is the Red Leaf Legion V81, V82, V83. We have encountered tens of thousands of foreign beasts on our front. We are fighting back and retreating back to the nearby towns. This is the Amphibious Corps Advance Regiment. We've encountered a large number of beasts on the sea. We're fighting back. Requesting reinforcements from the Southern Armor Corps. The support from the north and south of the map was temporarily blocked. Mu Chen and Li Shi were able to see the small screen. It was Zhou Yang who pointed the camera at the main screen. Shen Aya's analysis is good. It's probably the Red Flame Archon in command with the people lurking on our side. Li Shi whispered. It's obvious to split their forces to block our support from the south and north. The air power they think is stronger. And the numbers and weapon power are lacking. Shepherd Dust was thinking. Copper Scale City's current 100, 000 foreign beasts are not a threat. The highest intensity is the three-headed Imperial level. The current firefight is good for Copper Scale City. I'm afraid that the other side will still be able to retreat and wait for the second and third strand of foreign beasts to converge. Report. The first wave of Fey beasts in Copper Scale City's defense line suddenly retreated and retreated to a direction 5 kilometers away. Commander Lin Tong applied to go out of the city to pursue them. Most of the people in the command hub disagreed. Zhang Dongyuan knew that this was an opportunity, but it was obvious that the other party had a high extermination level Fey Beast commander. It was most likely a trap. There were a wide range of Fey Beasts. There were those that could not be scanned, or those that lurked on the ground. Negate the application. Have Lin Dutong speed up preparations for defense. It was Shin Aya who then led people to rush out. This side of the academy. Li Shi blankly glanced at Mu Chen. Mu Dust was embarrassed. It's not like I commanded it. It's just that he guessed right. This is the second district frontline position. We, the Ma Yang general team, we estimate that there are still 10,000 people dying to defend the last gate. This is the third sector's forward position. Our vice general team Jiang Wu, we still have nearly 20,000 or so, holding down the third gate. Chief team Jiang Kangsheng just died with an imperial level alien beast. This is the fourth sector frontier position. I'm chief team Bingyo. We were attacked by a large area of fire chuns and alien beasts in the sky. We're guarding the final gate. The sky may have released some alien beasts in the past. This is the fifth frontier position. Gong Shi Chang Mao's general team has already been sacrificed. The vice team Reed Ran has also been sacrificed. I am the communication captain Kong Yutong. We still have 10,000 people holding down the last gate. There are generally five gates in the frontline positions. The center gate is the third. And after the fifth gate it's a flat river. It was too miserable. Actually, it wasn't just here in the playground where Mu Chen was peeking. Like Zhao Pengfei's side and some of the clans and groups, all of them were now listening to the sound, but not the picture. Frontier position 2345 can barely hold on, it's only been more than two hours. At the entrance of the academy, Yen Pei had already arrived immediately with the crisis department, and all of the academy teachers had been drafted. Apart from Principal Wu, the injured machine girls, all the other teachers would soon be going to the front line. 
following the transporters to Chuan Fong City. The current deployment is for the idle forces of each power to go to Chuan Fong City, and all the core forces of the military department to go to Copper Scale. The second, fourth, and fifth frontline positions were sacrificed horribly, all with only the last gates left. A large number of corpses of alien beasts in the frontline positions. The heroic machine girls all turned on self-detonation, using their last lives to take away the alien beasts. The third frontier position was in the center gate. This is the sixth sector frontier position. This is Chief Kai Buotao. We are holding the fourth gate. There are still 30, 000 people fighting. This is the eighth sector forward position. This is Qin Zhao. We've just retreated to the second gate. Sacrifice is estimated at 3000. This is the seventh sector's forward position. We still have 11 meta force fields and 13 gamma force fields. Sacrifice estimate 400 and are doing our best to stop the alien beasts. The main gates of the seventh sector are all still standing. Luo Tong, hold the seventh sector. By time for Chuan Fong City, Zhang Dongyuan spoke. Luo Tong that was considered to be encouraging news. The five, six, seven and eight districts were facing about the same number of foreign beasts. This was the effect of having all the firepower and all the weapons and spare equipment all available at the first time. This couldn't be blamed on the other districts. 4-1. None of the centers had predicted it, except for very few, and the Archon's descent was the first in hundreds of years. 4-2. Equipment and recharging were both consuming a lot of resources, and each frontline position was fixedly dispensed, and every commander actually wanted to put good steel to good use. Luo Tong reported his idea. It was treated as a joke because of the lack of evidence. Everything has to be logical and evidence-based. Even Luo Tong couldn't do it. Not to mention Mu Chen's current status. Going to report it, he might even be arrested. Understood. The 7th district will definitely fulfill its mission. Kai Buotao blew up the intersection to the north of you. Let some over. You kid. Oh you a favor. Then pay attention. Kai Buotao immediately blew up the mountain so that some of the alien beasts in the back would charge towards the 7th district. Relieving a little bit of the pressure. With the 6th district gone. The 7th district would also be flanked by enemies. This was the barrel effect. The command of the Fey Beast commander could only command to attack, retreat, stay, and specify the direction. After all, Fey Beasts below the Emperor level really don't have much intelligence, except for the individual ape-type Fey Beasts. Currently, the alien beasts in zones 5, 6, 7, and 8 should have received orders to destroy the human positions, as well as to gather in the swamp forest of Chuan Fong City. Team Luo. You and Lieutenant Tu Lian should retreat to the second gate. Leave this place to us. What are you talking about? You and Lieutenant Tu have repeatedly transformed three times and rushed out to kill the enemy. You're all having problems walking. To put it bluntly, you're now in a state with no combat power. Please retreat to the second gate and take command. Leave this place to us. Luo Tong's men were also daring. The second class squad pointed at the sixth class metropolitan's nose and said. These voices were heard by the command hub as well. It wasn't just Luo Tong and Tu Lian. The general squads of the 8 districts were all rushing out to kill with the machine girl transformed wargirls, doing their best to minimize the onslaught. Several of the district's total teams held out until the center, and died in battle after not having enough transformation energy for the second time. The wargirl transformation energy consumption was huge and time was limited. Luo Tong had actually gone soft on both legs and had no strength. I'm the general team, how can I back off? I'll take command here. Luo Tong, you retreat to guard the second gate. Zheng Dongyuan snapped. No way. The general is outside the military orders. Luo Tong is also head iron. Not to mention the frontline positions. This is only the first wave of the beasts. Chuan Fong City and Copper Scale City in the latter waves may not be able to defend. Luo Tong, roll to the back and rest. You prepare to guard the central station gate. I'll take command. A woman's scolding voice came from the communicator. Who dared to yell at Luo Tong to roll in the 7th district? Who yells at me to roll? Shania? Shania? Shepherd Dust and Li Shi covered their faces. Shen Aya had already arrived. Luo Tong was still tiger like a moment ago, but when he saw Shen Aya, he immediately became turtle like. Shen Aya? The people in the command hub were dumbfounded. Shen Aya that body went to the front line? Luo Tong, give you two hours to rest, go and then guard the center. Bring the communicator over. Now I'm the seventh district command. Shen Aya watch your back. Behind her, a Swiftwinders 3 went through the anti-aircraft guns and rushed towards Shen Aya. She turned around in a domineering manner and punched with a breaking sound. Boom dash. The beast was smashed into blood mist by Shania. All of the nearby Sector 7 warriors were dumbfounded. Shania held a cigarette. Luo Tong. Still not rolling. Someone come. Give me this various Luo Tong to rack away. Yes. Shania deputy temporary chief. 
Chapter 092 Shinaya Crazy Raid 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 Shinaya temporarily took over command of the 7th sector of the frontline position. Luotong was sedated by the double ponytail squad leader Zhong Qingqing's sneak attack and pulled to the central defense line to rest. Such a thing. It is estimated that only the 7th district can, or a character like Shinaya do it. Basically, they all know Shinaya, and several of the captains are comrades in arms. Shinaya's reputation and image had always been very good in the hub. I am Shinaya the temporary general team of the 7th region, the hub side is temporarily in contact with me. The corners of Zhang Dongyuan's mouth twitched, and the entire command hub tension was dispersed by her. This Shania even had a few witches who did not hold back their laughter. The Red Dragon Center was also able to hear it, but both Chen Dong and Xian Qing did not speak. First of all, Luo Tong has killed a 3 and 3 out, but anyone who has transformed can imagine that he is now soft in both legs. It is difficult to walk, and his mind may not be clear. It was good to have someone to take over the command. At this time of crisis, as long as everyone trusted Shania, it was perfectly fine to fight at his command. It was like the 5th district's general team and vice team were all killed in action. And now 10,000 people were listening to a communication captain in command. They didn't see that Shania's dominating punch. The human hand tearing apart an earth level alien beast shook all those who saw it. All of them, after all the Gunji's fire in one round, immediately retreat to the second gate. Understood. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. On the city walls, the 5th, 6th, and 7th generations, the 219 type self propelled howitzer girls, the Knob 252 type self propelled howitzer girls, and the Yachts 2000 self propelled howitzer girls, type PL 205A 155mm howitzer G, type 2 to 8875cm anti aircraft gun G, type 223 37mm battle defense gun G, all open fire. Boom, boom, boom. One round of bombardment completely retreat. Metaforce field is going to be gone. Enter the second gate and fill it immediately. Prepare to cover the tank G. Yes, Chief Shania. More than 2000 Gunheims opened fire and immediately transformed back into their human form and retreated towards the second gate. Anti-aircraft gun squares. Fire indiscriminately at the dense area. 800 ground to air pulse electromagnetic cannons frantically hit. Clattering. Green crystalline colored pulse waves shot wildly at the airborne alien beasts. Report. 274 gamma rocket launchers are filled. Fire. Undiscriminatory attack on the front battlefield. Yes. A bombardment. All the weaponry was available. A sea of fire. And the alien beasts screamed in agony. Tank Chi all gather outside the second gate and prepare to bombard the first wave of incoming foreign beasts. Understood. There were more than a hundred tank Chi, And a third of them had drivers. All transformed into a line in front of the second gate. When the gate shattered the metaphors field was not there. The alien beasts could storm down and enter melee combat fights. 30 Talon cannons. Fire. Shinaya picked up the heavy weapon pulse cannons on the walls one in each hand. Fire at the bottom. Tulian looked dumbfounded. This heavy weapon pulse cannon was heavy and needed to be set up on the city wall for three people to work together to fire. Shinaya held it in one hand, cigarette in her mouth, and fired furiously at the alien beasts crashing into the city wall. It was important to realize that only the seventh sector metaphors field was still in place with the occasional image reaching the hub. The image was just clear for a few seconds before Shania's image was seen. Xian Qing and the others, the several hundred people in the command hub all saw it. Shania had one foot on the city wall and two hands on her heavy weapon pulse cannon, and she was standing at the front. Surge 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 surge, fired wildly at the bottom of the city wall. The other machine nymphs began to retreat according to tactics, and she was still there. Zhou Yang and their mouths were wide open. Wang Chunfang and Zhang Lingmin's eyes stared into fish eyes, only to see the two guns in Shania's hands overheating and needing to cool down. She throws them down and an explosion occurs, blowing up a few heads. First, take a smoke and exhale. A ground level alien beast Windthurster 8 rushed and jumped up, opening its bloody mouth at her. Shania's body turned to avoid it while grabbing its tail, and the 3 meter Windthurster was thrown down with a petulant shout. Roll dash, then pick up the other two heavy weapons pulse cannons next to it, and once again burst into a sweeping shot at the bottom. Good. So strong. She. So handsome. Crap. Crouching. Shania crouch. Can't stand it. She's so handsome. Handsome. Shania is awesome. The people in the command hub spit out their hometown language furiously. Colonel Wu was also watching Ah, She almost had a heart attack. Shania. Go. Force field is gone retreat to the second gate. Still two Lian came before shouting to move. Shania threw her weapon. The first gate was shattered and the alien beasts impacted and entered. Shinaya mounted two Lian transformed machinery and flew back on the citadel, rushing back to the second gate. Tank G, open fire. 
Boom 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 boom. The bombardment was positioned to detonate all the weapons on the city walls, shattering the swarm of alien beasts that rushed in. Then the tank GI transformed back into their human forms, and the people on the gates dropped their teleportation chains and pulled them all up. The cooperation was very tacit. Five Talon mega cannons, two scorpion beam cannons, and 200 ground-to-air pulse electromagnetic cannons were all destroyed and exploded by the alien beasts that rushed in. These alien beasts were desperate to impact. The 100, 000 fey beasts in sectors 2, 3, and 4 were killed by an estimated 30, 000 to 40, 000, but the defense line was going to be unable to hold out. The first wave of fey beasts on the 5, 6, 7, and 8 district side was estimated to be 70, 000, and again 30, 000 to 40, 000 were killed. As far as the cosmic ice screen was concerned, the red dot in the 7th sector's energy area still had about 20, 000 foreign beasts left in the first wave. The transmission screen is blurred and only sound can be heard. The force field disappears the signal is interfered with. The 7th area does have two-thirds of the heavy weapons left. Chief Shania. The south side is estimated to have nearly 10,000 alien beasts coming from the 6th sector, blowing up the mountains. The temporary spillover of alien beasts from the 6th sector came over. GG, Ku Ingwang, and whoever that is, I can't call out the name. You war G squad, take 8,000 people and take charge of the south first. Yes, Chief Teen Shania. Shania looked at the side, Tulian aren't you going to rest? I'm fine. I'll join you. Luo Tong will rest for a while and then transform with Zhong Qingqing. Tu Lian joined her. Is your body okay? Shania smiled evilly. I'm not okay? Mechanizing one hand. She pointed it at the sky and a laser shot out. It penetrated that earth level alien beast, the black and white king eagle. And the top 10 threatening alien beasts were killed by her in ultra long range seconds. I'm not afraid of anyone now. Really? Tu Lian picked up a 6th generation pulse gun and fought side by side. Without the meta force field. A large number of fey swooped down, and there were fey climbing up the gates. Shania took the heavy weapon and the two fought shoulder to shoulder. On the left and right sides, more than 2,000 cannon girls, some were semi-machine, some directly disliked the face of the alien beasts with their own cannons. Boom 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 frantically firing. Of course. Where's Makoto? Eh? Shania almost fell down. Mac Dust. Is probably angry with me? I didn't give him a word and rushed here by myself. You ah. Uh, I can see that he favors you. A huge fireball slammed down pulling down. More than 30 witches on the walls of the second gate were blown away. There's a fire koan. That huge flying whale of over a hundred meters. Not to mention its thick skin. Could also spew out super fireballs. Damn it. This alien beast is tricky. Surface to air pulse electromagnetic cannons give me a hard shot at the fire koan. The battlefield at the frontline position was intense. Hang Fong and Nansha were also facing the fey beast. And support could not arrive. Only the main city of Shuangguang. The 300, 000 Guanghong ground legions would not arrive until tomorrow. The following 1 million Guanghong legions would take a day and a half. And the heavy armor legions would be even slower. Xinjin's air force was small in number. And there were still 4 hours for air first support to come. On the other side, Yen Pei arrived at the academy with people from the crisis department. And all the teachers were conscripted onto the plane except for Zhang Chuanjiu and Kai Jia. Yen Pei spoke loudly. All higher department students were recruited and will be divided into the combat department and transportation department. Pilots all come out to the combat department and prepare for the afternoon transport plane to Chuanfeng City. The airwoman transportation class please all go to the left side. The rest go to the right side. Seeing that it was Yen Pei, Mu Chen looked at Li Shi. Li Shi understood in seconds. Ah, you're going to? Mu Chen was worried about his wife. And Tu Lian which pulled her back. Chapter 093, The Second Wave of Fei Beasts is Coming Again. Principal Wu, leave the distribution to us. Yen Pei came up to shake hands with school head Wu. They just reached adulthood. Can't they share the heavy cloud boundaries? I also graduated from you. I know your thoughts. To be honest Chuan Fong City may be safer than the heavy cloud boundaries. Colonel Wu understood what he meant. If Copper Scale City was breached, although Chuan Fong became an isolated island, the army of foreign beasts was coming towards heavy cloud boundary to impact heavy cloud city. The drivers all came out alone. The whole team had no choice all to go to Chuanfeng City. The foreign ones don't need to care. They are not among the conscripts. Yen Pei looked at the foreign class. Many foreign class people long sigh of relief. What do you mean plebeians? What do you mean it's not in the recruitment? What you guys lack is heavy firepower like this lady. This voice. Beldet pointed at Yen Pei with a very scornful look. That's right. The whole world is being attacked by beast tides. Fighting anywhere is fighting. Don't underestimate us. Yutina crossed her arms. Yen Pei's mouth twitched, 
but gave them a thumbs up. Foreign personnel, on a voluntary principle, join the regional squares to which they belong, and your battle records will be harmonized with the Red Dragon Warriors. Armored Car G and Transport Car G to this side. Your mission is to transport ammunition and supplies. Many of the girls were happy. Chang Rong was taking a long breath. Sports car and sedan. And motorcycle and tricycle machine girl these envy. They either load poorly. Transportation is hard. But safe ah. Merit less is also okay. Go to Chuan Fung City this SS Beast Tide that is basically dead ah. Back then. The S Class Beast Tide broke the heavy cloud boundary. Not to mention the two cities outside. Yen Pei immediately received a call. Boat G please come over here. Boat G will go with CJ-1 squadron to support the direction of Nansha. It was a sea battle over there, and it was simply useless for Funaheim to be over here. By helping Nansha open up the sea route earlier, the reinforcements over there could also arrive earlier. The higher department had more than one, 200 machine girls. Among them, there were more than 200 gun girls, 300 or so armored vehicles and transports, 45 planes, and more than 130 ship girls. There were no fit pilots for the students. There was a pair that was also Qin Fei Fei and Mu Chen. The crisis came too quickly. Although Zhao Peng Fei and Gao Yanchan were standing in the driver's team, when they waited until they reached Chuan Fong City, their families would have special arrangements to preserve their safety. Some clans were charging forward, such as the Qin clan, and some clans were trying to shrink as much as possible, such as the Gao clan. The scene was immediately divided. Some that really didn't have a drop of battle power would be conscripted into the equipment department, referred to as portering. Arriving at Chuan Fong City, you guys follow Qin Fei Fei first. What about you guys? Mu Chuan. Qin Fong looked at Mu Chen and Li Shi standing together. We'll come over later, and Qin Fei Fei will command everyone to prepare for battle. Although Qin Fei Fei was a heavenly whale transporter, if she hadn't been able to transform with Mu Dust, she would have been returned to the transportation direction. However, the war girl's battle power was too strong, so she naturally went to the direction of Chuan Fong City. Immediately, Mu Chen went to find Yen Pei. Yen Pei, we have to go alone first, giving Yen Pei a greeting. Yen Pei blinked his eyes. You damn well are known to be Shania's boyfriend, and you can transform with Qin Fei Fei of the Qin family, and this side has brought a pure and absolutely beautiful woman. You this kid can ah. Shania did not put you dismantled? No, Shania seems to have run to the front line in the 7th district. Wait, Mukin, you're going to the 7th district? Yen Pei lowered his voice. You know me well. I'll arrange an airplane for you. Do you know how to fly it? No need. My companion is. A look was given. Yen Pei had an impression of this beautiful woman. Wasn't it a registered motorcycle? Just at this time. Alert, 5th Sector Frontier Falls. 5th Sector Frontier Falls. With 41, 000 people led by General Gong Shi Chang Mao. All of the 5th District's frontline positions have fallen. Fending off the alien beasts for 2 hours and 47 minutes. Killing three imperial grade alien beasts and 66517 ferocious nuclear worm grade alien beasts. Alert, the remaining Fei beasts in the 5th district are moving towards Tuan Fong City. The 5th district has fallen. The 5th district is gone. Gong Shi Chang Mao, Zuo Jiasen, Zhang Oji, Kong Yu Tong. Their friends closed their eyes, held back their tears, and gritted their teeth viciously. You guys are good. Leaving the academy, Li Shi immediately transformed into a war girl and broke through the air. Less than half an hour later. Alert, the 4th sector's forward position has fallen. The 4th sector's forward position has fallen. The Bingyu general team fought to the end. Rushing towards the emperor level Fei to self-destruct and take away a wave of Fei. Command hub everyone. Defense hub everyone. The people of the various legions. The people of the red dragon ministries. The major guilds. And the rock elephants. All of them heard the news. The battle went on for more than 3 hours. The forward positions in sectors 1, 4, and 5 fell. On the rock bishop's board. Two horses flew across the river and kicked out three of the opponent's pawns. Two pawns remained. Four hours are not up. Alarm, second sector front falls. Second sector front falls. Four forward positions have fallen. A defense barrier was shattered. As if hitting the door of everyone's heart. A large number of partners, fighters, machine girls and pilots were sacrificed. But, this is just the beginning ah. Zhang Dongyuan saw the big screen. How is the battle situation? Three, six, seven. Eight forward positions received please reply. The technician immediately counted. Mr. Zhang refers to the current estimate of 130. 000 alien beasts assembling in the swamp area in an hour. Among them, the cosmic eye has captured the dragon level alien beasts war beasts and fire koan lords. War beast, has a hundred meters body humanoid type multiple mutation monster. No special moves, but itself is huge and incomparable. 
Power destruction is classified as a dragon class low level. Fiery Koan Lord. Possessing a certain level of intelligence, a 50 meter fiery koan. Surrounded by crimson flaming clouds, smaller than a royal level fiery koan. Mainly because of its high level of intelligence. Classified as a dragon level mid rank. If there was a fire koan lord, there would be at least 10 or more fire kuns. Nearly 5 hours. This is, the 3rd district deputy chief Jiang Wu. We, still have 5000 people and are guarding the final gate. But, we seem to be surrounded. It may not last half an hour. District 1, 2, 4, and 5 have all fallen. And District 3 is an island. The 6th district Kaibuatao. We still have 8000 people. Holding down the final gate. This is the 7th district Shania. We will soon retreat to the central gate. There are still 30,000 people fighting. Shania. Quickly back up. Why are you rushing to the front again? You've kicked more than 10 foreign beasts to death. Tu Lian could be heard pulling Shania. Kicked more than 10 heads to death? What's going on? We saw the head on our side. The war girl squad is preparing to head to the 6th district for support. Shania's voice. On the big screen. The number of alien beasts in the 7th district was valued at only 3,000. There were still over 10,000 left in the 6th district, which was still a diversion of a few thousand for the 7th district to fight. This is the 8th district Xin Zhao. I, I'm lying in the back. I can't get up. Transferring the squad leader Xin Lingui. Xin Zhao also changed three times and could not stand up. I am the 8th district tactical squad leader Xin Lingui. Report hub. We retreat to the 4th gate. There are still 20. 000 people. The number of foreign beasts can see the head. The number of foreign beasts in the 8th district was seen to be less than 5,000 as well. Sort of good news. The 6th, 7th, and 8th districts were able to hold out. The threat to Chuan Fong city was reduced, and more weapons could be equipped and assembled. Blowing up buildings and immediately mounting heavy artillery and weapons on the foundations. 5 hours time. Luo Tong's tranquilizer recovered and he rushed out of the tent. How's the situation? How's it going? Shen Aya smoked a cigarette. Countless corpses of alien beasts, but none of them were standing now. The 7th district town held the first wave of beasts. At the central gate, the 7th district took the lead in eliminating the first wave of foreign beasts. Heavy cloud notification, Frontier Position Sector 7 has eliminated the first wave of fey beasts. Please support the teams in Sector 7 and head to Sector 6 or 8. The 7th district is holding? Awesome. Well done. The 7th district I remember is that Luo Tong kid. I heard that Luo Tong killed a 3 and 3. Fought for two hours then ran out of power. And it turned out to be Shania who commanded until now. Shania? She ran to the front line position of the 7th district? Go to. To very much in line with Shania's style. And the people in the 7th district have to listen to her. Ha ha ha. Worthy of being Shania? Awesome. That girl can do it. The forces of the other main cities. And many legions of people listened to the communication. Some knew that the follow up was Shania helping to command which was clearly allowing Luo Tong and his machine girl to rest and recover their ability to fight again. The 8th sector was also about to be killed. Originally seeing a hint of respite, the foreign beasts assembled not far from Chuan Fong city were not yet 50,000 in number. Alert! Alert! A large number of fey beasts have been newly discovered in the North Molan, South Cloud Forest, Thousand Gully Wetlands, and Mago Plains, with an estimated 400,000, and are approaching the heavy cloud region. The second wave of foreign beasts are coming immediately? Chapter 094 Shepherd's Dust Arrives at the Frontier Position Alert! A large number of fey beasts have been newly discovered in the North Molan, South Cloud Forest, Thousand Gully Wetland, and Mago Plains, estimated at 400, 000, and are approaching the Heavy Cloud Region. A full Heavy Cloud-wide notification. And just now I heard that the 7th District had held the first wave of fey beasts onslaught. In the past, the beasts would have to wait at least a day or two. But I didn't expect it to come immediately? The first wave of 700, 000 beasts. Most of them are bug level. And there are only 25 imperial level beasts in total. Currently, there were still 130, 000 at a distance of 20 miles from the gathering in Copper Scale City. And 50, 000 in Chuan Fong City. But at this moment, the second wave came with another 400, 000 foreign beasts. And this time, most of them were fierce and earth level foreign beasts. Here again? It's over. Who can block this? Are we heavy cloud going to be finished? What are you afraid of you softy? We copper scales can definitely hold it. Everyone prepare for battle. Before the fight even started, some timid machinima were leaking oil in fear. And some pilots tried to escape and were directly arrested. Retreating before the battle was too demoralizing. Copper scale was now 5 million. And all the major military departments were sending support here. Tuan Lin held the macro light far probe and looked at the swamp area. 
That extinction level alien beast commander, just how many alien beasts will accumulate before attacking? This is the light macro legion. I'm Qin Zhao from the 8th sector headquarters, we're requesting to join forces. At the command hub, all signal sounds were successively neutralized, all of them could not be contacted. What's going on? Why are the communication signals gone? Report, we are repairing it. We, we have encountered the sound signal being interrupted for the first time in 300 years. What the hell? Right now, the heavy cloud hub was informed by the Dragonheart artificial system in addition to the cosmic visionary chart. The signals out of heavy cloud city were all gone. Heavy cloud briefing, I am Zhang Dongyuan, the general director of the defense hub. Now all regional signals are being shielded one after another. All the support teams that can be heard, act according to the original plan. And when contact is not possible, the various departments and divisions of each team, and their own judgment of the battle, trust the people they elected. Zhang Dongyuan immediately notified, fearing that after a while, all communications would be cut off. What's the situation? The connection between the defense hub and the frontline positions, as well as the two cities have all been cut off? Could it be the work of a foreign beast? It's over. It's over. We're all going to die. Let us escape to Hangfeng City. Uhu. I don't want to die yet. I haven't married yet. There's a beast wave over at Hangfeng now too. It's over. It's over. Our red dragon is going to be gone. The panic spread aggravated. And now everyone knew that four of the frontline positions had fallen. At the defense hub, Zhang Dongyuan asked the deputy chief finger to control the scene. He immediately went out and went upstairs to see the communications team manipulating the screens nonstop. Even Professor Yan's team had come to help. A battlefield without communications would be less eyes. Although the Cosmic Eye and the Dragonheart AI were still working fine, hitting uploading and downloading was completely blocked. How is it? Can it be repaired? Zhang Dongyuan was also anxious. No, it can't be picked up at all. Mr. Zhang pointed out that we are being interfered with by three signals, probably Dragon Class Interference Class Alien Beasts. The communications department was busy and sweating. It couldn't be repaired. Something's not quite right. Professor Yen also spoke. With a look from him, Zhang Dongyuan immediately followed him out. Professor Yen what's the situation? Just now, Chen Dong's side also contacted me for the first time. Look at these three signal locations. They are very strange. Professor Yen took out his highly precise private instrument. The first point is at the frontline position, which should powerful interference type alien beasts. The second one is actually in Chuan Feng City. And the third one is right here in our heavy cloud city. What do you mean? Professor Yen? Zhang Dongyuan narrowed his eyes. We can't openly go out. The other party's technology is very high. We won't be able to fully locate it in a short period of time. There are people within Chuanfeng City and the main city of Chongyun who are helping the alien beasts, or using extremely advanced technological equipment. Zhang Dongyuan clenched his fists. There were traitors amongst the humans? Not necessarily humans. I went to the Red Dragon secret meeting. Now it is suspected that there are aliens lurking amongst us. The division judges are all open for action. You and be careful. Don't be around anyone you don't particularly trust. Zhang Dongyuan nodded. Fortunately, Lin Hua and Fan Hanwu are reliable. Professor Yen restoration work depends on you to command. Chief Metropolitan Lin Hua, Chief Commander of Copper Scale City. Fan Hanwu Chief Commander. Chuanfeng City Chief Commander. But are the two men really as trustworthy as Zhang Dongyuan said? In the highest secret conference room of Chuanfeng City, monster-like things were placed, emitting interference signals. Professor Yen nodded. I'll do my best. By the way what about that young man called Mu Dust? He might be helpful to us. Mu Dust? I'll contact immediately. Zhang Dongyuan immediately communicated to Yen Pei. Yen Pei. Where is that Mu Chin now? The academy's transportation plane to support Chuan Feng City hasn't taken off yet. Right? Immediately have him come to the headquarters to help. Yen Pei. Ah? Uh, ah uh, what? Ah? Uh? Yen Pei was embarrassed. Generalissimo Zhang. He. He. He probably went to the 7th front position now. What did you say? You. No ah. Uh, Shin Aya is in temporary command of the 7th front position. That boy is also a man of nature. Probably will not let Shin Aya die there. Zhang Dongyuan was speechless. This cannot be contacted ah. Uh, at the 7th sector frontline position. Luo Tong flipped up that over the communicator. Hub, hub. Zhang Dongyuan chief finger. The signal is blocked. The signal can't be contacted beyond 5 kilometers. This has never happened before. The second wave of alien beasts is coming soon. Reporting to Luo team. Shen. Shen team. The macro light remote probe found that the foreign beasts are still half an hour away from us. And found that it is a large number of fierce level foreign beasts and earth level. Stronger than the first wave. The number is less than 40,000. Shen Aya smoked a cigarette. 
Luo Tong doesn't need to report to me when he wakes up. I'm only temporary. Shania was now respected and even worshipped by everyone. She was too handsome. Rushing at the front, her hands domineeringly holding heavy weapons furiously, like a female god of war. Everyone ready their weapons and prepare for battle. Yes, Team Luo. Anticipating 400, 000 foreign beasts, more than 200, 000 would directly rush towards Copper Scale, more than 100, 000 to Chuan Fong City, and more than 40, 000 to the 7th District. Shin Aya, we still have airplanes, you quickly leave, you don't belong here. Tulian and Luotong said almost simultaneously, what did you guys say? Shin Aya took a drag on her cigarette, holding this place as the mission of the 7th District's forward positions. We must hold here today to buy time for Chuan Fong City. Everyone appreciates you coming to help, but you're not from the 7th district, so please leave now. Luo Tong spoke firmly. The other warriors listened, and although it was a bit ruthless, everyone knew it. Team Luo wanted Shania to leave. She shouldn't fall here. Sister Shania, let's go. Nukin is still waiting for you to go back. You guys can still fight in Chuan Fong City. It was still the double ponytail Zhong Qingqing who could talk a little. Dam Dash Shania threw the cigarette on the ground and stomped it out. Tu Lian smiled. In the past, no one could pull you. Now it's useful to talk about Nukin. Go back. You alone are a regiment. I believe that with you. The chances of ending this beast tide will definitely increase. Salute. Swish 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 everyone around all saluted Shania. Shania had flown her own airplane to come single-handedly in support, and had killed two flying alien beasts on the way. Battlefield Command. Rushing at the forefront. Her pulse pass wristwatch shows this 571 value. This is the merit system of this time. If it can survive, each person who fights valiantly will be awarded medals or rewards based on this value. She alone had killed 571 monsters with a ferocious beast level value. Damn it. Let's go. Your man is waiting for you in Chuan Fong City. Leave this place to us. Tu Lian went up to hug her. Shania was very unwilling to leave like this. The communicator rang. This is Qin Zhao. Luo Tong. Shania. Can you hear me? Our 16, 000 people in the 8th district are 3 kilometers away. This is Kaibuatao. I only have 3500 people left here. We're 3 kilometers away. What's the situation? Why are the people from the 6th and 8th districts all over here? The plane swooped down. It transformed back into its human form. Shepherd dust fell from 60 to 70 meters in the air. Dang. The floor shattered. Li Shi fell on her arm's semi-mechanized propulsion, which could cushion a light landing. Pain pain pain. Fly lower and then change back off. You're trying to murder pro. Everyone all gawked at Mu Dust. Li Shi with a mask and beret. She intentionally pitched Mu Dust, knowing that he will be fine even if he falls down this high. But it was also too domineering for him to directly jump out of the airplane. Nukin, why are you here? Luo Tong, Tu Lian, Zhang Qingqing, and even Shania were shocked. Wasn't I worried about our family Shania? If we retreat back to Chuan Fong City now, she would definitely be very very, very upset, so I took the initiative to come over. Chapter 095, Preparation for the 7th District Guard Battle Begins. Mu Chin spoke and also looked ambiguously at Shania. Shania brushed her face scarlet. This dog food spread by the two of them was really super sweet, and this was the forefront of what was going to happen. A large number of machine maiden warriors around, and even some people excitedly issued a scream. This, this, is so sweet, so sweet ah. Shania coughed immediately rushed up to twist the face of Mu Dust. In fact, she now has a somewhat shy expression. And everyone is looking at, you stinky guy, who let you run to the front line? It wasn't the teacher who took the lead. Li Shi leaned against the wall, giving off a smell of kitchen condiments. I'll clean you up after the beast tide ends. Makoto's lowered voice could only be heard by Shania. Her face turned even redder. Turning to the others, we're just here to help. I'm a selfish person. If the 7th district is not protected, I'll immediately knock Shin Aya out and take her away to leave. Ha, huh? Maxin directly takes Shin Aya away. The three of you, you can't help much. Luo Tong spoke. Really? Mu Dust didn't say anything. We'll leave at the last moment. The primary task now of gathering strength. The people from the 8th and 6th districts are the ones I call out. You went and said that? Yes. The communication seems to be broken now. Except for the Dragonheart AI briefing. We unknown any intelligence. With this second wave of alien beasts attacking. Normally all forward positions will be destroyed, and the 6th district is already dead in name only. There were only about 3, 500 people left in the 6th district, and these 50, 000 plus foreign beasts pressed up and instantly wiped out. Mu Chin looked at Chief Kai Buotao and Chief Qin Zhao who landed in their flying G. I first went to the 8th district and found General Tin Qin Zhao, 
although there are still 18, 000 people in the 8th district, but all of them are injured, and the last gate is also dangerous, so I, I reasoned, plus the Qin family's relationship, convinced him, Tulian knew that there was communication when Muqin contacted Qin Fei Fei's old mother, Tu Wei Lan, with a single sentence, she made Qin Zhao completely obedient, right now, Tu Wei Lan liked Mu Dust tightly, predicted the beast tide ahead of time, and had an amazing talent, and liked his personality as well as his looks, Qin Zhao saluted, Luo Tong, we and my people are joining your side, now that we don't have communication, we can't kill many foreign beasts at all by guarding separately, unity is the best plan, ha ha ha, I didn't think we could die together, Luo Tong laughed, Kai Tao is a bit older, as soon as little old brother Muchuan came to say that the 8 districts have all shifted, we're so little, we owe you, no, we owe Shen I a girl a favor, in case we can't pay it back in our next life, why don't we just come all together, brother Kai, the rest of you are all elites, we will fight together until the end, the 6th district was indeed left with all elites, almost the worst of them were B-ranked machine girls, and there were 5 more in the war girl squad, now Luotong became the 3rd district metropolitan commander, war girl squad combination, we have 20 Zun war girls that can be divided into 2 teams, 21 Zun, Kai Tao asked Shania to borrow a cigarette, 22 Zun, Xin Zhao also raised his hand, this place is fully under your command, Luo Tong, we are the squad leaders, the squad leaders of the 8th and 6th districts arrived, all landing on the central platform waiting for orders, the combination of the 3 districts, not counting Mac Chen and the others, had 23 battle maidens, with 2 SS class, 6 S class, and 15 A class battle maidens, this was a powerful battle force, originally, each district had 6 captains and 20 junior captains, now there are 14 integrated captains and 29 junior captains, more than 40, 000 integrated mecha warriors, and more than 8, 000 driver warriors, and sector 7 now has 3 fifths of its heavy weapons still in place, all of the weapons that could be taken away from the 8th and 6th districts, all of the transporting machine nymphs had brought them over, nice job Maxion, you made the right decision, Tulian praised from the side, Shania also knew that the talent and decisiveness that Mukin had displayed in the tactics class was something she had appreciated before, he was a handsome talent, unlike her reckless general, the decisiveness of a strong man, as well as the control of the big picture, and the keen judgment of opportunities, Luo Tong was deploying, now that there were many good generals, it was good to distribute them, and they could also divide 3,000 people each to defend the north and south gates, so as to deal with the foreign beasts that ran up the wrong way in the 8th and 6th districts, everyone, we don't have any grandiose words, it's to take away more foreign beasts before we leave this calamitous era, being in this era, we can only put our best foot forward to create a new and better environment for our descendants, much earlier, Luo Tong raised the weapon in his hand high, roar nearly 50,000 people roared, their voices firm, and everyone, if the battlefield is chaotic, if we war girls rush out, Shania and Mu Dust and the others are also temporary captains, everyone cooperate in the battle, Shania everyone recognized, Shepherd Dust, at this moment, many people were looking at him to memorize his looks, this young man, in fact, looked familiar at first glance, don't think that the frontier position doesn't brush the heavy cloud news, Mu Chen is on the hit list, there are still more than 10 minutes to go, can already feel the vibration of the ground, can also see the sky black in the distance, it was coming, Shi Yi used this, Shen Aya helped Li Shi Yi choose the pulse sniper rifle that suited her, thank you, we don't have to be polite, I've also prepared a tranquilizer gun here, I won't be polite if you don't listen when I let you go, Li Shi Yi really showed it off, with Mac Chen and you here, I have a feeling that we won't be defeated that easily, the two women stood on the citadel and chatted, while Mac Chen clicked on the quests behind them, quest 1, destroy 1, 000 ferocious great alien beasts, 127 completed, 1's level was still almost at 20, ding mission 4 completed, traveling to the beast tide battlefield, level D, Receive reward, 9th generation A Great Land Shield Divine Light 3000 Close Defense Cannon, 4 units, just in time to use them. Mu Dust walked to a citadel position on the left. Let me have this location. There were more than 30 machine nymphs and 5 drivers here. This, Chief Luo Tong spoke just now, and they immediately stepped aside, not knowing what Mu Chen wanted this location for. Shen Aya and Li Shi also looked over, and Mu Chen wouldn't do anything useless, especially since he had a serious expression now only to see that he pressed a few times on the screen, and the multifunctional floor platform on the ground appeared, which was a convenient device to quickly set up heavy artillery, or weapons, then there was a flash of light, knock, 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 four close defense cannons suddenly appeared on the citadel, 
golden colored metal frames, the dark barrels of each of them were as high as 33, and green energy pillars shone around their circumference. Under Mu Chen's operation, they began to link up with the ground platform. What is this? A close defense cannon? Luo Tong and Kai Buatao saw it. A precision weapon. Close defense cannons with ordinary ammunition weren't much of a threat to alien beasts above the fierce level, and pulse level ones would at least require copper scale city to be qualified to equip them, which had a huge cost and consumed a great deal of money. Why hadn't Shepard Dust seen this weapon before, regardless of whether it was a machine girl or a driver? Almost everyone in this era loved weaponry. The four units that Mood Dust had taken out here, basically no one had seen them before. Ninth generation A grade land shield divine light 3000 close defense cannon, with a range of 2. 000 meters, capable of firing 3, 000 pulse shots per minute. Mu Dust explained. Crap, capable of firing 3000 rounds per minute? A 9th generation A class close defense cannon? One unit can sell for 40 million credits, right? Mainly this thing is out of stock. You know that 3, 000 rounds of pulse cannon is equivalent to 150, 000 rounds of armor piercing bullets, shooting 150, 000 rounds a minute. There weren't many units of this kind of weapon in Chuan Fong City, and Mu Chen took out four of them at once and set them up. Shen Aya threw over two heavy artillery pulse guns, two for her and two for Mukin. Everyone on the Citadel looked at their pair. It takes three people to set up this thing. Mu Chen picked up two with one hand. Monster, monster. These two words surfaced in their brains. Shen Aya's little boyfriend is also a fucking monster. Luo Tong patted Kai Buatao and Qin Zhao next to him, his eyes saying, don't make a fuss. I'm used to it. Yelling, all units, prepare for battle. Chapter 096, Close Defense Cannon and Makoto's Wild Blasts. Charging over, the hissing of the alien beasts roaring resounded through the sky. They let out wild, strange cries, and the ground was almost clear of ferocious level foreign beasts. Iron-horned green oxen, triangular iron monsters, bloodthirsty giant wolves, and double-headed red leopards that ran at extreme speeds. Behind them, earth monster apes with a stature of more than 20 meters and saber-toothed crocodiles could also be seen, there was no lack of one-tenth of the number of them being earth-grade, insect level and fierce level at least have beast-like, earth level is a mutated monster, berserker 6, dryad 2, destroyer 1, in the air, there was a huge glowing turbot, which emitted a green aura as if it had formed a magnetic field, Makchen, look it's that guy, Li Shi took out her scanner next to her, what a terrifying magnetic field, it has an extremely strong ability to block communication to interfere with long-range shooting. That thing could even speak human language. Probably a dragon-level leader-type monster. It was densely surrounded by flying exotic beasts, silver round eagles, great moths, flying mantises, and highly poisonous wasps. These two or three times mutated exotic beasts swooped down in a black mass. 500 ground-to-air pulse electromagnetic cannons. All fire. A barrage of cannonballs shot into the sky. Mu Chen controlled his 9th generation A-class land shield divine light 3000 close defense cannons, and four of them swept into the air. ZZZ, ZZZZ, fire suppression, almost laser-like projectiles, spraying beams of energy. The power of these four close defense cannons of Makoto was even fiercer than the 500 surface-to-air pulse electromagnetic cannons. Crap, that weapon is too fierce. Nima, it's too beautiful this cannonball. It's even more beautiful than my wife, more handsome than my husband. Instantly suppressing the alien beasts in the sky. A rain of light beams filled the sky. The foreign beasts that had just swooped down seemed like they were going to be swept away in one fell swoop. Ground prepare the Talon Mega Cannons. Fire. Ten Talon Mega Cannons attacked. And three Scorpion Beam Cannons fired simultaneously. The alien beasts rushed closer. Reaching a range of 300 meters. The 3000 or so cannon girls on the citadel with their drivers. Frantically fired their cannons. Boom. 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 The front of the battlefield exploded. The same weapon with a linkage fit of 10 or more had a 3 to 5 times increase in power for the cannon girls. Don't spare them away. Undifferentiated attack. Damn these ferocious class alien beasts are really thick skinned. Don't look at the fact that this wave was only 50,000. It was even harder to deal with than the previous wave. The power of normal human weapons started to be insufficient. Like gamma rockets with handheld weapons, it would take a dozen or more shots to completely kill an earth level. The Dryad 2 was even more fearless of normal explosions, and was right in front of them to open up the way. Mu Chen and Shania simultaneously stepped on the city wall with one foot and held heavy artillery pulse guns in both hands. Surge surge surge. Luo Tong and Tu Lian almost laughed out loud at the sight. They were really a family. The two of them were four turrets, bombarding the approaching beasts furiously. Li Shi pulse sniper cannons were set up to snipe at the leaky ones in the air. 
The first wave relied on Muchen's close defense cannons, and the pressure in the air plummeted. However, there were still those that swooped down, especially coming towards Mu Dust's side. The foreign beasts also realized that these four cannons had to be destroyed, or perhaps it was that flying in the air, the huge glowing turbot sending out commands, spotting the swiftwinders rushing down. Li Shi mechanized her left hand into a black mangled multifunctional missile launcher. Small missiles pierced through the sky. The three swiftwinders were bombarded into powder. Nima, behind her, the other battle maiden warriors and the machine maiden in charge of support looked at her like she was a monster. This beautiful girl was also a monster. Sniper cannons, bullet less. Half mechanized weapons were able to hit completely. War girl squad prepare for support. Yes, fire suppression. Don't wait for my order. Once the weapons are cooled down, Give me the opportunity to fire at the places where there are a lot of alien beasts. Understood. The entire position opened fire frantically. The gun girls ran out of bullets and immediately had the drivers hold them back. Except for the 200 pound gunheim. At this time the armored vehicles equipped with weapons. As well as the tank carheim came up to transform and fight a second round. The gate has been impacted. But the firepower suppression is enough. It was only 10 minutes into the fight. And the merit number on Shania's wristwatch hit 485. These ground level alien beasts didn't die even after dozens of shots, they're too able to carry on. This wave is a bit much, can't let them impact the gate. Shinaya threw her cigarette and shouted, all those close to the parapet wall, turn your head for three seconds and crouch. Some people heard it and immediately turned their heads to crouch. Of course there were also people who didn't hear. Flare X dash, Shepard Dust released his move. Boom 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 boom, Makoto's battle score was 617 points. Shinaya happened to renew a cigarette. Watch as a sea of fire explodes. Hundreds of his own people were lifted off the ground and smashed into the ground. Luckily it didn't really hurt. What the hell? Those who turned their heads saw Mu Dust stretching out his hand. What weapon did he use? This power. It's comparable to the main weapon killing move of a SS battle spirit, isn't it? Old brother Mu Chen is awesome. Keep firing. Luo Tong immediately commanded in surprise. Alert, 6th frontier position fallen. 6th frontier position fallen. The alarm could be heard throughout the entire heavy cloud, and all of Red Dragon's major organizations and agencies, and even Plaza News knew about it. Now only the 7th and 8th frontier positions remain. Alarm, 8th front position fallen. 6th front position fallen. A mere 5 seconds apart. A second alert came as well. The command hub froze. The 8th sector's forward position only lasted 3 more seconds? It's over. It's over. The foreign beasts are all rushing towards Chuan Fong and Copper Scale. The SS class beast tide has only begun and it's this fierce? Finished. The people in the command hub could only look anxiously at the big screen. Communication, not to mention the frontline positions, was now intermittent even at the heavy cloud boundary, with no transmission from either city, and no signal with the Red Dragon Center. Right now, only the Cosmic Eye and the Dragonheart AI informed. The latter was invented by the super scientist Black Ink 300 years ago, the only existence that ignored magnetic fields and wave interference but only had the ability to scan and could not inject commands. The 8th district fell too quickly. Will it be struck by destruction just like the 1st sector? It's very likely. The command hubs were talking. Even the Red Dragon Center's Shen Chang and Shen Dong. They were also thinking. The last report from the 8th district. Even if it was tragic, how could there still be more than 10,000 people? 30 minutes. There are now 300. 000 foreign beasts gathered in the direction of Copper Scale City. And they may attack at any time. Alert. Alert! A large number of foreign beasts are attacking Copper Scale. Please prepare for Copper Scale City's highest response. Countless people in the main city in Red Dragon Kingdom prayed that Copper Scale must hold on. What about Chuan Fong City's side? Chief Finger Zhang. An hour's time. Chuan Fong City's side is now gathering 150, 000 foreign beasts. And they haven't acted yet. Copper Scale had already fought and had been joined by Dragon Level foreign beasts. The battlefield and it's grueling and terrifying. The battlefield of millions of people. That shell bombardment was densely packed, but the death ray spewed out by the dragon level alien beasts directly penetrated a force field wall, it ran through a thousand meters, and all the life above the path turned into powder. Some people screamed miserably, and some people topped them. In the seventh sector, after fighting for over an hour, the weapons were basically smoking, the gates were broken over seventy, the war girl squad had joined the fight, fire Cohen is coming, watch out, Machin, watch your position. The foreign beasts are eyeing you and the close defense cannons, Tu Lian shouted. At this time, the four fire cuns spewed out fireballs and all of them blasted Maxion. Shania had just gone to fight the foreign beasts in the south and ran back when she saw four giant fireballs smashing down. Mac Dust. Mac Dust. Mac Dust is in danger. 
The anti-aircraft guns hitting them only weakened the power. Abs force field open up. Boom boom boom. The walls of the city collapsed and subsided. And Shin Aya and Li Shi, who was supporting from the rear, froze. The explosion lifted multiple people off the ground. And the city wall shattered in large pieces. However, the flying sand scattered. And Mu Chen stood there. The blue force field unfolding around his body almost shattering. It resisted. Portable force field? What kind of terrifying prop? Where did Mu Chen get so much high technology? Shin Aya rushed up to fill her ears with double winds. You stinky guy scared me to death. Chapter 097 War Girl Squad Charge Lord Xin Cheng, the big battle on the copper scale side has lasted for half an hour. We can't see the casualty figures, but the meta force field has been penetrated three times. There should be a dragon class exotic beast and the force field loss is 64. Very tragic. Long range missiles supported 3, 0, 0, 0 rounds. The heavy cloud hub is relying on optical charts to try and support it even though communications have been cut off. Heavy cloud boundary had over range flying continent missiles to support. But these weapons depended on the actuality. The interfering magnetic field of the Fey would affect their flight and accuracy. A bad shot would hit one of their own. For now, Copper Scale City can still be stabilized. What about Chuan Feng's side? The expected 150, 000 foreign beasts didn't move. Lord Xin Cheng, we are afraid that this group of foreign beasts will suddenly head south to encircle Copper Scale. Most likely, Zhang Dongyuan and the others should have thought of it as well. The latest support of the Earth Wind Legion. The direction is clear. It is going to look for abandoned stations to set up a temporary defense line to block it. Shen Chang and Shen Dong. In fact, many people were looking at one spot on the map. There were a total of eight lines that were red dots, seven of which were unobstructed. The only one that was blocked was particularly conspicuous. The seventh sector's forward position is still there? It had been an hour since the second wave of alien beasts had impacted. The seventh sector is still there? Yes, Lord Shen Cheng. The seventh district is still there. And, according to our cosmic eye scan, the 7th district is currently estimated to still have more than 30, 000 heads of foreign beasts, which means that they have knocked out more than 10, 000. Zhang Dongyuan's side was all in shock. Knocked off more than 10,000? Yes. Currently, the cosmic eye's macroscopic observation has found that 17,000 counts of fey beast life traits have disappeared. How did they do that? Reporting to Chief Finger Zhang, we received a picture from the mysterious signal and have done a security scan. Open it on the fifth screen. The security scan had been done and read, and the report up should be something important. What was sent was a set of pictures. The first one was of Rotunda pointing at the 3000 Gunjis and firing. It's Chief Rotom, isn't it? This is a picture of the battle in the seventh sector? The second one was a picture of Luo Tong, Kai Buatao, and Qin Zhao, the three general teams, transforming into Battle G and charging down. Isn't that the 8th district's chief team Qin Zhao? That bald head is chief team Kai Buatao. Have they all assembled? No wonder. The 8th and 6th districts did not have resistance to be broken through. So they have integrated. Zhang Dongyuan nodded his head. The 6th district would have been emptied. More than 3,000 people would have been swallowed up in an instant. Instead of all three points being broken through quickly, the general trend was better to gather together and exterminate more alien beasts. Right choice. Who contacted them? The third one showed the two of them. Shin Aya and Mu Chen, holding heavy artillery pulse guns and firing at the alien beasts in the sky. Put, someone didn't hold back. Shin Aya was too obvious. Next to it was, that's young assistant instructor Mu. Ha, huh? he also rushed to the 7th district, fighting side by side with Shin Aya. So romantic that quite a few machine girls almost said it out loud in excitement. The latter few had densely packed alien beasts, many of which were about to climb the city walls, as well as roiling beam projectiles and close-ups of long-distance blurred, blowing turbots alien beasts that emitted a strange light. What is this fey? Didn't recognize it? Zhang Dongyuan felt familiar. Mr. Zhang refers to the picture reported by Chief Luo Tong. There has been this fey. Then perhaps this is the command of the fey beast. Very likely. Can we contact the other party? No. Chief Finger. This was sent from a wa something cell phone a few hundred years ago. Since there are no G9 towers now, it's basically a single transmission. The technician said, so do we still have a keeper of this communication tool? Report, I have the collector's model. Then immediately send this map to Copper Scale and Kawafeng City. Understood. Knocking out the opposing commander's command was also one of the core of the battlefield. The picture sent by this mysterious signal was naturally sent by Li Shi. Team Luo, our weapons are hitting overload. Reporting that the Talon Mega Cannon and Scorpion Beam Cannon hit overload. Continuous high intensity firing, the cooling ended and immediately opened again. Multiple times under power consumption the weapons hit overload. 
simply put the condensate is hitting a rolling boil, to let then it's cool down, at least half an hour time, do not fire all the way to kill the beast, ha ha, it's all hitting overload, we're not losing out, Kaibwatao laughed, our six distinctions say all overloaded, overloading a few heavy weapons is broken through, gamma rocket launcher overloaded on another round, rocket launchers can ammo hit insufficient, ha 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 ha, some of the old fighters on the contrary, still laugh out, kill cool, kill worth it, to know that they are now the central defense line is still holding, the moment the weapons hit overload, losing firepower suppression would easily be broken through, the foreign beasts are climbing up, Luotong took a deep breath, tanks and armored vehicles top up again, pay attention to the fire chuns in the sky, everyone else focus on sky defense, all of the wargirls follow me to kill out and stall for time, Captain Zhong Qingqing transformed into a 7th generation S-class domic fighter, and Luo Tong flipped up. Fusion, SS-ranked domic air battle G. Captain Feng Xian transformed, 8th generation S-class laser tank. Xin Zhao jumped up. Fusion, SS-ranked quadruple laser warjack. Kai Buotao fuses with his second in command. S-class steel armor guardian battle G. Landing on the city wall. The S-grade light energy battle G with a golden glow. The S-rank artillery warjack whose entire body was a variety of gun barrels. The S-grade purple sword wargirl with a huge purple crescent moon sword in her hand. The combination of a firm shield S-rank 100 style battleheim, with a helmet that looks like a bull's horn. The S-grade golden DX wargirl. All 15 A-ranked armed warjacks fell. Tu Lian, I'll leave the command above to you and Shania. All of the warjacks prepared to kill down and block the time. It was basically the second transformation of the round. Don't add me. I'm not up there. Shania flicked her cigarette away and tossed her jacket. Transformation. Earth attack battle vehicle. The moment Makoto jumped in. Fusion. Transformation. A brownish golden light shone. The cloak made a noise. And Tu Lian and the girl stared in disbelief. Shania? Transformed? Is Shania's body really okay? When she started to burst through the main gate, some people were incredibly puzzled. Didn't Shania's G body say that it was no longer working? And now it's still transforming? The entire team stared with wide eyes. Witness the SS-ranked Earth Guardian War G fall, drawing her Scythe Thunder Split God Gun. How can you charge without adding me, 24? Shania's 10-meter body was the largest on the scene, and the quadruple laser warjack was only 8 meters. Double transformation. Flash. Lingdang leaped and landed on Shania's shoulder. 25. Only 3 meters of body of the S-class lightweight Battleheim Black Feather Battleheim. Who was she again? A strange Battleheim? Shania could let her sit on her shoulder. Someone Shania brought with her right? Facing the foreign beasts that were still like a tidal wave. The Earth Guardian Wargirl raised her scythe under splitting lance. Charge. The 25 battle ages leapt down. Above them, the tank Heim and battle armor Heim immediately transformed, blocking the city walls as well as the artillery support. Without the intensive artillery support, countless alien beasts surrounded them. Die. The thunder splitting god gun rotated, and the Earth Guardian Battle G was unstoppable, like a golden brown bulldozer, killing a straight line. Ha dash the earth roared, exploding with Shania at the center. Dozens of foreign beasts became powder. Chapter 098, the battle was grueling. All of them killed madly. There is an issue between Cloudflare's cache and your origin web server. Cloudflare monitors for these errors and automatically investigates the cause. To help support the investigation, you can pull the corresponding error log from your web server and submit it our support team. Please include the Ray ID, which is at the bottom of this error page. Chapter 099, why hasn't Sector 7 fallen? Holding the Earth Guardian shield in his left hand, he blocked all kinds of destructive rays. The thunder splitting god gun rotated in his right hand, sweeping across the cross, the left and right hundred meters of crushing wind arrows. The foreign beasts on both sides turned into blood mist. Makchen, what kind of monster have you transformed your teacher into? Li Shi was astonished while still carrying a few moments of envy however, she was also happy that her teacher was one of her own. The contact was more. Also because of the reason of the sinful relationship with Makchen. In Li Shi's case, Shania was like a strong and reliable big sister. Anyone had times when they were tired. Seeing Shania, there was a layer of reliance. I'll block the foreign beasts. You guys go. Mu Chuan's soul appeared in Li Shi's world. And the fusion fit instantly skyrocketed to 57. While Shania's side dropped to 40. The black feathered wargirl didn't hesitate and leapt out. Her mechanically propelled feet breaking through the sand and rushing towards the elaborate demon sheep. Strange roars spread. The back row of fey beasts recoiled back. Don't think you can pass without me. Shinaya E.G. posed as a barrier. The thunder splitting godlance swept across the room, while the left and right retreated their steps, and the shoulder armor unfolded as 20 broadaxe bombs were shot out, utilizing the jets to take off. 
letting the foreign beasts on the left and right swoop in, and then opened the earth roar from the sky. 200 meters of concussion. A single force turned the tide in the horde of demonic beasts. On the central wall of the frontline position, Luo Tong and the others couldn't hold on to change back. Shania this is too strong. Almost attracted all the foreign beasts. We can't waste the time that Shania has bought us. Those who are rested immediately go up to the city wall to set up defenses, while the others follow me to eliminate the foreign beasts within the clean defense line. Maxion's four close defense cannons had cooled down, and Tu Lian controlled the firing to ease the pressure in the air. On the other side, the elaborate demon goat let out a startled roar as the swarm of demonic creatures was blocked by Shania, and that black warjack rushed towards it. Its voice was as if it was shouting non-stop protect, someone escort. Suddenly the air creased. For earth level hidden soul beasts too that were hiding around suddenly appeared and attacked the black feathered wargirl, sensed you guys a long time ago. With a flash of sword light, the four hidden soul beasts too disintegrated their bodies at the same time. Shuttling through, they rushed towards the elaborate demon sheep. The two firecuns in the air swooped down. Even the firecuns of the same level were trying to protect it. The more it does, the more it must die. She dash. Bloom. The black feather battleheim's stunningly beautiful face appeared. Her feathered wings unfurled behind her. And the wheels of the machine behind her body transformed into jets. Black light coalesced around the sword body in her hand. Forming a spiral of light. Fusion fit 65. The black feather goddess flickers. Changing 20 residual shadows in the air. The black lightning passed through the twin koan. Continuing forward. Only the sound of the giant koan smashing into the ground could be heard. The sounds of screams and spurting blood. On each head's body were ten wounds that had been sliced. Against the elaborate demon sheep. A single sword cut. Directly killing in seconds. The black feather goddess spun back and used the black mangled multi-purpose missile launcher before using it against the fire koan. A complimentary slash killed it. Looking up again. The glowing giant turbot was actually gone. Sensing a crisis it retreated further away? I don't care about it. Immediately went back to help Shania. Who was facing a few thousand foreign beasts furiously pouncing on her. Go to teacher's place. Shepard Dust returned to Shania's side and raised his hand EX Flare. Relieve the pressure. The commander of the group of foreign beasts, the elaborate demon sheep, was killed. And now the group of monsters drilled indiscriminately, not caring about the cannonballs and trap spikes. The black feathered wargirl returned to her mask once again. Teacher, advance. I'll defend the back. Let's kill back. This is Heavy Cloud Hub Center. Copper Scale City receive please reply. Receive please reply. The communications section officer had been trying to make contact. Mr. Zheng pointed out that we can't support long-range shooting anymore. The alien beast's jamming ability has increased once again. The long-range missiles were ineffective. The human weapons were being upgraded and the alien beasts were mutating multiple times. Damn it. We can only watch. Copper Scale has been fighting for two hours now. I wonder how it's going. The main screen showed that the metacore stance was less than 24. If it shattered for half a day it couldn't be restarted except for the multi-gravity field regional protection, which was brutal melee combat. Dragonheart artificial systems scanning for how many fei are left, reporting to Chief Finger Zhang. The prediction is that there are still 240. 000. Everyone in Copper Scale City was fighting, currently fighting in all directions, south and north, the only support in place. Besides the three transportation squadrons of ZB, there was also half a million air support. Guanghong Legion will arrive in four hours. The Earth Wind Legion advance is about to break through the impeding alien beast swarm. The estimated time is also 4 hours. All of the various legions were fighting, and it could be said that everywhere outside of the heavy cloud boundary was being fought. Even the main city was subjected to airstrikes from time to time. In Shinsu, the rock bishop looked at the board. Three of his five pawns that had crossed the river were gone, and there were two more. Knights and cannons had crossed the river, but hadn't fully launched an attack, just surrounded. The opponent, whether cannon or knight, was already in disarray, and one of the red phases was still black. Strange. The rock bishop was wondering. All four of the opponent's pawns died easily, except for one. It was under siege, just not taken. It had been eight hours of fighting until the afternoon. Heavy Cloud Command Hub Zhang Dongyuan and the others watched. The people from Red Dragon Center watched. And even the hub centers of many kingdoms watched. Qin Fei Fei who had arrived at Chuan Feng City and the girls were watching the briefing, as well as some of the internal news. Countless people in the main city were also discussing. It seems like we haven't heard any news about the fall of the 7th region. It's been 8 hours and I really haven't heard it. It couldn't be that the notification is broken, right? No, I heard that the 7th district is still holding out. That's awesome. A few other forward positions would have fallen long ago, right? The 7th sector's forward position is still standing. 
Nima, just outrageous, people abroad are shouting outrageous, whose ministry is it anyway? Then what's the situation with the Red Dragon Nation's 7th sector front position? Copper scale might even be in danger, and they haven't fallen yet? I found out, it's a 6th ranked general named Luo Tong, there's also intel, I heard that a female warrior named Shania is also critical and is helping with the command, general, look, this is from our internal observation, I heard that a person named Mu Chen and Shania have integrated the remnants of the 8th district and the remnants of the 6th district into the 7th district in battle. This 7th sector is doing a good job. The command hubs of the various countries were discussing and maneuvering. This point, if it withstands the second wave, will hold back Chuan Fong city from being attacked for a time that the exterminating level alien beasts would not expect at all. It's likely that they'll spare a certain amount of troops to clear them out. Buying time. The red dragon was taken by surprise. All it needed was time. At the center of the Red Dragon, Lord Xiancheng, the latest scan of the 7th sector just now, there are still more than 5, 000 foreign beasts left, and looking at the cosmic eye observation, their third gate has not yet shattered. What? So powerful? How in the world did that happen? The people at the Red Dragon Center all had unbelievable expressions. It was simply impossible to hold on to it. The people on Zhang Dong Yuan side were also mentioning this. On the main screen, just that point far away was blue. The other red areas were growing. General Manager Zhang pointed out that the foreign beasts near Chuan Feng City have made a move. Has it started? No. Not. The observer put on the big screen. It seems to be splitting off 10 to 20,000 high-speed moving alien beasts, going in reverse to attack the back of the 7th sector's forward position. What? Reverse back to specifically tackle the 7th sector? Chapter 100 responding to the battle with an air carrier stance. The Super Bulldozer. Earth Guardian Battleheim pushed against the shield raising countercharge and crushed back again from the outermost circle. Taking the Black Feather Wargirl with him, he leapt back to the city wall. The hegemony landed. The Black Feathers fell. The Black Feathered Wargirl disappeared. And Li Shi came out of the broken room alone. Shen Aya. Mac Chen. You guys are too strong. Killed a round trip ah. Crushed how many foreign beasts. I'm already in awe. This is Shen Aya in the linked state. Too strong. You guys have a fit of 45 or more. Right? Shania turned around and beheaded the three foreign beasts that jumped up. The battlefield was still going on, but it was already possible to see that the foreign beasts weren't counting for much. There were still four or five thousand counts. How about inside the city? The light dispersed, and Shania and Mu Dust lifted their fusion. Unlike the other drivers and machine nymphs who were so tired that they passed out and panted from exhaustion, the two of them just had a head full of sweat. Li Shi was already damp in her underwear, but the two of them were actually so refreshed after cooperating to kill so many. It was seen as a monster by everyone. This was the intensity gap of the physique. Lying down for a piece, Xin Zhao's legs were still twitching, as if he had handed in his homework five or six times at night and was exhausted. Luo Tong is still reluctant, held out. The damaged weapons are not too many. Sacrificed a lot of people. Kai also sacrificed. The city was in chaos, and the medical team had been rescuing. Hold out for another ten minutes, and our overloaded weapons will be usable again. How long until the Metaforce field recasts? half an hour left, holding on for another hour and a half, the Metaforce field recast would also activate the new mechanical backup wall system, instantly building a new certain system again, although there were wounded everywhere, there were still nearly 40,000 people in sector 7, everyone, there aren't many alien beasts left, exterminate them we hold on to win the second wave, Luo Tong shouted, roar dash, victory was just around the corner, the fey beasts were now in chaos, there was only one fire koan in the sky, and no other emperor level fey beasts were found below, with weapons in hand, and also weapons equipped by machinima, and some machinima under the linkage driver's enchantment to eliminate the tough ones, there was no problem in holding on, seeing the hope one would get more and more courageous the more one fought, but, alert, alert, tens of thousands of flying aliens are attacking the seventh sector's forward positions from the direction of Chuanfeng, alert, tens of thousands of flying alien beasts are attacking the seventh district's front line from the direction of Chuanfeng, the people in the main city were shocked. Not only did the 7th district not fall, but they also let the Fey beasts attacking Chuanfeng city go to wrap up. The 7th district forward position is still there? Many people from the Qin family had already supported Chuanfeng city, and a large amount of supplies and ammunition were on their way. More than 100, 000 transportation vehicles G, already loaded with weapons and ammunition are on the move. This alert was visible to all of Red Dragon, and even the command hubs of each country. The 7th district is gone. This is the killing move. The commander of that alien beast actually saw it. 10,000 is enough. Damn it. Don't we have any support that can go help them? 
The people in the Heavy Cloud Command Hub were slamming their tables in anger. When the teams from the various legions were blocked, they definitely prioritized supporting Copper Scale and supporting Chuan Fong City. Regardless of the guilds and military forces, they were unable to support that side, and the fastest Redleaf Legion V81 regiment would need 4 hours to pass by that side. They have far exceeded expectations in accomplishing their mission. They are all heroes. This alert made countless people despair. Why so sure? The fixed steering of all heavy weapons took time, and the 50 meter huge Talon cannon could only move 30 degrees from side to side. So did the Scorpion beam cannon. Secondly, they were going to be surrounded from front to back. They were already running out of ammunition. And then the beasts in the sky were even more impossible to deal with. It's impossible to fight from the back. Warning, Chuan Fong City area valued at 100. 000 beasts, heading south towards Copper Scale City to attack. Warning, 100. 000 beasts from Chuan Fong City are heading south to attack Copper Scale City. The foreign beasts in the vicinity of Chuan Fong City, the ones in the sky went to the frontline positions in the 7th district, and the ones on the ground all killed towards Copper Scale. The people in the command hubs of each country had expected this. The only surprise was that the 7th district attracted the foreign beasts in the sky. Don't look at only 10,000. These were a higher threat that could rush straight into the city. Luo. Luo team. Here the people of the people confused. Not to mention that they have nearly 40,000 people, of which a third of them are G-body overloaded cannot stand up. Energy hit the exhaustion of the need to rest. A third of them could only hold weapons, transforming into witches who couldn't help. With less than 4,000 pilots now, there were only so many machinima that could link up. We've been very successful, and attracted another extra stream of alien beasts. Everyone, hold on to the last man and we'll live and die together. Luo Tong shouted, and all the pilots and machine nymphs blood boiled. Everyone was holding the determination of certain death. Makchen, teacher, we should go. Li Shi came over. This wave of the seventh area can't be blocked. It can't deal with the enemies in the sky. Hurry up and go. You pair. Fantastic. Can't stop here. Luo Tong patted Shen Aya's shoulder. Tu Lian and Zhong Qingqing were nodding their heads. Qin Zhao and Feng Xian were lying there giving thumbs up. They couldn't stand up yet. Mu Chen dragged his chin. 10,000 flying alien beasts right? Unless there's a powerful air force that can help intercept it. Tu Lian spoke. There isn't. The Red Leaf Legion is also stopped on this line. It will take 4 hours at the earliest. Leave the rest to us. Makoto looked at Shania. Shania crossed her arms in front of her chest. The two made eye contact. But of course the scene was understood by three people. Hey hey, guys aren't it? Come for real? More than 10. 000 foreign beasts saw. Uh, it's estimated that they're all fierce grade and earth grade. Li Shi's clothes weren't even dry yet. Luo Tong and the others didn't know what Li Shi was talking about. It's true that the Air Force doesn't have one. However, there is an aircraft carrier. Nukin smiled. Luo Tong, you guys go all out to clean up the foreign beasts here. And leave the swarm of bugs in the sky to the three of us. Ha, ha, ha. All question marks. Couldn't understand. Shania and Mu Chen were saying something. Instead, it was Li Shi who crossed her arms. First ton 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 drink more water. And then fight. The three of US are going to deal with that wave of flying foreign beasts. Leave it to us. But, there is only one flying. Girl, she, Tulian knew that Li Shi was a double change machine lady. Who said only she had fly? Shania crossed her arms. Only to see that Li Shi had already turned into a fighter jet. And Mac Dan jumped on it first. Nukin hasn't let me transform all this time. I guess I'm also worried about this kind of situation. Luo Tong. Tu Lian. I'll block the foreign beasts coming from behind. I can only help here. After saying this, Shen Aya leapt up. The exterminator 25 fighter took off. Luo Tong and Tu Lian. As well as Zhong Qingqing. They were a bit stunned. They hadn't let Shen Aya transform? Hadn't they all changed once as battle agents? No matter so much. Let's. The clouds in the distant sky shone with light. Alert, SSSR ranked high energy reaction in the sky above the 7th sector's forward position. Alert, SSSR class high energy reaction in the air above the 7th sector's forward position. The people in the heavy cloud hub were confused as to what was going on. The people in red dragon hub didn't know what was happening either. Unable to see, just the people in the 7th sector could barely see that there was an oversized behemoth on the clouds. Shen Aya transformed the Ching Wan space mothership. Li Shi and Mu Chen landed inside. This is the air and space carrier. The Ching Wan space mothership advanced. At the Red Dragon Center and Heavy Cloud Command Hub. Report. We've scanned that a. A. Carrier has appeared in the sky close to the 7th sector. An aircraft carrier? Yes. An airborne carrier. What? An empty sky carrier? Yes. Lord Xianchung. The scanning G body is estimated to be 682 meters. 
and has scanned all kinds of high energy weapons, and she has released 60 mechanical fighters to escort her. And the direction is exactly the direction where the Chuanfeng City airborne alien beasts are attacking. The direction was too obvious on the big screen. This airborne carrier was preparing to meet the tens of thousands of airborne alien beasts. An airborne carrier. It's at least SSS class, right? The warriors of the seventh sector could hear the thunderous sounds generated by the departure of the Qinghuan space carrier. Luo Tong and Tu Lian looked at each other dumbfounded, not knowing what to say. Could it be Shania? Chapter 101, The Space Mothership's Combat Power. Cast the sparring simulation of that mysterious carrier to the sixth screen. Yes, Chief Finger Zhang. The 17th Cosmic Eye is individually macro scanned to form a stereoscopic image to be cast. Stereoscopic 3D optical images of the battlefield. Images of the mountains and plains below. The Qinghuan space mothership flying above. Macro simulated image. Marked as blue friendlies. Directly in front of them, only 10 kilometers away. Dense red dots. Tens of thousands of flying alien beasts coming. The people in the Red Dragon Center were also paying attention to this point. Who was this mysterious gigantic machinima that had suddenly appeared? No one knew, but all could sense that she should be a friendly. It rushed almost straight towards the incoming group of alien beasts. Mu Chen sat on the main control chair, his hands entering the controller to link up with Shania. Li Shi first helped out at the side console. The first time, Mu Chen was the one whose eyes were dazzled and didn't study an understanding at all. Luckily, it was linked, so the direct brain could help with the maneuvering. But Li Shi was an expert in this area. Airspace scanning radar on. The big screen was densely packed with sky alien beasts in the due east position. Biological perception activated. Scanning for enemies. Based on the alien beast's body type and characteristics, it immediately appeared on the big screen. Fierce grade foreign beasts silver round eagle. Maroon ghost magpie. Killer owl. Swarms of green poisonous bats. Accounting for a valuation of 67. Earth grade foreign beasts sound blocker 5. Wind swiftener 3. Air stormer 1 were more numerous. Accounting for a valuation of 32. Makchen. Teacher. The scan has revealed that there are three more emperor level fey beasts. We need to pay attention. That glowing doppelganger fish is actually there too. Images of emperor level foreign beasts appeared. The huge bodied fire kuan was highly recognizable. Upper imperial grade. Two headed devil eagle. With a body of 50 meters. Its wings could fan out waves of light. And its mouth could spew out destructive rays of light. Middle rank of the imperial grade. Devil spirit ghost fire. Mutated unknown creature, like a ghost fire that burns purple flame, able to release terrifying flames, flying speed is also faster, imperial grade higher order, these three will let me do it later, Li Shi directly took off her top jacket, and inside was a close fitting black workout suit, Makoto nodded as the screen got closer and closer, that turbid fish probably didn't expect to encounter a space mothership, they were just going to exterminate a human frontline, maneuvering the space carrier, Shinaya maintain altitude and deceleration, Hatches full open. Escort group ready to respond. All 30 refined 67 fighters and 30 BC-2 bombers took off. The bombers didn't look like they could help. But one by one they were stuffed with bombs. Failing that it was fine to be a self-destructing plane. Ben was all drones. The people in the hub could see the air carrier slowing down and stopping its progress. 60 planes appeared around its perimeter ready to respond. All weapons warmed up. Shipboard hyperbolic laser cannon energy storage commencing. High power particle diffusion cannons on. High power pulse laser cannons on. Large multi-purpose missile vertical launch units filled. Combat platform in the air. Linkage fit 30. Distance is still 2 kilometers. Get a little closer before we hit. Let these bugs know how powerful we are. Best to aim at the angle of a royal level alien beast. 1 kilometer to go. Li Shi acted as an assistant first. The main gun directly in front of the Qinghuan space mothership opened. And the silver magnetic lightning circle of 10 layers was augmented. Shipboard hyper laser cannon. Fire. Boom dash. The clouds dispersed and space roared. The sound was heard clearly from 20 kilometers away in the Earth 7 area. A 5 meter thick laser with 10 layers of rotating light waves attached. A straight line cleared the air. It even shot through the sky above Chuan Fong City. The terrifying penetrating laser scared countless machine girls into screaming. And all kinds of mechanical drip 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 alarms continued to sound. Those who saw it leaked oil on the spot. The deathly laser penetrated through 100. 000 meters of sky. 2. Too powerful. Li Shi saw that the range was over 100. 000 meters. This was completely a cannon hitting a mosquito. She aided in reporting from the side. Well played. Fire Kuan was also seconded. Not to mention the Fire Kuan. Even the dragon level Fire Kuan Lord had to be taken away by this cannon. Shinaya and Mu Dust didn't know just how powerful this main cannon was. And now it looked like it was indeed a cannon hitting a mosquito. 
with several hundred alien beasts disappearing in a straight line. Coming, all the fey beasts pounced on them, with countless roars of life-threatening fey beasts. Muchen hadn't injected his talent just now, and now the S-class beacon fire was injected. Crimson light linked from Mu Chen's arm into Shin Ayaji's body. Considering the level of the fatal Fei beast, the S-class high power particle diffusion cannon was injected. High power particle diffusion cannon. Fire. Wow. Wow. The number of diffusion particle cannons tripled, sending a golden curtain rain towards the sky. Instantly there was a mist of blood. High power pulse laser cannons fire indiscriminately. The large multi-purpose missile vertical launching units on the back platform were fully open. Each unit was a 10 missile flurry. Instantly 210 flying missiles were fired. 30 DC-2 bombers suicidally rushed towards the alien beasts. The sky became a sea of bombardment as the first wave of firepower exploded. On the big screen in the hub center, the red dots that disappeared in a straight line were seen just now. This first moment of the firefight. It was as if one-fifth of the red dots disappeared again. The entire sky exploded into a sea of fire. Mukin, Li Shi shouted before opening the hatch and leaping out. Fusion Li Shi. Accept. Transformation. Radiant Wargirl. Highlighted blue points of light appeared on the hub's large screen. Wargirls appearing on the carrier. Scanning for a familiar energy response. Report. Should be the glory Wargirl labeled 0003. The alien beasts rushed up again in a frenzy. And Li Shi killed a straight line. To the left and right of her side were refined 67 fighters. Firing together at the Fey. Terahir reflex force field unfolds. The destructive sound waves of several thousand Fey beasts. As well as the venom and fireballs. All hit the force field. Taral Barrier 97. Tarahir Reflective Energy 7. The number was large, but they were all fierce and earth level, and Shania's force field was enough to easily block them. The particle diffusion cannon radiated again. The back unit launcher fired missiles. Shania. Steady. You want to empty all your reserves as soon as you come. Ha ha ha. Cool. Maction firing is. Output at full power. Mac Dust controlled the refined 67 fighter with his left hand helping Li Shi to open up. Even if it crashed and exploded, he still had to help her share the firepower. 30 BC-2 Bombers 030. The carrier is good. It's just too burnt. The bombers are all gone in the first place. 30 BC-2-67 Fighters 1130. 20 million credits. They'll be gone in less than 5 minutes. Carrier strike group launched. Except for the main guns. All weapon charges instantly complete a charge to fire. All 10 9th generation S-class Xin Feng Air and Sky Fighters departed. Rays of light traveled through the sky. Countless angles penetrated. 10 minutes. The alien beasts disappeared by more than 5,000 counts. That floating turbot. A mid-rank dragon level imperial demonic spirit beast was stunned. How did the human machinima have this kind of cosmic weapon in existence? There are only a handful of human space motherships in the intelligence. How could they appear here? It wouldn't have appeared in the front battlefield. Right? Golden light. The radiance war girl killed up. Block her. The imperial level two-headed demon eagle took on the radiance battle girl, weaving through the air. Honey, let's just run over it. Ha ha, that's how I like it. Shania just loved going head on. Shepherd dust harnessed the carrier and pushed forward. It was surrounded and sprayed by hornet-like alien beasts, but they just couldn't break through the force field and were crushed when they crashed into it. At the same time, the Shin Feng air skyfighter controlled by Mu Chen weaved and directly rushed towards that imperial demon spirit beast. It couldn't be allowed to run away. The ninth generation of Xin Feng Air Sky Fighters had strong combat power and super fast speeds. Makoto just controlled them to pester the turbot fish. Terra Hall Barrier 87. Terra Hair Reflective Energy 47. These four, 000 to 5, 000 flying alien beasts were crashing and spraying light rays, but they just couldn't do anything about this huge airborne carrier. Moreover, Terra Hair Reflective Energy can be activated when it exceeds 30. Shinaya. Tar All Reflection is activated. Shining brightly. With the Green Wan Space Mothership as the center, an omnidirectional and dead angle free destructive shockwave spread over a thousand meters. Clatter, clatter, clatter. The incomparably noisy sky seemed to quiet down at this moment. Chapter 102 Pure Sky. Shinaya's Absolute Mightiness. The people in the Red Dragon Center and the Heavy Cloud Hub would stare at the sixth screen when they had time. The copper scale side was too dense for the macro scans to see, and it was impossible to distinguish. Moreover, the magnetic field was extremely strong. And the scanning might not necessarily be correct multiple times to correct it, but Shania's side was different. The number is not too many, and the number of macro scans is clear. Just now. Swish. Quickly ah. Suddenly four or five thousand red dots were gone. F.A. What happened? How come the alien beast suddenly disappeared by a few thousand? That space mothership should have released some powerful move with her as the center. So powerful. 
more than 10,000 foreign beasts, and now there are only 2,000? This was faster than taking a brush to the screen. Above the battlefield, the Radiant Wargirl was cutting out golden trajectories as it pierced down from above the clouds, and it was fortunate that Mu Dust's voice had informed him in advance. This was also too strong. Pure sky, worthy of having a SSSR level weapon. Not even molecular powder was left behind, and an emperor level foreign beast would have been crushed. Wings of Radiance Flash. The two headed demon eagle was frantically dodging her attacks, but she carried the dawn banner gun with two precise shots, shooting through both heads of the twin eagles. An imperial level beast was wiped out again. There were only a relatively sparse thousand or so foreign beasts in the sky, and the glowing turbot was intercepted by Xianfeng's air and skyfighter attacking it from multiple angles. This foreign beast was able to unfold its magic ability field, and the attacks were temporarily blocked. Ghost fire destructive rays were suddenly sprayed, and the glowing battle fairy shakily dodged them. Li Shi was shocked out of cold sweat. If she were in the past, this sneak attack could not be avoided. Demon spirit ghost fire. You're next. Li Shi fired two shots in a row. The demon spirit ghost flame suddenly disappeared. It can hide its shape and can also flicker in a 50 meter area. However, the Radiant Wargirl had an absolute advantage in speed. Insight unfolded. Sensing the airflow of the other party's movement, golden light particle jets. The Radiance Battle G chased after it. Inside the Green Luan Space Mothership, both Mu Chen and Shania were still excited. It was like a soccer match, where the two killed through the opponent's 11-man defense. The power far exceeded their estimation. The advanced warriors of the Terahir Star, the pure energy Terahir's core that took 2,000 years to condense and fuse, even the Archon coveted it. There were only a hundred advanced warriors on the entire planet, and Shin Aya had absorbed it with the help of Mac Can. So how could it not be powerful? Tarahir Barrier 82. Tarahir Reflective Energy 1. There was one more shot from the ship's hyperbolic laser cannon, which was slow to recharge and recover, and a quarter of the other weapons. This frenzy of bombardment was still very taxing on the weapons. My dear teacher, now that more energy ammo is saved, we'll shoot with the high energy pulse laser cannons, in conjunction with the broad axe bombs. At your service, the pressure plummeted, and the seven remaining refined 67 fighters flew back to assist Shania in clearing the sky of the remnants. Pulse cannon boom 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 boom, shattered seven or eight of them in one shot. Shania's shooting ability was incomparably accurate. On the other hand, Mu Chen was controlling the Xianfeng air and sky fighters. Since their weapons couldn't destroy the opponent's defenses, they would keep three to keep you from leaving, and then the other seven would fight the alien beast stragglers. The Xianfeng air sky fighters were equipped with quantum tracking missiles and continuous penetrating lasers, and because they were essentially the weapons of the machine lady, they could also link up to multiply their power several times over, and each one of them chased after the foreign beasts and shot wildly. Shepard Dust's multi-party control was like fighting a thunderbolt fighter. Advance. Let's go and tackle that turbot fish. Be careful. Let's force field maintain. This monster I always feel is dangerous. From a normal viewpoint, the battle power of a very high spiritually intelligent foreign beast was not too high. However, both of them were clear that they should never be careless. As for the other alien beasts that pounced on them, the space mothership's force field crashed and shot them at the same time. High up in the sky, the radiant wargirl was chasing after the demonic spirit ghost flame. The doppelganger imperial demon spirit beast let out a strange roar, and the rest of the alien beasts were desperate to wildly pounce on the space carrier. Instead, they crashed themselves. Chi Finger Zhang the air battle. Carriers over there are already going to be purged. One carrier wiped out the other side? There are still three to four hundred counts, as well as two high light energy bodies, which should be imperial or dragon level xenomorphs. The radiant battleheim is fighting with one of them. Even if there were only simulated points of light, it was roughly possible to judge. The green lawn space mothership was less than a thousand meters away from the imperial demon spirit beast, and it let out a hoarse human voice. Why would this planet's life form give birth to a higher life? How did it do it? It's impossible. It's absolutely impossible. The energy glow emanating from Shania. Its own weapon level. It had long ago judged it to be a high level life. Who are you? Which planet's life is it? If you don't tell me, you're waiting to be racked up on a test bed and split into experimental subjects. Confess and be lenient, and give you a pain in the ass. Shania's voice echoed in the air. Ha 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 ha. Tiny planetary life. Actually threatening our lacustrine crystal spirit. Rockest? Planet name? The other party had come by breaking through the wormhole, and the mutation was most likely due to them. And what is your relationship with the planet Taral? Taral? How could you possibly know that name? It let out a shrill sound and suddenly began to mutate from a greenish light to a purple color. Crystal Titanium Fusion. Intense light flashed as it transformed into a half-humanoid monster with four long tentacles. Must take you higher beings. Die. 
The four tentacles on its head burned, and its mouth opened oversized, spewing out black and red rays of destruction as its entire body burned. It was as if it sacrificed its body to boost its power. The destruction rays blasted in. Baird 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 Baird. Maxion and Shania hadn't been slacking off in the slightest, and the Terra Hell Barrier had been kept fully open. The force field flickered. Terra Hall Barrier 47. Terra Hair Barrier 31. Makoto. Shania. The airborne radiant wargirl turned around and saw the sudden scene. The other party actually mutated to spew out a destructive beam of light. The light shone. Linkage fit 39. Dislike wave? Waste the energy of the ship's hyperbolic laser cannon. Transform. Wan Huang Heavenly Realm Warrior Girl. Directly dodging the opponent's destructive rays. Light like speed flashes. By the time the gathering battle forms Imperial Demon Spirit Beast realized it. The Phoenix Heavenly Realm Wargirl was already less than 10 meters to its flank. A shot pierced through the force field and shattered as if it were glass. Against the creature's head. The thunder splitting god gun in her hand drilled through and penetrated. And the high energy pulse laser cannon mounted on her shoulder with two more laser penetrations attached. To the death in seconds. The head of the imperial demon spirit beast exploded. And its body fell down from the heights. Everyone in the heavy cloud hub and red dragon center was watching. Just now. The alarm went off with a SSS ranked high energy warning. And suddenly that huge carrier disappeared. Making many people worry that something was wrong. Which knew that an ultra high light energy point appeared. Flashing the screen with blinding energy. With a body scan of only 20 meters. That carrier transformed into a war girl? Transformed? Really? Xian Qing's eyes widened. And those three words carried incomparable envy. This level of ripple was extremely difficult to have a harness adapted. She and the high precision simulator. With multiple constructions and simulations. Had only reached a maximum of 10%. Xian Qing also wanted to transform into a battle maiden. That was why she had been very supportive of the research of the Ultra Core so that she would also have the opportunity to transform into her battle girl form alone. Disappeared. That ultra-high energy alien beast. The life characteristics disappeared. It must have been killed by the carrier transforming into that war girl. Too strong. Who the hell is she? And who is the driver? Zhang Dongyuan thought about it, walked out and dialed a phone number. Hello Mrs. Black Rose. I am Zhang Dongyuan from the Heavy Cloud Hub. Chapter 103, The First Wave of Beast Tight Ends. Temporary Repairing. Mr. Zhang refers to not controlling the chaotic battlefield. How come he is calling my personal phone? Then the radiant war girl is one of yours. Right? Oops. Chief Finger Zhang you should know that I'm not the heavy cloud region lighthouse guide anymore. Seeing as we have worked together in the past, I can give you a simple reply that she's a guide. I think I can guess. Yes. This is something we have knowledge of. So the few times she acted and appeared, we did not investigate. Zhang Dongyuan asked in a low voice. That space mothership is one of yours? Ouch. 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 If I say I don't know either, would you believe me? Lady Black Rose and Tian Sua were also watching. Li Shi had flown directly out of the carrier's body and was a transformed war girl, so she definitely knew them, but they didn't know either. You don't know either? Aha, uh -huh. that little girl has a lot of her own intentions and plans. She rushed to the front line. We wouldn't do that in her place. Zhang Dongyuan hung up his communication and walked the command center. This new head of the lighthouse heavy cloud region. A young woman? I must meet her sometime. The screen returned to Mu Chen's side. Eight rays of light pierced through the demonic spirit ghost flame to kill it. And when he looked back, there were five mechanical Xianfeng battle maidens flying in the sky, clearing the remaining foreign beasts already. Shin Aya transformed into a war girl. And that Xianfeng Yaren skyfighter also immediately transformed into a mecha form? Many of the carrier's equipment layers went to these mechs, transforming from a single fortress into a powerful team of battle maidens. A golden light was drawn. Li Shi landed on the ground and looked at the gigantic Luan Huang Heavenly Realm Battle G. The powerful aura made it impossible for people to get close. As if there was a pinpoint aura. And that was even with convergence. How is it? Shin Aya squatted down. Her hand touching the Imperial Demon Spirit Beast corpse for Mu Dust to scan. Name, Imperial Demon Spirit Beast Ear. Title, Lacoste Star Crystal Spiritist. Rank 55. Ability, Interstellar Interference Light Wave. Strong Harness Life Control. Crystal Titanium Fusion State. Status, dead. Special, the Sentinel Spiritist's Crystal Core can synthesize a high-level weapon. A Rakustian. A commander-type monster that may explode with dragon-level destructive power in a short time of transformation. Chopping open the abdomen. A light red crystal core appeared. This can be used to upgrade weapons later. It's mine. Li Shi pouted. I won't grab it for you even if you kill it. I want a little bit of stumps on it. Wait for Li Shi to seal a little bit of the stump and then incinerate its body. Luo Tong. Luo Tong. Can you hear it on your side? The distance is not too far. 
and this turbot fish was eliminated. Less than Xuan Fingqing's signal is restored a lot. Shen Aya, we can hear. How about your side? Shen Aya and Mu Chen were really tired this time. Sitting in the cockpit of the Exterminator 25 fighter, hovering in the air. We've taken care of the airborne beasts. How's it going on your side? What? You guys solved it? Tu Lian, Zhang Qingqing, Feng Xian, and Qin Zhao, who were listening to the connection next to them, did not believe their ears. It's only been more than half an hour. There are only three of them. How can? Say something. We'll come back if it's not resolved. No. No. We've just finished cleaning up the beasts on our side. And we've just finished eliminating them as well. Now on the Citadel machine ladies lying on the ground apiece. Injured. Exhausted collapse. Energy ammunition exhausted. We'll go to Kawafong City to recuperate. You guys wait for the announcement. I'm counting on you. The mission of the 7th District forward really has long been completed. Helping Chuan Feng City to delay the idea of the beast attack. With Shen Aya and Mu Dust's judgment, they might be notified to evacuate. After all, Chuan Feng City had enough preparations, so the delay in their frontline positions wouldn't have much meaning. Over at Copper Scale City, the great battle had been continuing. The 120, 000 foreign beasts that had passed southward from Chuan Feng City were blocked by the 300, 000 of the Earth Wind Legion, and they were mixing it up in the Copper Boat Heights. The three of them, Mu Chen and Shen Aya, arrived at Chuan Feng City. The city with over 5 million people was now heavily armed as a fortress. Anti-aircraft lights and multiple floating radars spread out, scanning the airspace without a dead angle to avoid having something as terrifying as a night attack. The Dragonheart AI scanning wasn't able to scan 100%. As for the Cosmic Eye the signal was poor. How come the signal of Chuan Feng City is worse than the rest of the city? Obviously the foreign beasts haven't come yet. Li Shi landed and changed back to her human form, and took out the instrument from under her skirt. The interference signal was at the red level, and it almost couldn't be sent out beyond 500 meters. Mac Chen, teacher, I suspect that there's something wrong with Chuan Feng City. Shen Aya also nodded. Find our people first. Qin Fei Fei had a message for us, and most of us were assigned to the 27th square area. Patrols, vigilante squads, a large number of them were patrolling the city. The entire city of Chuan Feng City was under martial law in preparation for war, and when they were in the prescribed landing area, Someone immediately came up to interrogate them. So it's Vice Instructor Mu and Shania. Are the two of you retreating from the 7th Sector's forward positions? The patrol saluted. Yes, right now the 7th Sector is holding firm for the time being. Here's the debriefing form. The forward positions are significant enough. My suggestion is for them to retreat back, repair and join the battle for Chuan Feng City. Understood. We'll report it up immediately. You guys are amazing. More than 12 hours had passed. The frontline positions of the 7th district were still there. For the time being, the third wave of alien beast swarms hadn't come. Heavy Cloud Academy, except for the ship girls and transporter maidens, were all arranged in the 27th square formation planned by Chuan Feng City. Li Shi and Shen Aya were eating while walking. Their energy consumption was huge, especially the ammunition for their own weapons, and they hadn't eaten lunch or dinner, so resting and eating were both better ways to go. Now two-thirds of the entire Chuan Feng City's buildings were split and destroyed building giant cannons and weapons instead, some of which went underground. With over 5 million people in Kawafan City, over 4 million would be left behind. Even if they were F-ranked machine girls and pilots, they would all go to battle in batches and arrangements. Only the injured who were underage and elderly could be transferred and transported back to Heavy Cloud City overnight. Behind the area from the tent square, it was almost all simple alloy tents except for weapons such as anti-aircraft guns. Morong Buwo sat on a camp tent, eagle-like and lonely. And the sense of crisis of the fan girls from the surrounding academies seemed to be lower. Zhao Pengfei's side had a lot of people. And the pro guards witches that weren't arranged were all there. Seeing Mu Chen and Shania, they returned. Teacher Shania is here. Did they take the last class? Are you a pig? Didn't the rumor spread just now? Teacher Shania went to support the frontline position in the 7th district. I almost forgot. The 7th district's frontline position blocked both waves of alien beast swarms. It's too powerful. Teacher must have killed quite a few. What nonsense. How could teacher's G body fight with high intensity? Why are Maxion and Li Shi also with teacher? Guess they were the ones who took the last transport. Ha ha ha. Those who are afraid of death will definitely go last. Normal. Still think you can escape? Brother Pang Fei was the first to get on the transportation plane. The school grass personal guards were not treating Mu Chen's side well. As you said one thing and I said another. The academy had more than 700 people in the vicinity. And Qin Fei Fei and Beldet and the girls all walked over. Plebeians, are you guys alright? It must have been tough with less support from this young lady, right? Indeed. 
almost couldn't make it back. Nukin smiled. Xin Fei Fei and Yutina didn't say anything, but their eyes showed worry. Susan immediately went to see Li Shi. The teachers weren't together. They were the war girls would be assigned to the war girl squad. Because they were a student team, they were not the first to go up to the city walls. Shin Aya was different. She belonged to the free people, or belonged to the old and weak area. At this time, three people from the command team walked over. One man and two women, wearing uniforms. The man was a third class brigade position, and the two witches were second class squads. All there, all stand still. I am the commanding officer of your 27 square first team, Di Bang. These two are the vice commanding officers Shi Qing and Shi Xiaoping. The 27th square first team's action deployment will be commanded by the three of us on the spot. The three of us are also graduates of Heavy Cloud Academy, and are considered to be five years above you as seniors and older sisters. Class A driver Senior D Bang. It seems like I've seen his name on the Academy's introduction board. So dignified. D Bang walked in the center. All of you stand still. Although Chuanfeng City has not been attacked yet, the SS class beast tide is far more than that. It has been observed that there are still millions of foreign beasts assembling in the Great Rift Valley of Galarbai, and they may attack at any time. Right now, I need to tell you all about some reality stuff. Daibun saluted Shania. Even though she didn't have a position at the moment, Shania was two years younger than him now a teacher. M.S. Shania come out for a moment. It's just time to borrow your Chakra Tong wristwatch and show everyone listening to you the merit system. Chapter 104, Battle Performance is so high it's ridiculous. The 27th Square's first team of pilots and machine girls all approached. After all, it was an academy square. The tacit understanding was there. Gentlemen, in this age, adulthood comes with this mission. And your ability to enter the academy itself is all directed towards training and development in this area. I don't want to say more words of encouragement. Everyone understands that when we get here, no one can retreat or evacuate without a retreat order. Shinaya walked up and out, putting on a ponytail, her hair still a little wet. Having changed just now on the plane, Daibun tapped on his chakra watch first, revealing it to be a blue interface that said zero for this feat. I'm going to explain to you all a very real problem. When entering the beast wave, all people's pulse pass wristwatches will receive a recruitment. Whether affiliated with a guild, or a free individual, they will have this interface. As you have presumably seen, they had been discussing this for a long time, and many of them knew about it. This is the battle record system. Also practiced in various countries since more than 300 years ago, where valor is rewarded as well as selected. Killing foreign beasts will earn battle merit points. For example, killing 10 bug levels earns 1 point. The merit gained at the end of this beast tide. The major unit hubs should be recruited. Selected. The unit is prioritized, or exchanged for a variety of weapons. Life resources. This point is the proof of your valor in battle. Of course it can be exchanged for a large number of credits. The major hubs will rely on this data and recruit new personnel, regardless of whether it was a security or defense hub. It was basically people who had faced several beast tides. They were all people who had been baptized and tested. If the guys sacrifice, your points will be inherited by your immediate family, which can be set in advance. The words were a bit heartless, but all of them were mandatory recruits. And this was also considered a kind of thing to leave behind for future generations. The specific points look like, Mr. Shinaya. Please come show yours. As your senior, I'm sure a lot of people want to enter the defense hub. If you get 100 merits this time, you might have hope, and you'll be awarded the Guardian Medal. Shania clicked on his current Beast Tide merit page, 4071. Everyone was silent. D Bang didn't see it and was still saying, The battlefield is incomparably dangerous. You should also preserve yourself when fighting against the beasts. Don't rush out mindlessly for the sake of the tough 100 merit points. That's equivalent to sending yourself to death. Brigadier Dibin. What rewards can there be for 4? 000 merit points. Utana asked a question. 4000 points? Are you crazy? Holding a nuclear weapon and rushing can't even have this much. Exchange credits can exchange 400 million. Not to mention this merit points. 1000 points Chong Yun Zheng Chief Finger will give you a personal handshake. And may also be specially hired. Shi Qing pestled him. Shi Xiaoping had already covered her mouth. Interrupting me for what? Di Bang looked at her. You. Look at Shin Aya's feats. I know that there should be dozens of the frontline positions in the seventh sector that she went to support. And I. Poof. D Bang sprayed on the spot when he saw the number. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. The other students didn't hold back their laughter when they saw the expression on D Bang's brigade's face. Many were confused. Over 4,000? Shinaya. You didn't make a mistake with your pulse pass watch? You didn't get this much even when you totaled it twice in your calendar. Did you? D Bang wiped his eyes and looked again. It was indeed the current beast tide. It seems like there are more kills this time. 
This is called more? The turbot fish that alien doesn't count as a beast, or else it would have to go up by 300. Di Bang immediately waved his hand. His words tinged with envy and shock. Shania did you go and throw nuclear eggs at the frontline position in the 7th district? That much? You're ridiculously high. Xi Jiaoping's squad joked. With this merit, you can shout Jiang General Finger back and forth to shake hands four times? After this fight, Mu Chen could have broken Zhang Dongyuan's hand. Poo dash. Poo dash. Ha 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 ha. Shania laughed out. That it's only a matter of killing more so that Chief Zhang can point that zombie face and force a brilliant smile to shake his hand. Put. Ha ha ha. Laughing without living? Half of the people at the scene were laughing. Who dared to say this about Chief Commander Zhang Dongyuan of the Heavy Cloud Main City? He had always been immensely respected. As if he was the image of a god of war. Shania used to be a henchman under him. Zombie face? Only Shania dared to say it like that. Shu, Shania, do you want him to know? Shi Jiaoping immediately covered her mouth. Ahem. Di Bang immediately pulled away from the topic. Just now it was just a joke. Right. Student Nukin you have battle points. Show everyone how many. Di Bang thought of it. Hadn't Nukin and Qin Fei Fei transformed into battle girls? They valiantly fought against the raiding aerial beasts in the heavy cloud main city. Mine? Nukin was still chewing food in his mouth. Hungry. After fighting for so long. How come it's the same as the one who came back from fleeing? Didn't eat in the school cafeteria at noon? I see that Li Shi is also eating. All ate in the school cafeteria at noon, right? I didn't eat much at that time because I was worried too. Nukin Tun 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 drank two mouthfuls of milk. It's true that I didn't eat at noon and dinner. Where did you go? I remember that in the morning. General Finger Zhang was still signaling for you. The two were fairly familiar. They had met a few times in the defense hub. And the title Mu Chen was still one level above him. Mu Dust tapped the pulse pass wristwatch. It's not much. It's just that I went with Shania to the 7th district frontier position. To throw nuclear eggs. The wristwatch screen reality merit, 3309. Put. How come it's so high too? Ridiculously high. Maxion went to support the 7th district with teacher Shania. That's two waves of foreign beasts fought in the 7th district's frontline position? It can't be that the fact that the 7th district's forward position was able to hold down had something to do with them, right? How helpful can two people be? Two people's battle points means they have a great deal to do with it. Qin Fei Fei laughed evilly. Aya, how many do you have? Li Shi, you're going too, aren't you? Deliberately, Qin Fei Fei. Li Shi was clearly eating next to her. And as a result, once her flirtatious voice said that, all the surrounding students looked at Li Shi. The three of them did come back together. Li Shi also went to the front line? No wonder she's very hungry right now eating. So they've been fighting all this time? How marvelous. It's so awesome. Some of the witches admired them. I'm sure my legs are weak when I see so many foreign beasts. Qin Fei Fei squeezed over. How many do you have? Li Shi gave her a blank look. Be careful I'll squeeze your arsenal. Damn it. Not much. I'm not as crazy as they are about killing. Li Shi also had 1151. It was actually quite high. She had solved more imperial level foreign beasts. Her merit was naturally not low. Cough cough. The words will be said here. Everyone in the 27th square 1 team keep the best condition. Even if the alien beasts attack to fight in squads, always be ready to listen to the command action of the three of us. Understand? Understood. Di Bang and Sher Chang nodded their heads and left. The activity area could not just leave the square formation area. Right now, there were non-stop transports in the sky and transports coming from the ground. Guilds from all over the world were coming with support. And without good coordination, millions of people would be in a mess. Zhao Pengfei walked out and turned to Mu Chen. Mu Chen, you wait for me. If the beast tide comes, my merit will definitely exceed yours. Exceed? Utina was about to laugh out loud. It was simply impossible. That number of points for Mu Chen and Shania was already heaven defying. Perhaps these students still didn't know how terrifying that number of points was. Nukin smiled. It's fine. Let's make it 3,300 points. Let's compare at that time. It's a deal. Let's go. As Zhao Pengfei left with his personal guards, the others dispersed one after another. What was in most people's hearts was panic. Just as Di Bong had said, the beast tide hadn't ended long ago. It was still an appetizer now, and the main course would begin soon. Allocated alloy tents. Xin Fei Fei arranged for their people to be in two next to each other. A dozen of them were all together. In less than three minutes, everyone heard a soft snore. Shin Aya was asleep for a second. Li Shi also lost her voice in the next tent. She should have rested as well. Originally, Beldet and the girls had a lot of problems, but now they let Makoto have a good rest. The sky dawned. Have you heard? The Copper Scale City side just finished fighting. How was the battle? It seems like it was very tragic, and the communication team just came back. 
Mu Chuan opened his eyes, took a look at Qin Fei Fei sleeping on his right side, immediately rolled over to the left and directly rolled over onto Li Shi, and was also face to face intimate. Mu Kun, Splat, Chapter 105, Mission Refresh, Air Sentry Ability, Red Slap Marks on Mu Chuan's Face. Su Shan and Qin Fei Fei in the tent saw it hiding their mouths and snickering. Li Shi stared viciously at Mu Chen, and took a look at Qin Fei Fei who was snickering next to her. Whatever, turned her head and continued to sleep. Mu Chuan ate a big, seems not to be a loss ah, at least the goods really kissed to the face. The main thing is that Mu dust, Li Shi is used to it. Other people want to be blown into powder by her until, but Mu dust well, and then overdo it, as if, it will not be how. This little episode Mu dust woke up, walked out to wash up, found that many students are unable to sleep, anxiety and anxiety. It is likely that they cannot live to go back, because the communication signal is poor. Even if the parents are also in Xuan Feng City more than 500 meters cannot be contacted. It was like a thousand years ago. If the internet was cut off, it would cause uneasiness and a lot of things couldn't be done. Not to mention that it was now a battlefield. Hello comrade in arms. Hello, assistant instructor Mu. It was easy for Mu Chen to go out and move around, changing his clothes and going out. The battle situation on the copper scale side is out? Please take a look. It was spread internally just now. The communication team flew back half an hour ago. The other party scratched the internal information on his screen. Copper Scale City had resolved all the alien beasts at around 3 in the morning, and from the photographic images the battle seemed to be grueling as well. The giant metaphorce field was shattered early enough for the Xenos to storm the city at 9 in the evening. First was the external core barrier. The western barrier was damaged 79 and was currently being repaired. Eight huge holes over 30 meters were particularly conspicuous. This was the death ray of the dragon level creeping source giant worm. Ignoring the force field running through the walls, in a straight line the war giants could be killed in seconds. The corpse of the hundred meter war giant lay on the city wall, surrounded by the remains of three other war maidens, who fought as hard as they could in order to block it. All the weapons on the western wall were destroyed, human blood and alien beast blood infested, turning the fish scale black and copper colored wall green and red. The northern and southern walls had over 30 degrees of damage. The first, sixth, seventh, fourteenth, and 26 squares of the copper scales were all killed in action. 30 squares fought in the main force, and the others had varying degrees of extensive sacrifice. These are the main force on the walls. Just these predicted sacrifices of 54, 000 people. The number of wounded unquantifiable. If there is no 2, 3, 4, these frontline positions desperately delaying time. It is possible that the number of deaths in copper scale city will at least double tenfold, and even deaths of more than a million are possible. North City Wall Bastion 31 weapons damaged. South City Wall Bastion 38 weapons damaged. The 20 close defense cannons were almost completely destroyed by the desperate alien beasts. Weapons like the Pulse Flak Cannon and the Mega Destroyer Howitzer inside the city were damaged to the extent of 13. The underground populated areas were also invaded by subterranean Xenos, resulting in over 3,570 deaths. The city was invaded causing over 6, 320 casualties. The overhead photo is a mess. Looking at the various figures, less than 100, 000 people were killed and sacrificed in battle, which really isn't a lot for a city of 5 million people. But, this is just the beginning. The destroyed weapons have to be disassembled and reassembled into new giant cannons, and supplies and ammo from all sides are being transported. This will take time, and the walls of the destroyed barriers weren't that easy to repair. The copper scale barrier only had two layers, and if both layers were broken, it would collapse. How long will it take for the western barriers to be fully repaired? Now that the repair teams are all on board, it will take four days at the earliest. All of these alien beasts are acting like they know where our heavy weapons are. Shepherd Dust had also discovered that the hidden destructive great energy cannons had almost all been destroyed, and the alien beasts were like open charts, looking at another set of intelligence. The copper boat heights melee was even more tragic. The 300. 000 people of the Earth Wind Legion Advance Regiment were engaged in a battle with the foreign beasts in the past of Chuan Fong City, and in order to help ease the pressure on copper scale, they chose to start the battle at Copper Boat Heights. It took 90, 000 people killed in battle to destroy the beasts. These are all elites. Zhang Dongyuan was also incomparably heartbroken as he watched the report. He even knew that if it wasn't for the mysterious carrier that attracted away the air power of the beast, otherwise, the casualties might have to be more than 120. 000 people. Vice Instructor Mu. Look at this intelligence. It just arrived. The main city of Copper Scale is now in full repair. The cloth formation is starting to shift. The number of people in the city is replenished to 4, 5 million, 
and there are more than 1 million people sheltering underground, including the old, sick, and disabled of the witches who don't have any combat power, as well as those who are injured. A massive buildup of Galarbi Rift Fae has been scanned, and the wave of beasts is far from over. It could attack at any time. North of Copper Scale, at a distance of 2 kilometers, the Earth Wind Legion converged and was building a 440 area defense line relying on the highlands and energy stations, totaling 650. 000 people in the Earth Wind Legion, 2 kilometers to the south, 500. 000 Skyfire Legion is building the 441 regional defense line, so as to divide the two alien beasts impact areas and alleviate Copper Scale siege. The Guanhong Legion's advance of 200. 000 arrived, and another 800. 000 are on their way. The crisis of the sea beast tide on the Nansha side had not been lifted, so they were unable to support it. At the heavy cloud boundary, 2 million Earth Wind Legions completed their assembly. Currently in the main city was 1 million Heavenly Fire Legion on standby. What about our side's deployment? The Red Leaf Legion's V81 SC regiment had already arrived 20 kilometers south of Chuanfeng and numbered 250, 000 people. Red Leaf's V82 ND and V83 RD regiments were farther away and needed to regroup after engaging the alien beast swarms. The main city of Heavy Cloud barely had any main battle corps to support this side. Instead, the first batch, totaling 3 million earrank or higher machine girls and driver conscripts were already in place. No wonder the city is full of temporary squares. On top of that, more than 50 guilds from the support had already registered. Wait, has the order to retreat from the forward positions in the 7th sector been sent out yet? No, Vice Guide Mu, that can't be. It wasn't reported to Chief Metropolitan Fan? Yuan Shinaya's report was submitted yesterday. Mu Chen's eyes changed slightly. He didn't ask more questions. It's still early. After breakfast he'll go and ask. Coming back to look at the other data. Mu Chen first returned to sit inside the tent. Su Shan and Xin Fei Fei had already gotten up and were curious about what Mu Chen was looking at. So he simply shared it with them. He sat in the corner to collect his rewards and claimed his quests. Forgetting about too many battles yesterday. In addition to the fours level characters. 123 was completed yesterday. 45 was completed a few days ago. Ding completed mission 1. Destroy 1000 ferocious level and above alien beasts in a beast tide. S rank. Obtained reward, 5 mercury spirit body ultralight painting chips. S rank. Upgrade the super chip of the flying mecha. Loaded for half an hour after swallowing it to take effect permanently. Ding complete mission 2. Level up to 20. Grade B. Gained reward, level B sentinel power. The host can fly in the air. I can fly by myself? Shepherd Dust immediately drilled out to try. There were many people. Shepherd Dust just simply tried. It was estimated that it could reach the speed of an ordinary motorcycle. If I level up in the future, then won't I be able to wear my underwear outside? Ding, completing mission 3, destroying an imperial grade alien beast. Level B, reward obtained, physique boosted by 100 points. Makoto was now at rank 21, with a monster grade physique value of 485. Ding, SSS task system refreshed. Quest 12345 refreshes 5 new quests. 1. Destroy 400 new earth level and above alien beasts in a beast tide. SS level. 2. Level up to 25. B rank. 3. Eliminate 2 new dragon level alien beasts. Level S. 4. Go to the room to explore. Level A. 5. Attacking the entire army. Following the initiative of an army of more than 300. 000 counts or more. And storming the group of alien beasts. SS level. Chapter 106. Shepherd's Dust facing the chief commander directly. Ding, based on the number of completions you've made, you've been given an opportunity to reset your quest, which can be used at any time. There were currently no quests that Mu Dust wanted to reset. The force ranked danger and opportunity of repelling the Red Flame Archon went hand in hand, so it was natural to keep it. Quest 123 was all with this beast tied, and there was a good chance that Mu Chen would complete it. The two S ranks were both good tasks that could not be missed. Instead, Task for exploring the room was quite strange, and it was returned to a level A where the difficulty wasn't low. The mission area was even very close. Looking along the map, his expression carried a few moments of doubt. This location? Chuan Feng Hub Combat Center? Mu Chen thought that he was going to the front line to investigate, but he didn't know that he was within a city. Wasn't this sending rewards? Mu Chen sent a message to Qin Fei Fei and went to see what was going on. Flanking the airport, a helicopter transport nymph and pilot, more and more people from the guilds came. Mu Dust arrived at the Chuan Phone Hub. The pace was light, imitating no sound. He could have changed his clothes and walked right in, but in still chose the more convenient method over the wall. There were too many people at the entrance, and they had to register. His jumping power or just flying in the air can be, 
and no normal person can keep up with the speed. Flipped over and just landed. Swish. A dagger was pointed at him and he was arrested on the spot. Who are you? The woman carried a voice that was a little mechanical. The woman looked to be in her early twenties, with short black and red hair and a black mask that covered her eyes and forehead, wearing a black fitted dress with a V opening on the chest and a 36 D rated arms certification. Slim figure. Black pants and black and red boots. Sexy and icy. Outside was draped the uniform coat of the heavy cloud hub. Her speed was fast. Shepard Dust was surprised that the other party's speed reached half of his. He had no less than 10 ways to counteract it. But the other party was wearing a uniform. There was no need. Don't make a move. One of your own. Moo Dust snapped his fingers and his profile screen interface appeared. Associate Technical Instructor. Mac Dust. The data has your name and I've heard of it. And analyzing the personality. You might indeed do this matter. She put away the dagger. It was a Thor beam cutting dagger. And meta hypercrystal and alloy was going to be sliced through. A ninth generation dagger. Rich. And who is this? Beautiful lady? This is the Chuan Seal Hub. You have no right to know. She still wanted to leave. When Makoto suddenly slapped her palm. The woman reacted quickly and struck out at the same time. The two of them were just palming each other. This power. Data is wrong. Don't treat me as a strange lurker. She retreated three steps back. Mu Chen used three layers of power and actually didn't send her flying out. In Zhao Pengfei's place, she would have flown out at least 30 meters. Zhao Pengfei? I thank you. She stood firm. If you do it again, I will make a special order arrest on you. Do you recognize this thing? She flashed her badge. Sorry, don't recognize it. But I can confirm that you're not a mixer. Makoto apologized and arched her hand. The data is young and the seniority is still short. So stop interfering with my work. She threw off her cloak and headed farther toward the hub's rear building. Makchen laughed bitterly. She was the one who was more like an infiltrator. Crossing hands was a way to find out the other party's identity. Mechanical maiden, no. 13. Rank, 55. Ripple, SS class. Mechanical form, 9th generation S grade thunder rush machine. Talent 1, grade A, Heim body strengthening. Talent 2, S class, Heim body reinforcement. Talent 3, grade A, high speed pulse movement. Position, judge of the red dragon center. Special Executive Officer of the Heavy Cloud Defense Hub. All of them are Heim Body Enhancement Talents? Punching through the machine? If Makoto had to think about it, the sixth generations would be called Pile Driver. Although Makshin didn't recognize the Special Executive Order, he saw the other party's position, and he had heard Shinaya talk about the identity of the division judges. Those who don't know, would think she's an AI robot. Mu Chen shrugged. Tidbit. The Chuan Fong City Command Hub was on the east side of the city protected by a multi-gravity field with various heavy weapons. This was the Battlefield Command Headquarters, and the building had a total of 8 floors. The place to investigate is on the 8th floor? Shepard Dust swiped his identity card to go up and follow the mission map, turning left and right, passing through the passage with the red warning light. What's in here? It can't be some golden legend, right? Shepard Dust was stopped by two people. Please stop. Entry is prohibited ahead. Two men in uniforms, holding weapons, blocked Makoto. This is the conference room, right? I would like to borrow it. Mu Dust swept his remaining light. In front of him, it normally said conference room, but the door locks were changed, and he could tell that there was an ABP force field padding, and there were two cameras nearby, so he was not in a good position to force his hand. You're that assistant instructor named Mu Chen, right? It wasn't good to look too handsome and have everyone recognize you. Yes, I'm also not familiar with this place and would like to borrow a meeting room. Please go down to the sixth floor. The 8th floor is not an area you can use. This is a prohibited area. The two men had serious expressions. And their bodies were representatives of muscular hard men. As if one person could pull a truck. And the sense of oppression. Was completely absent for Mu Dust. It wasn't as oppressive as Qin Fei Fei. Really? Okay. I thought the 8th floor was quiet and no one was using it. Mu Dust turned around and left. As early as downstairs he checked that there could be no prohibited areas on the 8th floor. The command operations room was on the 7th floor and the chief metropolitan office area was on the sixth floor, leaving the passageway. Sure enough, there's a problem. Shepard Dust's physique was super strong, and his perception was also far different from normal people. Having just stood 10 meters away from the gate, even with multiple protections and isolations, he still sensed special energy fluctuations. Could it be a secret weapon? Shepard Dust went downstairs while thinking, synthesizing all the information he knew. When it comes to things, think more and don't be impulsive. Chief Commander. I have a report. What is it? Just now that young student assistant instructor, Mac Dust, came to the 8th floor forbidden room and said he wanted to borrow the conference room. Mac Dan. I remember. 
I know, no one is allowed to approach. Understand? Understood. Macduin was eating breakfast in the center, and saw that 13th machinima once again. If we consider it in terms of danger, my behavior just now has been reported as having some risk. After eating breakfast, he still went to the seventh floor, just to touch the most likely person he guessed, Chuanfeng City's chief metropolitan Fan Hangwu. There were a few risks, but the gains were there to detect if it was related to him. Sir, Deputy Instructor Macdan of the Defense Hub has requested to see you. The communication appeared on the screen. Fan Hangwu narrowed his eyes, let him in. The hatch opened and Muchen walked in with his head held high. Chief Commander Fan, Fan Hangwu, with various hero titles, participated in the Beast Tide 16 times with countless feats. Heavy Cloud Top 10 Trailblazers. It is estimated that all the foreign beasts know his name, SS Class Driver, Orthodox Multinational Study Graduate, and Sinew Worship Driving Right. With his hands behind his back, Fan Hangwu, who is over 80 years old, keeps his appearance at 40. There was nothing sickly about the driver's body, and he could normally live for more than 150 years, and it was estimated that he wouldn't change his appearance at 100 years old. Associate Instructor Mu Chuan, I've heard of your name, and it was even on our heavy cloud hot news some time ago. He turned around with a few smiles on his majestic face, quite appreciative of the young man's performance. It's an honor for Mu Chen to be recognized by Commander Fan. What's the matter with applying to come see me? Right now the war situation is dangerous, and there's quite a need for a young and daring guide like you. Mu Dust clicked on last night's report. Shania and I came back from the 7th region's frontline position, and the current significance of the frontline position has already been completed. Makoto's words were interrupted. I know what you mean. But quite a few of the heavy weapons in the 7th district's forward position can still be used. You young people haven't experienced a beast tide. More points to cope with it. And the formation on the side of Copper Scale City go and look at it more often. Commander Fan. I know. Multipoint response is best within a 10 kilometer range. The 7th district is so far away from us. There's no point in that at all. With adequate preparations. Leaving them alone over there. Isn't it sending them to their deaths? What do you know? Fan Hanwu chortled. Technical guidance, just go get into the technical stuff. What do you know as a young man who's not even 20 years old? Instructing me? Nukin is only making suggestions. We are personally involved in the battle for the frontline positions of the 7th district. Mu Dust's expression was serious and his mind was always clear. Humph. I know that you and Shania have a good relationship with Luo Tong. The battlefield is not a place for emotions. Well, don't disturb my work. Go out. Chapter 107, The Second Wave of Million Level Fei Beasts Attacks. Mu Chen was practically whisked out. His technician couldn't question the chief commander and had no qualifications to speak. Seeing Fan Hongwu's slight anger, Mu Chen had the sense to leave. After leaving, both of them had some thoughts. This kid called Mu Chen. We must get rid of him when we have the chance. Fan Hongwu carried his hands behind his back as he continued to watch the battlefield division. Leaving the Chuan Feng Hub Center first, Mu Chen looked back at the sixth floor. Does this Fan Hongwu also have a problem? As he walked, his clothes changed back first and returned to the 27th square zone tent. Shinaya was also there. Plebeian, where did you go early in the morning? Maybe. Went to spy on something. Xin Fei Fei laughed evilly. Shinaya was looking at the tactical board. And Li Shi was holding an antique communicator. Editing something. Went to the office of the chief commander. Shinaya, are you familiar with Fan Hanwu? Had a few contacts. Why? Although he's a rather serious person, he should still be quite reasonable. Much better than Zhang Dongyuan, we used to go through every shipment of supplies and application quite well. That's just unfamiliarity. Shinaya only had occasional contact with material applications, and her impression came from propaganda. Zhang Dongyuan often lectured and berated them, so it gave Shinaya a stern impression. What's wrong? Going to the chief commander's place early in the morning? Several people could hear that something was wrong. With a look from Mu Chen, Susan immediately closed the tent door and added a lock. I found three problems. First, I sensed that there were dangerous items on the 8th floor but couldn't get in. I even suspect that Chuan Feng City's signal being so poor would be the reason for that. Second, Shinaya and I helped the 7th district's forward position apply for a retreat which was denied. And Fan Hangwu actually let them continue fighting where they were. And there was no transportation of supplies. What? What was he thinking? Shinaya was a bit agitated. Wasn't this sending them to their deaths? Li Shi was also shocked. It's not a matter of splitting the battle points. The basic logic to fight to the frontline position now should be withdrawn. The signals are not even there. Even the effect of the sentries are not there. Shinaya do not get excited. The key is the third point. I interviewed Fan Hanwu. I had a special feeling when I was near him. A special feeling? What? You guys can't detect it. 
There is a hint of softness like the bond of the Milky Way. Put, poo dash, plebeians, the Milky Way, a joke, describing chocolate? But Shania understood what Muchen meant, you mean, a high life? That's the one. Nowhere near as good as you, but he's got a little bit. What is a higher life? Aside from Li Shi Makduan mentioning it, the others had no idea at all. I'll go find him, Shania put on her coat. There's no need to go. I'm probably being watched right now, and you going will aggravate it even more. Makoto had thought about it long ago on the road. Right now, the only thing that had contact with the frontline positions in the 7th district was this side, and it was now Fei Ji who was sending the message. Chuan Feng City and the Heavy Cloud Defense Hub were also sending messages, allowing Fei Ji to send a message to the Heavy Cloud Boundary, and then informing the Defense Hub. The communication was basically unusable. In this way, the 7th Sector's forward position was out of contact with the Defense Hub. There's no reason for the 7th District to be in that position. If communication is restored, the Defense Hub will definitely let them retreat to join the battle for Chuanfeng City. This Chuanfeng City is getting more and more problematic. Mu Chuan, let's move tonight and go to that room you mentioned to take a look. Li Shi's expression was serious. If Fan Hanwu had problems, it would be troublesome. We can't leave easily, but Shania is a free man. Teacher Shania will first go to the 7th district to notify Team Luo that they're retreating here. Li Shi'i pointed at the map. This is the foot of the mountain range to the north of the 8th district. Give up weapons other than beam type. You can use the 475 abandoned station. The password is 745614. This abandoned station has a huge amount of weapon resources, as well as 100% of the Metaforce field. The abandoned station has a huge amount of weapons? How is 100% Metaforce field possible? Utina and Qin Feng listened in shock. There was also the special password how did Li Shi know about it? Li Shi lowered her voice, this is a special base station for the lighthouse. Let them hold down over 30, 000, 000 people there. I contacted someone to have the Red Leaf Legion's V81 regiment, pass by here, then both sides will gather. Then together they will approach Chuanfeng City and become the northern flank defense front. Mu Chen also understood her meaning. Shen Aya, you go and inform Luo Tong. Then go back to Heavy Cloud Main City and report back to Zhang Dongyuan. I believe that no matter if it's our judgment, or Li Shi's identity, and the logic that was already correct, Zhang Dongyuan will definitely recognize it. But I'm going back and forth here. It will take quite a bit of time, and the beast tide will most likely come today. Qin Fei Fei's charming voice, Alala, teacher, there are still us, rest assured to go. Utina, Beldet, everyone was here, and Mu Chen could transform with Qin Fei Fei and Li Shi. It was mainly Li Shi who was there. I'll go then. Wait. I'll get you a plane that doesn't fly hubs. The hub one would definitely be known by Fan Hongwu. Dina, have you E-Fire come to Chuan Feng? What are you talking about? We E-Fire are the representatives of the bottom. At least 70, 000 to 80, 000 people came. There are more than 4, 000 people on my side. You guys are there too, right? I heard about your heroic performance. Give me an airplane. I need it now. Come on. 35 squares, Shania left, and Makoto deliberately moved around the edge of the 27th square formation, clearly sensing that someone was watching him from afar, they thought that because they were holding remote instruments, Makoto couldn't detect them, the more so, Mu Dust was wary of a fan chief Dutong, but from the current point of view there wasn't any evidence or confirmation, Mu Dust wasn't the kind of character that relied on conjecture to get someone to death, but he also felt that he had spooked the snake, he could only be more careful. The development from Awakening until now had gone too smoothly, causing him to lower his guard against some things, thus stepping on a pit. 199, 200, at noon Qin Feng was doing push-ups, Mukin, you do 200, the body is the capital of the revolution, I don't have much effect doing this, ah, uh, no effect? Zhou Pan was just now praising Qin Feng for being so handsome, Mukin smiled and tapped on his wristwatch, and the screen showed 300 pounds of weight bearing, let me do 200 as well. Come on two people to add some weight. This wristwatch weight is 300 at the highest. It's too low. Too low? Qin Feng tilted his head. His brain overloaded. Yutana and Qin Fei Fei they knew that Mu Chen was strong. The last time he was tied up by a spotted spider. He tore it apart with a light support. And that one 10 meters high. This was a completely monster-like physique. I'll do it. I'll do it. Ride a horse. Only to see Mu Chen supporting the ground with one hand. Carrying a weight of 300 pounds. Plus Yutana and then sitting on a coming Qin Fei Fei. This was completely rewarding him, doing 200 prone with one hand like this easily. Alert! Alert! Galarbai Great Rift Valley has a large number of alien beasts moving towards the direction of Heavy Cloud. The number is expected to exceed 1 million. 
Alert! Alert! There are a large number of alien beasts in the Galarbi Rift Valley moving towards the heavy cloud. The estimated number is over a million. Everyone listening to the alert, here it comes. This is the main meal of the SS Beast Tide. How could they not expect that it was less than 24 hours apart? The sky and earth are covered with foreign beasts. The sky and earth are densely packed, moving towards the direction of the heavy clouds. Terrifying war, coming soon. Chapter 108 is this time to play for flying? The Dragonheart AI scanned and notified that the entire Red Dragon had received an alert. It had only been an hour since the frontline positions of the 7th sector had been evacuated. Luo Tong and Xin Zhao heard Shen Aya's analysis reasonable. They completed the first day of the mission, and the arrangements for the second day of the defense hub could not be given. Chuan Fengcheng hadn't given them orders. It required their frontline commanders to make a judgment. Battle since they were unable to convey effective intelligence. Half of them were injured and only 15,000 were able to fight. It was useless to hold down the area with only two gates. Before leaving, the heavy weapons were lowered into the ground and hopefully saved. Then cover the paths that must be traveled with detecting boom bombs. It can also have some blocking effect. First going north to turn with the Red Leaf V81 regiment to form a northern support army. Hearing the alert, Shen Aya immediately piloted the plane and began to rush towards the main city of Heavy Cloud. It was important to report what they knew. The flying G that sent the message were conveying what Fan Hanwu had reported. After knowing about the rock elephant and having met the alien emperor, Mu Chen and Shania felt that that fan chief commander, there might be a problem. All red dragon alert, a large swarm of fey beasts has appeared to the south of heavy cloud. The number is expected to be over a million. Please ask for support from the all red dragons, and heavy cloud is ready to respond to the battle at the highest level. What's the situation? We haven't even reached the heavy cloud area yet. The communication is all cut off. Hello, hello, hello? This is the first land warfare support corps of the Northern Bear. Can Xuanfeng City hear us? Support teams from several other kingdoms had also arrived one after another, but now they were all facing the inability to contact each other and needed to make their own judgment. The only thing they could hear was the briefing from the Dragonheart intelligence system, which covered the entire Red Dragon. Judging from this briefing, millions of foreign beasts? It's over. It's over. Copper Scale and Xuanfeng can't hold out anymore. I'm afraid. Crazy, crazy, crazy. An S-class beast tide is only 200, 000 foreign beasts, right? We're not even safe in Heavy Cloud main city. Heavy Cloud alert, there are 700,000 foreign beasts moving towards copper scale. Heavy Cloud alert, there are 400, 000 foreign beasts moving towards Chuanfeng. Heavy Cloud alert, 50, 000 airborne beasts are moving from high altitude and will soon arrive at Heavy Cloud main city. The city's defense system has been activated urgently. Not only are copper scale and Chuanfeng going to be attacked, there are 50, 000 aerial alien beasts directly killing Heavy Cloud main city. Command Hub. The Skyfire Legion is fully prepared to respond to the battle. Yes. General Finger Zhang. Security Hub Yenjin reports that there are many people fleeing and grabbing supplies on the streets now. Requesting for support. Immediately support groups 26 and 28. In addition, notify everyone in the security hub that at this moment, those who don't listen to lead to chaos will be suppressed on the spot. Understood. Zhang Dongyuan and the people in the command hub looked at the big screen. The 50, 000 foreign beasts in the main city were not enough to be feared, and now the Heavenly Flame Legion still had 1 million inches. Two recruitment teams of 3 million people were ready to support Chuanfeng, and a recruitment team of 4 million people were on their way to Copper Scale. The remaining 18 million people were recruited to guard the main city and boundaries as well. It's coming so soon. The beast tide is coming. So many? It's over. It's over. We're all going to die. What are you afraid of? Smash these beasts. The projected number that came to our Chuan Fong city was only 400. 000. We now have over 6 million people. And the Legion's support is arriving. Not to mention the entire Chuan Fong city panicked. Even their tiny 27 square formation was filled with panicked voices. Woo woo. The city alarms went off. And there was the sound of people running up everywhere. Chuan Fong notice, the 2nd, 3rd, 8th, 9th, 11th, 15th, 17th, and 22nd square formations belonging to please go up to the citadel immediately to prepare for battle. Chuan Feng's announcement, 2nd, 3rd, 8th, 9th, 11th, 15th, 17th, and 22nd squares. All flying pilots should go to the takeoff airport and prepare for battle. After 25, all squares will start distributing weapons, ready to face air raids and the beasts that appear underground. Notify. Again. Notifications and alarms continue. Talks of panic and fear. It's estimated that it will take more than two hours for the foreign beasts to arrive at Chuan Fong City. A few people in the tent. Makoto had heard many students shouting the name of Dibong's brigade. 
The three of them had already arrived at the square formation to command. Chuan Feng notification, please prioritize the issuance of weapons of 4, 12, 13, 25, 27, 33, and that the cannon G and air G will gather at the designated stop within two hours. Notify again. Makoto and the others were stunned. We'll be on the second batch? Debong us. How we're on in the second batch? Everyone get ready to line up and come get their weapons. We are the second batch of action squares. Ha! Huh? Jeez. Ru Xiao Chui and Yu Chi Yu they. Most of the girls were trembling in fear. It really was going to be a battlefield. Us student squads. How are we going to be on the subbatch? Shi Chang and Shi Jiaoping were also wondering how it should be the fourth batch of squares. They hadn't even graduated yet and weren't considered much of a fighting force at all. But they could only give everyone a pep talk now. Cheering and comforting. Everyone, don't move around. The ones handing out weapons will be here soon. Unlike most machine girls, Yutina and Beldet were at least able to go into battle and kill the enemy without dying in vain. The family blood was burning. Let's go out too. Wait. Susan, Han Xuanyan, Xin Fei Fei, Li Shi stays behind first. Yutina and the girls blinked. And Xin Feng led Zhou Pan out first. Bastard. Tactics not for this lady? It's not tactics. I'll give them flying nymphs to check their nymph bodies first. They'll fight in the air later. Nine deaths. Indeed. A lot of machine girls are negligent and careless. They might not even know that their paint or weapons are loose. It's worthy of being Makoto. He's so calm even now. Yutana gave a thumbs up, going out and closing the door. Xin Fei Fei was immediately dishonest. Ah la la la. Playing four flight at this time? I want to be the first. Put. Poo. Put. Susan and Han Xuanyan directly sprayed. Mu Chuan covered his face. With a stroke of his fingertips, four aquamarine crystals appeared in his hand, surrounded by a seven-colored light. They all stared, wondering what they were. The Fei Beast's commanding mind is very clear. It even knows our force field remodeling time. The double meta force field's backup force field still has five hours left. This battle is bound to be fierce. Susan and Han Xuanyan, you're fighting in the air. Fighting against the airborne Fei Beasts and the air defense cannons. You're going to die in nine deaths. Fei Ji this kind of battle death rate is extremely high. Xin Fei Fei is the family through the relationship. Just in the city organization. The transport aircraft will not air combat is a living target. This is I get strange things, Mercury Spirit Body Ultralight Painting Chip. You four are all flying G. One person a piece to take. Susan and the girls took it and felt the warm crystals. Something they had never heard of. Take it directly. Orally? Yes. Eat it. Although it has not been tested. But it should have a high degree of safety. All of them were their own people. The four women took it directly. And immediately the light flickered within their G. Spreading throughout the body. Talent loading. Need some time. You have obtained the brand new talent S rank Mercury body armor. S rank talent? Oh my god. An S rank pure defense talent. Extremely rare. How is it possible for a talent to be acquired like this? Susan and Han Xuanyan couldn't believe their eyes. Looking at their interface again and again. Li Shi was used to it. Ah la la la. What are you guys talking about? We all just comprehended the same hidden talent? Aya aya. We're so awesome. It was still Qin Fei Fei who understood that the talent comprehended itself. Su Shan and Han Xuanyan also understood. Thank you, Niu Kun. Let's go gather soon as well. In the 27th square formation area, Chang Rong and the other six transportation vehicle G came pulling weapons and just happened to see Mu Chen and Li Shi and the others. Aya, the next batch is about to go into battle. TSK TSK TSK. I hope I can still see you guys tomorrow. Chapter 109 Beast Tide Siege Battle Begins. You're an armored car. Do you think you won't be able to go up in 27 squares you're going to be a meat shield? Han Xuanyan immediately disliked back. That's not necessarily true. Chang Rong unloaded her weapon case and transformed back into her human form. It's to say that Gao Yinchan took you, isn't it? Xin Fei Fei smiled flirtatiously. I guess the wee hours of the morning is that the Gao family has already taken him away without reserving a place for the dog. What did you say? Chang Rong's face was flustered. Immediately looking at the assembled squares. There were just so many people in the driver. And they could immediately look at all of them. Where is Gao Yenchan? Where is the person? Where is Gao? Chang Rong ran over to find Gao Yenchan. When Ru Xiao Chui and Yu Qi Yu saw Chang Rong, they even greeted her and whispered, Sister Chang, the beast tide is coming. When will you take us away? How many of the squares that went up in the second batch could go back alive? But anyone with a bit of brains knew that. Where's Gao? Have you guys seen Gao Yenchan? Brother Gao? I haven't been able to find it since morning. Yu Qi Yu immediately spoke. Qin Fei Fei's passed by from the side, oops, some people never know, the owner promised to take the big dog away, the big dog proudly told the two small dogs, in fact, at the beginning, the small dog has no place, 
But the big dog did not expect that the owner one is not ready to take away. Jean Fei Fei you actually said we are dogs? Aya, what are you guys talking about? I'm talking about the story of the master and the dog. What are you guys getting excited about? Chang Rong's trio was furious, but now so many people were watching. And, I haven't seen Gao Yinchan since the morning. Where are the people in the tent he was with? Didn't see him. Really used family connections to run away? This deserter. That's how the Gao family's reputation is. A nest of rats. No one who follows him has a good end. Look at Qin Feng and Qin Fei Fei are both there. Morong Bu Wu is also there. Morong Bu Wu listened to these people's discussion. Humph. Boring. Even Zhao Pengfei, who was usually somewhat loathed by everyone, was there. Chang Rong panicked. Ru Xiaochui and Yu Qi looked at Chang Rong. I say sister Chang Rong. Qin Fei Fei's words can't be true, right? You didn't want to take us away in the first place? The three were about to start pulling each other's hair. Di Bang chided. What's all the commotion? Everyone return to the line and start handing out weapons. Chang Rong go stand in the armored tank line. Chang Rong was also an outcast. Ru Xiaochui and Yu Qi Yu were now gnashing their teeth. They had been teased by Chang Rong and thought they were following the right big sister. Here is the sixth generation a great particle pulse gun. The cooldown time is 20 seconds per shot. It has a good killing power against the alien beasts below the earth level. There is a certain amount of recoil. Crouch down on the ground floor when you shoot and keep your center of gravity. The two captains, Sher Chang and Sher Xiaoping, were giving a demonstration. This was not the toy gun from the last practical training. All gun heim to the center position. Air heim to the right to gather. Armor and tank heim on the left hand side. Beldet went to the center. Looking at the left side of the square, there were five other schools as well as agency companies in addition to Heavy Cloud Academy. The entire 27 squares added up to 8,000 people. Dibin spoke. Cannon girls are the core output. Right now there are one. 071 cannon girls in the 27th square formation, and 201 on your team one side. The cannon girls must be equipped with a driver. Now you are given 5 minutes. Those who are familiar with each other can combine. If not we will arrange for a driver from another team to link up with them. No refusal of orders. Ha! Huh? We have to link up? Linkage status boosts the power by at least 3 times. Other machinima can be unarranged, but the cannon girl must have a driver. If we can't find a familiar pilot, must strangers take control? Dibin looked at his watch. 10 minutes. No one else will be arranged by us. Beldet looked panicked. She didn't want to link up with a stranger. It was like riding her. It was all over the place. This. This. There were very few harnesses she was on good terms with at school. Just Utina and the girls were on okay terms with her. Usually the mouth is unforgiving. But when it matters. Missy. Looking for someone? Beldet had been looking for mood dust. And it turned out that he suddenly appeared by her side. Plebeian. Mood 1. Are you? You here to join me? Yes. What? Forget it if you don't want me. I'll go over there. Nukin laughed evilly. Don't don't don't. Humph. This young lady sees that you are still more obedient. Just you. Immediately pulling on Mu Dust. In fact, there was no driver coming around her at all. D Bang whispered. Nukin. You're going to transform with Qin Fei Fei. What's the point of going to Cannon Girls Camp? It's fine. Big Team D. I'll join with Mu Chen and our group of battle ages will go up to the citadel. Qin Fei Fei followed Mu Chen and the three of them went together. The citadel was extremely dangerous, and one could lose their life at any time. Beldet wanted to thank Qin Fei Fei. They were a war girl group going anywhere. In order to take care of her, going to the most dangerous location of the citadel, Susan and Han Xuanyan went in the air G team and Li Shi was in the normal team. While this side was grouping up, a loud alarm and notification continued. Alert, Beast Tide crossing the forward position. Alert, the beast tide is estimated to be 70 minutes away from Copper Scale City and 60 minutes away from Chuanfeng City. Please prepare for battle. Di Bang jumped onto the stage and yelled. The rest of the 27 square formation follow me to the city wall reserve stage. The entire square formation began to move towards the city wall. Beldet, Mu Dust, and Qin Fei Fei were together. Cannon Girl was the first to top it. Followed by the handheld weapon combination that assisted with air to air. Li Shi Yi and the girls were among them. Utina was in the city's rocket launcher support group, and Susan and Han Xuanyan had three, zero 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 air geezers assembled in a few squares on their side, and had already gone to the takeoff area to wait. The second batch entered the interior of the city wall first, when the first batch fell, they could immediately rush out and run up 20 meters to make up for it. Many people were nervous. In addition to Chuan Feng City's regular defense team of 300, zero 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 people, there are two, three, eight, nine, eleven, 15, 17, 22 square 80, 000 people have already gone up to the citadel, 
in the entire western direction of the main battle, there were 380, 000 people on the citadel alone, it was densely packed, the howitzers below had more than 20, 000 machine girls, 3, 000 pulse anti-aircraft guns positioned near the city wall, as well as 200, 000 people assembled here, ready to go up to the citadel as well as respond to the alien beasts that were impacting the sky downwards, all move faster, run up 4, 12, 13, 25, 27, 33 all into the city wall, prepare for fire support, all give me a point of aim to hit, within the walls there are have output windows to fire with particle pulse rifles, all of them were human, the sub batch of 6 squares totaling 45, 000 men, the third batch was on standby under the city wall, and when Mu Chen looked back, he estimated that there were 80,000, this was the battlefield, as far as the eye could see it was full of people, everywhere, in front of millions of people, at this moment it feels like how small he is, on the battlefield, it didn't matter how polished they usually were, no matter how beautiful or handsome they were, maybe with a single destructive ray from a dragon level alien beast, thousands of people became powder and left this world forever, becoming nothing more than a name on a medallion monument, when we go up later, Fei Fei is only allowed to stand in the position behind me and shoot, is that clear? Mu Chen's expression was serious, so overbearing oh, listen to you, Xin Fei Fei was not nervous, belled its first time on the battlefield, or at this level, Missy, don't worry, I'm here, window shooting position they didn't bother to fight, that one star of battle doesn't matter, Humph, plebeian, I cannot be, nervous at all, yeah, Beldad's eyelids were dancing and the number of times she swallowed her saliva increased significantly, time passed quickly, and the sound of sirens grew closer, it's coming, I can see it, it's coming, so many, so many, hearing the sound, they all looked over, and could see outside from the windows of the multi-gravity field walls, the sky was densely packed with foreign beasts like dark clouds, and the ground was blackened with swarms of fire cones burning with flames, the fire cone lord let out a whale roar, and fifty fire cones roared in unison up to the sky, on top of that, there were also the shadows of many imperial level foreign beasts, it was able to be seen, 200 meters in size, look what that 200 meter behemoth is, could that be a, dragon ranked higher destruction juggernaut, a legendary super monster, chapter 110 battlefield chaos instantly kills classmates in seconds, the destruction juggernaut, possessed a 200 meter tall body, appeared in the S class beast tight 68 years ago, dragon level higher beast, black and red scaled 8 footed horse under body, Upper body is human, head like a black giant bull, eight eyes and four horns, holding a 200 meter long blade that emits a ghostly green light, terrifying to the extreme. Just its one beast was enough to give people chills. Not only that, two dragon level creeping source giant worms could also be seen, as well as ten imperial level large sized fellows, land emperor turtles. These behemoths were particularly conspicuous in the midst of the blackened beast tide, at the command headquarters of the heavy cloud defense hub. Chief Finger Zhang. Both Copper Scale and Xuan Foam have scanned for destruction juggernauts, and the Emperor and Dragon level energy body Copper Scale is twice as large as Xuan Foam. Red Dragon Alert, Thousand Gully Wetlands and Mago Plains. Half a million alien beasts are predicted to appear and are moving towards Copper Scale. Wouldn't this Copper Scale city be over one, two million number of foreign beasts? Heavens, it's too terrifying. One, two million in Copper Scale. Four hundred, zero 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 in Xuan Foam. There was no need to explain this intention much. Everyone who was an individual knew it, regardless of whether it was the legions that could receive the signal or those that couldn't, all of them were closing in on copper scale. Large guilds, companies with various organizations, because the news from the command hub could not be transmitted, it was all up to judgment. It's good that the Dragonheart's manual notification is unhindered. All the human legions out there can hear the notification. All troops moved to copper scale city. There were almost 4 million teams plus 4 million conscripted teams moving towards copper scale in support. As for Chuan Fong City, only the Red Leaf Legion V81 arrived at the area and did not move. The viewpoint returned to Mu Chen's side. Everyone in Chuan Fong City could hear the warning. With over 1, 2 million foreign beasts in copper scale, that side was the main battlefield, and this side was the secondary battlefield. Copper scale might not be able to hold on. Mu Dust actually had thoughts, why didn't the traitors among the humans destroy the Dragonheart AI's briefing in advance? Was it a failure and couldn't be destroyed? Or were they deliberately not destroying it? There was too little time given to Mood Dust to think. And it was always fighting and preparing for battle. Don't care about the rest. Holding on to Chuan Fong City is our only task at the moment. Di Bong shouted. The shooting window was full of people. The brave ones standing directly on it. Without the double metaphors field. 
The people standing at the window were easily killed. Blackness approached. In the center of the city, the command platform rose. Fan Hangwu was here with all of the capitals, all units of long-range heavy weapons. Prepare. Fire. Clatter. Boom boom boom. Boom boom boom. At a distance of 800 meters, the heavy cannons on the citadel, and the 50-meter huge super-electromagnetic howitzers inside the city all opened fire. The sky was filled with projectile shells and laser cannons like a torrential downpour, bombarding the entire battlefield. Those who saw this scene for the first time were all stunned, especially the people on the citadel. Some of them were dumbstruck. What are you waiting for? Fire at the alien beasts rushing over. The force field is still there now. We can't let them get close to the barriers. Fire at 300 meters. Hit them hard. In the first moment, the human side was filled with artillery fire and pulsed lasers, brilliant and incomparable. It was like fighting bugs inside a game. Many people got excited. And the force field was still there now. So the outside couldn't hit it. Roar dash the destruction juggernaut roared. A large number of alien beasts rushed out in the first wave of wild bombardment, lining up too widely in too many numbers. Especially the land emperor turtle moved. A huge fortress. There were smart fey beasts that knew to hide under their bodies, or follow behind. The moment the first wave of cannonballs set fire weakly. A turn system? Ten land emperor turtles opened their mouths at the same time, destroying the light. Ah dash. The sound of many mecha goddesses screaming in fear was heard. The destructive rays bombarded the metaphors field, creating huge waves of fluctuations and even cracks. First metaphors field energy 63. Second layer metaphors field energy 100. That knocked out 37 of our force field energy? Shoot. Fire. Fire. The beasts swooped down in the sky, and the close defense cannons began firing furiously, as well as the ground-based anti-aircraft cannons, and various air-to-air -air nymphs opened fire. These xenomorphs were charging towards the force field with no desire to die. Bug-level nuclear ferocious xenomorphs, tearing and crashing into the force field before being blasted to a pulp. Many of the airborne nymphs and pilots were vomiting. It was the first time they had seen such a hideous sight. Even the people from their preparation batches were puking when they saw it from the window. Those who are going to vomit quickly do so and then keep firing. Those standing at the window without firing throw them away. Yes, the ground level alien beasts could spew out small destructive rays and were also consuming the force field. 10 minutes, 20 minutes. The current firepower of Chuan Fong City was still sufficient, and at least 50,000 of the 400,000 alien beasts had been blown away. First level metaphors field energy 33. The destruction juggernaut lifted his 200 meter spectral longsword, and at a distance of a thousand meters away, made a chop, an eardrum piercing chop. The green shockwave of destruction directly chopped through the first layer of metaphors field. Ah, the first layer metaphors field shattered. Battlegirl squad 123, prepare to strike at any time. Long range cannon squad, prepare to fire. Raise the Talon cannon to high tower mode. Yes, chief metropolitan fan. There were panicked voices everywhere. But Fan Hanwu was like a sea pin, marshalling his troops and commanding the major squares to attack. Second level metaphors field energy 87. The two creeping origin giant worms were advancing. Mu Chen could feel Beldet's nervousness. They were now at window position 45. And there were several two dozen people in front of them taking turns shooting. Window 46 on the right side Morong Buo was the main shooter. He was holding two guns and shooting. His shots were very accurate. And the witches pursuing him around him kept handing their weapons up. After all. The particle pulse gun can only fire one shot in 20 seconds. Morong Buwu that became an assembly line. Eight Machinima handed him guns. Deafness. As if the world was black and white. Mu Chen's cold hairs stood up. Instantly pouncing on Qin Fei Fei and Beldet. Boom dash. Wow. Behind them. The penetrating destructive destructive light of death pierced through the metaphors field. Piercing through the western city wall defense barrier. This 20 meter thick destructive light pierced through the entire Kawafan city. There were shrieks everywhere. Two holes were made in the city wall. Not to mention Beldet. Even Mu Chen and Qin Fei Fei's hearts nearly stopped at this moment. The place that disappeared seemed to be where they had just been. The 40 to 50 people in windows 46 and 47 had all disappeared, leaving no powder behind. Murong Bu Wu is gone. Qin Shi Yu, Yu Jin, and Mi Meng Fan. They, they are all gone. All the lives on the light all disappeared. The turret collapsed a straight line. The wind whistled and poured inside. Never mind who died, keep firing and get on top of me. Get up to the windows and shoot fire suppression. And go for it on the gap. Daibin yelled. This was the battlefield. Morong Bu Wu and the others were just gone. Mu Chen got up and pulled up Beldet and Qin Fei Fei. And the two women's hands were shaking. The god of death had taken Morong Bu Wu and had nearly taken both of them. Plebeian. Plebeian. Fortunately you reacted quickly. This god reacted. 
Sheen Feifei looked at the gap in the irrigation wind. Just now the position Beldet may be almost. She is absolutely dead. Millimeters. Crouched down and hit a wave with the particle pulse gun. Fifi. Fifi. It took two shouts to wake Jean Fifi up. Don't worry. I'm here. Jean Fei Fei pulled on Mu Chen and nodded. Taking out her particle pulse gun to aim and fire at the alien beasts. Half an hour of wild bombardment. The land emperor turtle had already spewed out waves of destructive light for the fourth time. Second level meta force field 34. The force field can withstand up to two rounds of attacks. Notify the people on the citadel to prepare for melee combat. Air defense ministries prepare. Air fleet prepare to take off. According to this current force field value, it could still hold out for more than 10 minutes. But, destroy dash. The destruction juggernaut swung out a death slash. There was a clattering, shattering sound. Warning, warning, Chuan Feng Chang meta force field disappears. It was the same time that 50 fire cones in the sky simultaneously spewed out explosive fireballs that landed on the walled citadel. Boom 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 dash. Countless people screamed miserably and turned into ashes in the exploding flames. The 9th, 11th, and 15th squares were all killed, right above Makoto and the others. The nearly 1, 000 meters of fire on the citadel. More than 20, 000 people were killed by all of them. What? There's going to be a breakthrough on the citadel. Express up. Turn on the barrier frozen condensate injection. Inform down. 25, 27, 33 squares. All go up and replenish. Chapter 111 Cannon Girl Caliber is Justice. With the meta defense force field gone, tens of thousands of fey beasts swooped down monstrously in the sky. We must block the first wave. Three fifths of the air defense cannons are on cooldown now. All 20 sets of temporary squares of air girls are taking off. Respond to the battle. Air Heim squares. All meet the battle. Transformation. Nearly 20, 000 air girls were ejected and clicked in the air to transform. 6th generation A class Rafaeli fighters. 7th generation F 166 V fighters. 7th generation Aero 10 C fighters. 5th generation A class meter female helicopter gunship Kaim. 6th generation A class 1259 A helicopter gunship Kaim. 5th generation B class CSH 22 helicopter gunship. There were also 4th generation modified light aircraft. And even an antique grade 4th generation B class biplane helicopter. The flying G all rose into the air and fought against the ferocious level and ground alien beasts that rushed down from the sky in a large area. Guns rained down. The air defense guns below fired wildly. Not only did the air giants have to dodge their own bullets, but they also had to fight against the alien beasts. In the first hour, the sky exploded into pieces, and the air girls screamed countless times. The number of sacrifices soared and countless crashed planes fell. Susan and Han Xuanyan were also at the catapult pad, they were the second batch to take off, and they were about to head out when this wave of planes were almost dead. Upper Citadel, 27 Squadron all move out. Hurry up, charge me, support up there. The new capital led the way up to the top, and Daibun roared as they and the other three brigades roared. The collective fireball explosions from the fire coin were all felt just now. Now all 27 squares topped up and charged 20 meters upwards. Nukin and Beldet and Xin Fei Fei. A few hundred people from the Heavy Cloud Academy, and all the people from the other academies went up under the leadership of Debang and the other brigades, seeing the citadel. Many people were confused. Ah, purgatory. The area where the fire cone sprayed just now. All the heavy weapons shattered. The city walls were burnt to a crisp. Blackened limbs could be seen everywhere, and even half of the brain could be seen. Someone started to vomit. What are you doing by freezing? The alien beasts are already about to climb up. All the cannon girls transform. Top up. Armored car Heim incidentally transform. Machine gun fire. Against the alien beast that rushes up directly ram it down. It was the 200 meter high Chuan Feng city barrier. The wind whistled. The smell of blood filled the air. And stepped over corpses that had been burned and exploded into charred blackness. Looking at the alien beasts rushing up like a tidal wave. Charge up. Top it. The barriers were a hundred meters wide. The citadel was huge. And immediately spare heavy cannons rose up. In addition to their area. There were more than 300,000 other people fighting on the western citadel. Charge up. The three squares of people immediately topped off. And the 2,000 cannon girls transformed. Click 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 click. Fifth generation. Sixth generation. Seventh generation self-propelled artillery heim. Heavy artillery heim. Fixed dual cannons. And ground-to-air anti-aircraft guns all transformed. And the misplaced ones found their own positions to transform. D-Bang and Shurqing fused and transformed. The armored war G fell behind and 200 counts of armored warjacks fell on the citadel in battle. Let's go. Beldet pulled on her skirt and took a deep breath to jump up and transform to land. Click 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 click. The fiery red 7th generation S-class defender ground-to-air rocket launcher landed. 
Makoto immediately sat on it. On the side, Missy Arms wasn't big, but the driver's seat was very soft. Safety switch on. Multiple rockets preheating. Plebeian, aiming is over to you. This Missy is only responsible for output. The linkage popped out to Makoto's hands, as well as wrapped around his waist. For the first time, Beldet felt a light enter her body. People at home, as well as teachers, countless people had said it. Those who hadn't linked up much would have a very hard time the first few times they linked up. Only the dryness is not bad. Some say it's comparable to having a small fire burning. And some even say it's comparable to a knife scraping on the body. Very unpleasant. But, Beldet linked up with Mood Dust. It was clearly the first time. The radiance of energy clearly entered. But it was like warm water. Without the slightest bit of discomfort. Machin's power. So comfortable. He was like a knight in silver armor. Half kneeling in front of her. Guardian. It was warm and made one safe. Missy, how does it feel? It's not. Bad. It's so high. Linkage fit 8. You've never linked before. Get used to this value first. Ready. Fire. Let's give these damn xenomorphs a taste of what we're capable of. Boom dash. Beldet fired a powerful shot into the air. Three airborne alien beasts were pulverized in one shot. Missy is fierce. Hoomph. Don't even look at my lady's caliber. Cannon lady. Caliber is justice. Shepard Dust harnessed Beldet to fire three consecutive cannons. The foreign beasts that were about to swoop down were blown to powder. And Mu Dust's timing and the angle at which he fired the cannons were extremely good. A foreign beast climbed up in front. The particle pulse gun shot its head off. And the one who fired the gun was Chin Fei Fei. Who stood right next to it to cover it. A la a la. I want a big mouthful too. Hoomph. Envious of this lady. Right? Not really. Big mouth. Good life. Beldet? Makoto? After warming up, the Augur Wind Destroyer missiles were fired. In addition to the main gun ports, Beldet's two secondary gun ports were possible to fire rockets. Precision strikes, blasting away the two Earth-class alien beasts. Not bad power. Young man, just to the right of them, the cannon girls who had just filled in. The adult woman at the head had half-mechanized hands, and the four women behind her were all half-mechanized. They weren't students and had the guild's logo on their chests, and the five cannon girls were firing wildly down at the ledge. Ahahahahaha, ahahahahaha, especially the machine girl at the head of the group, wearing a sexy brown leather jacket that barely covered her key parts and a skirt that was almost flush 13. The president of the female guild opened fire and laughed wildly like a female lunatic, but their firepower was very fierce. Awesome. Beldet saw that all of the alien beasts that had climbed up the ledge in this area were swept away. Ha 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 ha. Our extreme fire guild. The firepower is just positive. Extreme fire? Sheen Fei Fei knew and whispered. They're somewhat famous in heavy cloud. The machine girls are all high, and they basically only take cannon girls. It might be a feast for some war crazies. Missy, we're getting real. Okay, watch this Missy's gifted fire suppression. Get ready. I'm going to energize you. Missy body tense up. Ha, tense up. The galactic heart energy a port input. Ah, Missy directly shrieked out, and Chin Fei Fei snickered. What is this? What is this? Missy almost flew up in the last second. The whole body energy was replaced. SSS level energy injection. More than five times shorter than just the energy. And the cooling time of the main cannon. This is my SSSS grade hidden talent. Missy ready. Let them know what is called infinite firepower. Linkage value up. Pull linkage? Beldet had a head full of questions. By the way Makoto had that hidden talent. Being able to pull a linkage fit of 20. Then the power of her cannon fire could be increased by four times. Linkage degree 18. Her whole body was warm and cozy. Linkage degree 28. What's the situation? What the hell? Her field of vision has tripled. Linkage fit 40. The Beldet was dumbfounded. More. Linkage fit 48. Chin Fei Fei all but stretched her neck. It didn't reach 50? First time for Missy. Steady on. I just injected her with the galactic heart as well. What the hell? The plebeian, 48, my god. My parents haven't been on 40 in over 30 years of linkage. In the linked state, the power of the cannon fire was increased by 6 times. And Makoto and Chin Fei Fei's mean could still go up? This, this, was too terrifying. Missy, we're gifted together. Beldet turned on S rank fire suppression, and the power was tripling. Shepard's dust injected the S talent beacon fire, and all that was shot out at the same time was three rounds. Six times, three times, three rounds together. The power of the S grade cannon G doubled again. Right 108 times? Aiming at the group of foreign beasts in the sky. One shot. Boom. Chin Fei Fei was almost lifted off the ground by the shockwave of the fired cannon. The ears of the left and right cannon girls were going to be shattered. Small nuclear egg clouds directly exploded in the sky. 
hundreds of meters of sky directly purged away, leaving no powder behind. All the cannon girls and drivers on the nearby walls looked this way. What heavy weapon? Dibon and a few other nearby war girls were dumbfounded. What kind of firepower was this? Chapter 112, Shepherds Dust and Sheen Fei Fei blown away. Velvet's cannon bombarded hundreds of meters in the air, creating a vacuum. The nearby cannon girls that could be seen for dozens of meters, as well as the other machine girl pilots were dumbstruck. This was shooting small nuclear eggs? The war girls were stunned. Those who heard the sound also looked over. What was going on? This wasn't over. The cannon barrel shifted horizontally into the air. Boom dash. Boom dash. The air was silenced and blood spray filled the air. Velvet's one cannon topped a hundred cannons firing in unison, continuously firing ten cannons into the air, hard vacuuming the alien beasts in this sky. Velvet's battle performance value hit 799. Too, too strong. Crap. Who is that cannon girl? It's Beldet? Don't say she's S-class. SSS class may not be this fierce, right? Look at her. She's so strong that she's smoking. Oh my god. Is that arrogant young lady that strong? Who's the driver? Makchen, with 20% of her own. It's not that outrageous. The energy value filled with silver light, linking up to reach 51. The steaming aura was so strong that it smoked, causing the entire area to crease. Only the close range people could see it clearly. The people from the Extreme Flame Guild, as well as the nearby students, and the Dibon Brigade they could feel. Beldet and Makoto were radiating a terrifying linkage value. This was what made the cannon fire so powerful. What are all of you waiting for? Keep firing the cannon. Press down towards the ground. Continuing to frantically fire was nothing more than a hiccup. It made the students on the chilled citadel, as well as those from the other academies, feel a hint of confidence. Too cool. Too cool. Makoto. Beldet was excited cooling down and firing into the sky once again. The two talents of beacon and fire suppression. Blasting out was not as good as a small nuclear egg, but it was truly terrifying. Beldet was very happy with the blast, and Missy seemed to be tearing off the skirt that restrained her at the moment, ripping off her jacket to reveal the sexy ribbon leather dress inside, with a small leather whip in her hand. Snapping, Missy's trademark ahahaha openly laughed. This is too fierce. What are your names? Are you interested in joining our extreme fire guild a young man? This terrifying power, this open laughter, the president of the Extreme Fire Guild, Man Ning, loved it, their guild just loved this kind of violence and flair, hot girls and hot sisters, this young lady is the second daughter of the Elucia family, Beldet, this president of yours has a good eye, foreign, can ah, communication a pull, friends first added, leave alive and have a good chat later, Shepherd Dust controlled the direction to fire, Beldet was in charge of running the filling, and could still say a few words, the machine girls of the Extreme Fire Guild were all wild, jumping up to the alien beasts. They mortared their faces and shot. The walls are being breached. War girls prepare for action. Although his friends were automatically added, Mu Dust didn't have time to chat. The battle situation was very bad right now. Without the Metaphors field blocking them, large areas of Fey Beasts climbed up. The Sky Fey Beasts and Air G were in a big melee, and thousands of Fey Beasts that had burrowed in from under the ground even appeared inside the city. In an instant, there was also a battle inside the city. The Land Emperor Turtle spewed out destructive penetrating rays that swept across the city. Ah! Screams and explosions were heard on the city walls. Fifty wargirls rushed up into the sky to impact the Fire Koan swarms in the air as well as the Fire Koan lords. Although there was no pressure from the Fire Koan, the Land Emperor Turtle couldn't manage it for the time being. Damn! Just let the Land Emperor Turtle spray destructive rays like this. How many people are we going to die? These giant tortoises sprayed sweeping across thousands of meters. It was directly going to take away hundreds of people. It was a struggle for the armored wargirls to help defend the citadel, and there were more and more alien beasts rushing up. With the wave of sprays just now, the three square formations were paralyzed by nearly 10, 000 people. Squares 4, 12, and 13 go up to the citadel to hold it. Charge, charge, charge. There's no way to deal with the land emperor turtle. We can't charge out. Damn it. Hold on for now. Don't talk about rushing out. This wave of artillery is a bit overloaded. Armored mecha nymphs all transformed to the top and hit the alien beasts that are charging up. The alien beasts that climbed up were basically earth level. Chang Rong could be seen being asked to top up as well. No, don't. After she transformed and saw the berserker, not only did she not go on top but also twisted her head and tried to escape. Asshole, who are you a deserter? If you're running away, I'll give a shot first. The armored war girl next to her yelled. Chang Rong was so scared that her engine oil was leaking wildly and hundreds of alien beasts had already climbed up on the city walls. There were also guys in the air, 
The spray of more than 10 Lan Emperor turtles just now directly killed 2 to 3,000 people in seconds, resulting in an empty area. D Bang and their war girls all rushed over to support them. Don't kill me. Don't. I don't want to die. Chang Rong was being chased by two alien beasts as she fled. The next SA armored war girl kicked her over and then killed the two berserkers. You deserter top me. The screen injected. Not only not at all, but a deserter mark on Chang Rong's battle record. The muzzle of the gun was pointed at her head. This is a battlefield. Running away you're selling out your teammates. Top it off. The battlefield was not meltingly optimistic. The second batch of squares were all on top. And the third batch of 80. 000 men were inside the city walls ready to come up. There was chaos within the city. The sky was still a chaotic battle. There were thousands of alien beasts on the walled city. Boom boom boom. Two death rays through Chuan Fong city. Two shots from the creeping source giant worms. This time at the city gate location. And more deaths. Qin Fei Fei was right behind Beldet's cannon. Assisting in the firing and killing the Fei that were going to flank and rush over. Beldet fired continuously. The barrel of the cannon was smoking. Bei you guys pay attention. Let's go support the right side first. There are too many alien beasts rushing up over there. A hundred meters away on the right side. A large number of foreign beasts rushed up. President Manning brought her people. All of them had cyborg forms. And cupped their two-handed cannons and ran towards the right side. What's going on? The city's fire support is a bit lacking. This shouldn't be. Shepard Dust looked back and saw that the city was also fighting. With many alien beasts protruding from the ground. There are obviously Sita alloy defense plates underground. Why are there so many coming up? Xin Fei Fei fired her gun, but there was no time to think about that right now. There was a window of opportunity, and with fire suppression reduced by a third, the pressure on the citadel was much higher. And, the Land Emperor Turtle's destructive rays were coming. Ab's force field unfolding. Mu Chen let out a roar. Wow boom 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 boom. Two at their position on the city wall, and five destructive rays swept across from 100 to 300 meters to the right. Explosion. Blasted out. A miserable shriek. The entire wall shattered in large swathes, and a large number of students were blown down, their lives and deaths uncertain. Bell Det was lifted off the ground, and the moment Mu Chen flew out, he jumped out and hugged Qin Fei Fei to protect her, smashing down from the 200 meter ledge. Dang. Mu Qin, Qin Fei Fei. Bell Det was in mechanical form, and Maxion's ab stance blocked the attack, only for the explosion to send them flying. Bell Det didn't fall, but Mu Qin and Qin Fei Fei directly fell from the 200 meter high city wall. She shouted, then looked to the right. The alien beasts fighting over there and the machine ladies of the extreme fire guild who had supported them, as well as the people who were originally in the fight all disappeared. Their side was exploded by five destructive rays of light, and the entire wall was blown out of the gap. Tragic and incomparable. Mac dust. Mac dust. Beldet cried out. There were foreign beasts tumbling up behind them. You damned beasts. She scolded as the barrel of the cannon was shoved directly into the mouth of that foreign beast. Boom. Blasting it into powder. Chapter 113, 13 decimated. Something's wrong with the governor. Clattering. The rubble was toppled out. Anyone else would have been flattened long ago. Mu Chen directly toppled out. And Qin Fei Fei was held by him. Is Fifi okay? Smashing down from a high place was the ground that Mu Chen's body landed on. I'm fine. Mu Chen. How are you? Qin Fei Fei immediately hand on Mu Chen's body to touch. To see if there are any wounds. It's fine. You touch again there's something wrong. Starting to touch the waist and back was fine. How come she touched and reached inside her pants? This also needs to be checked ah. Qin Fei Fei saw that Mu Chen was fine. Just now she thought she was dead after falling from a high place. Mu Chen ended up holding her to death and used himself as a meat cushion when he smashed into the ground. If it was her, how could she possibly withstand it? Shepherd Dust's body that was 40 times stronger than a normal person's. For him, it was like an ordinary person falling from the second floor. Bell Dead is still up there. Let's go up. Beldet blasted furiously at the alien beasts that rushed up, and the gap over here emptied out quite a bit. More berserkers jumped up. Connect. Sheen Fei Fei. Come in. The heavenly scene war girl appeared, and the heavenly whale giant scythe swept across, killing the five berserkers that rushed towards Beldet in seconds. Plebeians. Beldet shouted with tears in her eyes. Mu Chen and Sheen Fei Fei were actually fine. The heavenly scene war girl went up to the citadel and swept across with her domineering aura. Missy I linked you. Keep firing. Ah, continue linking? We have all fused and transformed. How can we link up? The skyscape warrior girl's hand pressed on her cannon's body on Beldet's screen. Linkage fit 37. What's going on? Makoto clearly didn't harness on her G-body. How could it still maintain linkage? I can hear the sound of talking in a thousand meter range. Let's go help over there first. Talented fire suppression and beacon fire could be used again. 
Beldad's status was bursting at the seams, mainly because she knew that Makoto and Qin Fei Fei were still alive, blasting furiously at the foreign beasts under the barrier. Boom, boom, boom dash. Beldad's battle record hit 1371. It was enough to see how much she had killed with this cannon. Mainly, there were too many foreign beasts, densely packed all over. The third batch of squares rushed up, seeing Beldet bombarding wildly there. Who is this cannon girl? So strong. This firepower. My god. What are you waiting for? All transform and fire. The top gunheim transformed. The battleheim on the back who thought the Duats of fused cursed. What kind of shit is command arranging? Why is the window so long? Everyone has to hold out for these 10 minutes. The cannons and long range fire are cooling down. This wave saw a large number of weapons cooling down at the same time. Only a few squares of Utana and the others were firing. Because there weren't enough drivers in large numbers, their power was limited. Maxian and Qin Fei Fei were cooperating better and better. Their fit rising to 57, wielding the heavenly whale giant scythe. He swept across the city walls, raising his head. The 50 to 60 battle agents were still fighting the battle flame coin, and they had to be surrounded by countless aerial beasts at the same time. There was simply no way to split up. The armored wargirls were over a hundred on the citadel now sacrificing a third of them. Looking at the city again, there were quite a few guilds wargirls clearing out the alien beasts that had burrowed out of the ground. It was quite chaotic. The booming sky dual cannon opened fire. Qin Fei Fei gave a burst of output into the air. It was really swatting flies. There were alien beasts flying around everywhere, helping to ease the pressure on the sky a bit. Destructive rays swept across. Wow. There was an explosion on the citadel. Two to three thousand people were killed and blown up by the Land Emperor Turtle in seconds, including the square on Beldet's left that had just been replenished. How many people blew up and flew down? How many people are going to die if that Land Emperor Turtle isn't removed? Is there no assault team? Where's the command? Why don't we raid? It was as if Mu Chuan was saying that there was a Duotong reporting that he must gather the Wargirls or special weapons to get rid of the Land Emperor Turtle. But Fan Hongwu said no, the special weapons must be used to destroy the Dominators. It was too much of a threat. But the destruction juggernaut just doesn't move forward, letting those big wangbangs spray from afar. It was as if it just knew that the orbital laser cannon existed. Fan Hanwu, ignore the outside of the city first, prioritize the inside of the city. But Lord Chief Commander, we can't still let the Land Emperor Turtle attack at will like this. The square formations on the citadel won't be able to withstand it at all. Are you questioning me? But, shut up, if you can have the time to report here. You might as well go and transform for me to clean up the foreign beasts in the city. That Machinima Metropolitan was so angry that he transformed and rushed out. Fan Hongwu's expression was icy cold. The fact that Chuan Feng City was so miserable was actually something that made the heavy cloud hub unexpected. Simply put, it was irrational scheduling, wrong prioritization, and the inexplicable ground being breached, leading to chaos within the city and short-circuiting many of the heavy weapons. No, we can't kill our way out. Come on it's a war girl we can charge out and try. The Skyview Wargi flew to the command deck. Commander Fan, deploy 10 wargirls. I'll lead them to kill out and destroy the Land Emperor Turtle. The destruction rays spewed out by the Land Emperor Turtle were far inferior to the Dragon Level Worm Source Giant Worm. However, this Great King's 8's power storage time was short. That Worm Origin Giant Worm's power storage would take more than 15 minutes, and it was at the back, not fully entering the battlefield. The Land Emperor Turtle's position, at a distance of 800 meters, was perfectly capable of rushing out to kill, guarding the citadel on, rushing out to die, just 10 wargirls, it's enough, the land emperor turtle is only 800 meters away, 11 of us s-class battler girls will be fine, do you know there are other alien beasts hidden outside, let's settle the sky first now, chief commander fan hanwu, you are delaying the battle and burying a large number of lives, the heavenly seen wargirl angrily rebuked fan hanwu, what are you talking about, questioning the chief commander, are you guys trying to revolt, Immediately, eight armored wargirls came over and stood beside Fan Hangwu with their guns pointed at Mu Chen and Qin Fei Fei. I'm just giving an important opinion. Mu Chen was now fully aware that this Fan Hangwu definitely had problems. He purposely made a show of being serious about commanding, but avoided the important points, and the barriers were all opened up with a large pit actually not supporting them up. Immediately, Mu Chen backed away. Farewell. In fact, there are quite a lot of people with the idea of Mu Dust, but now is a great war. Listening to orders and arrangements is not the time to argue. The data is wrong. The data can't be retained. Just as he was about to charge up the citadel again, Mu Chen's ears heard a special voice. Fifi, wait. What's wrong? Undo the transformation first. Her figure was too huge, and she could easily be seen at 10 meters. Undo the fusion. Mu Chen simply picked up Qin Fei Fei directly and ran. 
there were three more diamond beasts encountered ahead. While holding Qin Fei Fei with one hand, Mu Chen took out his lightsaber with his right hand and swished and chopped. Running to the side of the crumbling wall, he saw a woman who had fallen in a pool of blood. Rushing up, it was precisely the machine woman with the mask called No. 13. No. 13. No. 13. She was only halfway down her body. Her chest and shoulder were wounds from the pulse gun penetration. No. 13. I'm Makoto. Why the pulse gun wounds and the plasma cutter? The G body damage was already 99%. Voice data judgment. Sub-instructor Makoto. What's going on? You were moved? Data judgment. Security nature 51. Entrusted. Mac Chuan. This is division judge 13. Code name Black Spirit. Fan Han Wu. If you have any questions, please forward them on my behalf to Zhang Dong Yuan. Or Red Dragon Center. Extraordinary code code 952312. 4311. Say the code. Other division judges will also believe. Your words. Her life signs disappeared completely. Chapter 114. Beldet transforms into a war girl. She's a division judge? Xin Fei Fei had also heard of the mysterious and extremely powerful division judges. She didn't expect that the first time she saw one would be like this. Fan Hanwu is problematic, but now that it's in full view of everyone, he's at most making some small moves. Shepherd Dust took the badge off her waist before letting the flames incinerate her. There were other human corpses nearby. Presumably Fan Hanwu had sent people to surround and kill her, and both sides ended up collapsing here. Let's go. Let's find a way to block this wave of beast attacks first, compared to the chaos of Chuan Fong. Copper Scale was very miserable. However, Copper Scale had a large number of supporting legions, a variety of advanced weapons, and a large number of war girls to support them. Fusion Transformation The heavenly seen war girls reappeared and flew back above the citadel. Eldest Miss This way, this way. Beldet hid behind a pile of rocks. Her face flushed red as she transformed back into her human form. I'm all out of ammo and the barrel of the cannon is overheating. The battlefield lasted for an hour. Oni I Chan you're hiding in that spot. The skyscape wargirls rushed up and decapitated at the alien beasts that climbed up. How beautiful the valor was. It was enviable to watch her. The sound of the destructive light wave. Wow boom. The two squares a few hundred meters away were hit hard. And once again, they were hit hard by the land emperor turtle. This big bastard was surrounded by countless foreign beasts and was close to jumping little apple from 800 meters away. Fifi, undo the transformation. You're consuming a lot. The transformation lasted for 15 minutes. The energy was unlimited, but the physical endurance was not working. She was a normal person. Nope, heavier than a normal person with two G-rated arsenals. Listen to you. The light dispersed, and Qin Fei Fei and Mu Chen separated. She narrowly failed to stand still, her fragrance sweat wetting all of her clothes, panting slightly, her body taut and sore. Mu Chen was completely different, as if nothing had happened. We'll rest here. I, plebeian, I want to try. Beldet's hair was tossed, her face blushing. Our linkage fit is enough, right? Just now I see the highest is 58. You have to think about it. Missy, isn't it just affecting the ripples? I don't even know if I can survive. Kill it and my parents will be proud of me. She patted the B-rank arms. Ah la la la. Missy hasn't transformed before. She doesn't even know what that feels like. What? What feeling? Isn't it just more mind to mind? Jean Fei Fei laughed badly. That is linkage. Linkage ah, is that you hold hands and dance? Or go on a picnic together? It is nothing at all. But the fusion war girl is. She said in Beldet's ear with a bad smile. Instantly, Beldet's head was going up in smoke. Shepard's dust was speechless. Jean Fei Fei definitely had to exaggerate. Originally it could be understood that a 20 to 30 fit was hugging together. But Jean Fei Fei's description that is the sea ah, tide ah, huge waves ah, body ah, Soft rot nah, little girl which can stand such evil description, but, ah ha 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 ha, Beldet's eyes are hairy circles, what is this lady, plebeian, let's come, think it over, humph, sure, Fifi just rest in the back and watch this lady perform, transforms into a defender ground to air rocket launcher, Makoto jumped on it, and the linkage began, instant 35, Fian, Beldet, Ept, fusing and transforming, the two souls were sent out at the same time as if they were two cannonballs, the moment Beldet and Makoto's silver light body reached out and pulled together, an 8 meter body with fire red armor and black body scales, shoulder armor is 8 missile launcher barrel stacked, chest is not big but armor layered, legs triple armor thick, can switch wheel body propulsion to move, running speed is relatively slow, behind the back is 6 sets of air to air armored cannons, as well as carrying a crimson 10 meters huge main cannon, the crimson color was bright and eye catching, S class, 
Crimson Heavy Artillery Battleheim. I transformed into a Battleheim. Beldet was fresh, looking at her palms. There were also two B-rank flash cannons on her small arms. A war girl? Is it from any guild? Transformed into a war girl? D-bang and the others hadn't died yet, and they were now weak and lifting their fusion to command on the citadel. With their own eyes, they saw Makoto fusing with Beldet. That kid was too strong, right? Beldet raised her hands, and her flash cannon snapped and exploded at the earth level alien beasts that climbed up. The war girl came with five times the damage, plus their current linkage fit of 51. It was now eight times. Mechanical Maiden, Beldet. Rank, 5. Ripple, S Class. Machine Form, 7th Generation S Class Defender Surface to Air Rocket Launcher. Battle Maiden Form, S Class Crimson Heavy Artillery Battle Maiden. Primary Weapon, S Class Crimson Heavy Cannon. Secondary Weapon, A Class Defender Surface to Air Multiple Rocket Launcher. Secondary Weapons, C Class Flash Cannon. A Class Gel Foam Missile Launcher. Talent 1, S Suppressive Fire. It feels fantastic. The Wargirl Form Weapon instantly filled up. The Crimson Heavy Artillery Battle Maiden stepped forward, and behind her back cluster 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 cluster. Simultaneously, 24 surface to air rockets were fired, bombarding the air with a sea of fire. At the same time, the shoulders fired auger wind missiles, blowing up all of the alien beasts in the location of the gap in the barrier. Ahahaha, fantastic. The Crimson Heavy Artillery Battle Girls moved slowly. This was the disadvantage of the heavy artillery battle girls, but their advantage was the fierce power of their cannons. They were a superb battery. All of you, get out of the way for this lady. Makoto and Beldet fought at the same time, going directly to the side of the citadel. The other cannon girls had long since made way. The crimson heavy cannon Battleheim took a step forward, her right leg half kneeling for support, and the auxiliary armor on her back extended to pierce into the ground. The main weapon, the crimson heavy cannon flipped over and slung over her shoulder dragging it with both hands. It was aimed directly at the howlingly triumphant Lan Emperor Turtle. Beacon injected. Fire suppression added. Aim, fire. The crimson cannonball instantly penetrated through the long sky, penetrating in through the Land Emperor Turtle's heart and incomparable head and exploding. Clatter. Flesh and blood exploded. That Land Emperor Turtle was blown into chunks of flesh and blood. Crap. What kind of firepower is this? Killed the Land Emperor Turtle in seconds? Aiming for the second cannon. The talent time duration was still there. Fire the cannon. Piercing through the sky. The second land emperor turtle was blown into bloody chunks. Third cannon. Fourth cannon. Killing the nearest four in a row. There was a strange roar from the back of the beast tide. The land emperor turtle was scared by the bombardment and started to retreat when it heard the order. And at this instant, a large number of beasts that had climbed up on the citadel rushed towards the crimson heavy artillery warrior girl in a desperate manner. Protect her. All tank Heimblock. Dibin yelled in command. The Tankheim blocked these Earth-class alien beasts that were about to charge, but some were also knocked away. Missy doesn't care. Keep shooting. Kill one for one. Beldet took a deep breath and focused on concentrating her energy. She was somewhat used to Makoto's galactic star energy. Boom. The Land Emperor Turtle moved slowly and was shot up one more head. Watch out for the foreign beasts rushing over. Crimson heavily armored battle girl be careful. Double linking and transforming. The heavenly whale giant scythe swept left and right and the fey beasts that pounced on both sides were cut apart by her. D-Bong was dumbfounded, only to see the heavenly seen wargirl protecting the side, the last line of defense, definitely not allowing the fey beasts to get close. Allah Allah, with me here, these stinky insects don't want to come close. Chapter 115, Bell that shows her power. Bai Yen arrives, the crimson heavily armored battle girl carrying a heavy cannon, and the skyview battle girl wielding a giant scythe. The combination of the two was graphic. The six-headed land emperor turtle was sniped from a distance, causing the beasts to go crazy trying to come and finish off Beldet first. The Skyview Battleheim stayed close to guard. Pretend we don't exist? In addition to the original 34 square formation of Tankheim and Loderheim blocking the Fey Beast, immediately supporting them came six battle humans, five A-ranked SA double blade armored battle humans and one S-ranked red shots of battle humans, helping to block the foreign beasts. Keep firing, we'll help you block and snipe that damn land emperor turtle. Everyone knew that that Land Emperor Turtle was too much of a threat. They couldn't rush out, and they weren't the powerful heavy artillery type. Missy, keep firing and don't let those big bastards get away. No problem. Beldet didn't care why Chin Fei Fei was unmanned and could still transform into a battle maiden, and was now fully concentrating her energy to shoot up the Land Emperor Turtles again. On the seventh head, the Land Emperor Turtle was hit by two explosions. Obviously the firepower had dropped a bit. There were still three heads twisting their heads to run. Supported by six battle agents, 
The Heavenly King battle agents turned on the booming Sky Twin cannons and fired wildly at the alien beast swooping in the air. It shocked Daibun the most. How was this done? He had seen with his own eyes that Machin and Beldet had fused and transformed. But the heavenly seen wargirl was Chin Fei Fei. So why could both of them transform at the same time? His brain was a bit overloaded for the time being. The 8th Land Emperor Turtle was hit by a cannon and ran away. And it was not powerful enough beyond 1500 meters. Beldet had already started panting. Focusing all her strength on firing her cannons continuously for a short period of time. The weakness of her first time transforming into a battle maiden immediately surged up. Roar. With a hissing roar, a behemoth suddenly tumbled up the city wall. Imperial level beast soul devouring transformation demon wolf. With a 10 meter body, it opened its bloody mouth towards the crimson heavily armored wargirl sitting on the ground. Danger. Watch out. Instantly lifting the fusion, allowing Beldet's body to fall to the ground. At the same time, Mu Chen went to Qin Fei Fei's world. He rushed up to the heavenly whale giant scythe and crossed it, letting that long blade like teeth bite down on the shaft. Roar dash the soul devouring variant demonic wolf fist. Qin Fei Fei was also very tired, but her willpower was more tenacious than like in the present. Beldet run. Beldet stood up and ran backwards. The skyscape wargirls blocked the soul devouring variant demon wolf, but a third eye emerged from its forehead. Erlangshan had to call out straight to the inner circle. A green ray of light shot out and pierced through the Skyview Wargirl's abdomen. Fifi, Beldet turned around to see. Tianjing Battle Heim half kneeled. She was out of stamina. The second transformation of the Heim body in a row was a little too much to bear. Qin Fei Fei's spirit was in a bit of a trance, and her fusion fit with Makoto continued to drop. Fifi, Beldet picked up the particle pulse gun and hit the soul devouring transformation demon wolf in the face. But this weapon was just scraping the bottom of the barrel when it hit an emperor level Fei beast. Several Fei beasts in the sky spewed out destructive sound waves that exploded nearby. Mac Chen, I don't have the strength anymore. Qin Fei Fei couldn't hold on anymore. Plus the wound on her abdomen. The forced fusion lifted. The soul devouring transformation demon wolf opened its bloody mouth and bit down. Dang. It was stopped just two meters above the ground. The scene was extremely discordant. It was because Mu Chen's physical body resisted the impact of the foreign beast. The Debang Brigade was almost petrified this time. The ground cracked underneath Mu Chen's feet, and Qin Fei Fei was right behind him, but he actually physically blocked the emperor-level foreign beast. His sleeves were shattered and his arms were exposed with veins. Against that mouth X flare. Explosion. The soul-devouring transformation demon wolf howled in pain, but the power of using this move in human stance was so much worse that it actually only made it take a few steps back. This soul-devouring variant demon wolf's physique was too strong. The helicopter flew by. A white fluffy cape jumped down from the heights as she spun three rotating knives to strike. The three blades were incredibly precise, hitting the three eyes of the soul-devouring transformation demon wolf at the same time. Ow Dash howled. She pulled the fur with one hand, took a blue bomb from her waist, and threw it into the mouth of the soul-devouring transformation demon wolf. Makoto, she shouted. Shepherd Dust had long been carrying Qin Fei Fei on the run, leaping up and then catching Bai Yen, using his strong inertia to carry the two women over the alloy baffle. Boom dash, the mouth of the soul devouring variant demon wolf was blown to smithereens. Blood sprayed wildly, but it wasn't fatal to the fey beast yet. That guy isn't dead yet. Bai Yen rolled up. After all, it's an emperor level foreign beast. It's a little tricky. Mu Chen looked at Qin Fei Fei's wound with worry. The blood had already stopped. The machine lady's Ji she was different now. As long as it didn't hurt the core, this kind of wound Ji she would slowly repair it. Her injury is fine but don't do any strenuous exercise or transformations for the time being. Baekhyun said. I know, you came just in time. The other people who were fighting had seen this side and almost spewed out. Just now the two humans actually fought with an imperial level alien beast. It was already against the blasted sky. What kind of monsters were they? The soul devouring variant demon wolf had two eyes that were stabbed blind by Bai Yan and now turned into a one-eyed fey beast. Beldet ran over panting. Plebeian, Fee Fee. Qin Fei Fei's whole body was sweating profusely and her arms were trembling. Ah la, can't move. Feels like my body is so heavy, especially my chest. At this time, she still didn't forget to hit Beldet. Beldet shyly scolded. I'll chip you. That monster is coming over. Qin Fei Fei shouted. What? The particle pulse gun Beldet was holding was still cooling down, and it was useless against this big guy. Fusion. Back Yan. Accept. With a turn of the body, the five meter body of the Battleheim appeared. Flashing translucent armor, three phantom wings flashing behind her back, and an overall silvery white got mech body, with protective scale crystals flashing, S-class phantom spirit wargirl appeared, transformation, fusion fit 28, fusion fit 45, 
the Mirage Warrior Girl suddenly turned into two. Soul Devouring Transformation Demon Wolf One Eye. Can't see over. S-Class Plasma Cutting Ice Blade appeared in his hand. Instantaneous Slash. Sharp Jump. Simultaneous Two-Way Chop. The Phantom on the left is fake. Slices the right brain of the Soul Devouring Variant Demon Wolf. Jumps to its back and turns into Ice Blade Dual Blades. Streaming Cloud Blast Flash. In an instant, 36 Blade Light Residues appeared. Only to see the illusory spirit wargirl land behind this foreign beast. The back of the soul devouring variant demon wolf exploded open. A perfect cutting line. As if it was the principle of the butcher's beef. Cutting it to pieces. At the same time, she faced more than a dozen earth level foreign beasts swooping down. She turned around. Jump chopped. And cut both heads. Landing back in a flowing stance. Cutting the third head. Padding back. Double blade thrown. Taking away the fifth head. Standing firm and flashing. Attacking on the left side, body dexterity grabbing the leg, smashing and abolishing the seventh head, swallow reverse, right side inch strength shock palm, directly knock out that bat head, didn't see it wrong, the war girl was playing tai chi, the double blades rotated and flew back, instantly the illusory spirit war girls turned into five, parading through the streets of heaven, the five foreign beasts were sliced at the same time, that's a good name, Bai Yen was still able to chat with Mu Chin, next time, a little more slanted but would be better, the hands rotated, and a blue light actually condensed in the center of the palms. She, it was actually possible. Bakyun was surprised. Wave palm here. The boom palm went out with a range of 50 meters of light waves spinning, strangling the alien beasts in seconds. Four angles of attack. More experience this time. Standing on the ground. Hands vibrating. A delicate shout. Nian Chi quake. Omnidirectional attack. Shattering. Only now did Mu Chen understand that by Yan's main weapon, the S-grade vibrating airwave wave, turned out to be this. The secondary weapon was an S-ranked plasma ice blade, but it was rare for both weapons of an S-ranked battle maiden to be S-ranked. One could only say that Baekhyun's strength exceeded the ratings, and this was still the weapon of her second mechanical form of Battleheim. Easily, gracefully finishing off this wave of flying alien beasts. It was the first time that Qin Fei Fei and Beldet had seen that a Battleheim used martial arts. Leaping back, we'll go down first. The 27 square formation was dead and in disarray. No one cared about it for now first. And they were the important battle force also needed the first round of rest. Lifting up Beldet and Qin Fei Fei jumped down from the citadel. Come to the side of one of the ruins in the city. Undo the fusion. Bai Yen and Mu Chen fell down. What? What? It's not? President? You and Mu can confuse and transform? Chapter 116, 3 Guilds Temporary Wargirl Squad. There were still quite a few people in the ruins over here. But of course there were just a few when they saw the lifting of the transformation. This voice was from Mai Yeli. There was nothing to hide from her own people. Bai Yen nodded. We tried fusion last time. Xiao Chui quickly helped her scan for healing and bandage. Gong Hong Ying stepped out. I'll do it. Sister follow me. We have healing instruments inside the room. Qin Fei Fei and Beldet look at Mu Chen. Don't worry. One of our own. In fact, when Mu Chen was able to transform with Bai Yen, they could basically guess that it was one of their own. The helicopter landed, and Duo Tingmei brought Li Shi over. And as soon as the battle started, the people from the White Maple Guild contacted Li Shi. Then together, they were cooperating in the battle. My tail is broken and must be repaired. I just saw the chairman transform. It's so cool, I want to try it too. Du Tingmei came over? A foreign sister? That hair is so pretty. Oh, you're very appreciative. Beldat crossed her arms. Yu Kin was maintaining her tank form. They're the White Maple Guild. And Bai Yan is Shania's best sister. Ha ha ha, they meet and fight kind of thing. Xin Fei Fei went into the room to receive treatment, and Beldet was able to take a breather. Unable to stand up once she sat down. Mukin, how's the situation? Li Shi was also bandaging her arm. The wound wasn't too deep. Missy's crimson heavy cannon blasted and shattered seven land emperor turtles, which is considered to have greatly reduced the pressure and stabilized the situation. But the 27 squares were basically shattered. I don't know how the other students are doing. I don't have time to care right now. They have to rest. I'm asking you. Li Shi gave him a blank look. These four words revealed deep concern. Ah, it actually made Mu Chen's face red with questions. As soon as Li Shi looked at Mu Chen and froze, she instantly blushed as well. The others looked on. This, these two young people were spreading dog food. Ah, I, me, okay, half of my physical strength is consumed. What, plebeian? You monster. Ah, with Qin Fei Fei transformed twice, lasted for at least half an hour and I transformed to beat the energy out, but also with this, white president transformed to fight a wave, and still have stamina, Chai Xiang they listen froze, change SS level driver so described, 
Should be legs soft on the ground twitching? At least a one-time turn in ten times the level of homework. Mu Chen's face was all still normal. You don't know. He and the teacher are both physical strength monsters. It's good that they didn't get hurt. Li Shi spoke. Where Shania? Should be on her way back. Now that the foreign beasts outside are actually decimated, we can fix things up. Xiao Chui also spoke. I checked the overloaded weapons. There's still 20 minutes left. They'll be restored. And right away we'll be able to resume fire suppression and completely stabilize the situation. The White Maple Guild and the other guilds had purged the grounds of the foreign beasts. And everyone was taking a short break. It was at this time. Wow. Boom dash. The location of the barrier gate was pierced by two penetrating lasers that pierced right through to the center of the hub. Nearly shattering the hub's multi-gravity field. It's the creeping source giant worm. Damn. Those two big worms haven't been resolved yet. The barrier gate is shattered. Many alien beasts are going to rush in. Immediately three squares top up. We can't let the foreign beasts rush in. The western barriers. The gates of the 20 layers of alloy were all blasted through by the two creeping source giant worms. And a large number of foreign beasts were going to enter from the ground. Bai Yen took off her fluffy promise. Makoto. Do you still have the stamina? What do you want to do? Chairman? President? Mu Chen and Bai Yan's eyes locked. A mountain of swords and a sea of fire is no problem. Mu Chen picked up the water bottle next to him and ton 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 filled a few mouthfuls. Li Shi made the same move. Beldad didn't know what Bai Yan was talking about. This beautiful silver-colored short-haired woman seemed to give off an immaculate immortal aura. A pure beauty that wasn't polluted by the world. There was no aristocrat's gold fascination. No businessman's arrogance. It was as if it was a feeling of nature's English spirit in general. Bai Yen took the communicator, going out to exterminate the giant insects, those who were going, gather at Chuan Fong City, X741, Y149 bearing in 3 minutes, exterminate giant insects, kill out, Qin Fei Fei and Beldat stared wide-eyed, president there are at least 250, 000 alien beasts outside, Xiao Chui's words revealed worry, it doesn't matter, no one is going, I'll try with Mu Qin, Bai Yen, why are you possessed by Shania today? Mu Chen smiled, but didn't say he didn't dare to go. According to my observation the destruction juggernaut has no sign of attacking and is far away. Killing the creeping origin giant worm will make a big change to the battlefield. And although there are many foreign beasts, most of them are fierce grade and earth grade. And the emperor grade foreign beasts are all fewer. And it won't be easy to leave us behind. Chai Xiang topped his glasses. The previous chairman never acted like this. Yu Jian smiled. That's because we can transform into a battle maiden now. We know how strong the strength is. How can we be missing from the charge? I will think of a way to air support. Duo Tingmei spoke was stopped by Bai Yen. No need. The mechanical form is too dangerous. Only allow the war girls to move with us. I'll join you guys. Xin Fei Fei was being bandaged and looked out the window. No. You're consuming a lot. And there's no place for you to transform. Xin Fei Fei blinked. I'll do it. Xin Fei Fei you just rest for now. Li Shi spoke. This time. The sound of brakes, and air falling, coming, Bai Yen crossed her arms and looked at the people who had arrived, I'll briefly introduce them, President of the Snow Heron Guild, Mati Yi Shan Dai, Chao Feng, Qin Qi Mei, and Deng Chang, the armored vehicle G transformed back to its human form and walked over to four people, two men and two women dressed in all white, Bai Yen, no, your driver, it's this little handsome guy, President of the Max Mountain Butterfly blinked her eyes and looked at Mu Chen, Arms magnificent but a level smaller than Qin Fei Fei. The helicopter changed back and also jumped down four people. Bai Yen didn't shake off the MA Tech Mountain Butterfly and continued the introduction. President Tai Su Pying of the Gaia Guild, Lu Pan Pan, Nailin Qian Ji, and Gong Ruiz. Tai Su Ping took off his sunglasses. No way. Bai Yen I have been pursuing for three years without success ah, so you like you like this kind of young ah? LV Pan Pan flew up as to give his man a foot, on your stupid like still pursuing Bai Yen's sister. Also do not look at their own what bear like. However, Bai Yen, it turns out that you are the same as Shania. Bai Yen covered her face. You guys, ha ha ha. Stop making jokes about Baek Yun. Be careful she gets angry. When Baek Yun gets angry, the eight of us combined can't even beat her. Yeah, in the past, you could still turn into a war girl, but now you can't even turn into a war girl without an advantage, right? Bai Yen pointed at Mukin. Mukin, is Shania's boyfriend. Ha, huh? crap. Bai Yen, you and Shania can be ah. Uh, this? Bai Yen smashed the wall with a palm. What are you guys thinking about? He's Shania's boyfriend. Not mine. So it turns out. Mukin ah, uh, a name that rings a bell with me. Knowing that everyone was joking. Getting down to business. Are you guys ready? If you kill out, you may not be able to come back. The candidates for the new president are all arranged. Having come here, 
I didn't think that I would definitely be able to return alive. Gaia and Snow Heron were both guilds that had excellent relations with Bai Yan and the others, and charging out would most likely result in no return. Who will be the captain? Of course it's you, Bai Yan. Of course you'll be. But, I'm not the oldest. You come. Shepherd's Dust also looked at her, and Bai Yan was suitable. All right then, everyone, transform and go. Chapter 117, Seven Battle Ages Kill Out. The moment Bai Yan and Mu Chen's hands touched, light flashed and a mechanical sound was heard. S-Class Illusory Spirit Battle Girls appeared. Li Shi moved away slightly to an unoccupied corner. Light flashed, the S-Rank Black Feather Battle G fell. Illusory Spirit War G? What's going on? Baek Yun, you're a cannon girl. The Ma and Mountain Butterfly Girls were puzzled. The Illusory Spirit Battleheim was a car high ma. Don't worry about that. Quickly transform and set off. Now that Big Bug's move is still storing up power. We're in time. Bai Yan had been calmly thinking and judging. She was just as handsome material as Mu Chen. President Mama Mountain Butterfly fused and transformed with Tung Chang. ISS ranked Snowy Magnolia Wargirl. Chairman Chao Feng fused and transformed with Qin Wen Mei. ISS Class Stamina Battle G. President Tai Su Pang and Lu Pan Pan transformed. SS Level UC and Star Wargirl. Nalan Qianji and Gong Ruice transformed into. Black Huge Winged S Great Flying Winged Wargirls. Lastly, there was White Maple Guilds Yu Silk and Chai Xiang. S Level Light Prismatic Heavy Armor Battle Girls. The seven Wargirls appeared at the same time attracting a lot of attention on the battlefield. The armored battle maidens were basically black, white, and silver gray. However, the S-ranked wargirls had different gorgeous colors, and their body armor scales were not at the same level. We, wait, the black feathered battle girl. Li Shi suddenly called out to stop everyone. Immediately, my stuff comes to open the way for everyone. Stuff? She entered the code, only to see the eight ultra-long armored transporter underground gates open up. These pitch black, ultra-long armored vehicles, of what model were unknown to those present. The other members of the Snow Heron Guild and the Gaia Guild, who had just transformed, leaned over. What is this? A new titanium battle tank? Someone from the Gaia Guild had seen it. All of them were silver white 5 meter mechs, 5 inside each cargo box. Standing up, a total of 40 mech engineers. H927 mecha engineers? Gong Hongying stared wide eyed. It's the H957 model, surpassing the current third generation version. Although it's still an experimental model, but it's no problem to charge into battle. Li Shi explained, immediately setting the parameters. Hey hey, this weapon is a rare commodity. The mecha engineer was less intelligent and had a greater commercial significance. A mecha engineer was something equipped with pulse and beam weapon stuff. First of all, the cost was big. The ability was average. Maybe five of them couldn't beat an armored war girl, but it's also an advancement in machinery. Not something the average power can own and manufacture. All right. These machines help us clear the way. Charge together. It turned out that she was the lighthouse's guide. Bai Yan knew Li Shi's identity through her fusion with Mu Chuan and the double linkage. The 40 mecha pilots opened the way, and the seven battle maidens simultaneously rushed towards the shattered gate. What is that situation? Mecha mechs? They're that troop? They're charging out? Crap. Brothers at the gates. Get out of the way for the warjacks. The mecha pilots pulsed bullets to clear the way, and the snow magnolia battle agents fired their four snow god cannons at the same time purged the alien beasts that rushed over. The illusory spirit battle G streaming clouds of electric lightning cutting, decimated five fey beasts and landed at the very front. Charging out. Charge. Cheer up. War girl squad. They're the guild's war maidens. Look at the shoulders with markings. White maple. Snow heron. And Gaia. Gaia is our guild in heavy cloud. The capitaine of the walled city gate shouted. All weapons fire. Help them cover. Charging out. It only took a moment's thought to realize that they were targeting the creeping source giant worms. Cluster cluster cluster. The pulse guns frantically helped them cover fire. The war girl commanding the square on the citadel saw it as well. Everyone, fire at full power. Help them clear the way. Go for it. Charge. At the red dragon center and the heavy cloud command hub. On the second screen, seven highlight points could be seen moving out of the city. Chief Finger Zhang. There are seven energy points that are moving out of the city. Can you scan what they are? The cosmic eye is scanning. There's information. The one at the top is one that has only been registered for a short while White Maple Guild Illusory Spirit Warrior Girl, White Heron Guild Snow Magnolia Wargirl and Stamina Wargirl, Gaia Guild's UC and Star Wargirl and Flying Wing Wargirl, as well as the White Maple Guild's Light Prismatic Heavy Armor Wargirl. The data was all displayed on the second screen. There's also a Freedom Wargirl. And we've scanned that there are 40 H957 experimental body type mecha mechs without registered codenames. The Lighthouse People. Zhang Dongyuan and a few other vice chief metropolitans thought of them at first. 
they are trying to impact the creeping source giant worm. Basically, they could see the purpose. The creeping origin giant worm threat was too great. Order the first square of the long space, the second square of the long space, 200 rounds of red dragon cruise super guide to fire. If you can't hit it, hit the back of the alien beasts. The war girls can dodge the missiles. We just need to support it to a point. Understood. Lawn space first square formation. Lawn space second square formation. Immediately strike at bearings X175. Y1421. Z375. Cluster 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 cluster. 200 huge red dragon cruise super missiles were launched. Cutting through the sky. Entering the airspace of Chuanfeng city was interfered with by the magnetic field of the alien beasts. But Zhang Dongyuan was pointing at targets that were farther away. There were explosions that were interfered with up to a thousand meters away. But there were also those that interfered within the range of the Fey Beasts. But as long as the explosion was loud enough to attract the Fey Beasts, it was sufficient. Everyone in Chuan Fong City heard the booming sound. 200 rounds of Red Dragon Cruise super missiles flew by. And of course there were explosions in midair. Explosions against the distant mountains. Mountain explosions. And a few bombed the alien beasts outside the city. In order not to bomb Chuan Fong City, they could only be thrown to a farther distance. There was no way around this. But Zhang Dongyuan's meaning reached. Ooh, that old commander Zhang Dongyuan is actually cheering for us? The UC Terminal Star Battle G laughed as it fired wildly with its two-handed weapons. A dozen or so alien beasts pounced on the mecha pilots, tearing and spewing venom. But what greeted them was the self-destruct program. Boom 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 boom. The mechs were basically on the left and right sides, and their numbers were continuously decreasing. There were too many alien beasts out there. The Phantom Warboss Plasma cuts the ice blades with both hands. Cycling six consecutive slashes. Phantom Spirit Double Flash. Parade through the streets of heaven. Cutting, cutting, flash cutting. One could see the illusory spirit battle G flying around. And then the alien beasts were constantly bursting. Disintegrating, cracking, and blood soaring wildly. Nima, how is Bai Yan so strong? Strong like a monster. There were no foreign beasts in a straight line that the illusory spirit warrior G could resist. For left and right hidden soul beasts too appeared. Just about to make a move. The four heads directly split, freezing ice blades on their necks. Fast, 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 too fast. It was normal for a war girl's movements to be more or less sluggish because of the armor, because of the weapons, and so on. But the combination of Bai Yan and Mu Chen, the movements were flowing without the slightest pause. Bai Yan, this is too strong. The other few battle girls looked at her and were already inappropriate. Bai Yan has always been strong. You few idiots. A war girl who is strong alone can't exert such an effect. That little brother called Mu Chen is also strong. The light prismatic heavy armor battle G fired continuous light rays before catching up. You guys don't know, do you? But Mu Chuan is a little handsome guy who can go 50 to 50 with the chairman. And he's a grandmaster level kung fu expert. No wonder. Nonsense. Can Shen Aya's crazy girl's vision be worse? Watch out. Coming from the left. The black feathers flashed. And the 10 foreign beasts on the left were chopped off by the black feathered war girl. Her cold humming voice could still be heard. The other few froze, how, does this black feather battle G look like she is comparing who killed more with the illusory spirit battle G? Chapter 118 The Living Carrying the Will of the Dead Even though Bai Yen and Mu Chen's transformed war girl was strong like a boss, driving invincible in the front, but their situation was very bleak, there were too many enemies, the first 500 meters sprinting out was easy, helped by the square formation on the citadel, but kill to a thousand meters, the 40 mecha pilots that Li Shi had deployed were already less than 20, it was being frantically surrounded. No, we won't be able to come back even if we charge through like this. Li Shi shouted. Everyone could see it as well. Chairman, you guys use the flying ones. I'll go and hold an area with the rest of the mech warriors. The light prismatic heavy armor battle girl pointed at the comprehensive huge crater. We can hold there. Help the chairman and you guys block the encircling incoming alien beasts. And pick you up. No, it's too dangerous not to move. Bekyon stopped it. We'll go with the people from the Gaia Guild. The mecha pilots will go in the other direction, and will draw fire for us. But, Bak Yun, leave it to us. President Tai Su Peng's voice. Alright, you guys must be careful. The UC Terminal Star Warjacks and the Flying Wing Warjacks, as well as the Light Prismatic Heavy Armor Warjacks, the three of them found a good pit canal with a good defense position, and Li Shi controlled the mecha pilots to go to the other direction. This to attract the other alien beasts. That left the Illusory Spirit Wargirls, the Black Feather Wargirls, and the Snow Magnolia Wargirls with the Stamina Wargirls. The four Wargirls charged forward, and at a distance of 1500 meters was the Creeping Origin Giant Worm. Now that the battlefield was in progress, there weren't many foreign beasts near the Creeping Origin Giant Worm. 
and all four were able to fly, directly accelerating over. Behind them, all the alien beasts were stopped by the firepower of the U-Silk combination and the UCN star Battleheim. No problem, they can hold out for five minutes, we can seize the opportunity to rush back. The words of the Ma'an mountain butterfly had just fallen. Wow, the ground burst open, and a giant 200 meter alien beast in the shape of a lantern fish opened its bloody mouth. Positioned just below you Silk and the three of their wargirls, those four circles of fangs and sharp teeth were still spraying destructive venom to wrap around them. You Silk, Chai Xiang, Tai Su Pang, Lu Pan Pan, they turned around and saw, the three warjacks were directly swallowed, crushed and chewed, the dragon level lower stage exotic beast devouring, the recluse, Li Shi's trembling voice, that perfect position was a trap, none of them realized it, Bak Yun, leave us alone President Tae Wook Pang's last message, President Charge Yu Kun's last message, boom boom boom, the war girls explode themselves in a shockwave of destruction. The dragon class alien beast devouring transported man was blown to smithereens, including the alien beasts in that area. Bastard dash. Baekhyun hissed and growled. Us, continue. They could not be allowed to die in vain. The living carried the will of the dead. Baekhyun was burning, his whole body burning out with silver white flames. Let's charge. Tears flowed out of the snow magnolia wargirl's face armor. The four battle ages continued their onslaught, and in front of them was the gigantic worm monster worm origin giant worm. I'll take the rear. You guys charge. The stamina war girls set up all their weapons. Just now, you silks and their sacrifices had blocked a large number of foreign beasts. But at this moment, there were still some rushing in. So someone had to attract firepower. Let's go. The snow magnolia war girl shouted. At the center of the red dragon Xian Chang and the others all looked at the second screen. They only have four left. The markings on the screen for the UC terminal star battle G, the flying wing battle G, and the light prismatic heavy armor battle G had turned gray. Record their names and carve them into the eternal monument of humanity. Roger. A blue point of light stayed behind to break the back, while the other three rushed towards the creeping source giant worm. This dragon level beast had strong destructive power in thick skin, but it moved slowly and would sprout quite a few tentacles in melee combat. However, the tentacle defense was only at the imperial level. It's bad. The destruction juggernaut is moving in their direction. What? The others stood up excitedly. The destruction juggernaut jumped in their direction. The destruction juggernaut that had been at the rear of the large area jumped over towards the creeping origin giant worm. Originally, by Yen and Li Shi, the girls, were less than a hundred meters away from the creeping origin giant worm, containing tears and anger, they were about to start chopping away. However, the oversized body of 200 meters, it fell from the sky, jumping 2000 meters. Dang dash. The sound of this landing was like a Tarzan pressing down on the top of the mountain causing a terrifying pressure of incomparable despair. Destruction Juggernaut, the strongest of the alien beasts known to mankind amongst the dragon class, raising its head, looking up, it exuded an ethereal green light, holding a 200 meter long blade, standing on its feet, who dared to answer the battle. In the place of a young new battleheim, this oppressive feeling was enough to make them automatically unfuse. The command deck inside Chuanfeng City could see it. Many of the metropolitans looked desperate. But there were also a few people with the corners of their mouths slightly raised. The 300, 000 or so people on the citadel who kept replenishing were also desperate when they saw this image. How could this destruction dominator fight? The captains holding the macro light distant explorers saw. They only have three wargirls. How are they going to fight the destruction juggernaut and the two creeping origin giant worms? How can this be fought? Bai Yen felt her world Maxion's main body disappear, leaving behind a golden body of light. Mac Dust was arriving inside Li Shi's body. The fusion fit skyrocketed. Bai Yen, President Mama Shan Dai, one of you has a creeping origin giant worm. We'll do it for the destruction juggernaut. The voice was Mu Chen. Mu Chen? Matek Mountain Butterfly saw the black feathered wargirl. How was the voice Mu Dust? Both the black feather wargirl and I are Mu Dust linking up. It's his talent. Bai Yen said, Destruction Dominator you can't resist alone. Leave it to us. You guys take care of the creeping origin giant worm first. I'll try my best to stall it. Bai Yen and Mama Mountain Butterfly looked at each other. There couldn't be a single moment of hesitation at this time. Simultaneously, they flew out left and right. Only Mu Chen and Li Shi remained in the front. Points of light could be seen moving on the screen of the command hub. Three of their wargirls, leaving only the one who didn't register. Taking on the destruction sovereign alone? They won't be able to delay much with their lives. The blue light disappeared. Disappear? Suddenly even more intense blue light appeared. The transformation switched. The golden light shone. Bai Yen didn't look back. She knew it was Li Shi's second form. The snow magnolia war G turned around to see it. In midair, 
The black feather wargirl changed into a radiant wargirl. It can still change into a wargirl form? The big screen showed. The scanning of Chief Zhang's finger shows that it's Mark 003 Radiance Wargirl. She, she appeared. The Radiance Wargirl appeared. Mu Chuan and Li Shi didn't speak. The two of them were fully focused. Their spirits and bodies extremely fused. Fusion fits 71. Opening their eyes and blooming. The feathers of the eight wings of golden radiant light. Forming 50 meters of golden light. She was like a tiny sun. Extraordinarily blinding in the front section of this battlefield. Goddess of Radiance. Radiant light shining. Roar dash the destruction juggernaut felt a certain threat. Ignoring the actions of the other two battle maidens, the eyes of the specter were fixed on this flying, stunningly beautiful looking goddess of radiance. Golden flash. Goddess of radiance comes up and opens up big. But we don't need to save up our rage points to fight monsters. Spinning in the air, thousands of golden feathers tilted towards the destruction juggernaut, singling out the strongest of the dragon class. Chapter 119 Goddess of Radiance Shining Form. Goddess of Radiance came up with a big move. The wings of radiance in full victory stance flashed. Thousands of golden lights cascaded down. The destruction juggernaut wielded the long blade in his hand, sweeping across the sky and chopping up a third of it. Dense golden light blasted down. The destruction juggernaut's huge body counted as a weakness, and it could hit at any angle. Boom 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 boom. The explosion kicked up flying sand and rocks, holding the shining sword in his right hand. Golden lightning, without giving the opponent a chance to react. He directly went for the neck, carrying a wave of destructive winds. The destruction juggernaut moved horizontally, its huge body generating gusts of wind. It didn't move slowly, its long blade rotated and slashed horizontally. Golden light particles advanced, and the goddess of radiance counter rotated to dodge it, where it was just now. 200 meters of green chopping waves cut through, causing the earth to split open by 3000 meters. In front of the destruction juggernaut, the shining sword in the goddess of radiance's hand was like a toothpick. The Black Mantle multi-purpose missile was launched. Boom, 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 boom. Exploded on the side of the destruction juggernaut. In a golden trajectory, the Goddess of Radiance appeared in the opposite direction, piercing the impact. The destruction juggernaut roared. The explosion was able to break some of its scales, but it didn't threaten it. A sweeping slash. Shepherd God reacted, dodging against the blade. Under the huge waves of the storm, Li Shi roared and rushed through the blade. Getting close, she X-chopped at the destruction juggernaut's neck. At the same time, she reached out her hand. X-flare exploded. Black Mantle multifunctional missile launched. All moves hitting it in this wound. The destruction juggernaut howls in pain. And a bloody hole is instantly opened in its neck by the goddess of light. However, the giant shadow body crashed. The goddess of radiance was knocked out. At the same time, incoming, watch out. The 200 meter long blade that tore through space slashed. Space compressed and the thrusters couldn't jet out at all. A green light shone in the eyes of the destruction juggernaut, which was its ability. Space compression. It could only come up hard. Maxion and Li Shi roared as they cupped their hands and chopped up with the shining sword. Touch. Golden meteor. Ah. Goddess of radiance. Goddess of radiance. The shining sword shattered. And the goddess of radiance was chopped out like a cannonball. The armor of her hands shattered as she flew out backwards, crashing into the airborne alien beasts. The battle maidens in the sky also saw this side. The goddess of radiance flew backwards for a thousand meters, smashing an unknown number of foreign beast flies, smashing into the ground, and then bouncing up for another hundred meters before landing on the ground. Goddess of radiance pestled into the ground, clack 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 broke open another thirty meters before stopping. Just one chop, so terrifying. PFF dash goddess of radiance spat a large mouthful of blood, the external armor of her entire body shattered, and even her protective scale armor cracked in several places. The destruction juggernaut was a big target. But its destructive power was too strong. It roared up to the sky. Like a victorious horse. It raised its front hooves and chirped in triumph. It was too strong. This monster. The strongest at the dragon level. With a higher combat power than some extermination levels. In the spirit world. Mu Chen saw a few wounds on Li Shi's body. Are you alright? Li Shi even asked him. It's my turn to ask you. If it's a teacher. I can definitely fight it. I. Am still a lot worse. Goddess of Radiance gasped as a foreign beast approached nearby. In my heart, you are as powerful as you are. There is no high or low. We are all my most precious, but the bedroom can't be helped. You're going to die. Instantly Li Shi scolded, her face slightly red. Goddess of Radiance stood up. Li Shi tried to fly and found her body sluggish. The two had different wills. Makoto? What? Your G body is seriously injured. And your armor is shattered. 48 I'll go to Bayan side and you'll turn back into a black feather battle goddess and retreat first. What are you saying? I can be injured. Any pain can be endured. 
But, I see you injured. You are my person. I listen to me. Shepard's dust was sincere and with a few strong points. Their fusion state is mentally connected to each other. And the truth and falsehood are immediately known. Li Shi's pretty face slightly blushed. The same. Dropping the hilt of the shining sword, the weapon shattered. Together, open a few more holes for that beast. I don't know why. With you around, I'm fearless. Li Shi never imagined that she was at the forefront of the battle as a lighthouse guide. Feeling her strong battle intent, Mu Chen took a deep breath and shared his will. Good. The two of them had a tacit understanding. Even without linking up, it was as if their minds were connected. Lady Black Rose and Skylock they all looked at the screen. The light of that blue shining point of light was much weaker. It should have been hit and sent flying out just now. Girl. The screen in the center. Report. We scanned that the goddess of radiance G body is injured. 48% of her body's armor is shattered, and her weapons, are almost all in a state of malfunction, she, she's flying again, direction, destroy the juggernaut, but she has no weapons left, Shen Cheng and the others and Zhang Dongyuan they all looked at the screen, that blue point of light took off again, together, honey, the weapons seem to be all gone, only the vehicle mounted laser machine gun remains, shall we go barnacle it, I don't know, there are still two shining missiles available, it was gifted, we can't let it interfere with Bai Yan and President Mati Shandai's side. Right now, Goddess of Light's side was awkward. The main weapon and server were broken and couldn't be used properly. The equipment weapon Shining Sword was shattered. And the Black Mantle multi-purpose missile launcher was broken and cooling down. The Godslayer cannon was too heavy to carry today. Only two rounds of talent weapon Shining 1 missile left. And the vehicle-mounted laser machine gun that doesn't break easily. How does this fight? The destroyer juggernaut let out a long cry and actually dared to come? Those who could see it were also moved to tears. The wings on the back of the goddess of radiance shattered, and her whole body armor was cracked, but she still flew towards the destruction juggernaut. How about this? You have a way? Give me a kiss. Let me think about it, and maybe I'll know. Li Shi had a head full of questions, and the goddess of radiance blushed. Makoto, I'll bite you to death. Take it out. Shu, keep your voice down. If you don't know, you'll think we're doing something evil. Li Shi's blood pressure sword. You perverted bastard. Asshole pervert. Fusion fits 79. The more she cursed the higher it still got. Then get ready. I haven't used it either. Let's see what effect it has the first time. A pressurized thing? This man could always come up with something. Li Shi always had this feeling in her heart. Shining seven colored light was injected into the body. Super night transformation. Shining Gaia armor. Shining light. The goddess of light flashed again. And the golden sun rose again. What's happening? What happened? What happened to the goddess of radiance? The blue point of light was brightening. SSS class high energy reaction detected. It's a high energy fluctuation. It seems to be some kind of form change. Fusion fit 91. Blinking away his entire body was golden dragon armor. And on his head was a golden V dragon shaped helmet. On the war girl's torso was brand new golden armor that shone brightly. The golden cloak cascaded down as the goddess of light shone form. And behind her, a huge golden five star aura appeared. A fusion fit of 60 opens the eyes and reveals the full state of the war goddess. Above 85, the legendary god ring, known as the transcendent form, would appear. Divine ring? Divine ring? Mr. Zhang pointed out that the goddess of light turned into another energy body. And you can see that there is a circle of light behind the scan. It is the divine ring that appears when the fusion fit is higher than the legendary 85 or more. God ring? Crap. It's been years since I've seen a war girl be able to enter a state of transcendence and open a divine ring. Going up another level, blooming a hundred meters of golden light. No weapons, full body glittering armor, golden glitter. The goddess of light had appeared in front of the destruction juggernaut with a punch. Bang, golden thunder explosion. The destruction juggernaut's neck was knocked out of alignment. Spinning, a kick. Destruction juggernaut crosses his sword to block. Goddess of light kicks at the hilt of the blade. But the shockwave of golden light caused the 200 meter huge body of the destruction juggernaut to fall back. Turning into golden light, she pierced through and punched straight at the destruction juggernaut. Chapter 120 beating back the juggernaut of destruction. Shining Radiance Goddess Straight Punch. Shining Radiance Goddess Flying Kick. Dodging the destruction juggernaut sweeping long blade again. Shining Radiance Goddess Golden Lightning Z Word Lightning Fly Hits with a Knee Kick. Kicking the jaws of the destruction juggernaut out of the way. The huge 200 meter body continuously retreated. The speed level Shining Radiance Goddess is one notch faster than the other party. This violent melee clash. Put the president of the Matak Mountain Butterfly to look surprised. Bai Yen did not expect the war girl to have such a flashy stance. Divine ring. Goddess perfect stance. Legendary degree of fit. Makoto and Li Shi actually reached it. Roaring. 
The destruction juggernaut let out a high roar. The ghostly green gale carried the power of spatial compression, and came, a chop of death. Shining Gaia armor energy was focused on both arms. Gaia, the shining radiance goddess blocked with both hands. The sound of the collision was like the flood bells of heaven and earth ringing, a sound that could deafen the entire Chuan Fong city. A thousand meter shockwave spread away. The stamina wargirls and thousands of foreign beasts were lifted off the ground. In the first collision, the goddess of radiance was blasted out. But this time, the two forces were leveled in the air. The shining Gaia armor drastically increased strength and defense. If it was Shin Aya's earth goddess equipment, it was estimated that she would now have to use a continuous over-the-shoulder slam against the destruction juggernaut. Golden Flash. Breaking through the shackles of space compression, the plasma jets accelerated as she rotated her body and shone with a kick. The destruction juggernaut's head shattered, and he let out a scream of agony. Li Shi was also gasping for air. Her body was already fighting through her overdraft. Maintaining this form consumed them greatly. Li Shi was only a little stronger than a normal human. Stronger in terms of her high rank. The destruction juggernaut was worthy of being the strongest of the dragon class, the great general of the foreign beasts, its head shattered and still immobile. Normally, if you wanted to eliminate it, you needed to unleash more than 10 S-class wargirls, and they had to be experienced and high ranked, otherwise it is not an opponent at all. Under the divine ring, the goddess of shining light stood in the sky, looking at the destruction juggernaut, a battle between kings, the tip of the broken mountain, the illusory battle goddess flew down on it, the ice blade in her hand flinging away the blood of the alien beasts. I'll help you attack. The creeping origin giant worm on the left was finished off by her. The snow magnolia wargirl direction was also near the end. The eight-legged horseshoe began to retreat. A sweeping chop that compressed space. Be careful. Mu Chan reminded by Yen. The illusory spirit wargirl made a swallow vertical cloud leap and dodged the green chopping wave that swept across a thousand meters. Looking up again, the galloping sound of horses' hooves was far away and the destruction dominator had actually run away? In the distant sky, the blue turbid imperial demon spirit beast signaled its retreat. Then the foreign beasts that had originally climbed the barriers, and even those that had rushed into the city, heard the sound wave sound of bared teeth and all began to retreat like a tidal wave. With the fall of the second creeping origin giant worm, the tide of beasts in Chuanfeng city was cooking, were they holding? That was something no one was sure of. How many more beasts were left in the beast tide? How many more imperial and dragon levels were there? How many times would it attack? No one knew. The goddess of shining radiance smashed to the ground. Not to mention chasing, her G body was also massed overdrawn severely. Back in Chuan Fong city, it was a mess. There was no joy of temporary victory. And everywhere were the sounds of people crying and the screams of pain in the healing area. Shepherd Dust came back carrying Li Shi, who had already passed out. President, President, where is our president? The three guilds assembled. There were 13 people when they went out but only seven when they came back. Gaia Guild President Tai Shupan, Vice President Lu Pan Pan, Nalan Xianji and Gong Ruiz had all sacrificed themselves. Where are you Silk and the others? President, Bai Yan lowered her head. I didn't protect them. All of them were injured, and Li Shi's body had multiple wounds. Mukan, I'll take Shi. You rest for a while. Qin Fei Fei picked up the fainted Li Shi. Everyone could imagine such an outcome. There were countless foreign beasts outside. They rushed out and decapitated two creeping origin giant worms, and even fought off the destruction sovereign. The word spread in Xuan Feng City, a heroic existence, but the dead couldn't come back. Bai Yan walked to the corner of the wall and propped herself up on the wall with one hand. This pain was even worse than if she had died herself. The living carried the will of the dead forward. Bak Yan was an excellent leader, but she was only a woman in her twenties. In a world where the average machinima could reach 300 years old, a woman was 50 years old and probably still looked 20 the sacrifice of the six of them. As the president of the MAT Mountain Butterfly, she thought that she should take the responsibility. Everyone was young. Small unions, individually taken out were all talented. Meeting together had fervor in youth. But, Chairman MA doesn't need to say anything. The chairman told us before he came that this is a battlefield. A beast tide that is enough to make humans disappear. Their image will inspire us forever. Beldet didn't dare to say anything. Missy was afraid that she would say something wrong. She could only stand beside Mu Chen with concern. Mu Dust sat down, very tired. He had fused and transformed several machine nymphs, and he had also opened his transcendent form with Li Shi. He and Li Shi took damage together under the destruction juggernaut's attack, and Qin Fei Fei rolled up his clothes, and there was an identical wound on his abdomen, immediately taking the healer to help heal it. Heavy Cloud Defense Hub. The foreign beasts in the direction of Chuan Fong City are in full retreat. According to the 105 scans determined by the eye of the universe, 
The prediction is that there are still 220, 000 foreign beasts. The three hours of fighting had knocked out 200, 000 fei beasts. Zhang Dongyuan exhaled. Immediately have the transmission air G group communicate and have Chuan Feng City report on casualties and defenses. Report. Chief Finger Zhang asks you to look at the copper scale side. The Fei Beast Army has also suddenly retreated. Retreated? The red dots retreated like a tidal wave. As if they were retreating with the Fei Beasts of Chuan Feng City. Obviously, the walls of the copper scale barrier had shattered. And this was the perfect time for them to destroy copper scale. So why would they retreat? Zhang Dongyuan and the other metropolitans looked at the tactical board. Puzzled. Report. According to our guess, Copper Scales 3 times Meta Force Field will be recast in 10 minutes and we have 800. 000 Earth Wind Legions arriving that will conduct a flanking steel blade attack, thus disrupting the opponent. How do our reinforcements arrive they fay no? The tactical centers were all analyzing, mainly revolving around the Copper Scales. Report. There are support troops from 4 kingdoms arriving. We barely made contact. The communication in the Copper Scale City area is quite a bit better than Chuan Feng City. Have them flank copper scale and occupy the high ground for a remote diversion strike. Understood. The screen returned to Chuan Feng City. Li Shi stayed here in the three guilds for treatment. Leaving it in the hands of Bai Yan Mudwan was very relieved. This matter also had a certain impact on her. Mu Chen patted Bai Yan's shoulder. And she nodded slightly as she knew what Mu Chen was trying to express. Wrapped in bandages, Mu Dust draped in a coat exposing his chest. The left side of the Beldet uniform is also dirty and unattended. Qin Fei Fei also wrapped a few places. The three of them first went back to the 27th square to take a look. Now the repair phase. See how many more students are still alive. Just entered. And saw the deserter Chang Rong. Crap. Chang Rong is actually still alive? A la a la. A low level villain like her. She can't survive more than two episodes in a fictional story. Right? It's actually. Still alive. Novels don't even dare to write like this. Chang Rong was still alive. And word of the desertion had spread. There were many tents. But less than a quarter of the people had returned. Sheen Fong limped back. Beside him holding him up was Zhou Pan. And Yutana's arm was wrapped in bandages. Han Xuanyan and Susan were also alive. Injured to varying degrees. Where's she? Mukin. Where is she? I seem to have seen that golden light in the air. Was it you guys? Su Shan inquired in a small voice. We went to deal with the destruction dominator. She's temporarily unconscious but her life is fine. I entrusted a friend to be treating her. Susan breathed a long sigh of relief. Drink, Makchen. Still alive? Chapter 121, Battlefield Situation. Transferring a tiger from a mountain? The one who walked out was Zhao Pengfei. His hairstyle already messed up. His head disheveled like a chicken nest. However, he and the fellow machine nymphs following him were all very proud of themselves. Brother Pengfei and us killed a lot of foreign beasts. We all went crazy killing them. I threw up a few times from the dense densities. School Grass Pro Guard. These machine girls were strong and most of the conspicuous packs were still there. Could it be because love gave them great strength? Zhao Pengfei clicked on his wristwatch, which displayed the number 234 for Mu Dust to compare. How is it? Mu Chen gave a thumbs up. Awesome. Zhao Pengfei was indeed good. This point, Mu Dust didn't tell lies, not counting him and Qin Fei Fei a few people. Among the six academies, Zhao Pengfei's feats were definitely the top three. Su Shan had 151, and Han Xuanyan 143. Humph. That's for sure. How much did you go up? Mukin? That's right. It's not possible that you're hiding behind an alloy plate this time and don't dare to come out. Right? Light up and take a look. Ah ha 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 ha. Mac Dust has not yet spoken. Bell that sign of laughter. 234 points. Is lying on the ground to throw a grenade. And you dozens of points. Is scared of loading card master? Or leaking oil all over the place forgot to fire a few more shots. Bell that's golden drill hair was tossed. Hearing her taunt like this. Those few machine ladies were just about to dislike her back when Missy directly lit up screen 2301. Poof. Poof. How come it's so high? Missy raised her head and chest. Do you know how the Land Emperor Turtle died seven heads? No. Who doesn't? Blasted off seven heads by a magnificent crimson heavy artillery battle girl. Beldit's chin went up to the sky. The plebeians are very good. No to use gorgeous to describe this lady. That crimson heavy artillery war girl. Is me. Ha. Huh? It's Beldet? How could it be? Zhao Pengfei was located some distance away and didn't exactly know who it was. Who did Beldet transform with? It's Mukin's hidden talent. It's Mukin. The seven-headed land emperor turtle might just have 500 merit points. Still watching? Mu Dust asked Zhao Pengfei. Mu Dust defaulted to transforming with Beldet, meaning that to look was to be struck. Show me. Hmm. Afraid of you? Zhao Pengfei is also brave. Challenge. One more look. In situ ascension. 
this is more than what? Just one look. He turned around without looking back. Mu Chuan now has a battle record of 7,945, and the points of the creeping origin giant worm are 1,200. I'm in the seven battle giants that rushed out of the city. Zhao Pengfei turned back and pointed at Mu Dust. You guy, a little something, but, but not much, take a good rest. Ha, huh? lest you don't live to see me trample you under my feet in the future. In terms of being tough talking, Zhao Pengfei doesn't convince anyone. Let's go over there and rest. Brother Pengfei, many of the tents over there are broken. This site is all good. The machine women of the grass protection group said. I'll go wherever I say. If you don't come, go rest by yourself. Zhao Pengfei's mouth was hard, but his body was still honest. He directly left and went to the broken tent area. He was considered a person who could afford to lose. As long as he didn't play dirty, Mu Chen didn't hate such people. Chang Rong was in the corner. No one was with her. Even Ru Xiaochui and Yu Qiyu who used to follow her left. They also had battle points. Unlike Chang Rong who hung zero, this was a sign of selling out a teammate. Mu Chen wasn't very happy and came over to see how everyone was doing. Morong Buwo had left before his eyes, and most of his classmates hadn't returned. This was the cruelty of this era. The main reason for being here was to wait for Shania. Mu Ken, thinking whoever it was arrived. Shania got off and returned to the square. She kept flying the airplane back and forth without stopping. Teacher, over here. Yutina and the girls waved. The Makoto girls were eating inside the tent. Shania didn't care about the others at all and ran inside, seeing that Makoto's entire body was still there. She hugged up. Is everything alright? Wow. Susan and Han Shuangyan blinked their eyes. Xin Fei Fei and Beldet didn't dare to speak. Yutina stood in the doorway and didn't look away. The formidable and domineering beauty, teacher Shania, would actually have such girlish movements. It was this headlight of the teacher's car that almost suffocated someone in a hug. Ahem. Shania. Shania then noticed that everyone in the tent was basically there just all with injuries. She blushed slightly. Where she? Immediately pulling away from the topic. She stood away a bit. She's not lightly injured and is severely overdrawn. Destruction juggernaut ghost chopping strike with rupture effect. My body is fine. She needs a long time to recover. Destruction juggernaut? I just heard a battle maiden go to single-handedly challenge the destruction juggernaut just now. Couldn't it be? The only people present who didn't know were Beldet and Utina. No teacher. The one who went one-on-one -on -one with that destruction juggernaut was the goddess of light who unfolded her divine ring stance. And Li Shi's classmate is a black feather war girl. Now, Shania directly twisted Mu Chen's face. You're crazy ah. You and Shi too go to fight the destruction juggernaut? That monster is stronger than quite a few extinction levels. There was more worry in the words. Just Beldet and Yutina were clueless. Xin Fei Fei whispered to them. Li Shi is a rare double transformation machine lady. And the radiant battle maidens are her and Mac Chen. It was too awesome. Yutana's eyes brimmed and glittered, and she almost slipped to her knees. Beldet, on the other hand, felt that the gap between herself and them was getting wider and wider, and she had to become stronger as well. Shinaya, what did Zhang Dongyuan say? The command hub fully agrees with us and agrees that Luo Tong and the others should be transferred, and it will immediately have the communication airplanes give Fan Hanwu a report to explain. Secondly, Zhang Dongyuan asked me to contact the five division judges here and have them work together so that if Fan Hanwu has a problem, the division judge captain codename Black Spirit can. She's dead. Maxion stared with a grave expression. Dead? Xin Fei Fei nodded her head as well. Mu Chen and I saw her corpse. It should have been eight experts who surrounded her together. Whose identities I happen to know. Then the problem is serious. Fan Han Wu definitely has a problem. Mu Dust scratched out the screen. Now that the beast tide has temporarily receded. We must quickly solve Fan Hong Wu's problem. On the screen, Mu Dust listed several important points. First of all, Fan Hongwu's troop formation is problematic, and quite a few of the Metropolitans should have discovered it, so we can split up and contact them. Secondly, there's a problem with the underground Sita alloy defense plate. I suspect that he had someone open the security gate and actively sabotaged it, causing the heavy weapons to short circuit. Now that the barriers are badly broken, if the next wave of alien beasts come in two days, we only have the no. Three metaphors field as a weak backup force field, and without the barrier walls, the number of sacrifices will definitely exceed a million. Judging the situation of the battlefield, he has many mistakes and even in action. There's likely something hidden inside this room on the 8th floor. Mu Dust analyzed a few points. Changing commanders on the battlefield is a big no-no, and we don't have a good reason. Even if the room checks out something, Qin Fei Fei curbed her ventriloquism, for now. There is no decisive mistake, and he shouldn't make such an obvious mistake. The special code left behind by the division judge. Mu Chen collected the screen. Call out to Qin Feng and Zhou Pan. Our people will leave one by one. 
and gather at the White Maple Guild's location first. Integrate the trusted forces first. Heading to the White Maple Guild location. There were only two guilds left when they went. The remaining eight people from the Gaia Guild decided to join Snow Heron. The two guilds would merge. And those who made it back alive by then would probably change their names to a new one. Bye. Shania saw Baekhyun what injury. Peace of mind quite a bit. Bai Yen lazily said Shania called her Shabai again. The young people brought should all be reliable partners. Missy was introducing Yutina and Chin Foam and the others. She already knew them all. The president of the MA Mountain Butterfly scratched out the big screen. This is the statistics of the big battle just now. If it is not us, the data of this battle played a huge stink. Killing the alien beasts valued at 200. 000. We rely on so many heavy weapons. And the force field to protect. Us sacrifices are expected to be 130. 000 people. Injured cannot be counted. Behind the conditions without stance and barriers. Good thing the beast tide on our side is only 200. 000 in number. Right? News from the copper scale side. The beasts have also temporarily retreated. But the number is still 1 million. All the legions have gone to support that side. Mu Chen held his chin and fought. The intentions of the foreign beasts are a bit too obvious. But the commander in chief over here is helping them. So why would he focus on attacking copper scale? This is unreasonable. Mu Chen glanced at Shania. Could it be? To transfer the tiger away from the mountain? Shania blinked her eyes. Mac Chen, what do you mean? You looked at me. Why did you think of transferring a tiger away from the mountain? What do you mean? Chapter 122 Beautiful Maiden Alien Emperor Azure Star. In any case, the heavy cloud hub can't communicate, so we can only act on our own first. Shinaya go find the other four division judges. Fei Fei, Qin Feng, Han Shuang Yan and Susan you guys go and investigate the other six levels of Duodong thoughts, and communicate directly when you meet someone you can trust. The five nodded their heads and immediately took action. Quite a few of the fifth and sixth ranked position holders in Chuan Feng city were from the Qin and Han families, as well as the Zhao and Morong families. Mu Chen was asked to take a good rest for a while. Bai Yan led the people to figure out how to investigate the room on the 8th floor, to ensure safety, gather back in 2 hours, and whoever doesn't come back, will go find him. Mukin went to sit beside Li Shi, who had only woken up a short while ago. How do you feel? My whole body hurts. It's like it's going to tear apart. Overloaded and overdrawn, she lay there unable to move. Mu Chen brought water and slowly fed her a little. She didn't want others to see this kind of posture. Li Shi was very strong, but it didn't matter to Mu Chen. Utina and Beldet were outside tuning their weapons, polishing and maintaining them, or helping the others. Gong Hongying and Jalov could be heard praising. A foreign noble lady is actually so handy. The ones I've seen before were all complacent to the heavens, but ended up moving their hands to do nothing. Ahahahaha, <laughs> our Elucia family is not that kind of vase. Mu Chen leaned to the side and clicked on the SSS quest interface. He was currently at level 24, only one level away from quest 2 while Quest 3 slaying a dragon level alien beast completed one of them. Only the kills related to his linkage counted for quantity, but Task 1 was completed. Ding complete Task 1, destroy 400 new earth level and above alien beasts in the beast tide. S rank, receive a reward, randomly boost 1 SS rank talent or ability, double linkage boost SSS rank triple linkage, able to merge and transform with 3 witches at the same time. With the distance increasing the value increase, it seemed that the SS rank ability was the only one. Machin. Why did your body emit a faint golden light just now? When Maxion closed his eyes, Li Shi had been secretly looking at him. My talent has been upgraded. And now I can transform at the same time as three witches. Triple linkage? Mu Chen nodded his head. You pervert. Li Shi was speechless. Double linkage was kinda heard of legends. Triple linkage was something she really hadn't heard of. Mu Chen laughed evilly. His hands reaching out to 34D. Then I'll do something that perverts should do. Mu Dust. Mu Chuan. The shouts of Qin Fei Fei and the girls outside. Immediately, Mu Chen went out. Only to see everyone looking at the screen. What's going on? Pick up the Chuan Feng City screen signal can see the screen. The signal has recovered a lot. Look, the main signal screen of Chuan Feng City appeared. And the 4 million people who were now cultivating could see it. The screen was the ruins at the bottom of the hillside with a broken number 5 flag. This was the ruins of the 5th sector's forward position closest to Chuan Feng City. Both the Red Dragon Center and the Heavy Cloud Hub Center could see this silent image. The only thing that could be seen on the screen was a large number of alien beasts walking around. Some with severely injured limbs, some missing half of their bodies and still alive. It was the foreign beasts that had retreated from the battlefield of Chuan Feng City. Report, the picture is of the 5th Sector's frontline formation. The Cosmic Eye Scan has determined that it is the alien beasts that retreated from the attack on Chuan Feng City just now. Is this who's filming? Report, 
It's probably the residual camera equipment from the 5th district. The picture conduction has recovered a lot, but the sound communication hasn't recovered much. What about copper scale side? It has retreated back to the ruins of the forward position in the 3rd sector. Were the commanders of the alien beasts preparing to attack after regrouping again? There were still nearly a million fey beasts on the copper scale side, and only 200, 000 on the Chuan Fong side. All legions and external support were rushing to copper scale, including 50, 000 of Red Dragon's latest technology, the 9th generation A-class nuclear-powered attack chariots. This was the world's newest technological chariot. For the sake of winning this great battle, all the things that were in the bottom of the box on Heavy Cloud's side had been sent out. The screen could see that the foreign beasts were not moving for the time being, and some even bled to death. A sickly appearance. Mu Chen was thinking, this image, it's a bit too clear, like it's deliberately showing us right? Xin Fei Fei understood him well. It's natural for us to feel strange when we look at it from the perspective that Chief Metropolitan Fan has a problem. What is this move? In the room of the Rock Bishop, Blacks on the board was getting ready to cross the river. Mu Chen closed his eyes and signaled Qin Fei Fei to keep quiet. He seemed to have heard some kind of voice commenting on the Red Flame Archon, and someone else knew its name? I'll go and return. I'll join you. No need. It's not far away. It's just over there on the city wall. Mu Chen pointed at the southern walled city wall 500 meters away. There seemed to be a young girl sitting up there. Long silver pink hair covering the bulge on her forehead. Beautiful blue eyes. Wearing a short blue t-shirt exposing her belly button. A blue zipper sweatshirt outside. And dark blue jeans. Just under 5 feet 6 inches with a slender figure. But with 32 D arms. In her hands were pancake nuts. With pearl milk tea next to them. And snacks such as will cakes and baked gluten. It was out of place with this battlefield picture. Um, next time I'm going to add 2 eggs. The voice that tumbled up and landed was none other than Makoto. Don't disturb my eating. Go away. The voice carried a shock to the soul. But Mu Chen stood still and didn't move. The other patrolling people would automatically leave when they approached a hundred meters. Obviously without opening my mouth. I have the sound of you speaking in my head. Little sister. Who are you? Shepherd Dust placed his hand on his waist. His lightsaber in that position. I can't believe my soul shock is useless. Eating? And just now you talked about the Red Flame Archon right? I heard it from 500 meters away. In Mu Chen's eyes. It was only at close range that he felt the flowing silkiness. It was the same as Shania. She was a higher being. Having transformed several times with Shania. Maxion was especially sensitive. Um, you humans know quite a bit. Don't you? I'm not wrong. You're the alien emperor. Right? Linkage fit 46 signal appeared in Shania's brain. Linkage fit 37 Qin Fei Fei kept looking this way. Linkage fit 32 Beldet ran out of the tent. What's going on? Plebeian? Plebeians. Missy. Over here. Don't move yet. If you transform. Makoto will take the initiative to say so. Qin Fei Fei beckoned. What had happened when MacDust suddenly kept the linkage ready to merge and transform? Confronting a young girl? Um, actually know that I'm a Fei Emperor? The wind blew and lifted her hair. Only to see that there was only a bulge on her forehead. Tarahir Senior Warrior Fei Emperor. That's very true. I sense a difference in you. You have three lifelines connected just now. It's the first time I've seen that in all the time I've been observing humans. She finished eating the same. Her hand stretched out. Pearl milk tea flew into her hand. Tons and tons and tons of open dazzle. Completely not putting Mu Chen in her eyes. I've seen Hai Kuei. I advise you not to resist well. There are many war girls here. Is that so? You think you can keep me? The candle spider is the one we chopped off. Candle spider? Who's that? Oh, I remember that loser. So trashy I almost don't recognize it. Humans you pay a lot of attention to my head while I can sense your heart rhythm lowering a lot when you see a crystal on my forehead. I don't deny it. Makoto was very direct. It seems like you don't really understand us tar all advanced warriors either. Our crystals are different. Flesh colored crystals are the more the stronger. But that's just the energy representation. Of course more than 10 crystals. Like me is golden. Get it? Shania rushed back to the tent location. Azure star spotted her. Um, a higher being? Humans? How did that happen? Could it be that you did it? I'm not interested though. I was just bored and came to see how that arrogant archon would fight you humans. Not interested in getting my hands dirty. If you want to try your hand at it, um, do you think that a high life war girl is my Azure Star rival? Chapter 123, The Red Flame Archon Strikes. Shinaya had just rushed back, and the long distance linkage between Mu Chen and her, as well as Qin Fei Fei and Beldet, was cancelled. Mu Chen put away his lightsaber. Azure Star, how many years have you been here? Human, are you trying to get words out of me? I know a super dazzling pearl boo boo nai nai milk tea that's super tasty with dark molecular chocolate. Blue light grazed Makoto's shoulder slicing through a thousand meters. 
She cocked her head with an icy expression. Human, do you treat me like a child? I've been alive for 5,375 years, and I've been awakened on this planet for a full 10 months. Then Lacoste and Terra Hell, are very marvelous existences? Makoto changed his question. Um, that's of course. The civilization of these two planets alone exceeds that of the Milky Way galaxy, and advanced warriors like the alien emperor, who was able to physically travel through wormholes, should have ruled the planet as early as a thousand years ago, but we found out that there's a lot of fun to be had here, and some of them, they just snuck off and got lazy. Not so with the Lacoste, they're cool with destruction and believe in sabotage. Such boring neighbors, thought they were much higher than us. She ton ton sipped her milk tea. Flowers, trees, sky, breeze, clouds, animals, rainbow, ocean, beach, forest, stones, gravel, earth, sweet, humans, bother me again, I don't mind moving around, with a stroke of her fingertips, a map reached her side, the instrument in her hand received it, Mu Dust backed up and prepared to go down, the other party was a foreign emperor of more than the 10th rank, probably several times stronger than that monster from Haikue, it wasn't wise to make a move, and Mu Chin sensed that she had been here for a long time, whether or not she was really here to watch the show, how many battle agents would have to be separated to fight it, at least he and Shania single out, alien emperors awakened one after another, even some awakened for years, but few appeared enough to show that they had a high degree of intelligence, lurking in various fields or hiding, if not seen in special perception, anyone would think that Azure Star is human, human what is your name, Mu Dust, seeing that no one was nearby to see, Mu Chen directly jumped off the sloping platform below and quickly went down, returning to their gathering place, Mu Dust, what's the situation, who is that little girl, everyone was a little worried, she was just sitting there swinging her legs easily and then eating, Li Shi was also watching from the window, Mu Chin simply said, she's a Fei Emperor, her name is Azure Star, and she said she came to watch the battle, the Fei Emperor Terra Halstar's senior warrior, and the one controlling the beast tide is the Rakustic Red Flame Archon, Fei Emperor, Fei Emperor, human looking, a completely human maiden, Last time we saw that half-human, half-spider-like monster, Bai Yan knew this alien name, Li Shiyu and Shania they were amazed, Beldet and Yutina they had experience from last time, she might be ten times stronger than that candle spider, but the hostility isn't strong, so I suggest not messing with her, ten times stronger? A monster like the destruction juggernaut? Stronger. Shania and Azure Star exchanged glances, the little girl sipped her milk tea and coldly grunted at the action, completely disregarding her turning on the heavenly realm mode, it was still unknown who would lose or win, her purpose is unclear, we don't have time to deal with it right now for the time being, we just hope that she is here to watch the battle as Mu Dust inquired, Bai Yen pulled back everyone's thoughts and worries, how are everyone's actions, Xin Feng they were quite effective, the two vice captains were from the Zhao and Morong families who didn't bother to contact them, of the 12 captains who were still there, excluding the Qin and Han families three, five of the other nine were extremely disgruntled, there was even one who was locked up, presumably angry at Chief Captain Fan. Shinaya continued to go to the division judge. We, the original plan was still going well. Look what's that one? What a big head. What kind of monster is that? The Red Dragon Center. The Heavy Cloud Defense Hub. And all of Kawafan City saw the screens. Under the undamaged camera devices in the 5th district, the earth cracked open and crimson flames pierced through the air. A huge monster that was prostrate and bubbling with flames was seen emerging from the ground with a 200 meter body, it had the flaming head of a walrus, flaming burning hair, and its torso emerged from the ground to form an ocean of flames around it, what kind of monster is this, warning, an extreme force ranked biological reaction has appeared at the 5th sector's forward position, warning, extreme force level creature reaction at the front line of the 5th sector, scanning what kind of alien beast is this, report, no data at all, report, According to scans this giant monster has a core temperature of 5, 500 degrees Celsius, but it's burning with an energy glow around it, not all of it is flame, discussions were going on everywhere, and the image traveled to other kingdoms, it's the red flame archon, Mu Chen and Li Shi could basically confirm it, this is the great monarch that Mu Chen was talking about, the red flame archon reached out his hand and grabbed a low flying fire koan. it acted as an eater, opening its large mouth of burning flames and extending its tentacles of more than a hundred meters, tearing the fire koan apart and eating it, it ate the fire koan like a small yellow fish, Makchen, are you sure he's not called an eating archon, poo dash, poo dash, with Jean Fei Fei's sentence, it wasn't just the few people around who laughed, even Azure Star's ears had heard it, the red flame archon had eaten the fire koan, and it also raised its four limb arms above its head as everyone watched, wah 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 wah, 
Five super big crimson formations appeared in the sky. Warning, SSSS destructive high energy has appeared in the frontline positions of the fifth sector. Warning, SSSS destructive high energy has appeared in the fifth sector's forward position. Before anyone was given a chance to figure out what it was going to do, the hellfire condensed by the red flame archon shot out. The super bit increased ball of hellfire pierced through the clouds. Warning, SSSSS destructive high energy has appeared over Chuan Fong City. Chuan Fong City Emergency Shelter. The flames. Over 4 million people looked up at the sky as the clouds flamed and the sky was crimson. The sound of the sky being torn apart. Dong rumble rumble rumble. Hitting the northeastern corner city of Chuan Fong City. Fusion mushroom cloud. Destructive explosion. Ripples 3000 meters. Earthquake. Collapse. Continuous explosion. Destruction. A quarter of the immense fortress. A city that could hold over 5 million people. Became a sea of fire. Shepherd dust and the others were the farthest southwest corner. And the storm that was set off sent half of them flying out. Ah. Countless people screamed miserably. And there were alarms everywhere. Red waves of flames. Nearly a million people instantly disappeared. Zhang. Zhang General Finger. The entirety of the command hub was dumbfounded. What kind of destructive move was this? Now everyone also finally realized why the first sector's frontline position instantly disappeared. It was definitely the same move. Chuan Seal City Talon Mega Cannon Malfunction. Scorpion Beam Cannon Electronic Malfunction. Northern Wall Barrier Breaking 71. East Wall Barrier Broken 62. Quick. All rescue teams follow. Emergency activation of the freezing cooling system. Pull all the mechanical guards over to help. The temperature is too high to get in. Damn it. Transfer three squares to help. The electromagnetic sensors of the heavy weapons are all broken. 2. Terrifying. The red fire archon's terrifying strike exploded for three kilometers, rippling through half of Chuan Fong City. The scene was incomparably chaotic. Chapter 124 350,000 troops struck. Since the planet's mutation, the hardness of the entire surface had risen a few notches. Humanity's response to radiation and destructive impacts had also improved from a thousand years ago. This move by the Red Flame Archon was equivalent to hand rubbing a nuclear egg. The images of the frontier formation in the 5th district were still there. And the Red Flame Archon did not move in place after issuing the terrifying move. It was like a downtime rest, with his limbs propped up on the ground, and the sea of fire around him was much smaller. Report, Chuan Fong City has suffered heavy losses. That location just now concentrates a lot of injured people with the logistical preparation area. Report, Chuan Fong City's magnetic field is disorganized, and the heavy weapons scanning the possible 8th floor are temporarily unusable. Zhang Dongyuan saw the picture and a loud report, and for a while, he did not know how to command. When the hubs of the country saw the image, their minds all stopped for a few seconds. If Chuan Fong City is attacked like this for another round, 200, 000 foreign beasts are enough to easily run over it. Almost everyone was thinking this. The rock elephants laughed contemptuously in the room. Right now, the whole world has only one choice. On the board, Red crossed the river. That super monster is taking a break. It takes energy storage to deliver a move that powerful. A body that big definitely does. No wonder it's hiding so far back. It's us, the northern bear country, who definitely kill it out first. It's up to the generals on the red dragon side. We definitely can't hesitate at this time. The line of sight returned to Chuan Fong City side. The communication still couldn't be picked up, but the Red Dragon Center and the Heavy Cloud Hub could intermittently see some images. A large number of people were seen assembling. City Headquarters Communications. This is Fan Hongwu, Chuan Fong City's chief commander. All those who can move in the first 40 squares are to gather at the North Gate Plaza immediately. Led by Vice President Morong Shinkong, gather more than 300, 000 people to the front line of Zone 5 to eliminate the Super Fey Beasts. I repeat, all major guilds, all brigades, all forces, will set out in half an hour. The entire city could hear the order and began to move. Fan Hongwu's command is right. Now that the Red Flame Archon has clearly used that move to show weakness, Shin Aya was all so judgmental. It's going to come shouting at us soon. President, how do we act? At the venue next to them, the other guilds went to gather. Mukin, what do you think? Even Bai Yen couldn't decide, as they always felt something was wrong in their hearts. Taking the initiative is the judgment of the absolute majority, but the precious sight that happens to be gained, as well as the Dragonheart intelligence system has been in perfect condition. Ah la 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 la, Mac Dust thinks it's a trap right? Mu Dust thought it was definitely a trap, and there were quite a few people who would judge it that way, but the problem now is that it has to go. Li Shi stood up, right now this image is watched by the whole world, if we don't go, when the Red Flame Archon recovers and comes back again. All the weapons in Chuanfeng City are destroyed without attacking, and the opportunity looks like it's right in front of us. 
For the undersiders, it was necessary to strike. It's a dead end. The opportunity is certainly good, but if it's a trap, the current opponent has generalized, and we are in a situation where we must go out and respond. It was now a situation of abandoning the car. The capital had come. A total of 40 squares had assembled, plus all the guilds and group forces. Mu Chen raised his head and glanced at Fei Emperor Azure Star, who was still leisurely eating without any other superfluous expressions. The point of breaking the game is to exceed the opponent's predicted battle power. Shepard Dust looked at Shania, we've always had reservations. Shania was definitely their bottom card SSSR Mashinima. Let's not spread out. After the square formation is assembled, move halfway and close in on us. Everyone nodded. It was now a mandatory assembly, densely packed with people. Chuan Feng City's 300,000 main legions now had 170,000 left, of which 150,000 assembled to lead the way. The rest gathered one after another. Morong Shinkong's vice chief metropolitan had blood and anger in his eyes as he learned of the news that his son Morong Buwo had been killed in battle long ago. Originally, there were more than 8,000 people in the 27th square formation, but at this moment, it was estimated that there were less than 800. There were about a hundred students wearing school uniforms inside. Beside Mu Chen stood Qin Fei Fei, Bel Det, Yu Tina, and Li Shi. Your injuries aren't light, so if there's an accident later, I'll link up with them. What are you talking about? I have recovered quite a bit. Li Shi's face was still a bit pale. Shepherd Dust didn't care if someone was watching, directly pulling her small hand and pulling it over to inspect it. Even Shania beside her was a little bit jealous. The smell of vinegar has drifted to me. Bai Yan's guild was right next to her. What are you talking about? Bai, don't lose track of me later. I'm just afraid of rushing overboard. Zhao Pengfei, Chang Rong, and the others were listed. The number of people exceeded 350,000. The gate of the northern barrier is fully open. It's time to strike. Everyone put on their weapons. All locomotive girls prepare to transform. No more than six per vehicle. With tanks and armored vehicles as the core. Airbenders ready for takeoff. The sky is filled with fighters. Helicopter girls taking off. And less than two tiers of airbenders have pilots. After years of continuous beast tides, the number of pilots was too low compared to the number of helicarriers. Han Xuanyan and Susan were up there as well, with an estimated 20,000 ships. Armored car G and tank car morphing. Cap of 6. 3 minutes time to load. Priority to load in gun G and machine nymphs that can't move easily. No one is to be denied access to the car before it's fully loaded. Integrating 350,000 people into 50,000 tanks and armored vehicles to set off. There are tens of thousands of mechanical transporters in the back, transporting heavy weapons for battle. On the side of Makwang, Shinaya stomped out her cigarette and transformed. Click, 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 click. Mechanical flipping sounds. The earth attack battle vehicle appeared. Come up. The huge vehicle immediately attracted the attention of many people. Who is that? Crap. Earth attack battle vehicle? Who is it? Mukun, Chin Fei Fei, Beldet, Utina, and Bai Yan all went up. Qin Feng and Zhou Pan were on the other side. The dilapidated and gigantic western barrier wall fell, and the 350,000 integrated army set off. A large number of guilds and warjacks were assembled, and there were no less than a hundred armored warjacks. At the very back pulled the Scorpion Beam Cannon, a plasma-destructive heavy artillery capable of being temporarily assembled in less than three minutes. Toward the fifth sector's forward position, depart. Morong Shinkong gave the order, and the 350,000 troops set off. Mu Chen flipped out onto the roof of the car. The sky in the distance was dark and cloudy, and she kept having a bad premonition in her heart. Where are the plebeians? Beldet and Yutana had just finished admiring the inside of Shania's mechanical body when they realized that Makoto was not there. He's on the roof of the car. Don't bother him. Li Shi sat to the side, her body not recovering much. All the major command hubs around the world, the heavy cloud command center, we're scanning the behavior at this moment from the cosmic eye. Report. According to the scans, more than 350,000 people from Chuan Feng City have struck. Zhang Dongyuan stared at the cold screen, and all the other deputy chief fingers were nervous. Even if it was a trap, they had to go out. Prioritizing now. There was no way to manage Fan Hongwu's loyalty. It was like a chessboard. When you make the wrong first move, every subsequent move is wrong. Rolling up the sand. 50. 000 locomotive ladies carrying 350, 000 people headed out, 1 hour to go, 1 hour to death, 